Super USB Chapter 451 Super USB Chapter 451 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter, Niger, Africa, a certain Iman's land in the Azawaga River Valley, Niger is located in the Sale region of Africa, the Azawa River Valley has a canyon topography, it rises from the Azhagan River and has an average elevation of 300 meters, as the border area of the Nima border, it is also the most rampant terrorist activity in the world, one of the zones, in the middle of the night, the moon is bright and the stars are sparse, over this area without any environmental pollution and maintaining the primordial landform, there are faintly hundreds of black spots sailing in the silent night, these black spots are as silent as death, like a silent fire insect, flying from all directions in no man's land, their goal is a small temporary base in a canyon, the camera zoomed in. Following the shining of the moonlight, I could gradually see that the countless black spots in Madea turned out to be a group of drones with a diameter of 2 to 3 meters and various shapes. These drones are located in the sky about 100 meters high. A single drone is like a small flying saucer. The largest one does not exceed 5 meters in diameter, and the smallest one is only 1 meter. When these drones are flying, they are able to maintain extremely excellent silent technology. Under the cover of night, like a pack of wolves slowly approaching their prey, moved towards the temporary base quietly approaching with. But those butterfly drones that reach the diameter of 5 meters have something else on their base. It is a robot with arms and legs. The robots are of different models, but they are all curled up like a deformed Vajra, curled up into a ball with the smallest footprint and carried on the belly of those large drones, below, as the distance gets closer, the layout of the base also shows unusual features, all around the sentry towers rising up from the ground, the machine gun fortress is looming around, and the center of the base, with no signs at all, the bloody flags all show that the people living in this base are by no means a regular military organization, at this time, as each drone arrives at the designated location, under those large drones, the robots with the largest size and the thickest armor are directly dropped from a height of 100 meters, and instantly fall on the soft soil, sending out there was a dull puff. Immediately afterwards, these robots seemed to have triggered some mechanism as soon as they landed. They only heard a low zizi sound. The red lights on these robots flashed twice and then they began to unfold their bodies silently, revealing four huge the anti-joint hydraulic thigh. Immediately afterwards, the robot's four thighs began to quickly find balance, but within a second, they stood up quickly. At the same time, on their sides, two slender and flexible arms stretched out from the flanks. The top is not a human-like palm but two exaggerated multibarrel weapons. The arms of this robot are actually two complete Gatling. So far, the whole picture of the robot is completely revealed. This is a kind of beast-shaped robot with a height of 2 meters and a length of 4 meters with extremely high armor. In addition to their respective numbers, they are also printed a line of great ags. BWXTNO021. About 20 robots of this type were dropped and they were not dropped into one place, but divided into six groups, blocking all the traffic arteries of this temporary base. But this is still just the beginning. While a batch of drones dropped those beast-shaped robots, more drones have silently arrived on top of the temporary base. So far, in this group of drones, the small drones are scattered directly, and on the large drones, more machine bumps are dropped. In an instant, in the original brightly lit temporary base, there were bursts of puff 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 falling. Some of these iron pieces fell on the ground, arousing bursts of smoke, and some directly penetrated the simple the ceiling of the house, knocked a big hole in the roof. Ah, what? What's the matter? Something has fallen from the sky. Damn, my legs. My legs. This is an enemy attack. Raise the alarm. In an instant, a series of noisy screams and screams of smashing over the tent came. These people were either at a loss or not knowing what to do, watching the falling shooting stars in the sky. Many people still in the dream, 
I was killed by the iron dropping from the sky. The village is completely messed up. However, this is just the beginning. A black young man who was awakened by the noise of the bass crowd suddenly sat up in the tent, took the AKM in his hand, and looked in front of him vigilantly. It wasn't until this time that he realized that a weird iron lump had smashed through the tent at some point and rolled down at his feet. This iron lump is non-reflective matte black has a hole but only has a diameter of 30-40 centimeters, and the thickness is no more than 20 centimeters. It is like a square iron block. The only difference is that the iron block is it is composed of many hydraulic devices and complex mechanisms. On this little iron bump, there is also the words BWXT N0048. At the same time, as it fell to the ground, a few red dots on the iron block flickered slightly and then only a small drop sounded, and the complicated mechanism on the iron block suddenly unfolded. In just an instant, eight slender pointed legs were stretched out, and this iron lump turned into a mechanical spider in an instant, staggering two steps on the ground, and then stood firmly. What the hell is that? A flash of surprise flashed in the eyes of the young black man. He moved the muzzle closer to the opponent's body, as if he wanted to go forward and poke the thing that he had never seen before, but in the next second, there were six mechanical spiders. With a sudden flick of his hind legs, he only heard a sigh, and hit the black youth's face. Ah, d-a-d-a-d-a-d-a-d-a. A scream and the sound of rifle shooting came. This sound was like a horn. In an instant, all the dropped robots had stretched out their bodies and began to massacre. Yes this is a massacre. Report. A messenger stumbled to the center of the barracks. At this time, a middle-aged man with gray beard and shiny skin was dangling a cigar, and he quickly walked from the only bunker with his own soldiers. Rush out. Report general. The messenger was covered in blood, his face and abdomen were cut with some kind of sharp weapon, drenched with blood. But even so, he still chose to come and report to his boss. We were attacked by unknown. Yes robots, there are spider-like robots everywhere in the military camp. Are you talking about this? The middle-aged man bit his cigar, suddenly pulled out the golden large pistol in his hand, and aimed at the messenger's head at the same time. Boom! There was a deafening gunshot, and the messenger screamed, and immediately curled up with his ears covered, but behind him, a spider robot was directly hit by the huge impact of the gun and flew out. Squeak. It's amazing that the spider robot hit by the bullet didn't at all die, and a burst of electric light burst out of its belly. It seemed that there was a short circuit, but it still twisted like a real naughty bug. Moving, screaming at the same time, trying to stand up. This time, without waiting for the middle-aged man to speak, the guards behind him directly raised the AKM and fired a string of bullets. DA 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 DA. After a burst of gunshots, the mechanical spider was finally shot with four limbs, and the remaining two limbs were no longer able to support it and continued to move. Seeing this, the middle-aged man was only snut. He crouched down and picked up the limb of a mechanical spider, only to see the sharp phantom light at the tip of the limb. These limbs are really sharp blades. Report, General. At this time, another courier gasping for breath rushed over. As soon as he saw the middle-aged man, he sighed in relief and loudly shouted, General, our people are almost unable to resist. Let the order go on and organize all the brothers. The number of enemies is not many. We can definitely defeat the enemy. The middle-aged man roared and walked quickly towards the outside world. But at this time, the severity of the external battle was far beyond his imagination. Because it was the cause of the raid, many soldiers were killed by mechanical spiders that suddenly appeared before them almost before they realized what was happening. Even, these mechanical spiders have the ability to crawl on the walls. In this kind of all-round attack, Although the number of spiders seems to be less than 50, it still caused heavy casualties on the military base. However, just as the middle-aged man was about to officially preside over the overall situation, there was another bang on the ground, and this impact sound is more intense than before. Careful, General. One of the guards seemed to have seen something. His pupils shrank suddenly and threw the middle-aged man in front of him directly to the ground, but the other guards were not so lucky. The guards reacted a bit slower, 
and were directly hit by the iron falling from the top of their heads. Shattered, a lot of blood and internal organs were sprayed out directly, splashing the middle-aged man, but the middle-aged man didn't have any panic in his eyes. He was just lifted up by the guards around him calmly, and then quickly backed away. So far, all the guards have formed a half circle and the center of the circle is the newly dropped iron block. The middle-aged man lifts the head looked towards the vast night sky, but found that there is nothing in the night sky. Then he started staring at the iron block in front of him. This iron block is several times larger than the previous mechanical spider, and with a few small lights flickering on it, it seems to be unfolding in the next second. Shoot! The middle-aged man gave an order, and the guards in front of him immediately opened fire. For a while, violent gunshots and medicinal smell filled the entire space, even covering the huge iron block. With the end of the round of shooting, all the well-trained guards began to change magazines. At this time, the middle-aged man also bit his cigar and narrowed his eyes, staring at the smoke in front of him. However, before the smoke dissipated, a red light suddenly emerged from the smoke. The original red light was blinking, but with a ticking, it jumped directly to a green light, and at the same time it was a burst of Kai Kai vent. The silhouette of an ordinary person quickly stretched out his body, and in full view, a complete metal head emerged from the smoke, with red light glowing in the eyes of the head, then the limbs, then the torso. What the hell is that? Looking at this impervious to sword and spear monster, the middle-aged man bit his cigar and muttered. The next second, he only heard the sound of ping. The middle-aged man had no time to react, his body was like a root noodles. In midair all split up and in pieces, burst out a handful of brilliant blood mist. The middle-aged man was torn to pieces by an enormous force under everyone's eyes. So far, the mechanical skeleton that came out of the smoke carried a powerful gun and opened the first shot of the massacre. Puff puff puff. The muffled sound of a series of bullets entering the human body was heard, and these guards did not escape the fate of death. They didn't even have time to react, so they were instantly shot into the body within the body by a special spindle-shaped hollow bullet, a soft hollow lead containing lead. The bullet began to twist and roll as soon as it hit the human body forming a funnel-like cavity effect. There was a scream from the crowd, but more people were beaten to pieces without even humming. They just swept in a circle and all the guards fell in a pool of blood. Just like the previous mechanical spider was just an appetizer, with the appearance of this humanoid robot. The form finally took a turn for the worse. The military base that could have sporadic resistance finally lost its ability to resist. Target. Any human being armed? Number of enemies, 300, threat level, low level. A string of data appeared in the upper left corner of the robot's sight. Random shots were zoomed out. Several men wearing military uniforms from various countries with at least the rank of colonel were sitting in a bright conference hall, looking at the front of the conference hall. Huge screen. This is, on February 20th. We were commissioned by the local authorities to record the video recording of the suppression of the armed forces in the Azawa Valley of Niger. On the commentary stage of the conference hall, a young man wearing gold glasses is holding a pointer and explaining in proficient English. As the video ended, the youth turned the video again, letting the video come to the middle period, revealing the images of small spider-like robots in the lens. BWXTN0048 Model robot, spider agile robot produced by our black light technology. The young man took the pointer and slightly touched the screen. Then, in front of the young man, a phantom of the robot in the video appeared out of thin air. Seeing this scene, all the soldiers are slightly moved, obviously knowing what this 3D scene means. In the meaning of this model, BW is the acronym of our black light technology and XTN is the number of the Xingxian military project of black light technology. Unlike the civil project of Xingxian, the military project is temporarily kept secret from the outside world. Of course, if you are willing to buy it back, you can naturally make it public. The young man spread his hands, and then pointed to the height of the one meter in front of him. Among them, the eight-legged robot occupies 23 of the robot spider. At the same time, he said, as you can see, 
XTNO-04 is a completely miniature agile robot. Its tactical purpose is not to kill the enemy, but to harass and advance, and to cooperate with ordinary soldiers. It is enough to achieve great victories in some small battles or rapid actions. But, this robot does not seem to be bulletproof. In the conference hall, someone couldn't help asking. Of course, the youth replied. Firearms do have a certain amount of damage to XTN004, but the movement speed of this kind of robot is too fast. They will adopt circuitous tactics. When the enemy locks them and shoots, they do not at all. It will rush forward, but will run to the left and right, one will lose the target without paying attention, and then appear behind the soldiers to attack. Super USB Chapter 452 Super USB Chapter 452 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Such agile robots do not exceed 20 kilograms. It is the ultra lightweight that causes them to move quickly and even have a short term wall climbing ability. If armor is installed on these robots, then maybe it is bulletproof, but the weight also loses the meaning of agile robots. The youth spread his hands and responded. Everyone understands, nodded. Indeed. This kind of robot is a harassment type at first glance. It doesn't even have a gun. It may be of little use in regular encounters, but it is used for tactical applications such as counterterrorism and raids. But it can have a miraculous effect. In addition to this model, XTN004 has several other models that can adapt to more complex situations. If you are interested, you can learn more about it. However, the meeting time is limited. So I won't list them here. Dot. The youth pushed the gold wire glasses, and then dragged the progress bar to freeze the screen on the robot that landed initially, XTN002. This one might be more in line with General Lawrence's aesthetics. While speaking, he looked towards the soldier who just asked about bulletproof issues. This is a heavy robot. It is a beast shaped robot with a height of 231 centimeters, a length of 421 centimeters, a weight of 420 kilograms, and a maximum movement speed of 60 kilometers per hour. Don't look at its low weight, it's because we are aware of the mobility problem, in order to allow drones to carry as much as possible, so we have reduced a lot of unnecessary weight. For example, its shell is made of special carbon fiber ceramic composite materials. Light weapons such as ordinary rifles and submachine guns cannot cause any damage to them. Only anti-material sniper rifles have the ability to damage them, but unless hit the intelligent core within the body, otherwise it will be difficult to paralyze XTN002 with one shot. At the same time, XTN002's important component within the body also has a layer of metal jacket to form a Faraday cage effect, which can effectively isolate electromagnetic pulse interference and prevent electromagnetic bombs. And its vision system uses two kinds of infrared vision and traditional electronic vision. The two visions complement each other and can find any hidden targets. As for the firepower system, XTN002 uses the airborne M61 AL Vulcan 6 barrel rapid fire cannon by default, with a series of calibers ranging from 5.56 mm to 25 mm. Under this firepower attack, any non standard cannon within 100 m heavy armor targets cannot survive. Of course, you can also choose to carry other types of weapons, such as bazookas and other heavy weapons. The replacement is very simple and you can even handle it yourself. Following the youth's words, a reduced version of XTN002 holographic image appeared out of thin air on the conference table in front of everyone, and there was also a human body next to it for size comparison. Speaking, the youth concluded, in short, XTN002 is a simple, efficient, and durable tactical weapon. It is like a tank in a drone. It may not be able to dominate the planes like a tank, but it can adapt to complex and changeable street fighting, swamps, jungles and other environments, and its mobility and flexibility are not comparable to tanks. Everyone listened fascinatingly. Indeed, XTN002 is like an enlarged version of an elephant, 
except that there are two Vulcan cannons acting as a firepower system. This robot can completely replace tanks in more complex street fighting. Of course, the premise is that its AI is really that smart. But until the end, XTN002 did not experience actual combat. Another general who looked like a brown bear suddenly spoke. I'm sorry. That's because the time we developed was short and there is no suitable actual combat record. Youth helplessly said, we have gone through tens of thousands of tests. These test data sets can be consulted at any time when you are here. In actual combat, only this rebel extermination operation in Niger, which you can also see, XTN002 was only used by us to prevent this group of people from escaping. Before they really waited for the show, the entire base of more than 300 rebels all surrendered. But you don't have to be disappointed, because in the future we will continue to accept commissions from various countries in the African region to use these robots for assessing law and order and suppressing the rebels. If you are interested in buying, you can wait and see. We are not in a hurry. Dot. Everyone is nodded as it should be. Next, this humanoid robot. The young man continued to drag the progress bar to show the humanoid robot that killed the rebel generals on the screen. This is the most conventional model of XTN003. XTN003 inherits the shape of Xingxian Project. As you can see, this type of drone is not as good as XTN002 in terms of armor thickness and tonnage and not as good as XTN004 in terms of agility. Just like its positioning, this is a conventional combat robot. Old rules, the 3D image of XTN002 was quickly moved aside, and the center of the conference table showed the appearance of a full-size XTN003. XTN003, with a height of 190 centimeters and a weight of 134 kilograms is a humanoid combat robot. It has the same vision system as other robots and can withstand light weapons. The armor thickness is half that of XTN002, and its moving speed is slightly higher than that of humans, reaching 45 km per hour. It also has the ability to isolate electromagnetic pulse interference. At the same time, it can do all the actions humans can make. Whether it is close combat or long range shooting is its specialty. So what are the advantages of this robot? Someone asked suddenly. The advantage of XTN003 is the panacea. No matter what the occasion, it can exert its full power without any special restrictions, just like us humans. The youth replied immediately, XTN003 can use any weapon and can conduct high intensity combat. Whether it is manipulating artillery or driving a car, whether it is street fighting or ambush, even when the weapon has no ammunition, they can easily grab the enemy's weapons go to battle, just like an impervious to sword and spear, a special soldier who never gets tired, and is also the trump card of special forces. What? Hearing these words, everyone couldn't sit still and the brown bear-like soldier among them stared at a pair of big eyes like the same age, is so smart that he can drive a car. Hearing this, the young man couldn't help but laughed, driving a car is not uncommon, if I say, only need to enter data, it can also drive tanks and airplanes. Everyone is even more surprised, impossible. Your robot AI can walk on two legs and maintain the same agility as ordinary people. It's a miracle. If you can drive airplanes and tanks, wouldn't it be able to completely replace humans? Soldier, I understand what you are thinking. It is normal to have doubts about the intelligence of this kind of AI. The young man pressed his hands and asked everyone to don't be impatient, and then said in a good voice, but if you don't believe me, after the first meeting, you can go and observe our XTN003 robot testing. At the same time, once we receive commissions from countries in the African region, we will try our best to send XTN003 for actual combat demonstrations. Even you can join our commanders to observe actual combat from a distance. We are also looking forward to this opportunity. These senior officials and generals all looked at each other, nodded and barely suppressed the uncertainty in their hearts. As you say, 
XTNO-03 is enough to replace human soldiers. Isn't this the dream of human progress? The youth continued to speak, in our imagination of black light technology, with the advancement of human civilization, the frequency of future wars will inevitably become less and less, and the scale of conventional garrisons will therefore shrink and become smaller. The military expenses that come out can be used for other high-tech weapons, and the positions of these vacant soldiers will be filled by robots and drones. It is even possible that there will be zero casualties in future wars. Who wins or loses is determined by the advanced level of the robot and the combat capability. Hearing the youth looking forward to the future, everyone showed a looking thoughtful expression. Indeed. XTN003 seems to be very intelligent to an unrealistic level, but is this situation not in line with the scenario of future war? As technology becomes higher and higher, human soldiers will be eliminated sooner or later. Not only in the future, but now many fighters have been replaced by unmanned fighters. This is a major historical trend. Moreover, in our vision, these robots can be used not only at the military level, the youth continued. As long as you reduce the thickness of the armor and the firepower level, it is a perfect police robot. I believe you can understand what this means. He showed urgency, even if military robots are to be upgraded in the future, these eliminated robots do not have to worry about becoming a pile of scrap iron, whether it is for police or even the hardest laborers on construction sites and farms. It's a normal thing. Hearing this sentence, Everyone lifted the head abruptly and finally revealed a look of shock. One of the soldiers said in a low voice, It is true. If the AI program of this kind of robot can handle even war, then it will become police robots and even industrial robots are overkill. The young man took a sip of water from the glass in front of him, and then continued, Apart from this, and the various drones that you see, such as this Mark I type, speaking, the holographic projection of XTN003 automatically moved to one side, and a flying saucer shaped drone appeared in the center of the conference table. Mark 001 UF, diameter 75 cm, height 20 cm, equipped with iron pulse vector propulsion unit, maximum cruising speed of 1,201,000 m per hour, flying noise of 20 dB just equivalent to wind blowing the sound made by leaves, and also equipped with a face scanning system, coupled with a 12K high definition zoom camera, can confirm the identity of a person up to 100 meters away, with an accuracy rate of 99%, and it can be converted into night vision even at night mode, there is no difference from daytime, and its shell adopts an intelligent protection color system which can change several camouflage colors, including sky blue, black, brown camouflage and green camouflage, which is enough to realize invisible surveillance activities in most environments. The youth continued to introduce, as for the weapon system, there is a weapon base in the bottom bin of the drone, which can carry several light weapons such as stun guns, flare guns, and light pistols. Of course, it can also carry nothing. If it is not equipped, it will be a pure spy drone. If it is equipped, it can be used for patrol and search missions. The actual combat video you just saw is Mark 1. The whole process was taken by the UF. The Mark 001 is only the most common model. Just like the XTN robots, the Mark drones are divided into dozens of models, ranging from a few centimeters of micro drones to those capable of carrying XTN002 as heavy duty drones, covering multiple application combat capabilities such as spy monitoring, tactical operations, and vehicle loading. Then, it is Mark 002 type. Next, the youth vividly explained the specific data of more than a dozen drones to the people in the conference hall. So far, the procurement team of the Bezu district finally has a preliminary understanding of the weapons situation on the black light technology side. Of course, the order contract will definitely not be signed so soon. After all, this wave is just a preliminary investigation. After the next group of people leave, they will definitely send the second and third groups of inspection groups to investigate. When it comes to tens of billions of dollars in orders and national security, 
No political system will take it lightly, and blacklight technology is not limited to the representatives of the Biazu region. They are just the fastest group that's all. After the disintegration of the Soviet Union, although the Biazu region still suffered from the Soviet Union many years ago the remaining bonuses, but now they have reached the bottom of the poverty line and most of the weapons are on the verge of obsolescence and obsolescence. Now that there is such an arms dealer who doesn't even give up in North America, they immediately couldn't sit still, and sent a number of high-ranking military officials to form an investigation group to conduct preliminary investigations. When the meeting was about to end, among the officers, an old man with a grey beard finally couldn't help it. He frowns saying, I have to say that the weapons of blacklight technology are indeed amazing, but in before we witnessed their performance with our own eyes, all of this still has to be a question mark. Isn't it time to talk about some of the highlights? For example, your scavengers and the individual missiles previously promoted at the Earth Federation headquarters? It turns out that General Carl valued our individual air defense system. The young man suddenly laughed. He took off his glasses and revealed a handsome face of Zongzu. This young man was transferred from the headquarters and was appreciated by Kian Wen Huen and given a high IQ talent Zhu Yi. At this time, I just heard him say, of course this is fine, but not now because in the next few days, I will personally take you to visit our various weapon systems. After all, there is too much talk here, and it's not as effective as you have witnessed, is it? Old man hearing this suddenly frowned, and to be honest, he didn't like to control the rhythm in the opponent's hands. It's just that he also understands that the idea of blacklight technology must be delayed, and the investigation team that drags to other continents will arrive forming a situation of multi-party bidding, but in this situation, he has nothing to do. After all, blacklight technology is the only one. Super USB Chapter 453 Super USB Chapter 453 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. In the next month, Officials from all continents and regions sent representatives to the Life Science City in secret to observe and purchase several weapons and technologies that are the mainstay of black light technology. For the various weapon technologies possessed by black light technology, every continent has developed a deep vigilance. Only the AI technology of robots, black light technology has come to the forefront of the world, perhaps in the military laboratories of each continent. There is indeed a similar intelligent super AI, but it is still in a state of continuous debugging and improvement. To reach the AI maturity of blacklight technology robots, there is still more than 10 years to go, not to mention the amazing individual air defense systems. In the ranks of drones, the iron pulse vector propulsion device produced by blacklight technology is a big hit. Representatives sent from various continents may not immediately decide to buy the XTN series, but they will definitely immediately purchase all the Mark UF series from model 001 to model 023. This group of people is just for the iron pulse vector propulsion device inside. In the minds of all those who are sensitive to military affairs, they have such an idea at the same time. If this almost completely silent iron device is used to replace helicopter propellers and submarine propellers, wouldn't it be invincible in the whole world? With the idea of trying to crack the iron pulse vector propulsion device, the Mark UF series received a large number of orders from all continents within a month, and North America ordered all UF models, a total of 800 units, totaling 1.3 billion US dollars. Zongzu district ordered 1,500 units, totaling 2 billion US dollars, and Bizu 600 units, totaling 800 million US dollars. With a few orders, Chen Chen has just opened his business, and his business has gone viral. The total amount of orders has exceeded 61 billion US dollars. However, when the next continents are preparing to purchase new system technologies such as directional aiming, long-distance environmental sensing, and Coriolis effect simulation, Zhu Yi, who is responsible for weapon sales, is not at all agreed, but made a request. Everyone, 
Although these technologies are extremely precious, what our black light technology wants is not money, but long term development. At this time, Zhu Yi, wearing gold wire glasses, said to the high ranking federal officials, his voice was neither overbearing nor overbearing, I believe you have heard that, our black light technology has sent delegations to various continents and regions to seek further cooperation, so we can pay the bill in another way. Don't sell it, you don't need money for black light technology, what do you want? No money, is it for us? Make a quote, maybe we can cooperate further. The audience suddenly roared. Zui laughed. We are planning to establish branches in various continents for black light technology to conduct research and medicine approval in the local area. At the same time, we will also open the rehabilitation center with black light technology characteristics, so we don't need this money. We only need the official policy tilt behind you. Everyone is hearing this and face changed suddenly. I hope you want money. Someone was whispered suddenly and wanted to open the health center to the whole world. Now in the world, who doesn't know that the black light technology recuperation center has become a gold absorption cave? which is completely naked huge profits, and now it is necessary to favor local policies. What kind of wolf ambition is this? Everyone is secretly shocked, but if you think about it carefully, in fact, the business of black light technology has always been limited to Africa, and has never gone out, but even in the scarce area of Africa, let it develop to become such a corporate empire. If you let it stretch out its tentacles and take root in all parts of the world, what kind of huge monster will it become? I am afraid that within a few years, Blacklight Technology will become the world's number one company. Thinking of this, everyone did not want to agree to it immediately, but gave a reply that needed to be reported to the superior. Of course, Zui has no opinion. In fact, he also knows that this kind of thing cannot be rushed. These all are tasks assigned to him by Kian Wenhuan, and I heard that this task also means that. Nowadays, Blacklight Technology Headquarters CEO Xia Yin has led a public relations team of hundreds of people. Grandiose is looking for business cooperation all over the world. If he can play a strong assist here, the future will naturally be bright and the benefits will be great. Of there, when today's event is over, after he and Kian Wenhuan sent senior officials from various continents back to the hotel, Zui just prepared to say hello and immediately returned to his residence. When he had a good night's sleep, Kian Wenhuan stopped him. Up him. Money general? Zui looked towards Kian Wenhuan with some anxiety. I don't know if he did something wrong when he explained to the dignitaries of various continents during the day. Don't be nervous, because of the hundreds of millions of orders in the past few days, someone invited us to dinner. Kian Wenhuan walked to his car and the sturdy secretary next to him immediately opened the car door, but he did not at all enter, but moved towards Zui beckoned, get in the car, don't let others wait for us it's been too long, hey, shouldn't the celebration party be called to all the colleagues in the propaganda department, Zui took off his glasses and wiped them with his sleeve, a little puzzled, this is not a celebration banquet, it's just a celebration of that's all for us in advance, the celebration banquet can only be held when the other group of people leave, Kian Wenhuan explained, raising his eyebrows, what are you still doing, why don't you get in the car soon, oh, good, Zui got into the car obediently from the other side and sat in the back row with Kian Wenhuan, then there was an awkward silence, Zui not at all asks who invited himself to eat, and asks less and does more is the way to survive in the workplace, probably because Kian Wenhuan is looking for his subordinate to stop drinking, he has been in the workplace for so many years, of course he knows Duming, actually, Zui didn't really appreciate this boss who was much worse than his own at worst. The other party had no academic qualifications and had no image. He had heard people say that Kian Wenhuan was able to sit on this one. The position depends on the reason for following that early. In addition, I will be able to shoot flattery, and I have been sitting as the CEO of Blacklight Technology Africa Division for many years. It is said that it is the African branch, 
but everyone knows that the power of the CEO of this branch is much greater than that of the CEO of the headquarters. Even if it is nominally required to be under the command of the general manager Xiaoyin, in fact, Qian Wen Huan except for that, no one can look at it anymore. These thoughts flashed through Zui's mind, but of course he wouldn't show it. Instead, he became more respectful now. Xiaozu, how old are you this year? Have you gotten a family? Suddenly, Qian Wen Huan broke the silence, and looked at Zui Dao with a pleasant look. I have been 28 years this year and I haven't married yet. Zui laughed shyly, shook his head and replied, I just broke up with my girlfriend before going abroad, and I'll talk about getting married for a few more years. I didn't have a family at 28. When I was your age, my daughter was three years old. Gain Wen Huan sighed. He couldn't help recalling the scene four years ago. In fact, what he didn't say was that he met Chen Chen in 28 years and joined the black light technology at the same time. Then, his own the trajectory of life has changed. Mr. Kian, have your relatives also been taken over? Zui asked suddenly, I heard that many people have brought their relatives here. My wife and daughter are here, but my parents are not. Kian Wen Huan has no pretensions, and directly replied, my parents don't want to leave their hometowns and come abroad. I don't really ask for it, but it's okay. Anyway, our blacklight technology is already planning to build recuperation centers around the world. When the time comes, it's the same way you do recuperation, you don't need to go abroad. If you want to take your parents over, it's okay. Anyway, you have been allocated a house in the community and you know the public order here, as long as you don't leave the life sciences city, public order can be guaranteed, and as a relative of the employee, your parents also have priority to obtain the qualifications for recuperation, Zui was suddenly nodded, then the two were speechless all the way, until they came to the front of a five star level hotel in the center of the life science city, the vehicle stopped. Almost all people who can live here are rich and noble people from all over the world. Zuyi looked steadily forward and obediently followed Kian Wen Huen's side and back until Kian Wen Huen led him in. An edge private room on the second floor. The entire private room within the body is not big, only about 10 square meters in size. There is a round table in the center of the private room. There are always many dishes on the round table. These are not the points. The the real point is that there is only one person in the private room. This is a young man who is even younger than himself. At first glance, he looks very ordinary, but if you look closely, you will find that the other person has very unique eyes. That is a pair of pitch black as ink eyes, which are sharp, vast, and deep, like a bottomless abyss. It seems that as long as one glance at someone lifts the head. It is enough to sink anyone. This is a pair of eyes with magic. Looking at the appearance of this young man, Zui only felt that the other party seemed familiar. He subconsciously searched for the memory, but he was suddenly surprised. This young man turned out to be the legendary Yu Are Chen and Mr. Chen. Subconsciously, Zui suddenly blurted out, It's me. The young man lifts the head unexpectedly, he took a look at Zui, and then nodded, replied, I am more ordinary. If I am not an acquaintance, few people can recognize me at a glance. Are you really Mr. Chen? Zui took a deep breath, and only felt a tremor all over his body. He thought it was only other senior leaders of black light technology who were drinking with Kian Wenhuan, but absolutely didn't expect that the other party turned out to be Chen Chen, the founder of black light technology! Exclamation mark. Hearing Zui's nonsense. Chen Chen suddenly laughed. He pointed to the opposite seat and rushed to the two of them, What are you doing while standing? Sit. Good. Kian Wen Huan was not welcome, and took Zui to sit down. Until this time, Zui realized that his second question was really lacking. He suddenly became annoyed. Didn't expect the first time I saw the founder of black light technology, he made this mistake. Dot. For a while, Zuyi wanted to find a place to sew in. This is Mr. Zuyi, he is really a kind of talent, and your image is much better than the old Gain. However, Chen Chen didn't care about this. After the two of them sat down, he immediately teased. That's for sure. Gain Wen Huan didn't get angry when he heard Chen Chen's ridicule. Instead, 
he bitterly laughed, when I was at Preston Biotech, I was good at negotiating and selling, it's just the reason for this dignity that makes me my performance is greatly reduced, otherwise I would not be just a sales manager, Mr. Chen, you are overwhelmed, Zhu Yi also said hurriedly, and at the same time he raised his arm subconsciously, ready to find a drinking vessel and a wine glass to punish three glasses, but then he was dumbfounded, because besides the dishes, there were only three bottles of Sprite on the dinner table, and there was nothing apart from this, ha 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 ha, seeing Zhu Yi's actions, Kian Wen Huen suddenly laughed, Xiao Zhu, are you looking for a wine glass, no need, boss, he doesn't drink, and this is a foreign country, and there is no wine table culture, so relax and feel free, just eat, so that's how it is, Zhu Yi only took a bite of the dish to hide his embarrassment, this big half a month, you guys did a great job, Chen Chen didn't care about this, he just said casually, today I'm just looking for the old money, you can find out about the recent situation, by the way, I saw this high achieving student from the headquarters, there is nothing else, but 6 1 billion orders, it may be a lot for us, but it is actually just one hair from 9 oxen for each continent, speaking, Chen Chen thought for a while, I believe it is just an appetizer now, and the real big head will be in the next three months, indeed, Kian Wen Huen is also looking thoughtful, now all continents have designated the Mark QF series, after they confirm the superior performance of our XTN robot series, orders will spring up like mushrooms at that time, it's our harvest time, in fact, I don't really value these. What I really value is the policies that can be obtained after opening branches in various continents. Chen Chen nodded, so, I hope you will put more effort into various weapon technologies and strive for a more superior local policy, for which we can give up some of the benefits. Understood, understood. Yan Wen Huen and Zhu Yilian hurriedly agreed. Apart from this, there is one more thing I need you to do. At this moment, Chen Chen's expression suddenly became serious, he lowered his voice and said, I'm going to use Namibia as a test platform to implement XTN robots instead of police for law enforcement, so that XTN robots will be the first to enter civilian use, you prepare, so fast, Kian Wen Huen was surprised, is it too early, can the people accept it, so I need you to conduct a research, Chen Chen replied, and what is the result of the survey? I believe in your ability, Super USB Chapter 454, Super USB Chapter 454, to you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter, when I saw these four words, Kian Wen Huen couldn't help but was stunned, some did not understand what it meant, instead, Zui's expression flashed, Mr. Chen, what do you mean is that if the survey results are not accepted by the public police use robots to enforce the law, can we learn the methods in Robocop? Yes, that's what I mean. Chen Chen applauded, I want to build Namibia into an experimental platform and become a pioneer. As long as under the management of XTN robots, Namibia can become the country with the lowest crime rate in the world, who will resist my XTN robot, but, Zui suddenly hesitated and stopped, but, can Namibia agree to this kind of reform, Chen Chen laughed, did not answer, but turned to look towards Kian Wen Huen with a blank face, it seems that old money rarely watches Hollywood movies, there is no time, Kian Wen Huen shook the head, so what does the method in Robocop mean? This will involve the plot, Zui immediately explained. To put it simply, there is a company specializing in the production of military robots in the movie. This company is exactly the same as ours. Their products have been used in the army in large numbers, and the company has also made a lot of money. Dot. However, the executives of this company are not satisfied, they want more benefits, so they think of the civilian field, as long as law enforcement robots replace traditional police to fight crimes, their benefits will at least be reversed, several times, it's just that when the company wanted to promote this plan, it was unexpectedly strongly opposed by the public, most people believe that robots have no human feelings, do not understand the value of life, 
and cannot bring safety to humans. They can't trust the cold machinery, so they can't hand over human life to robots to judge. After thinking about it, Zui continued, however, despite the strong opposition from the public, the company still did not give up. So they thought of another way to satisfy the public's approval to find some disabled police officers and provide them for free. As long as the mechanized police officers can return to their posts and perform better than before, after seeing this result, the public can naturally accept robot law enforcement calmly. So that's how it is. Kian Wen Huen's eyes shinned, indeed. This is really a steady and steady method. Free mechanized transformation can promote the public welfare of the company, and the public has no reason to oppose it. After all, you can't say that he installed isn't it a human being with a mechanical prosthesis? After that, the reformed policeman will become a billboard. The better he is, the greater the impact on the public, but the only requirement is that it must be eye-catching. If the whole thing has never been paid attention to, that simply is meaningless. Not only that, the disability is not a general physical disability, because even if we help them install prosthetic limbs, these mild disability will only allow them to return to their posts, but they will not have the slightest impact on their business ability, so we need at least severely disabled police officers, preferably high position paraplegia, and even the more serious the injury the better. Only in this way will people count the police officers' accomplishments on our heads. Finally, Kian Wenhuen concluded, in short, the police officer who undergoes reformation is best known as a hero, and he must be seriously injured, so heavy that he needs to be replaced except for his head. All the organs outside must have heat and gimmicks. Only in this way can he become an excellent billboard and achieve the purpose of commercial promotion for our company. Hearing Kian Wenhuen's summary, Zhu Yi on the side was secretly surprised. He didn't expect to find out the key points of this plan in an instant even if he hadn't watched the movie Robocop. Sure enough, in this position, there are really two brushes. Before, I thought that the other party would only shoot flattery straw bags. Old money, the analysis is very good and I immediately grasped the key point. At this time, Chen Chen couldn't help but patted his hand and praised, if you only listen to what's behind you, who will not think you've never watched this movie, it's very good. Now what we have to do is match the movie the approach is the same, looking for a few spokespersons, and advertising effects, so that the public can agree that law enforcement robots replace the police law enforcement. In fact, this kind of police is not hard to find. Kian Wenhuen is not at all because Chen Chen's praise is complacent, but modestly said, it's not difficult for the African region to find this kind of extremely injured police. Can this kind of robot be transformed? Don't worry, we can all heal James Watson, not to mention ordinary injuries. Chen Chen and different expression, as for the modification of the human body, this is the business of the research department. Understand, I will give you a plan on Friday this week at the latest. Gain when Huen immediately nodded and agreed. Zhu Yi on the side was dumbfounded. He didn't expect that. Just sitting at the dinner table for just a few minutes, the two of them actually planned a huge plan for the entire country and even the entire Earth Federation. This efficiency is not any bloated listed group at all. Comparable. While Zhu Yi was deeply shocked, he could also understand that the reason why everything was decided so quickly was because all the rights of the entire company were concentrated in the hands of the young man in front of him. This is the power of centralization. Next, Zhu Yi was almost stunned at Chen Chen Gorge oneself. He thought that the table full of food was the luxury of the rich, but he didn't expect that when he left for dinner, all the dishes in that table were bought by Chen Chen. Belly and Kian Wenhuen is a strange look. After he left, Kian Wenhuen called Zhu Yi again and asked a special car to take Zhu Yi to the gate of his community. After a dinner, Zhu Yi's views on Kian Wenhuen changed a lot, and the two became familiar. I got in touch. Do you feel a little uncomfortable? On the way, Kian Wenhuen suddenly asked. It's a little bit, Zhu Yi replied. I used to drink alcohol in the workplace, and because I was young, I had to lie sideways almost every time. This time I saw Mr. Chen, 
but he didn't drink any alcohol, I was a little uncomfortable feel, it's okay, our company is still young and in a period of rapid development, depending on your ability, you can basically get promoted in 35 years, Kian Wenhuan said with a smile, when the time comes, you will slowly adapt, and at that time, you will also know a lot of secrets, it is possible that many things that you could not understand before will become reasonable, it should be, hearing these words, Zui's pupils shrank slightly, sure enough, there are many secrets in the blacklight technology, now I'm a weapon sales manager, but I'm still a bit short of the real senior, but even so, if some information about arms leaks out, it's enough to shake the society, then those only real senior what kind of startling heaven and earth, ghosts and gods weeping will the secret that I only know, Zuyi is very much looking forward to, dot. Gain when Huen waved his hand and said goodbye to Zuyi until he returned Zuyi to the gate of the community, looking at the back of Zuyi gradually walking into the community. Kian Wenhuan's expression has changed from mild to expressionless. Mr. Kian, you seem to be very optimistic about this. Sales manager, the secretary in the front row suddenly turned his head and asked, All right, young people are still very capable. Kian Wenhuan was nodded, it's just that there are some proud and arrogant, but people who come from college are like this, and I don't think much of my unorthodox. The secretary shook the head and didn't say much. Next. The first thing Kian Wen Huen did when he returned to his villa was to find the movie Robocop from the internet and watch it from beginning to end. Moreover, it's not like an ordinary person. Kian Wen Huen records every detail on paper and saves the screen as a screenshot at a critical moment. After watching a movie for four hours, Kian Wen Huen looked at the time. It was already one o'clock in the morning and there were more than five thousand words in his hand. But Kian Wen Huen not at all because the new version of Robocop is a movie produced in 2014, actually 30 years ago, there were three bosses Robocop, so Kian Wen Huen took a quick look at the old version of Robocop again, then he started writing the plan himself, when he went to work on the second day, Kian Wen Huen notified his team and gave the draft to everyone, and then began to discuss and delete the content of the plan, after three days in a row, Kian Wen Huen and his team discussed almost every night until the end of Friday. They finally finalized the plan, and Kian Wen Huen sent the 30 word plan directly go to Chen Chen's mailbox. At this time, Chen Chen sitting in the office immediately received the news. The old money was done so soon, Chen Chen leaned on the chair, swiping his right hand, and suddenly opened a holographic web page out of thin air on the empty desk and at the same time the mailbox automatically opened, revealing Kian Wen Huen's plan. Your godfather, this is Kian Wen Huen's plan. Xiao X's voice came directly from the audio. According to Kian Wen Huen's plan, first is the selection of the target. The target needs to be selected in this plan is a bit harsh. First of all, the identity of the other party must be a legal police officer in Namibia. This is a hard requirement. At the same time, the other party has three requirements, first, you must be severely ill, high paraplegia, secondly, he must be upright and upright, with a high sense of responsibility, and must have a strong obedience to orders to prevent the other party from being out of our control, and the protagonist in the movie must kill the company boss. Speaking of this, Xiao X said, Kian Wen Huen is indeed right, although we can use the god chip to control it, it is easy to turn around, so it is best to choose the target at the beginning. Then the third article, the target must be to get injured while fighting criminals. Only in this way can it be more conducive to shaping the image and triggering public opinion. Fourth, the target must have good facial features and an upright temperament. It is best to fit the identity of the police because the quality of the appearance is very important to the public's impression. The fifth and most important one is that the target's family situation must also be included in the investigation factors. If necessary, we can connect his parents, wives and daughters to the Life Science City to prevent unexpected outside the situation. Hearing these five, Chen Chen frowned, M. Has the taste of producer for all. According to Kian Wen Huen's meaning, in fact, it's best for the target's injury to be vigorous, 
so that we can promote his deeds. If possible, we can use the slogan of superhero to promote the target. Make him a super idol who does not lose the popularity of the international first line superstars. Little X continued. Yes, try the war too by the way. Maybe our black light technology can enter the entertainment circle in the future. Chen Chen snapped his fingers and said half jokingly and half seriously, These are the five requirements of the target. Only those that meet the requirements can become the training target of the plan. When Xiao X heard Chen Chen's words, he couldn't help but smile. Next is Qian Wen Huan's official plan. He divided it into 15 steps. It takes about two years to shape the goal into the perfect super British image makes him a criminal nemesis and a world class hero. Does it take two years? Chen Chen frowned, it's been too long. What is the budget given in the old money plan? The promotional cost is approximately $1 billion. Xiao X replied, that is to say, according to the plan given by Qian Wen Huan, including some special performances, only one billion US dollars will be required to create a world-round international superstar, then add it to three billion dollars. Chen Chen without the slightest hesitations replied, I hope I can make this time acceleration within one year. I am afraid it will be difficult. X shook the head, in addition to the means of throwing money. Word of mouth fermentation is also very important. Gain when Huen's plan contains these. After my calculations, two years are indeed the limit. Super USB Chapter 455. Super USB Chapter 455. To you can search for I have a super USB flash drive. Imiabaj imiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. The transformation plan proposed by Chen Chen was eventually named the Robocop plan. In the afternoon of second day, Chen Chen walked out of Zhu Lama's ministerial office, got into the car with a contented expression, and quickly left. At this time, on the balcony on the third floor of the Ministry of Resources building, Zuma looked at Chen Chen's back with a complicated face, speechless for a while. The climate has come, and the whole of Namibia, he has the final say. Looking at the car slowly moving away, Zerma was deep in one's heart at this time. Suddenly, he thought, if the businessman's car suddenly exploded at this time, would it be better for the Namibian government? Although black light technology will be messed up and cause huge economic losses, Namibia can also take the opportunity to receive a large amount of wealth and technology. This wealth is even enough to make Namibia surpass the rainbow country and reach the status of African hegemony. But in the next second, Zerma completely dismissed the idea, because he knows that once Chen Chen dies, in addition to the above mentioned situation, there is another situation that is more likely, that is, the Central Continent and North America will instantly take action to snatch Chen Chen's legacy assets, when the time comes packs of wolves ringed. Unless Namibia is willing to fight against these huge monsters, it can only reluctantly return these technologies to the Central Continent. Otherwise, whoever becomes president will die miserably. Even more how, if Chen Chen dies? Who will support his campaign? Who can sit on the throne of Namibia's president? So, this idea just flashed through Zulama's mind, and then disappeared again. At this time, Zulama's heart is extremely complicated. On the one hand, he hopes that his country can be self-reliant and independent, on the other hand, he hopes that he can stand on the top of power in Namibia, and these two options are incompatible. Thinking of this, Zerma could only close his eyes in pain, while taking a deep breath. When he opened his eyes again, he took out his cell phone and tried to check his bank account opened in Switzerland. Just now, under the name of this account, there has been an extra 30 million US dollars quietly. Seeing such a thrilling number, Zerma's eyes did not fluctuate. These money no longer made much sense to him. Perhaps a few years ago, this huge number would allow him to be wild with joy. But now, it can only attract him slightly. Immediately, Zerma closed the account, cleared all usage records, and finally turned off the computer. Dot. While Zerma was rushing around for Chen Shen's person reforming act, Qian Wen Huen had already started casting roles. At this time, Qian Wen Huen sat at the conference table boredly, 
watching his team continue to bring in a thick stack of documents from the police station. These documents have been piled up on the conference table by half a person, but still new materials have been continuously moved in. Mr. Kane, these all are information about the currently injured and disabled police officers in Namibia. Since 2000, they have all been here. An assistant came over silently and reminded in a low voice, there are 320 copies in total. Very good. Kane when when patted his hand, and suddenly everyone subconsciously lifts the head and looked towards this side. Everyone, I hope to be able to find out all the regulations that meet the options in the Robocop plan according to the requirements of the plan. Kane when when reminded, because it is the primary election, the conditions can be relaxed. After the number of qualified people is finally determined, we can proceed to the next step of screening based on the number of targets. Yes, I understand. Everyone replied scattered, and then picked up the stack of documents one by one, opened the envelopes and looked at them. The same is true for Kian Wen when he didn't give this task completely to the following. Instead, he screened together with everyone to find qualified personnel targets. In fact, those ages are a bit old, and they're basically in a state of giving up. First, it has been 25 years since 2000. The police officers who were injured and disabled at that time were at least 50 years old. Regardless of their ability to respond the reaction ability has dropped greatly, and coupled with years of disability, even if people can still move, they also lose the ability to continue handling cases. Therefore, what Kian Wen Huen focuses on looking for are those police officers who have been injured and disabled in recent years. Only in this way, the conditions are a bit too harsh. For the next hour, Kian Wen Huen read more than a dozen copies in a row, but none was satisfied. Either the other party was too old, or the other party was not disabled enough, but lacked arms and legs. Rarely, general paralysis occurs. However, after another thought, Kian Wen Huen was relieved. After all, Namibia's national strength is inherently weak, and neither medical treatment nor other conditions are guaranteed. The people are even more impoverished. Once there is a major casualty accident, those people are basically can't save. Even if they are saved, they will starve to death due to poverty and loss of self-care ability. Thinking of this, Kian Wen Huen is frowned and continues to look for it. Finally, an ID photo on the profile made him shine. It was a white race, wearing the uniform of a level 1 superintendent. His name was Brooke Humphrey, a native who moved over when the Germans colonized. He has brown hair and black eyes. Not the blonde and blue eyes unique to Caucasians, but his cheeks are as three-dimensional as Caucasians, with a high nose, deep eye sockets, and sharp like falcons. Eyes, and thin, sharp lips. This brook almost grew up with a righteous and or inspiring face. Although a bit rough, it was surprisingly pleasing to the eye. Immediately, Kian Wen Huen continued to look down. Brook is only 32 years old this year, and just two years ago, when he was 30 years old, he was unfortunately hit by a stray bullet in his spine during a conflict to arrest criminals. At that time, the situation was not at all so bad that he was paralyzed, but when he was sent to the hospital, the doctor made a major mistake during the operation, which eventually caused him to be completely paralyzed from the neck down. Yes. Young, good looking, well informed, and the injury is in line with the publicity plan, now only the two requirements of family and character are left. Seeing this, Kian Wen Huen suddenly became a little enraged. He took out a marker, marked the selected signal in this document, and then collected all the documents again. Kian Wen Huen's only concern is that two years have passed and he does not know whether this person is still alive. Next, Kian Wen Huen found a more suitable document from it, but unlike before, this was a black man. Actually, this black police detective named Bray Morton is only 25 years old, and his appearance is ordinary. Although the appearance requirements are a little bit worse, the opponent has a racial advantage. This cannot be ignored. His experience was even more frightening, because he was caught in an ambush by a D-dealer when he was arbitrarily following the D-product case. 
he was directly cut off his limbs and turned into a stick, but finally survived tenaciously, and all this is less than a year ago. Seeing this, Kian Wen Wen hardly hesitated, and directly included this document on the candidate list, even with a higher priority than Brooke before. Next, Kian Wen Wen sat quietly for more than half an hour, until he read all the 4050 pieces of information in front of him, and did not find one that met the requirements, either because the other party was old or injured, not heavy enough to make a fuss about these aspects. Stretched, Kian Wen Wen lifts the head threw the two materials into the center of the conference table, and said, I have selected two, you speed up, and after the election, select all the goal of sending me to my office. Speaking, he turned and left the conference hall. Next, Kian Wen Wen returned to the office and corrected several documents. It was not until the end of the morning that the secretary walked in with just seven or eight documents. Mr. Kian. The materials selected this time are all here, please have a look. Kian Wen Wen nodded, asked the other party to put these materials on the desk, and then took a copy and opened it up. This time is going to be much faster. After only ten minutes, he will read the seven materials selected by the crowd one after another. Then, Kian Wen Wen hesitated for a while, and finally kicked out the information of the two police officers who were the oldest among them. The two police officers were over 40 years old, although they were just entering middle age, still passed by Kian Wen Wen. Next, he removed a more abstract police officer, and a police officer who was only paralyzed in the lower body, but whose arms were still usable. In the end, in addition to the two materials he selected before, only one met the requirements. That was a man named Hodge. He was different from the previous two because he was chasing the culprit's vehicle. The collision caused the vehicle to roll over, which eventually caused a fire and caused severe burns to his whole body. This man named Hodge has lost all the skin of his body. At the same time, his hands and feet have been burned to charcoal, completely losing his physiological significance and even his five senses have been completely burned. Even, the burned part also included his trachea and lungs. Now he can only live in the intensive care unit and hang him forcibly. Looking at the date when the incident happened, it turned out to be only half a month ago. Seeing this, Kian Wen Wen couldn't sit still anymore. He stood up directly pa and said to the secretary, Go to inform the company's office in Windhoek asked him to immediately go to Windhoek General Hospital to find a patient named Hodge and tell the hospital that no matter how much money it spends, he must save the life of this patient. Then Kian Wen Wen thought for a while and added, by the way, I will inform the transportation department of the company that I need a private helicopter for a trip to Windhoek. Understood. The secretary understood immediately and he quickly walked out of the office. Looking at 30% of the information in his hand, Kian Wen Wen was caught in a dilemma. He wanted to choose Hodge directly, but the other two were also very qualified, so he thought about it, and simply put all three pieces of information. Take it, then get into the elevator, moved towards the top floor. When the people who were familiar with the road arrived at the top floor, Kian Wen Wen saw Chen Chen sitting in front of the floor tosling windows opposite the elevator because the entire top floor was an office. Old money, you are here. Chen Chen didn't seem to be surprised by Kian Wen Wen's arrival. He just stared at the desktop extremely seriously, as if looking at something that ordinary people couldn't see. Seeing that Chen Chen maintained a posture from beginning to end. Kian Wen Wen couldn't help being a little strange. He moved towards Chen Chen's table, but he was even more dumbfounded, because the position on the table where Chen Chen was staring was nothing. Nothing. Boss. What are you doing? Kian Wen Wen said in amazement. I'm looking at the micro world. Chen Chen not at all raised his head, but replied peacefully, there is a planet in front of me, and there are a group of stranger looking aborigines on the planet but the lifespan of these aborigines is extremely short. Also, because I am too big, they cannot see my existence, but I can look down at them and observe their lives silently. Kian Wen Wen opened his mouth again, but said nothing. He didn't quite understand what Chen Chen meant. If you speak human words, 
it means that I am observing the dust in front of me and a group of bacteria on the dust. Until this time, Chen Chen lifted the head, a smile was raised from the corner of his mouth and said, Old money, do you think there is an observer on our planet? The reason why we can't find he, maybe it's not that he is hiding, but we don't even have the power to discover him. But isn't it God? Kian Wen Huen is frowned. At this time, he was deeply influenced by the doctrine of God's forbidden zone, and had a completely negative attitude towards the existence of God. No, of course not God. Chen Chen shook the head, according to the Bible, God created this world, but the observer only observes. He is not responsible for creating, but it often represents destruction. Speaking at the end, Chen Chen suddenly stretched out a finger, pressed it lightly on the desk in front of him, and then wiped it back hard. When Chen Chen raised his finger again, a thin black mark had appeared on the desk in front of him. The dust was crushed by Chen Chen. Seeing this scene, Kian Wen Huen's expression moved slightly. Although he understood the meaning of Chen Chen's words, he did not understand Chen Chen's actions. Even more how? Can human beings really see microbes like bacteria with naked eye? Obviously, Chen Chen seemed to just talk casually. He didn't explain anything, but instead asked, has the candidate been decided? Not yet, there are currently three options. I am a little hard to choose, so I specially come to ask you the boss. Yan Wen Huen shook the head and took out all 30% of the information and placed it in front of Chen Chen. Immediately. He saw Chen Chen flipping through pages at a rate of two seconds per page. It only took less than three minutes to read all the information. It's just that this scene is accustomed to Kian Wenhuan, because every time he provides information to Chen Chen, the other party reads it so quickly. Not only can he finish it, but also the content on it is never forgetting. At this time, Chen Chen threw the three documents back on the table. He thought for a while and then said, these three are all in good conditions. In this case, why don't we let them form a combination? P. Super USB Chapter 456 Super USB Chapter 456 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. With Chen Chen's approval, the helicopter was ready. Kian Wen Huen went directly to the top floor got on the plane, and immediately flew to Windhook. More than an hour later, Kian Wen Huen saw the police officer Hodge, who was now living in the intensive care unit and was burnt to the shape of a human. Behind the glass, Kian Wen Huen, accompanied by the hospital dean, silently looked at the brightly lit intensive care unit, where there was only one person who was wrapped in a mummy, because of the burnt hands and feet. The man's arms and legs have been amputated. If you don't pay attention, you won't even be able to see that the person on the bed is alone. Mr. Kane, this patient is Hodge. At this time, the dean of Windhook Hospital was accompanied by Kane Wen Huen and exclaimed, He has been here half a month, and he is struggling with death almost every day. To be honest, he can live up to now. It has been a miracle. Is there no hope of cure on your side? Gain Wen Huen looked into the glass window with a calm expression. No, the patient's wound has started to deteriorate a few days ago. The dean shook the head. His external defense system has completely collapsed. The trachea is damaged, the lungs are damaged, and the internal defense system has begun to be on the verge of collapse. It is basically the matter of these two days. Anyone can pull him back from the death line. Kian Wen Huen glanced at the other person, but the dean was feigning ignorance, only chuckled. What do you plan to do, Mr. Kian? I would like to meet Hodge's family, please recommend Mr. Dean. Kian Wen Huen said solemnly. Well, the dean hesitated for a while and showed an awkward look. My side may not be very good. After all, this is the privacy of patients. As a company, if you. Before finishing speaking, Kian Wen Huen looked towards the secretary behind him. The secretary nodded, took out his mobile phone and dialed a call, and then said, Mr. Kian, Hodge's father is on his way to the hospital now. Minutes arrived. Go, let's go to see him on the first floor. Kian Wen Huen turned around and left, 
leaving only the dean with expression gloomy and uncertain and a group of doctors standing outside the intensive care unit. The hospital, the dean, a doctor stammered, let's go down too. The dean coldly snorted, following Kian Wenhuan, moved towards the first floor. There are only four lay buildings in the hospital. The ward as the Iku is located on the top floor and it only took two to three minutes to walk down from the fourth floor. Soon, Kian Wenhuan saw this Hodge's father at the gate. Hodge is only two fourteen years old. He is younger than the previous two eligible targets. Fortunately, he is the son of a wealthy white businessman in Windhoek. If he was just the son of an ordinary Namibian citizen, I am afraid that he could not afford to live in the intensive care unit, and he would have been buried at this time. According to the information, Although Hodge's father was a wealthy businessman, he was actually only slightly richer than ordinary people. This half a month's intensive care unit treatment almost made him unable to support. However, when learning about the arrival of blacklight technology and willing to treat his son for free, the white wealthy businessman finally showed a relieved expression despite his doubts. Mr. William, our blacklight technology already knows about your son's situation. If you agree, we can transfer him to the Life Science City to treat your son with all his strength, and even install the most advanced equipment on the market. His bionic prosthesis allowed him to return to the police post. The secretary next to Kian Wenhuan took out a drafted contract and handed it to the other party. The contract contains more than 50 pages, and there are over 1000 regulations. Looking at the contract in his hand. The white rich businessman seemed to understand something, he looked serious, just tell me, what is your purpose, and what do you need us to do? We are currently developing some new bionic technologies that require people to try them on, such people cannot be normal people, but disabled. Kian Wenhuan did not speak, and secretary side said directly, this is our purpose, and what you have to do is actually very simple that is to move to live in the life sciences city, but in order to make up for your loss, we will treat you subsidies for the relocation of people, we can also take care of them in business. I dot I need to think about it. The wealthy businessman opened his mouth, seeming to be a little excited, but still hesitant, I need to find a lawyer to help me see this contract. There is no time for Mr. William. The secretary suddenly increased the volume, righteously speaking. Hodge has shown signs of infection in the wound now. Do you know how long your son can last? He may not last for a day, you hesitate so much, do you think that our company still has any conspiracy? Then. All right. The wealthy businessman felt nervous, so he had to agree, and at the same time gritted his teeth and directly signed his name on the position of party B. At this moment, everyone from the hospital also arrived in front of Kian Wenhuan. Hearing Kian Wenhuan's secretary's persuasion, the director said with a gloomy expression, Mr. Kian, I'm afraid it's not possible, because Mr. Hodge can't bear the impact of the transfer. Do you think Hodge's injury can withstand four or five hours of bumps? There is no need to worry about Mr. Dean at this point. Our Life Science City eliminated ambulances as early as six months ago, and now we have been using medical helicopters. Kian Wenhuan said lightly, and then took the contract handed back by the rich businessman, and left the hospital with the secretary and bodyguard without looking back. President Kian, the Dean dares to stop us? Do you need me to send someone to teach him? As soon as he left the house, the secretary lowered his voice and asked. No need. Kian Wenhuan shook the head, this kind of people who are hostile to us is very common in Namibia. After all, we have seized a lot of resources and markets in Namibia. The locals naturally don't have a good face for us. Then let's forget it. The secretary nodded, relax. Forget it. Call the Minister of Health and let him find a reason to remove the director of this hospital. Kian Wenhuan waved his hand, calmly said, Secretary. A notice was given to Life Science City to send a medical helicopter to pick up the people, and Kian Wenhuan's entire group found the second target family. This is a low-rise bungalow on the outskirts of Windhoek. Although it is the capital, the suburbs of Windhoek are mostly bungalows built of stones. Although they are not as prosperous as the urban area, they are at least inferior to those in the slums. However, compared to the other bungalows along the way, 
This bungalow is undoubtedly more desolate, most of the red paint on the door has fallen off, exposing the bare door panels, and the doorway is even more messy. Obviously, life is unsatisfactory. Dot. Without waiting for Kian Wen Huen to get out of the car, the bodyguard who had been following walked down and knocked on the door of this house. About half a minute later, when the bodyguard was a little impatient and thought there was no one in the room, he finally heard a footstep from far and near, and then the wooden door opened with a creak. Zai's black woman appeared inside the door, and behind her, there were two four or five year old mulatto children. The two children poked their heads out behind the mother, looking at Kian Wen Huen and the crowd with some curiosity and fear. Let's find Mr. Brook. The secretary opened the mouth and said for Kian Wen Huen, don't you know he is at home? Please come in. The woman was stunned. Then she walked away and let everyone in. As soon as they entered the room, Kian Wen Huen and the secretary coincided with each other as frowned, because there was a pungent stench in the room, as if it was not a private house, but a public toilet. And it's the kind of dry toilet. Followed the woman to the innermost room. Finally, Kian Wen Huen and the others saw the goal of his trip, a plump, sloppy man. The color of the bedding under the man's body has long been indistinct, and he was lying on the bed like a mountain of meat lying there, completely lacking the hard lines and sharp eyes in the materials, and some were just dead. Numbness. What's even more frightening is that although the man's face and body are extremely plump, his limbs are atrophied like bones. At first glance, it looks like four toothpicks are stuck in a mass of flesh. Dot. Smelling the disgusting smell coming from the man, the secretary resisted the discomfort, opened the mouth and said, Mr. Brook, are we? We are from Blacklight Technology, this is our general manager Kian when Mr. Huan. The secretary waited for a while, but the man in front of him still did not respond. He had to continue, we want to sign a contract with you. If you agree, we can make a reform for you. Until this moment, the man still did not move, even his eyes did not move. He was like this a long time ago. Just when the secretary was not knowing what to do, the voice of the black woman suddenly came from behind a few people. Her voice was calm, as if talking about a stranger. I tried it, no matter what happens outside what happened, he didn't have any response, he was dead mentally dead. Kian Wen Huen glanced at the woman, then stepped forward and squatted directly beside the man's bed. Mr. Brook, I know you can hear our words, so we won't say more nonsense. If I say, can we make you stand up again? However, even so, the man still did not move. If it weren't for the other person to open his eyes and see the chest rise and fall, everyone would think that the other person was just a corpse. Seeing that the man still did not move, Kian Wen Huen finally shook the head and prepared to turn around and leave. However, when he turned around, a hoarse voice suddenly came from behind him. Is it true what you said? Of course it is true, Mr. Brook. Kian Wen Huen turned around and showed a meaningful smile, but the only requirement is that you need to sacrifice something. I have nothing to give up. Brook slowly lifts the head, as if something is trembling in the grey pupils, as long as I can stand up. I can give everything for it. A few minutes later, Kian Wen Huen and the others walked out of the room, because Brook easily signed the contract. Two of the three goals have been achieved, and then there is only one goal left. However, the remaining target is not in Windhook, the capital of Namibia, but in a small village far there away. So Kian Wen Huen took the helicopter again and moved towards Nihum village, a hundred kilometers away. This time, it took several people two hours to find the black detective named Bray. As a native of Namibia, this man named Bray has completely lost his mobility after being chopped off by the traffic AD. However, he did not at all sink and give up like the brook before, but found a new one. Work weaving straw ropes and fishing nets. With his flexible mouth, Bray can sit at the table all afternoon and weave a few meters of straw rope, of course provided that someone can put the raw material of the straw rope in front of him. With this job, he lives with his parents and has a job that can make a living. You guys are who, was the police sent me to solve my physical problems? Oh, please, how many times have I said that the police station please send me a woman, 
if it's a white younger sister, it's best, even if there's no white younger sister, black aunts are fine, but they do send me a group of big guys, damn, don't I have to keep my chrysanthemums, the dealer who chopped off my limbs let go of my cows, but you guys want to fuck my chrysanthemums, looking at the black man sitting on the stone bench with a row of straw ropes in front of him, Kian Wen Huen's secretary couldn't help being a little surprised, he didn't expect the other party's status, if he wanted to survive in a poor country like Namibia without his limbs, he would definitely need to support himself in addition to having a certain family property at home, but he didn't expect it, the other party was so optimistic, although it is full of swear words, everyone can tell that the man in front of him is not at all, I, I am, waiting until the black man in front of him talked about trap with his racial talent, the secretary came forward, when he was just giving the words to the organization, Kian Wen Huen patted his shoulder and said directly, Mr. Bray, we it's black light technology, not from the police station, so this is the case, no wonder it's not a group of niggers, the black man showed his white teeth, said with a laugh, so, what is the purpose of your oriental guys here, isn't it because I am a tourist attraction, the stinky guy next door does have this he discussed this with me, the ticket to visit me is ten dollars for one visit, and one time for a photo with me is twenty dollars but I think it shouldn't be boring for tourists to watch a street full of black people, the ghost is right, we do have other purposes, Kian Wen Huen laughed, did not respond to the other party's mouthful and just said, listening to your conversation, it seems that you are deeply affected by the American shadow transformation, then I think you should have watched a Hollywood movie, the name of the movie is Robocop, no, I haven't watched it, it sounds a bit like a superhero movie, Bray shook the head blankly, I have only seen one superhero movie, called Black Panther, dot. Super USB Chapter 457 Super USB Chapter 457 To you can search for I have a super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter, second day. When Chen Shen got up from Medbud 3000, he had already received news that three people had been transported back. Not only the three targets, but their families will also relocate to Life Science City within this week. Gain Wen Huen has arranged three suites for the three in a community in the city center. Seeing this, Chen Chen left the Minaret Laboratory directly after washing himself and returned to the Biological Research Center. The Biological Research Center also has its own independent ward, and it is far more advanced than the Life Sciences City Central Hospital. At this time, in a ward in the laboratory building, Chen Chen thoroughly saw the police officer named Hodge. At this time, Hodge has been stuffed into a life incubation chamber, and it is also filled with amniotic fluid. Hodge is suspended in the center of the incubation chamber with the mouth and nose connected to the whole body, a large number of pipes are like a baby that has not yet been born, and the all around of the life incubator has been surrounded by seven or eight expert surgeons, Mr. Chen, boss, boss, when Chen Chen arrived, the group greeted Chen Chen immediately, thanks for your hard work, Chen Chen nodded responded and said, the purpose of inviting you to come this time is actually very simple, it is to do everything possible to save the life of this police officer, I think it should not be difficult for you, it is not difficult to just maintain his life, the difficult thing is that he can abandon the life sustaining device and survive, a middle aged man of a ruddy complexion said, at present, his burns are too serious, anyone who experiences this kind of injury will die on the spot, but not only did he not die, but he was in the regular echo ward, it's been a miracle for half a month, it shows that the patient has a strong willpower and desire to survive, someone next to him was nodded and admitted, but this is also related to his strong enough physical fitness, I can hardly believe that his immunity is still working and has not been defeated by infected bacteria, now we have disinfected his whole body and stuffed it in a sterile solution to cut off the channels for bacterial reproduction, now his fortunes are saved, the middle aged man continued to speak, and now the first step we are going to do is to replace the lungs, 
60% of the patient's lungs have failed. We'd better go international and buy a DNA that fits him, transplant their lungs. This is not needed. Hearing this, Chen Chen replied immediately, the Xingxin project department has developed mature bionic organs, including bionic stomachs, bionic hearts, bionic lungs, etc. which can replace digestive organs, which can be used on Hodge first. Soon the people from the Xingxin project department will come over to connect with you. Thank God. This is really exciting news. Many doctors immediately shinned. Chen Chen's news is very exciting because the emergence of this technology means that in the future, it is very likely that some patients will no longer need to wait for an organ donor. After all, these people are only contract workers of black light technology. Although they are all internationally renowned professor level doctors, they are not members of God's Forbidden Zone, so they would not know that there were corresponding bionic organs as early as the Xingxin project was released. But Chen Chen felt it was too advanced so he cut it off. However, it has been a year since the launch of the Xingxin project. Now Blacklight Technology has successfully promoted to a legal arms dealer. In this case, some technologies that need to be hidden can be released without worrying. Coveted by various countries, because all continents and countries have regarded Blacklight Technology as a similar existence, rather than a piece of fat that everyone can fight for. Apart from this, we also need to use his DNA to cultivate the skin and graft him, otherwise he will not be able to leave the incubator. At this moment, someone on the side suddenly added, it will take about two to three months for the two sets to come down. When the time comes, it is the work of the bionic prosthetic design department. Chen Chen hearing this nodded, two to three months are still within the time frame he can bear. Seeing this, he found a reason at random and turned and left. In fact, if you use Medbird 3000, it can indeed heal Hodge's injury within a few minutes. Although their removed limbs will not grow back, they can at least leave the gates of hell instantly. But if this is the case, his healing process will become a mystery. In the future, Hodge may be the world famous Interpol, exposed to thousands of spotlights and every trace of his mystery will be explored. Chen Chen is naturally unwilling to leave her handle now. So Chen Chen has long decided to use traditional methods to treat Hodge, and his treatment process will be recorded every day, which will become evidence of his fight against the disease, and will be thrown out when Hodge becomes a Robocop in the future. Naturally can circle a large wave of fans. Next. Chen Chen came to the next door again and met two other targets Brook and Bray. Brook is spinal paralyzed and has not been maintained and maintained for many years. The nerves in his limbs have been completely atrophied and necrotic. Even if the god chip is installed, he cannot control his necrotic limbs to make him stand up again. Not only that, he is also accompanied by various complications such as liver cirrhosis, hydronephrosis, diabetes, and so on. So the first operation he came to Life Sciences City was to remove his necrotic limbs and hollow him out. The liver on the abdomen and the kidney on one side, plus a liposuction operation. And the best situation is mine. Because Bray relied on his flexible mouth and tongue to weave straw ropes all the year round, his mouth was extremely flexible. He even boasted that he could bend down and bite himself, but because of this he suffered a serious cervical spondylosis and needed a corrective operation. Dot. At this time, both of them were wearing hospital gowns and sitting in wheelchairs, and in front of them was an attending doctor in charge of the matter. Several people not at all noticed the arrival of Chen Chen, but only heard the doctor say, Mr. Brook, in the next operation, we will amputate your limbs and also need to remove your kidneys, because they have lost their function in recent years. The doctor showed a regretful look, but please rest assured, we naturally have an alternative method. After the new organ is replaced, your body will be healthier than before. Then use our bionic prosthesis and we will let you I stood up successfully. However, no matter what the doctor said, the man named Brooke just collapsed in the wheelchair and did not move at all. But at this time the doctor also knew that Brooke had heard clearly, 
but he was just unwilling to respond. This is a type of post-traumatic stress disorder caused by a huge blow. But Bray next to him couldn't sit still anymore. He glanced at the fat brook with harboring malicious intentions, and then sighed, Man, you're depraved with such a blow. You are a thinker. What are you meditating on? Are you praying silently in the heart like a little girl? Speaking, Bray followed the woman's expression of pity, and at the same time said in a high-pitched voice, God come and save me, save me, I'm trapped under this skin and can't move, who come and help me, I want to stand up, I want to run run, bitch, run. Ah, the attending doctor showed an awkward expression, Mr. Bray, your body is very healthy, the only thing is that you have a cervical spondylosis. We only need to perform an operation on you to correct it. These operations are free, right? Bray lifted up and asked quickly, after all, I don't have money to pay back. If I have to pay back, I think I can become a toy for those rich women. Have you ever heard of humanoids? I'm ready. Yes. And I'm very hard. The gay guys in our village call me Granite Brother. Enough is enough, enough. The doctor raised his hand, made a pause gesture, and pressed his inner anger, stop. Mr. Bray, I, our blacklight technology will spend hundreds of millions of dollars to build a set of panther armor for you. As a result, you now want to be a, would you please respect our profession? Please buddy, don't you want to try it? Bray is not ashamed but proud. He was just about to say something, but he saw Chen Chen side by side somehow, it's another oriental guy. Hey buddy, you think what I said makes sense right? It makes sense, so what name do you plan to name your armor? Chen Chen stepped forward, said without thinking, granite or panther? This. Bray was dumbfounded, and was caught in a dilemma. Mr. Chen. The attending doctor greeted immediately, why are you here? I just take a look, you don't care about me. Chen Chen waved his hand and sounded aside. Next. The attending doctor explained a series of matters needing attention to the two. Brooke was still as dead as a dead man. Even if Bray on the side didn't respond anyhow, Bray kept talking. The yellow joke caused the attending doctor to furious. Seeing this, Chen Chen also didn't know whether to cry or laugh, because he understood that this Bray psychology also has a big psychological problem. Just concealing that's all under the cheerful appearance and that picture will always stop the mouth that does not come down is the best proof. It's just that Chen Chen can help them treat their physical injuries, but they can only rely on them for psychological injuries. In the end, more than an hour passed before the attending doctor asked the nurse to push them down. Leaving the experimental building, Chen Chen just walked out the door and saw the silhouette of Xiao X. At this time, Xiao X was wearing a new white dress squatting on the lawn outside the door, holding his chin with both hands, obediently waiting for Chen Chen to come out. Chen Chen has become accustomed to the fact that Xiao X uses this body to run around. Not only he, but even the black light technology is also aware that there is a 1516 years old girl around Chen Chen, and the authority is extremely high able to get in and out of any place. As for the real identity of this little girl, no one knows it. Even Kian Wenhuan, who has the highest authority in the life sciences city, doesn't know, only that she is a younger sister recognized by Chen Chen and she is also a knowledgeable scientific research genius. When Chen Chen appeared, Xiao X immediately smiled with joy, and ran to Chen Chen in three or two steps, turning around like a butterfly. Godfather, do you look good in my new clothes? Chen Chen took a casual look and said perfunctorily, it's okay, it looks no different from before. Oh, Xiao X suddenly became a little frustrated, and then said, my Godfather, I have simulated the results of the surgery. I think Brooke and Hodge need a more thorough remodeling operation, which can not only shorten the time, but also make Hodge now get rid of the risk of death. Chen Chen immediately refreshed nodded and said, talk about it. Didn't Hodge burn his whole body? Not only did he lose his skin, but even his muscles were burned out, so I think his body is no longer necessary to save. Xiao X tilted his head and said, we can amputate Hodge's neck all the way down, which saves time for him to recover completely. Anyway, with our current technology, 
even a single head can sustain life. Brook and Bray are the same, they will have the strongest battle strength only when all the organs in their bodies are replaced with artificial ones and only one brain is retained. This is indeed the best choice. Chen Chen laughed, and immediately explained, but we have to consider more than these, apart from this, we also have to consider a very important thing humanity, don't forget. We will need them to stand under the spotlight of the whole world in the future. When the time comes, everything about them will be revealed. If someone broke his case, when the time comes the whole world don't you all know that we have cut off his body parts privately for profit. This is to give someone a handle. Speaking of Chen Chen shook the head, half open place said with a smile, so we try not to set back on these issues. And don't forget how the company's bosses always die in the movie Robocop yes, I don't want to repeat the same mistakes. Well, little X shrug, pouting, replied, then just follow the doctor's plan, but it will cost more money, and you will also need to design their unique armor. This will cost it's even bigger. It doesn't matter, just let it go. Chen Chen encouraged. Don't forget. What we need now is long term investment. This is a very abstract thing, but you should understand that just like your profit system, human vision for the future belongs to a kind of profit system, but without your precision that's all. Yes, following the conversation between the two, Chen Chen and Xiao X return to the Blacklight Technology Headquarters building. Next, there is a long wait, waiting for the three people to be transformed and then reappear in front of everyone. Although the three were transformed by Blacklight Technology and signed a large number of agreements with Blacklight Technology, but for the sake of justice, the identity of the three is still the police of Namibia and is not affiliated with Blacklight Technology, because Blacklight Technology is only a private enterprise, not at all local law enforcement powers, these only have the police. Super USB Chapter 458 Super USB Chapter 458 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. This is a three bungalow located in the Windhoek Villain area. The towering European style buildings, the grassy courtyard, and the iron fence with gold trim in front of the door all tell the great value of the owner of this bungalow. In Namibia, this room undoubtedly represents the identity of the master. At this moment, Hodge is looking at everything in front of him in confusion. This is his home. He doesn't remember when he came to the door, nor why he stood here. In his memory, he seemed to be hit by a vehicle while driving after several murderers. Right. Then, there was a whirl of heaven and earth. Hodge subconsciously took a deep breath, but suddenly he smelled a pungent scorching smell, something seemed to be burned, but when he looked around, he found that there was nothing. There is no fire, nothing burned. Am I rescued? Hodge looked at all this in confusion. He didn't remember when he appeared here, or even how long he stood in front of his door. It seemed that he had just arrived home, and it seemed that he had been standing for a long time. Dot. Just when Hodge was a little weird, he saw his door slowly opening through the iron fences outside. A stern middle-aged man appeared behind the door and he looked at Hodge in his eyes. There is expectation and disappointment. Father. Hodge hurriedly beckoned to the other party, then directly opened the fence door and walked quickly into his home. Father. I am back. Hodge loudly said, but he was taken aback before he finished speaking because he discovered that his father had disappeared at the door for some time. Not only that, all his relatives were gathered at home, a piece of inner the frenzy atmosphere is like having a party. Jenny, is it a holiday today? Hodge asked a babysitter next to him, but the other party didn't even look at him, and walked directly by him. Hodge yelled, but the other party still ignored him. Okay, Hodge spread out his hands and made a helpless move, but then he saw his mother and grandmother clustered together, walking towards this side. Hey, mother, what happened at home? Hort showed joy on his face, as if he moved towards his mother and asked like a child, but the next second, he watched the two pass by him. What surprised him even more is that not only his mother, but even the grandmother who loves him most, it seems that he does not exist. The joy on Hodge's face suddenly solidified 
and he gradually realized something was wrong. I don't know when, the room was faintly filled with smoke, with a pungent burnt smell, which made it difficult for Hodge to breathe. He coughed, and at the same time an inexplicable panic overflowed. Why can't everyone seem to see themselves? With this thought, Hodge was about to go to his father to confront him desperately, but he saw his father suddenly wearing a dress and leading a girl in a wedding dress to the living room. The moment he saw the girl, he was immediately stunned. Ah, Amanda. Hodge looked at each other blankly, and the girl in front of her wore a white and gorgeous wedding dress. Her temperament was ethereal and pure, just like a pearl in the sea. The girl is not someone else, she is her own fiancé Amanda. My son, today is your wedding day. Don't you remember? The father's voice was thick and loud. He showed a slight smile, and finally looked towards Hodge's direction. I'm proud of you, son. Following his father's words, Hodge's mother, grandmother, and even a group of relatives appeared all around in the living room, clapping and applauding. For a while, the room was filled with a warm atmosphere of joy. Father. At this point, Hodge finally settled down, he showed a hearty smile, it turned out that everything just now was a prank for himself by his family, the solemn music gradually floated in the air, with the blessing of everyone, the girl in the wedding dress moved towards Hodge step by step, with a shy blush, slowly in the hazy smoke of the house he took Hodge's hand, then, with the crowd watching, Hodge and the girl performed a western ballroom dance, at this moment, a huge sense of happiness surrounded Hodge, he closed his eyes intoxicated, and only hoped that the world will stay forever in this brief moment. He is smiling, maybe he has a good dream, preparing to lift the drowsiness protection state, he has had this dream for three months, it is time to wake up, start to reduce dopamine, start the electric shock device prepare for electric shock. Just when Hodge was surrounded by endless happiness, suddenly, his all around faintly heard a series of conversations. This voice seemed to be right in front of him, and it seemed to come from a distance. In short, with his dreams very uncoordinated, what's going on? Hodge subconsciously eyes opened, but he was taken aback, because he found that the girl in front of him had disappeared some time ago, and at the same time, there were also the relatives in the room who were blessing him. Father, mother, grandma, and Amanda. Everyone, all disappeared. No, no, this is not true. The smoke in front of Hodge's A's became more and more dense, almost blocking his sight. He subconsciously wanted to escape this weird room, but found that at some point, his home began to fill with endless fire. Hodge looked desperately at the flames quickly surrounding him and at the same time the burnt smell reached peak, and there was a sudden sting. The tingling came from his abdomen, as if he had been shocked by an electric shock, and there was a burning tingling sensation in his abdomen. Ah! Ah! At this moment, Hodge suddenly roared loudly. His voice was extremely painful, as if everything had burst out in this brief moment. The patient has woken up. At this time, in a sterile laboratory full of high-tech equipment, Several doctors are looking solemnly at a person lying on a special instrument in front of them. This person has only a bare head exposed, and his body is covered by a set of matte black armor. The gaps in the armor bite each other, but according to the structure of the human body, it presents the shape of chest muscles and abdominal muscles. Kind of violent beauty. If you look at his face, Chen Chen can immediately recognize that he is Hodge who was burned before. However, at this time, Hodge's skin and facial features have been completely repaired. Not only that, but his hands and feet have also reappeared on the body. The only dissonance is that his hands and feet are the same as his body. Wrapped in a layer of black armor, there is one after another red and blue pattern on it, just like some kind of artwork. However, at this time, Hodge was lying on a special instrument made entirely of metal, and at the same time he kept roaring and the sound was deafening. What's the matter? He is out of control? The timing of waking up is wrong. The patient is releasing too much adrenaline. At the same time, the blood pressure is rising rapidly, ready to inject a tranquilizer. No, wait a minute. Just when the nurse was about to follow the doctor's statement, 
a middle-aged hair gray white doctor suddenly spoke up and saw him solemnly said, don't interfere with him, let him vent first. Physiology is good. Obviously, this doctor has a very high status even among many authoritative experts. As he spoke, everyone fell silent. Hodge Raw took a full half a minute, and then stopped completely when he was completely out of breath. He gasped heavily and opened his eyes blankly. You woke up. A group of doctors quickly gathered around and looked towards Hodge, showing unconcealed joy, as if the sculptor was looking at a perfect sculpture that he had worked hard to create. This dot where is this? Hodge looked at the people above his head with a little horror. He subconsciously wanted to sit up, but he realized that he couldn't move a finger. Not only that, there was a lot of unknown data on the table, as his goal moves, these squares in the eyes are still changing, are you still dreaming, your current location is the biological research center of life science city under black light technology, the middle aged man with a hair grey white smiled kindly, we are your chief physician and designer of bionic prostheses, my name is Sheridan Todd, you can call me Dr. Todd, what happened? Why can't I move? Hodge asked suspiciously, also, why can't I feel my body? Please relax, Hodge, Dr. Todd replied slowly, trying to get Hodge into his own rhythm of conversation, your body is still there, but something has happened. A little problem, but it's okay, it's fixed now. However, we still need to do some tests before letting you resume action. For example, do you remember your last memory? The last memory, Hodge's expression is empty, he silently recalled the fragments before he woke up, but after thinking about it, there are only the bits and pieces of dreams in his mind, but how he got here is long ago, forgot, I forgot, Hodge shook the head, it's okay, Dr. Todd showed a look of sighed in relief, this is just a type of post-traumatic stress disorder, it is not a bad thing for you to forget these, but on the contrary, it is a good thing, at least it delays and lowers the second level of your heart, injuries, so what are you trademark talking about, what happened to me trademark, but even after hearing these comforts, Hodge not only didn't feel at ease, but felt very angry, he began to yell, and at the same time began to struggle with his head, seeming to want to sit up, don't get excited, we will tell you what happened, but not now, Dr. Todd waved his hand, and suddenly all other doctors and medical staff retreated towards all directions, Hodge, don't struggle anymore, we disabled the activity function of the XTN 118 police bionic armor, you will struggle again, it's useless, but if you are willing to calm down, we can make a discussion and help you unlock your mobility, hearing these words and seeing everyone's attitudes, Hodge took a deep breath, suppressed his increasing tension, and tried to reduce the heartbeat frequency, very well, that's it, calm down, Dr. Todd spoke slowly and looked towards a medical staff next to her, the female nurse responded immediately, she took up the tablet in her hand and said, the patient's heartbeat and blood pressure are rapidly decreasing, at present, the heartbeat frequency is 120 beats per minute, and it is still decreasing, it has been reduced to 80, no, it is 75 beats per minute, very good, seeing this, Dr. Todd was finally satisfied and nodded, he walked slowly in front of Hodge, and put his hand on the instrument where Hodge was lying down, where there was a red button, Director Todd, will this, the other attending doctors hesitated a bit, but subconsciously stopped, will there be an accident, he is also a human, and a qualified police officer, he will not hurt us, Dr. Todd shook the head seriously, then turned his head and looked towards Hodge, I want to release you now, speaking, before Hodge could speak, Dr. Todd pressed the button decisively, Kaka, scoff, with the sound of something being unlocked, and even the sound of a valve deflating, Hodge only saw two rows of probes being pulled out automatically between his ribs, and his body suddenly won loose, the next second, Hodge stepped forward and sat up directly from the instrument, suddenly, except for Dr. Todd and a few doctors in front of him, everyone in the entire laboratory took two or three steps back subconsciously, and their gazes looking towards Hodge were full of alert, that kind of gaze, it's like not looking at a human, 
but some other species. Seeing this scene, Hodge lowered his head and looked towards his body until he found out that he was actually wrapped in a layer of black armor from head to toe. Not only that, as he extended the hand and curiously touched his body, he magically produced a strange sense of touch. This kind of touch is slower than his original body, but it is unexpectedly sharp in details. What is this? Hodge slowly lifts the head, looking at Dr. Todd solemnly asked, you put on me a suit of armor? Is this an April Fool's Day spoof? A tribute to Iron Man? Or a steel frame? None, we are saving your life. Dr. Todd spread out his hands with an excited expression, you were in a car accident and almost died from a serious injury, but our black light technology has saved you, allowing you to survive the almost mortal injury, you do you know? On hearing Dr. Todd's explanation, Hodge fell silent. The chaos of his brain from the very beginning gradually became clear. It was only then that he slowly remembered that he seemed to be chasing several murderers in a police car, but because he was hit by the other side's car, it caused the vehicle turned over the road. What happened then? His memory was blank, as if someone had deleted his memory. The only thing that cannot be forgotten is the pungent burnt smell and the thick smoke that fills the eyes. Ah! Hodge suddenly let out a scream, which seemed to touch something in the depth of one's soul. He slumped to the ground with his head, convulsing uncontrollably. Director, the patient's blood pressure is starting to rise again. His ache has entered the peak stage and is still improving. We can't control him. Inject a tranquilizer. Seeing that Dr. Todd finally stopped hesitating, he gave the order to inject a tranquilizer. In the next second, under Hodge's invisible armor layer, a needle quickly popped out and pierced Hodge's body directly. At this point, QO Genius gradually calmed down and fell asleep again. Immediately, Hodge's body moved on its own. He climbed back to the special instrument like a bed behind him and stuck it tightly with the groove under him. Looking at this scene, Dr. Todd couldn't help sighed, and then said with satisfaction, at present, the patient's physiological indicators are all qualified, and there is no problem with the XTN-118 police bionic armor. Next, wait for him to wake up. After calming down, Let's calculate again. Everyone was hearing this, and they all cheered. The three-month results were not in vain. Super USB Chapter 459 Super USB Chapter 459 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. I don't know how long it took, when Hodge opened his eyes again. He had gradually accepted reality. The famous black light technology he certainly knows, and he also knows the existence of Xinction Project, which is a bionic prosthetic project developed by black light technology last year. Then the rest is easy to infer he had some accident in the chase, so I came here. But this also means that some very bad conditions have appeared in my body. In front of him is still the pure white clean and transparent laboratory. The light in the laboratory is so bright that it makes people dizzy. But for this discomfort, his eyes do not feel any, even looking directly the light source has no effect at all. Director, the patient is awake again. Before he could think about anything, another woman's voice came from the side. He wanted to turn his head to look but found that his body was still unable to make any actions. Hodge, the familiar voice came, and Dr. Todd's face appeared in his field of vision. The other party lowered his head and looked at him kindly. Did you sleep well this time? Tell me, what happened to me? Hodge swallowed and solemnly asked, why can't I act by myself? Why should I wear this damn thing? What happened to me? Dr. Todd was silent for a while, and then looked at Hodge's body data, and then replied, sooner or later you need to face reality anyway. If you can stay calm now, I can let you take a look. You will understand afterwards. But are you sure? Yes, I'm pretty sure. Hodge was a little excited and nodded, I want to know everything. Seeing this, Dr. Todd stopped talking. He just pondered for a while, and then said to the assistant next to him, get ready ready to disassemble the XTN-118 police bionic armor. Speaking, he suddenly waved his hand, and the waiting virtual screen appeared directly in front of Hodge, 
so that Hodge could see the whole picture of his body without having to sit up. Up to this time, Tuo Genius saw his current body for the first time. In his eyes, he is now wrapped in a layer of pure black armor. This suit is tightly stitched and even his fingers are apt. At the same time, there is a perfect ergonomic streamlined shape, which seems to be synonymous with violent aesthetics. It looks cold and murderous. As an embellishment, there are red and blue fluorescent lines on the armor, which is the exclusive color for police use worldwide. Puo Kaiming remembers that his body is definitely not so good. This suit looks like he has a height of 1.9 meters or more and his hands are long and legs are in line with the golden ratio of the human body. The muscle feel is just right, inverted triangle. Her figure is neither too bloated nor slender. This armor seems to be quite higher than myself, Puo Kipyang said with a smile. Until now, he still had some unrealistic illusions. It is normal, after all, it is not your original body. Dr. Todd glanced at him slightly. Kyoki's heart sank before he had time to ask again. Suddenly, a few manipulators rose automatically from the place he was lying down. These manipulators, like the fastest workers, began to dismantle his body quickly. The legs, then the arms, and finally even the small half of his lower body was removed. When he saw this, Hodge was already short of breath. His eyes widened. He looked at the screen in front of him incredulously, and muttered, God, this is not true. Sorry, this is indeed true. Todd regretted. You may have forgotten the situation at the time because of the traumatic stress effect. You were in a car accident. Your body was burned to 100%, and your limbs were burned to coke. For this reason, the local hospital I had to undergo an amputation operation. Now whether it is your eyes, nose, mouth or skin, we have recovered after a long period of repair. Hodge has been paying attention to his body until he heard Dr. Todd's words, and he subconsciously looked towards his face. This look immediately made him eyes shrank, only to see that his face had already changed. The whole head is bald, neither the eyes nor the nose look a bit like me, but a stranger. No, damn, damn. Damn, Hodge murmured with his lips trembling. But the disassembly not at all was completed. After his limbs were dismantled, the other two manipulators suddenly moved up and began to dismantle Hodge's chest armor at the fastest speed. When the abdomen and chest armor was removed, finally, Hodge finally saw his whole picture. Looking at the monster wrinkled and wrinkled on the screen like a stick, Hodge was completely stunned. We transplanted you a set of bionic lungs implanted bionic tubes, bionic eyeballs, and performed anal reconstruction surgery on you. It's a pity that we can't do anything about your reproductive function. Dr. Todd sighed, I know it's hard to accept, but, let's face it. Hodge closed his eyes slowly. He gritted his teeth and didn't want to look anymore. When Dr. Todd saw this, he removed the virtual screen in front of him, and said, you can take a break first, and then we will bring you food to let your stomach gradually recover. After all, you have I slept for three months. Then, you need to cooperate with us to conduct various data tests. If the tests pass, you can return to the police post, or even return to your own life. Please let me die. However, just as Dr. Todd was talking about the next plan, Hodge spoke suddenly. His voice was dead gray, slowly said, Please let me die. Please. Hearing this, Todd paused, he shook the head, and his expression gradually became serious. Listen, child, I know how desperate you are now, but please believe me, blacklight technology is capable of bringing you back. Yes, would you believe it? Blacklight technology has done a lot of impossible things, such as using stem cells to make people young again just like me, you may not believe it. In fact, I am 7 and 13 years old. Similarly, maybe in the near future, stem cells will be able to grow independent organs, such as a hand, a leg, or even. Dr. Todd paused, continued, you may have to wait 5 years, or 10 years, or even longer, but you have to understand that now that lifespan generally begins to artificially extend humans will slowly obtain a more long-lasting lifespan. This is a policy that the whole world is pursuing, 
especially those developed continents. They are eager to extend the technology of the aging reversal treatment project to everyone in their country, so as to alleviate the aging phenomenon to alleviate the human crisis. So, you can wait until that day, even in the past 10 years and 20 years, don't worry because the lifespan of human beings will be greatly extended in general, and it is a high quality young life, rather than old age. Slow lifespan, trust me, this day will come sooner or later, when the time comes, you can regain the ability of limbs and even reproduction with biotechnology. On hearing Dr. Todd's words, Hodge opened his eyes, his eyes were full of movement, and he looked towards Todd with hope, are you true? Of course it is true. The bionic prosthesis is just a transition. After all, no matter how good it is, it cannot replace the human body. Therefore, this is an inevitable development direction of technology, Dr. Todd kindly said with a smile, and I can promise you that blacklight technology has been studying the technology of directly cultivating stem cells into complete organs. It will not be too long before completion. Hearing these words, Hodge seemed to have ignited the flames of survival. He was nodded, as if he had made an agreement with Dr. Todd, and then said again, let me take another look. Good. Dr. Todd agreed, and then the virtual screen appeared in front of Hodge. In the screen, he was lying on a bed-like instrument, and behind his head, there seemed to be several wires connecting with. This is a nerve conduction line. Dr. Todd seemed to know what he was thinking and said directly, they go directly into your cerebral cortex, read your consciousness, and transmit these signals to your limbs to replace your spine to work, so that you can get active. I remember a few months ago. Didn't a VR brain control technology appeared? It can directly receive signals from the brain. Hodge frowned and asked, That's just an external brain computer interface, there is still some delay. Dr. Todd lightly said with a smile, It's okay to play games, but it doesn't mean it can be used for combat. It's like a wireless mouse, no matter how sensitive it is, it cannot be compared with a wired mouse. Apart from this, the anti-interference ability of wireless cannot be compared with that of wired, so please rest assured that we are not trying to do anything in your brain. Hodge did not continue to ask questions. Seeing this, Dr. Todd gestured to the side. Suddenly, pieces of black armor returned to Hodge's body like piles of wood. Soon Hodge became a full body armor again. Looks like, I release you now, you should also try to control this new body. Dr. Todd said, Seeing Hodge nodded, he pressed the button again. Suddenly Hodge only felt his body loose and his body regained control. He sat up slowly, and at the same time there was a mechanical turning zizi sound within the body. Hodge raised his hand blankly, looked towards his hands, and touched various objects around him. This kind of special touch is directly passed into the mind. This set of XTM 118 police bionic armor on your body is made of carbon fiber ceramic composite material, which can resist trifle shooting within 10 meters. Excellent impact resistance can also protect your body and internal organs from the impact of bullets. Dr. Todd stood in front of Hodge and said with a look of appreciation. You can even jump from a height of 10 meters without worrying about being hurt. This suit comes with support. The system can also automatically adjust the center of gravity in midair to protect your head from landing. This kind of touch, Hodge murmured, it's amazing. So you meant this, Todd replied. We used nanobionic neuron technology to make this armor sense pressure and touch like skin. If your armor is damaged, you can also sense the pain in the corresponding part. So you in order to better judge whether the opponent's attack is dangerous, then what's in front of me? Hodge lifts the head. He stared at Dr. Todd. In his sight, Dr. Todd was drawn out of a box. Not only that, but a row of data popped up below, including Dr. Todd's height, weight, heartbeat, blood pressure, body temperature, etc. This is the ability of the bionic eye that we installed for you, Dr. Todd replied. It is equipped with a combat system, which can estimate a lot of data, including analysis of weapon data, enemy threats, etc., and even photography and video playback functions. When you catch criminals, 
you will I know how convenient this system is. Hearing these words, Hodge just shook the head, and at the same time he started to support the equipment under him with both hands and slowly stood up. Be careful, it may be a little uncomfortable to walk for the first time. Dr. Todd took a few steps back, watching Hodge stand up like a toddler, and then slowly stepped out. One step, two steps, three steps. Just a few steps away, Hodge's posture gradually became familiar from the very beginning. Very well, it seems that you are very suitable for this body, Dr. Todd encouraged, it's perfect. As Hodge tried to walk, he looked at all around uncomfortably. At this time, he had discovered that this bionic armor was indeed much taller than the previous self. He was only 1.8 meters tall. Now it is at least 1.9 meters, and when he came to the mirror, he realized that the armor was really beautiful. Seeing the other party's self-observation, Todd couldn't help shook the head. He wouldn't tell Hodge that the reason why this suit is so beautifully designed is to catch criminals, and more importantly, to use this image to the outside world. Promote. In other words, Hodge and the others are actually more like a face-saving project. Their real combat capability is not even comparable to an ordinary XTN-003 military robot, but their cost and maintenance price are XTN-003 ten times or even dozens of times. At this moment, the doorbell of the laboratory rang suddenly and Dr. Todd looked subconsciously at the surveillance screen at the door, only to see two other Robocops similar to Hodge were already standing outside the door. The black man named Bray even had a cream cake in his hand. Child, it seems that your friend came to see you, Dr. Todd said with a smile. Who are they? Hodge also saw the two people on the screen. He was frowned and didn't know what he was thinking. They are the same as you because they are in a situation similar to yours because of the fight against crime, and then they are treated by us, Dr. Todd replied, and then said, since your friend has come to see you, then you should also go out, come with me now, speaking, Dr. Todd put down his work and walked out of the laboratory first, Super USB Chapter 460, Super USB Chapter 460, to you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter, in a desolate small county in Africa, four men wearing black stockings and AKM rifles raged in the only bank in the city, several customers hugged their heads and huddled in the corner, while two men gathered around an iron door leading to the inside of the bank's business window. Everyone raised their hands, come on, whoever is not obedient, I will shoot him in the ass. The people inside listen, open the iron door for me now, or I will kill the hostages. Kang Dang, the bank manager had no choice but to open the iron door. Then, with a loud kick of the iron door, the iron door was kicked open directly. A man walked up to the bank manager and suddenly raised his hand. The butt smashed the opponent to the ground. Suddenly, there was a cry from the hostages. Now, everyone will roll me into the lounge next to me, if you want to survive. The remaining two armed robbers drove everyone away, let them enter a lounge, and then locked the door of the lounge. Until this time, Everyone moved quickly. Put the money here in the wallet first, hurry up. Has the bomb in the vault been installed? Ready to detonate? Bang. Then, there was another noise, and then the whole bank shook violently, blocking the vault door and being blown up. At the same time as it exploded, the bank finally automatically sounded the alarm, but at this moment, except for a robber who was responsible for guarding the gate, all three of them rushed in. When they came out again in two three minutes, the bag in front of them was full of green bills. Go, go now. Almost without stopping, the three of them prepared to charge ahead with the people guarding the door, but before they could take a step, a few police cars stopped outside the gate of the bank, blocking their way completely. Damn, why do these police officers come so fast? Seeing the police car that appeared suddenly, the four of them immediately drew their guns and fired. The raging fire was poured out, and several police cars were sieved. Fortunately, a few policemen were hiding quickly. These policemen got out of the car and saw that the other party was holding a rifle, not at all hiding behind the police car, but hiding in shops across the road. 
and then they survived. The two police officers who were hiding behind the police car were directly killed on the spot. Reinforcement, call for reinforcement. There was a robbery at Finroke Bank. We were attacked by violent firepower. We request reinforcements. The remaining policemen hid in the opposite shop, not daring to show their heads at all. They could only shoot at the bank while calling for reinforcements. For a time, the two sides fought back and forth, but the three police cars and a private car at the gate of the bank were completely scrapped. Damn it, our car. A robber suddenly realized something. He quickly looked next to the bank, only to see that the car they were going to use to escape had unexpectedly blown the tire of the other party. The three police cars have also been completely scrapped. Now, they can't leave at all. Listen to the police on the opposite side. We have six hostages in our hands. If we are not allowed to leave, we will kill the hostages now. Realizing the bad robbers started to take a hostage out of the lounge, put him in front of the bank, and pointed his gun at the other's head, let us leave now. However, what they got in exchange was not a compromise, but all around more and more police cars. So far, the bank has been completely surrounded by the police and has entered the longest confrontation between police and robbers. At this moment, the sheriff at the scene kept contacting his superiors. We have surrounded the robbers, but they have hostages in their hands. We dare not act blindly without thinking, yes, I am holding them down. What? The HB men's police team. I understand that I will definitely delay the arrival of the police force. Silently hung up the phone. The sheriff took out his horn and stood behind the bunker, loudly shouted, the people inside are listening, now release the hostages immediately, disarm and surrender, our Namibian police will not compromise, now release the hostages immediately, damn, boss, they don't eat this set. In the bank, the four people were already anxious like ants on a hot pot, among them, the robber who pointed the gun at the head of the hostage, shouted inside, they don't seem to care about the safety of the hostage. Impossible. Continue to tell them that we give them 10 minutes. If they don't withdraw from this street within 10 minutes, we will immediately kill the hostage in front of them. Among the robbers, the strongest robber loudly shouted, If 10 minutes are up, you will kill this hostage. I don't believe they will not retreat. Following the order of the robber leader, the robber who was in charge of negotiating shouted out the conditions. Suddenly, the sheriff's heart became tense. After thinking about it, he finally opened the mouth and said, Our police understand. Give us 20 minutes of thinking time, and don't hurt the hostages within 20 minutes. Otherwise, we will rush into the bank at any price. No, it must be 10 minutes. The robber in charge of the negotiation was immediately frowned. He knew that the longer the time, the worse, so he insisted on the time and never let go. However, when the two were constantly arguing across the street, all of a sudden, everyone just felt that the top of their heads was darkened, and something seemed to be blocking the sun. At first, this robber thought it was a cloud, not at all taken seriously, until his peripheral light seemed to see something flashing past, then he subconsciously lifts the head but he saw that a ship had an aircraft the size of a bus appeared above the crowd, blocking the sunlight at the entrance of the bank. Immediately, a few palm-sized drones flashed past the bank door, and when he wanted to find it, the other party flew out of his sight. What is it? This robber heart startled. He didn't have time to think about anything. Suddenly he only felt saw a flash, and then he completely lost consciousness. A bullet directly penetrated the wall in front of him and hit his forehead. Nora. Everyone in the bank was shocked. They were just about to raise the guns in their hands. But at this moment, a few people suddenly slammed into the side wall, and a tall soldier wearing black iron armor hits him. After breaking their side wall, before two of the robbers had time to react, their shoulders were directly pinched by the opponent. In the next second, the two robbers directly rolled their eyes and trembled violently as if they were overcharged. Seeing that all three of his subordinates were planted in an instant, and the remaining robber leader ran away, but before two steps were taken, the ceiling above his head suddenly began to shatter, and another armored soldier dropping from the sky, stand in front of him. Die for me. 
the eyes of the leader of the robber were completely red. He took up the rifle in his hand and moved towards the armored warrior who was blocking his way. D-A-D-A-D-A-D-A-D-A. A series of violent gunshots came, but only a fire star burst out of the armored man's body. 7.62 bullets with a kinetic energy of more than 2,000 joules, even the opponent's armor could not penetrate. Kaka, until all the bullets were shot out, the robber leader still pulled the trigger, but he fully realized that he had failed. Until this time, the mask of the armored warrior in front of him was completely bounced, revealing a face like a sword and axe, and the other party was righteous and stern, Boswell, male. 316 years old. In accordance with Article 370 of the Namibian Criminal Law, you are suspected of violating robbery, dangerous crimes, crimes against personal safety, and possession of illegal fully automatic weapons. Now you and your comrades will be arrested. You can remain silent, but every word you say will become evidence in court. The man spoke loudly and forcefully, while directly grabbing the hands of the robber leader. The next moment and silver white handcuffs appeared in his hands. A vicious robbery incident was completely calmed down without any hostage casualties. In the next second, this scene was directly frozen, and then suddenly turned around. There appeared three armored warriors posing in silhouette. The three stood in front of the ruined bank gate, with shattered glass on the ground and a police car shot into a sieve in the background. Only at this time can I see that the three armored warriors have uncovered their fully enclosed helmets, revealing three heroic faces, and the three of them also looked at the screen in front of them, as if they were watching each one. The audience is average. At this time, there was a burst of solemn and heavy orchestral BGM resuming at the same time. Under the three people, the three letter logo of BHB flashes, and the words in the row below all battle scenes are real, taken by micro drones, please do not imitate. Next, the picture turned into a close up of the three people. The first thing that appeared was the man with a three dimensional face that looked like a sculpture. He slowly turned around and looked towards the camera with a solemn expression, BHB never asks how many criminals are, just ask where the criminal is. Then a bold black man. He also looked towards the camera and said in fluent English, try to race against time, every second will pass, innocent citizens may lose their lives. Finally, there is a slightly childish face of a teenager, he has a solemn expression, nodded and said, try hard to fight against all forms of crime, justice may be late, but it will never be absent, courage, honor, sacrifice. The next second, the three of them spoke in turn, each uttering a word, and then the three of them extended the hand at the same time, and three manipulators filled with metallic feel were stacked on top of each other, and they shouted in unison, we it's the BHB police team. At the same time, BGM has reached a climax. Yeah, so handsome. The BHB police team, they are simply my idols. At this moment, an adolescent boy in North America in front of the computer exclaimed excitedly, Dad, Dad, I will join the BHB police team in the future, and I will also become a superhero. At the same time, in another city in North America, several youngsters who were watching a video while drinking coke were also dancing with excitement. One of them was sticking out his tongue and posing like Brooks. Damn, Brooks so handsome, Hodge is also handsome isn't he? Another young white teenager also shouted, he is the youngest of the three and the strongest of the three. What are you talking about nonsense? Is it clearly that Bray is the strongest? Following the quarrel between the two, a black teenager also joined the argument. Bray is a role model for us blacks. He is the most vigorous and is the most criminals arrested. Nonsense. Obviously Hodge is the strongest. Shut up, Brooke is the best. Dot not only offline. At this time, the entire network is also full of various words related to BHB. At this time, this video has been on the top of the tubing for a whole day, and the amount of playback has exceeded 500 million mark, and under this video, there are hundreds of comments breakthrough, and people keep asking what is this video, which promotional movie is it, what is BHB and why do you always see it in recent days.
Below this question, there are more than 50,000 likes and more than 30,000 likes, and the answer with the highest number of likes is this, BHB, is a public welfare activity organization of the Xinction Project of Black Light Technology recently. The Xinction Project transforms a group of disabled police officers into super soldiers wearing mechanical armor for free, so that they can punish rape and eliminate evil. The HB is the abbreviation of the names of the three of them, they are called Brooke, Hodge and Bray. Many people followed this answer in a thread, yes, don't look at these three fighters so powerful, in fact, their life experience is very miserable, all of them are pitiful persons. Upstairs, why did you mention the word poor? The HB does not need anyone to be pitiful, they are all superheroes and evil nemesis. Support, we don't need anyone to be pitiful in the house, he is a true powerhouse. Of course, some people support it, and some people oppose it. What heroes, what superfighters, they are no longer humans but robots. We humans should be wary of them, wary of black light technology, because it is destroying all of our humanity. Super USB Chapter 461 Super USB Chapter 461 To you can search for I have a super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Well, we have worked hard for the three members of the BHB police team. We will leave the next site investigation to us. With four robbers dead and three injured, the bank robbery finally came to an end, and three BHB team members wearing black armor also left the camera. At this time, the sheriff also greeted him and shook hands with the three of them, you are the pride of Namibia, buddies. Sergeant Elson is welcome, this is what we should do. Among the three, Brooke as captain, was the first to smile and replied, but the sheriff always felt that the handsome, sculptural men in front of him had an inexplicable gloom. Standing in front of the three non-human beings, he unconsciously fought a cold war, and then quickly nodded to the three of them, and began to get busy with his work. At this moment, the sound of a helicopter propeller from far to near, everyone heard the sound but saw a large transport helicopter capable of carrying more than 10 people flying from the sky, and then landed on the side plan, in the clearing. Then, a woman wearing an all outfit with a fiery red hair and a fiery figure walked angrily on high heels. A dot it seems that our great princess lord seems a little unhappy. Seeing this, Bray, among the three, immediately took a half step back. He spread his hands and looked ridiculous. And Hodge is also somewhat guilty. He coughed and was about to walk to the side. Hodge, Bray, you two stop me. However, before the two of them strayed away, the woman walked over on high heels, making them stiff. Until this moment, the woman completely stood in front of the three of them. Compared with the height of 1.9 meters and 5 for three people, the woman wears high heels only about 1.8 meters, the height difference is nearly 20 centimeters, but her aura does not lose to three people at all. I saw her looking up at the three of them. Suddenly, Hodge and Bray lowered their heads in unison. Only Brooke was expressionless, looking at the woman calmly. Austin, what are your dissatisfaction with this operation? After looking at each other for a few seconds, Brooke finally spoke and solemnly asked. Do you still ask me if I am not satisfied? The woman is frowned, she is coldly snorted, shaking her hair, Brooke, how did we teach you during the training? Try to keep the life of the suspect, this is the most basic one, but why did you kill this time? Do you know that in the operation the day before yesterday, because you killed two suspects on the spot, 20% of the public opinion in that operation turned negative. Captain is not to blame this time, Hodge quickly explained. Miss Austin, the suspect had taken hostages at the time. If we can't kill with one shot, the hostages will probably be harmed. So Captain's customized strategy is one strike certain. Kill, otherwise once the hostage dies, public opinion will be more serious. Then you can't think about other methods. The woman called Austin was a little crazy, we blacklight technology invested hundreds of millions of dollars in each of you, do you know how much our company has lost to killing a suspect? And as yours agents and spokespersons, how much pressure do I have from public opinion? That's about your blacklight technology, 
Miss Austin, Brooke frowned, coldly said, we are the police in Namibia, and Blacklight Technology is only a cooperative relationship. It is your business where the Blacklight Technology is lost. Captain, Hodge quickly grabbed Brooke, Captain, don't be so heartless, after all, we were saved by Blacklight Technology. H M P H. Brooke is now sneaked, stepping over the woman's side and moving towards the helicopter. Brooke. The woman turned her head abruptly, her chest rising and falling violently with anger, and with her red hair, she had a unique charm. Hey, Austin, don't care about Captain, you know his character. At this moment, a pair of iron hands suddenly came from behind and pinched the woman's shoulders, seeming to help her release her anger, while Bray's voice followed, Austin, I like your angry look, Bray. If you don't want to continue to try the performance of being debugged half a month, just take away your bad hands. The woman coldly said. Bray was hearing this, retracting his hand like an electric shock, and said, Well, I seem to have forgotten one thing, I will go now. Speaking, as if he was greatly frightened, he quickly moved towards the helicopter and ran away. So far, only the red-haired woman and Hodge are left. Hodge. You are the most honest, you tell me, did you judge the armor piercing bullet just now or was it Brooke's order? Austin turned his head and asked Hodge questioningly. Of course, Hodge scratched his head, wondering, I judged myself, sorry Miss Austin. Really? Austin is in hot pursuit. If you don't believe me, you can watch the video playback we uploaded. Hodge replied, there is really no other way this time, this is the way with the least loss. Well. Then I will believe you again. Austin was nodded, she was shrugged. Well, let's take a plane and go back. I hope that after this video is released, there will be no that many people questioning us, otherwise my bonus this month will be gone. Dot. Miss Austin, watch out for the gravel under your feet. Hodge was secretly relieved, and quickly helped him walk towards the helicopter. Dot. When the helicopter flew back to Life Sciences City, there were already a dozen reporters gathered under the helicopter. These people rushed up before the helicopter stopped. They scrambled and quarreled and blocked the helipad. Mr. Brook, what do you think of killing two suspects last time? Would you feel guilty? Mr. Bray, what do you think of the international public opinion on you? Mr. Hodge, Officer Hodge, what kind of case was this operation? success or failure. Naturally, the three of them will not be surrounded by a crowd of reporters, and even before the security guards next to them disperse the crowd, the three of them rushed out of the crowd with great strength. Seeing the unforeseen digging from the three of them, many reporters had to point their cameras at Austin, who was still in the helicopter, Miss Austin, as the agent of BHB, can you tell me about this is the action within the body content? Is there any casualties in this operation? Will it be made public in the form of a video? Miss Austin, may I ask? Listening to the buzzing sound like a fly in her ears, but Austin's complexion was completely different from before. While keeping a smile, she suppressed everyone's questions. Everyone, reporters. This action it's perfect, I can't disclose the details. But if you're interested, you can log on to the official website of Blacklight Technology or YouTube's BHB channel, and we will immediately release the video of this action. The reporters became even more excited when they heard this news, but before they had time to ask more questions, a large group of security guards rushed up and pushed the group of reporters aside to protect Austin from leaving quickly. P. When the outside world was full of heated discussions. The three of them had already sat in the recording room. According to the process, they watched the editor constantly replaying the previous actions, and at the same time, a staff member would ask the three of them what they thought at the time. The three of them answered one after another. These questions and answers will also be edited into the video clips after the operation. When the later work was completed, more than three hours passed before it was completely over amid Bray's complaints. Every action is nothing. The key is that we will always do these vain things after the action. I feel more troublesome than the action itself. The three of them were walking on the way to the dining hall. Bray beat his back waist while complaining, damn, 
My granite panther armor still needs some detailed adjustments. The armor center seems a bit forward, poor. My kidneys are almost broken. When he came to the cafeteria, Brooke kept his face as cold as ever, and ordered a few steaks under the gaze of the employees, and then sat in a corner alone and debt. This canteen is also the canteen of the biological research center. Although the three of them are police officers and are not affiliated with the black light technology, but because there are only enough technology and equipment to repair and supply, the three actually still need to live here. Only when large-scale criminal activities such as bank robbery occur in Namibia, the three people will go to the scene with a fast drone capable of flying at the speed of sound. This kind of drone is controlled by a computer and can fly at low altitudes, but it cannot take off and land vertically. If the passengers on it want to land, they must jump off the drone. Therefore, there are only three Robocops from Hodge this drone is allowed to quickly rush to the scene. At this moment, a black girl who appeared to be only 17-18 years old and dressed in nurse clothes ran over. She took a page and a pen with a shy face and handed it to Brooke. Mr. Brooke, I, I am your loyal fan, can you sign me? Brooke lifts the head and looked at it, but at this time, he didn't have the righteousness in front of the camera. He just lightly took the other party's pen and paper, and then directly shredded the paper in the other's cheerful eyes. The girl was stunned. She stared at all of this, and she forgot to leave for a while. He he he. Bray hurriedly stepped forward. He pulled the black girl over and whispered, That guy has always been like this. You don't have to take seriously. If you don't dislike it, can I sign you? No. Thank you. The girl broke free of Bray's hand and ran away crying. Hodge watched this scene, shook the head, and sat beside Bray with his own food. Bray, if you have a handsome face like Captain, maybe a fan girl will ask you for an autograph. Nonsense. There are so many people who want me to sign. Bray unconvincedly picked up his phone and turned on Twitter. There were hundreds of message records. Look. There are so many people replying to me. Do you think I will be short of girls? Not only do I not lack, but I my nickname, Granite Panther, has been announced. This is my current name. You will be scolded by Ms. Austin if you tweet so casually, Hodge honestly said. After all, now we have attracted the attention of the whole world. According to Ms. Austin, we have become superheroes. You should have also watched Spider-Man. His uncle there is a saying the greater the ability, the more likely it is to fuck a white younger sister. Bray suddenly said with excitement, of course I have watched it. I watched all the superhero movies as early as when I was tuned in performance. But it seems that the Black Panther starring us black people is the most powerful. The only regret is that he didn't fuck the white younger sister. This is something I've never understood. Why didn't he fuck? Actually, the three of them not only have the BHB channel on YouTube, but also each have their own official Twitter. From time to time, the three of them are asked to post some short videos to put up. The short content ranges from legal science popularization to answering fan questions. Listening to the other party's words. Hodge was speechless, he no longer persuaded the teammates who were minding their own business to start eating. After the meal was over, the three of them had not had time to get off work, and saw Austin reappearing. She looked at the three with a cold face, prepare, there will be a press conference next, about today's for the task, I will transfer the speech report to your computer. Hearing these words. Bray suddenly yelled. While he said that he was unwell and needed to be adjusted, he lay down directly on the ground and said that he didn't want to get up. Brooke is even more frowned. He looked at the time and then said with a cold face, Now it's time for get off work, I haven't seen my wife and children half a month before, and I promised that they would stay with them. Sunday. Super USB Chapter 462. Super USB Chapter 462. To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. This is the first time Brooke has acted on someone other than criminals. At this moment, Hodge looked embarrassed looking at Brooke and Austin who had completely turned their faces. He was originally innocent by nature. Although the previous trauma made him suffer, 
Blacklight Technology had thought of this a long time ago and assigned them a dedicated psychiatrist who would conduct psychological treatment two to three times a week. After the treatment, Hodge felt much better. Although occasionally he was frustrated by his physical defects, he slowly began to pin his hopes on this new career, becoming a world-famous superhero, this is his until now dream. The other team member, Bray, is the one with the best mentality of the three. Even if his limbs are amputated, he is not desperate. Now after getting this opportunity, he is gearing up every day, shouting for fans. Both are the highest scores. Blake, as captain, belongs to the strongest of the three. Before his disability, he was the trump card of the police force. Both spear art and melee ability are far superior to ordinary people. The handling of the case is even more meticulous. It is only two years of disability that brought him huge psychological trauma and changed his personality. It was gloomy and twisted. At this time, just when everyone did not know what to do, they didn't know that everything that happened had been transmitted back to the BHB command center through the surveillance system on the armor. The BHB command center is under the newly established BHB Department of Blacklight Technology. This department on the surface is the logistics department of the BHB three people. In fact, it is a propaganda department that integrates logistics, planning, and operations. Make a name for it so that the name BHB War Police can be transmitted to the entire international community. At this time, in the BHB command center, the sirens broke out loudly, and an inspector loudly shouted, Oops, Brooks' physiological characteristics are in an unstable state. He is irritated. What happened? He attacked Miss Austin. Quickly, notify the manager and gentleman in charge. Following the noise of the crowd, within two or three minutes, Three department executives came to the command center, but at this time Brooke had already left Austin. What happened? The middle-aged man who is the head of the Central Europeans frowned and asked, Brooke attacked Miss Austin just now. The situation is endangered, but it is all right now. An inspector replayed the video recording just now and then said, We originally planned to shut down Brooke's bionic armor urgently, but he later let go of Miss Austin so we didn't do it at all. P. The three people hearing this looked at the replay on the screen. When they saw Brooke lift it up with Austin in one hand, everyone's complexion didn't look good. Brooke dares to treat Austin who represents black light technology like this, and he can treat everyone like this. That Brooke has a big psychological problem. The Middle Continent man frowns, saying, I have read his information. His psychological evaluation was four times. Three of them failed. The last time he passed was the possibility of finding out the psychologist's routine and actively concealing it. He has a strong sense of anti reconnaissance In this case, he really shouldn't have him enter the BHB police team so quickly. No way, the money is always rushed. The bald man next to him spread his hands, and at the beginning, didn't you think that the psychological problem was just a small problem? You are a department manager. Without your signature, he would not just go through a few psychological counseling sessions with the other two. People set up BHB in a hurry. H-M-P-H. What about now? Coldly snorted, dissatisfied with the knackers man. Such a serious psychological problem and disobedience to our management will make us very passive. If this incident goes out, it will only make money feel that we have no management ability. If it happens what's wrong, we should pat our ass and roll back to our original department. Actually, the matter is said to be big, but not small. At this moment, the third middle-aged man suddenly said, let's do it. Austin's insulting the BHB players is wrong, and Brooke dared to attack the ordinary person. It must not be tolerated, but it must not be a big fan. To punish him, we can talk to him, let him understand that we hold his life and death, and then threaten and lure him, let him be completely obedient. This is the only way to go. The Middle Continent man was nodded, pondered then said, we all got up from the bottom step by step with great difficulty, and only then became the manager and supervisor of a department. Although the BHB department is a newly established department, we face us from above. The expectations are great and it must not be stained because of this. So, 
Let me do his thought work myself. Dot. Brooke glanced at Austin, who collapsed on the ground and almost fainted. He only felt that the frustration in his heart was vented. He was sneaked, turned and walked out of the corridor, despite Hodge's constant calling behind him. However, just as he entered the elevator, arrived in the underground parking lot, and was about to drive away, the communicator on his armor suddenly ticked. It was not someone else who received the communication request. It was Liu Zijin, the department manager of the BHP department. Damn it. The time of his free activities was interrupted again. Brooke suddenly showed a furious look. He slammed the wall, and immediately the wall in front of him made a bang. A large cloud of smoke dispersed, and a huge depression appeared in Brook before. With just one punch, the wall formed by the load-bearing wall was pierced by Brook, and the deformed steel bars inside are vividly visible. After venting the inner anger, Brook connected to the communication, only to hear a low voice from the communicator, Brook, come to my office now. Okay, I will come now. Brook suppressed his anger and returned to the elevator. Five minutes later, when Brooke came to the door of the department manager's office, he was about to knock on the door, and he heard the voice again, the door is unlocked, just come in. Brooke hearing this pushed the door in and saw a man from Central Europe sitting behind a huge expensive desk, staring at himself expressionlessly. This Central European man is about 3 and 15 years old. He has a slightly fat body, flat face and slightly shifted hairline. Apart from this ruddy complexion is obviously the reason for frequent maintenance. Seeing the man putting on airs in front of him, Brooke suddenly said coldly, Manager Liu, you're looking for me? Come, please sit down. The man called Manager Liu pointed to the opposite chair, and then pressed one of the buttons on the table. Xiaozu, come in and pour tea. Enough. Brooke waved his hand, coldly said, if anything, I don't want to waste too much time here because I am going to be with my family. Mr. Liu didn't mind when he heard this sentence, but just said, if that's the case, then I'll just say it. Speaking, he took out a thick contract directly from the drawer and threw it on the desk. While looking serious, Mr. Brooke, I know you belong to the Namibian police, but don't forget, you and Blacklight Technology is also an employment relationship. The contract you sign clearly states that you are obligated to cooperate with the activities arranged by Blacklight Technology. I know. Brooke glanced at the contract on the table, but in his eyes, legal clauses began to appear automatically. After looking at these legal clauses, Brooke continued to open the mouth and said, During this time, I checked the laws of Namibia and found that some of the treaties in this contract did not comply with Namibia's labor law, including the 24-hour standby clause. It was mentioned in the labor law that, except for some important departments in some countries, private companies should not squeeze the rest time of citizens. Strictly speaking, my working hours should not exceed 12 hours but I have been on standby at the company's 72 more than hours. As the legal clauses in his eyes were quickly swept away, Brooke continued, Apart from this, there are also some clauses that seriously violate the laws of Namibia, and even the constitution of Namibia is also violated, such as the 30 Article 26 in Paragraph 2, Article 13 in Paragraph 45, Article 8 in paragraph 57. Listening to the other party's words, Liu Zijin's expression gradually became hard to look at. He asked in an incredible way, You are crazy? Do you know what you are talking about? Do you want to break the contract? Of course not. Brooke shook the head. Blacklight technology gave me a chance to be reborn. Of course I won't requite kindness with enmity, but in this contract, I almost become black light technology from head to toe, including the name, signature moves, mantras and even appearance. If the contents of these contracts are exposed internationally, I think the reputation of black light technology is not good, so I hope to revise some of the terms of the contract. Not only that, Brooke continued, as the core of the whole department, our BHP men are the core of the whole department. Compared with the investment of billions of dollars in the whole department, our compensation is too small, 
and the employment fee is so small that's all, but I hope to get the department share dividends, so that we can pay more attention to the BHP department, and hope that manager Liu can consider it. Hearing Brooks' string of requests, Liu Zijin looked at each other as if he were a lunatic, the three of you are all standard contracts. If you change the others, don't you have to change it? You'd better not consider this. As for shares dividends are more impossible, even I do not have the right to receive project dividends. In this case, there is nothing to say. Brooke looked cold, Blacklight Technology and I are a cooperative relationship. I am not an employee of Blacklight Technology. From now on, I will only work here in the same way as the police station. Please don't give me more I delegate work, and even if I perform the task of fighting crime, I will only execute it according to the plan I made, and will not obey the orders of black light technology. So you still have to breach the contract. Will Yuzuji and looked at each other as if he was an idiot. A trace of pity flashed through his expression. He finally understood that because Brooke was paralyzed on the bed in the past two years, and his family was too poor and the information was blocked, he had no idea about black light technology. What does each word mean? However, Liu Zijin could not say clearly about this. He could only coldly said, Mr. Brook, if you insist on doing this, the company will probably hold you accountable and take back your bionic armor. Brook is even narrowing his eyes when hearing this. He got up from the chair and walked forward step by step, are you threatening me? Hearing this sentence, Liu Zijin was shocked. He saw how the other party tore Tostin, but when he saw a red emergency button on the desktop covered in a transparent lid, suddenly I must have said in my heart, Mr. Brook, this is not a threat, but a piece of advice. I don't think you want to go back to the life where you could only lie in bed and couldn't move, right? I believe you have the right to take back the bionic armor. Brook nodded and then asked, but if this step is reached, it means that the BHP police team has been stained, and it is also equal to the blacklight technology's early stage propaganda of hundreds of millions of dollars. I think when the time comes you can't sit down in this position. As the manager speaking, Brooke turned around and moved towards the office. Brooke, seeing that the other party is about to leave. Yuzi Jin's heart is cold. No wonder the other party dared to negotiate terms with him. It turned out that he didn't want to make things happen if he was right, but he knew that dealing with such a person must not be controlled by the other party. Otherwise it will cause no end of trouble. Thinking of this, Yuzi Jin quickly opened the crystal cover on the desktop and pressed fiercely on the red button. Pa. There was a rush of sirens. The next second? Brooke only felt that his body instantly lost consciousness. His movements were directly frozen in midair, and then he slowly fell to the ground because he lost his center of gravity. What's going on? At this point, Brooke finally showed a panic expression in his eyes. Why is my body? Mr. Brooke, this is not your body. Lusagian took a deep breath. He stood up, walked directly to Brooke and squatted down, since you have read the contract. You should understand that this bionic armor belongs to the company, you just borrow that's all, we have to take back the right to bionic armor. At this time, Brooke finally panicked, and he began to struggle, you can't do this, it's illegal, damn it. If you think that blacklight technology can be threatened by investing hundreds of millions of dollars, you are wrong. Will use a gin was cruel in his heart, he directly pinched Brooke's mouth to stop the chatter of the other party. I hope you'd better not mess with me, and be your robo cop, so you are good and I am fine. P. If something really happened, I would be dismissed at worst, but you don't even have the body that you finally got. You can only be as dirty as Austin said, like a fat pig roll in the pig pen. Hearing these words, Brooke, who was still struggling, suddenly stiffened and fell silent. Understood. Seeing that Brooke didn't answer. Liu Zijin gritted his teeth and only heard a slap. He slapped the opponent directly in the face. I understand. Brooke nodded, then lowered his head. Very good. Liu Zijin exhaled, stood up again and returned to the desk, and then pressed the red button again. Suddenly, Brooke's body regained consciousness again, and he rolled and got up directly from the ground, then looked towards Liu Zijin with a cold expression. Any questions? 
Mr. Brook Yuzuji Jin put his right hand on the button and stared at him, a drop of cold sweat slowly ran down his forehead. However, Brook not at all replied. He just took a deep look at Liu Zijin, then pushed the door open without looking back, and turned and left. Liu Zijin wiped the cold sweat from his forehead until he saw Brook completely leave from the surveillance, and completely relaxed. Unexpectedly, I haven't had a fight since I was in elementary school, and now am I want to use violence to threaten others. Sure enough, the benevolence, justice, etiquette and wisdom of Zongzu district will not work in the outer area. Thinking of this, Liu Zijin couldn't help but shook the head with a wry smile, and then fell into deep contemplation. Super USB Chapter 463 Super USB Chapter 463 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. In front of the camera, Brooke, Hodge, and Bray are wearing imposing armor, standing on top of a building that has collapsed in half. This is a five layer high building, but there seemed to be an explosion before. At this time, the fourth and fifth floors of the small building were bombed and several rooms were destroyed, and one could be seen outside the body. Rows of bumpy bullet holes under the dazzling sunlight above their heads. The three of them faced the scorching sun, each posing in their own exclusive poses, and their chests had their own design logos. Brook represents courage, and his logo is a roaring lion head, and Hodge represents honor, his logo is a sacred sword entwined with vines, the only black bray among the three represents sacrifice, and his logo is a boy near badge. Next. The picture gradually pulled and turned into a close-up of the three people. First, Brooke's face appeared. He looked towards the camera with a solemn expression, we will crack down on any form of crime and resolutely defend the legality of every citizen. Writes. Then it was Hodge. He saluted a police officer first, and then said or oh, inspiringly, the dignity of the law cannot be trampled on. Finally, it was Bray. He slowly turned to the camera, showing his white teeth. No one can commit a crime in front of our BHB policemen. Courage. Honor. Sacrifice. Then the three of them spoke in turn, each of them uttered the vocabulary they represented, and then the three of them stretched out their hands at the same time and stacked on top of each other, BHB police team, every battle will win. Immediately, the complete BHB logo appeared on the screen, and the promo that represented this scene ended again. Next. The screen switched. A black man in a suit with piercing eyes stood on a pitch black stage, facing the camera. Only listening to him slowly said, The audience in front of the screen, you just watched this is the case of a terrorist attack in Windhoek, Namibia today. At 8 o'clock in the morning, the local police received a report saying that someone was setting up a bomb in the Tagula building, so the police rushed out and surrounded the six criminals in the building but no one expected it. Then, this group of terrorists even had heavy weapons, so the police had to evacuate the citizens on the whole floor, and then invited the BHB police team. Then, without letting anyone down, the BHB police team took only three minutes to wipe out six terrorists and bring peace to the local area. Who would have thought that, as the continent with the most backward human civilization Africa, would have come to the forefront of the world for the first time. Speaking of this, the black man couldn't help sighing. Starting in 1860, England was the first to start the first industrial revolution of human civilization. In that revolution, humans replaced manpower with machines and used large-scale industrial production has replaced manual production in individual workshops. Since then, the productivity of human society is ascending to the skies with a single leap. The Industrial Revolution was also the era when machines emerged. However, what really played a decisive role was the Second Industrial Revolution from the second half of the 19th century to the beginning of the 20th century. During the revolution, mankind began to enter the electrical age. Then, the Third Industrial Revolution. Mankind has entered the era of development of artificial intelligence and microelectronics technology until now. Following the black man's opening, one after another flashes behind him. These images include black and white old machinery and industrial photos, 
as well as the shadows of scientists such as Edison and Einstein. There are screen silhouettes of various electronic technologies. These images are mixed together to produce an inexplicable sense of space-time travel. Immediately, the black man strode forward. He walked directly to the camera, spread his arms and said, However, the ideology of this world has never been so close to the future. You can see that starting from the black light technology launching the Xingxian Bionic Project, we humans are slowly and naturally sliding into a brand new era. This era is called the future, hope, name it's called peace, and everyone can call it paradise. Chen Chen waved his hand and said, so the focus of our early propaganda should be in the West. Little X is nodded. It is in the early stage now, and it is understandable that the cost is higher. When BHP gradually gains more popularity, the cost can be reduced. Chen Chen thought, moreover, if you want to build BHP into a big IP, three people alone are not enough. After all, the Namibian market is too small. After discussing with North America and Europe in the future, you must be there. Build a new police team, and BHB is the prototype of all the teams. So we want to continue hiring? Little X asked. Yes, we can do a variety show to convene the highly disabled police officers from various countries who are retired. Chen Chen Ponder then said, first create a simple armor for them, and then let them show their skills in front of countless audiences, such as fighting and spear art and select a few everyone's favorite super warfare police, and these talents are eligible to join the BHB police team. But if we establish local men's police teams in other countries in the future, we will inevitably squeeze the market of the BHB men's police teams. After all, people from all countries will definitely support their own men's police teams. Isn't it uneconomical? Xiao X is a little confused. Of course not. Chen Chen couldn't help but laughed and he asked, because if that day comes, it means that in that continent or country, they have begun to accept robots instead of human law enforcement. When the time comes, we just sell them. The men's prosthesis can make a lot of money. Do you still need to care about the BHB men's police team? Ah, also, little X suddenly reacted. So, now we should closely monitor the BHB department and let them not issue any setbacks. Chen Chen pointed out, otherwise, there will be a little error, BHB's reputation is likely to be ruined. When the reputation is broken, it will not be as smooth as it is now if you want to rebuild. Little X looking thoughtful nodded, immediately continued, by the way, your godfather, speaking of close supervision, there was a conflict between the BHB yesterday. This incident is not at all and what the consequences are, so I did not immediately report to you. It is normal to have conflicts. After all, these people are not real superheroes. Chen Chen replied, so, what is it? It has something to do with Brook. As Xiao X spoke, a video quickly played. On the screen, Brook lifted up a red-haired woman with one hand, then left it again and said a bunch of threatening words. Then the picture turned around and it turned into a dialogue between a Middle Eastern man and Brooke. This Middle Eastern man Chen Chen recognized that it was Liu Zijin, the manager of the BHB department pulled by Qian Wenhuan, but at this time, because the two did not speculate, so Brooke turned and left. But the next second, Liu Zijin suddenly pressed the emergency button on the table and Brooke suddenly lost his ability to move. Next, there was a period of coercion and temptation, and then the two broke up unhappy. After the two videos are over, Chen Chen is slightly frowned. This matter can actually be big or small. If it is said to be smaller, it is just an ordinary contradiction, but if it is not resolved well, a big setback may occur. Chen Chen thought for a while and decided, X, Keep an eye on him. If he is still so unbearable for a while, then according to the previous countermeasures, let him accidentally die. Now I'm in the BHB development period, I don't want any problems. Super USB Chapter 466 Super USB Chapter 466 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Dong. There was a dull impact, and the tyrant's huge head directly hit the floor tossing windows in front of the crowd. 
blood spurting wanton, and staining the floor hustling windows red. Seeing the tyrant flying out of his head, everyone couldn't help but let out an exclamation, revealing an expression of incomparable shock. On the outside of the elbow of the black rider that was knocked out, two sickle-like bone spurs suddenly appeared. These two bone spurs were extremely sharp. Obviously, at the moment when the two sides collided, Black Rider relied on these two bone spur hooks, live the head of the tyrant, and use the force of the tyrant to knock himself into the air, and kill the tyrant on the spot. Chen Chen couldn't help applauding, it's really difficult to deal with. I can beat the tyrant in hand to hand combat. This is something I never thought of. Isn't this the best way to win? Leel on the side vomited, boss. This Black Rider obviously uses weapons. Although the weapons are grown on itself, if you give the tyrant another chance, I am afraid that the winner will be the winner. Question mark. Chen Chen shook the head and lost said with a smile, Wrong, Leel, your nerve reaction speed can't keep up, so you have the illusion of a stronger tyrant. In fact, you can detect it when the two sides fight. The Black Rider injected with the G358 virus is better than the Tyrant in terms of speed, flexibility, and even defensive ability and resilience. What's more abnormal is that it can also evolve according to the opponent's blow, even if 10 matches and 100 matches will all be Black Rider victory. Speaking of which, Chen Chen regretfully shook the head. It's a pity that this virus has limited timeliness and is not permanent. Little X nodded. She looked towards the field again, and at the same time reminded, 15 minutes have passed since he turned into shape. According to the previous experiment, it should be almost the same. Following Chen Chen's words, the black rider, who had regained his feet, suddenly bowed again, lying on the ground as if he had lost all his strength. A large amount of water vapor was sprayed out, as if countless water separated him and the bone spurs on his back and elbows and the cuticle of his whole body were rapidly oxidized, turning into countless powders floating in the air. Experimental body has begun to unpack, Hannibal reminded loudly. Everyone looked around, only to see that as the water vapor dissipated, the monster transformed from Black Rider looked like an insect molting, completely shed its huge coat, and then the whole person slowly sloughed away, crawled out of the fallen shell. In Chen Chen's gaze, the black rider, who was transformed into a body full of bone spurs and cuticles, turned back to what it was before, except for the slippery slime, the only difference from before is, he looks violently thinner than seven titty catties, and whether it is hair or other hair, all disappear without a trace. Supernatural skills. Seeing this scene, Chen Chen couldn't help muttering in a low voice. As early as a few months ago, he saw Xiao X doing this experiment, but at that time the object of realization was a rabbit, and it was not the current G358 virus, but G322. At that time, the scene of the rabbit finally regaining body shape gave Chen Chen a great shock. But now the shock is even greater. Mr. Chen, we. At this moment, Watson spoke suddenly and said to Chen Chen, Go ahead. Before the other party could tell, Chen Chen waved his hand. He knew that the entire group of Watson was going back to the experiment hall on the first floor to do a whole body data test for the recovered Black Rider and record the injection changes before and after G358. Seeing Chen Chen's statement, several people left the second floor again. After ten minutes, they returned to the first floor wearing protective clothing and began to conduct various tests on Black Rider. If the previous Black Rider had a sturdy body and a heroic temperament, then the Black Rider that has now changed back is a beggar who is alive and bony, as if his body is hollowed out, and can only be squatted there as if a sick person, of patience. Half an hour later, a series of physical tests ended, and the test report was delivered to Chen Chen. Yes, although Black Rider lost 80% of fat and 50% of muscle because of thiz molding, and became a severely malnourished patient with low blood pressure, low blood fat, and low blood sugar, but these all are reversible. In fact his body not at all suffers any irreversible damage. Looking at the report in hand, Chen Chen thought, in other words, with Black Rider's physique, 
if there is an emergency, the use of this G358 is completely within the acceptable range. Yes, especially without a gun. Xiao X said, it is very possible that in some situations, a copy of G358 can save lives. Nodded agreed by Chen Chen. In fact, this is G358's 50th five experiments, which means that the experimental process is almost complete, although accidents are still not ruled out, but overall, the benefits of G358 have exceeded the harm. This is great value for money. However, I have a bolder idea. At this moment, Chen Chen suddenly said again, since Black Rider can achieve this effect after injecting G358, what will happen if the tyrant is injected with this virus? Xeering this little Xeering this immediately shines. Indeed, tyrant and Black Rider are essentially the same. The only difference is that Black Rider is a reduced version of tyrant, and some genes have been debugged to make it no different from ordinary people. Since G358 can work against Black Rider, it basically works against tyrants. But I'm afraid the change will not be too great. Thinking about it, Xiao X tried to use computational power to simulate the genetic change process of G358 injection tyrant, and then said, I found that there is a regularity in the injection of this type of G3 virus. I used rabbits as the experimental body before. When the rabbit was up to 10 times bigger, it changed from a height of 20 centimeters to a giant rabbit with a size of more than 1 meter. Now when the Black Rider is used as the experimental body, the size has only increased by 4 or 5 times. In the case of a tyrant, the effect will continue to shrink, and it may not even double. It's better than nothing. Chen Chen squinted his chin and said, it would be better if this virus can make the infected person do as one pleases. That's impossible. Xiao X vigorously shook his head, pouting, the reason why the Black Rider will increase in size and weight after the injection of G358 is completely because the skin of the host will specifically produce so this special organ can directly absorb moisture and microorganisms in the air to replenish itself and a large number of high energy covalent bonds will be generated in the blood of the host, which directly react with the nitrogen in the air to form an outer skeleton. But this kind of generation also needs to pay a price, that is, it consumes a lot of its own fat and energy. The reason why even Black Rider can only last for 10 minutes is because these energy will be quickly consumed during this time the reason for completion. I know. Chen Chen laughed. It's not possible now, it doesn't mean it won't be possible in the future. Also, little X is nodded. When Chen Chen left the laboratory, a black rider suddenly came forward, took out a strangely shaped metal tube about 20 centimeters long and handed it to Chen Chen. Chen Chen took it casually, but saw that the metal tube turned out to be a strangely shaped syringe. In addition to two buttons, one blue and one green, the red liquid inside could be seen through music. This is the G358 virus. When Chen Chen was watching the Black Rider injection, he already understood how to use it, and saw that he moved towards the blue button on the top with a light press, and suddenly Su, a black slender needle probed come out. It is best to penetrate into the heart, so that it can take effect as quickly as possible. Xiao X reminded him, nodded of Chen Chen indifferent expression, this needle is 14 5 centimeters long, which is exactly the depth of the human heart. Seeing this, he once again pressed the blue button just now, and he saw the needle again Su flinched back. Although Chen Chen has a field of energy as a weapon, he thinks he can't use this thing, but after all, he is prepared and not at all refused. Pushing the virus into the trouser pockets, the two left the minaret experimental base and returned to the ground. As for the experiment of tyrant injection of G358 virus, Chen Chen does not need to follow up specifically. Naturally there will be a group of experts who will do everything for him. Dot. As the life sciences city continues to flourish, the other end of the world, Los Angeles in North America, 
is ushering in the dusk of the sky. In the eastern suburbs of Los Angeles, in addition to the world-famous luxury housing area, there is also a huge warehouse area. The name of this warehouse area is called the Harank Warehouse District. It is said that it was established in the 1950s by a capitalist named Harank, so this area continued the name. Harank's warehouse area covers most of the daily necessities of the city of Los Angeles. As a material storage point, countless businesses and industries store goods here. If you look at it from a high altitude, you will find the huge warehouse group stretches for thousands of miles, from this end to the end of the line of sight, all are the dome structure of the warehouse. At this time, in one of these warehouse areas, a batch of special steel imported from abroad is being transported by trucks one by one, and then unloaded into one of the open warehouses with the help of crane. The warehouse was also filled up quickly at a speed visible to naked eye. The operation of this area is also inseparable from the workers working in this area. Bruce de Chester is one of the tens of thousands of ordinary unloading workers in this large warehouse area. Bruce de Chester has a large body of fat. Like most ordinary workers, he normally wears a yellow helmet, and he wears dirty work clothes and stained jeans. My favorite thing is to eat burgers. It was twilight at this time. Due to the season, the sky was getting darker and later. Although it was already close to 7 o'clock in the evening, the sky was still extremely blue, and only one sun was gradually slanting west. There seems to be a tendency to fall. Chester, who was manipulating Crane, saw the last truck unloaded and left. He checked the time and saw that it had been more than half an hour off work. He suddenly shook the head somewhat helplessly, and then whistled. Crane climbed up and down. Chester, a worker in the factory greeted him, Why, are you ready to leave? Yes, the work that belongs to me has been done. The next step is your work. Chester replied casually, and his colleagues walked towards the parking lot non-stop. Wait a minute, Chester. I have something I want to show you. However, the worker suddenly lowered his voice and stopped Chester. Oh roar. Chester just spread his hands and stopped with some doubts. Leon, what do you want me to see? A very cool thing. Anyway, you will know it when you come in. The worker called Leon showed a mysterious look. He beckoned, then turned and walked into the warehouse. Chester stood in front of the warehouse door and hesitated for a few seconds but thought that he wouldn't get pregnant if he went in and took a look, so he had to shrug and followed him into the dark warehouse. As soon as you enter the warehouse, you will first assault the senses of oil and steel. This warehouse is one of the warehouses previously unloaded by Chester, and he also knows the basics of this batch of goods, but it is nothing but huge steel pillars. These steel columns, the thickness of a human waist are all used to build the foundations of tall buildings. According to architecture, they are called steel columns. Ahead, Leon continued to walk forward, but Chester caught up in twos or twos, and at the same time asked, Leon, what do you want me to see? It will be here soon. Leon was full of excitement, but he was still selling, no matter how much Chester asked. He didn't answer. When the two were about to reach the end of the 100 meters warehouse, Leon stopped. Arrived, Chester has become a little impatient. He looked at the sky outside the window next to him, only to see that the sky had begun to change from clear blue to dark blue. Then he followed Leon's gaze and asked, So, what do you want me to see, now? Before finishing speaking, Chester suddenly closed his mouth because he saw that among the piles of steel columns stacked next to Leon, one of the steel columns actually had a vivid mural. The content of the mural is four angels with wings. These four angels are almost all doing the same action, that is, they are all covering their eyes. The only difference is that the angles are different, and some are squatting, some are standing, some are sideways, and some are upright. However, it is said to be frescoes, but they are a little weird, because these pictures are more like reliefs, but what makes Chester puzzled is who would carve on a building material like steel pillars where's the relief? I said Leon, Chester said suddenly, what you said is very cool, is this thing, where did they come from? Leon did not answer, 
but stared at the four angels. Hey, Chester asked in a heavy tone, ah, only then did Leon react. He continued to stare at the four lifelike angels with fascination, and at the same time replied, this batch of steel seems to have been shipped from the outer zone, perhaps from the central continent, or perhaps from the Indian region. Who knows? But don't you think this painting is very, very cool? Chester was speechless, he shook the head, and at the same time patted the other's shoulders. Then see you tomorrow, Ryan. Speaking, Chester turned and left. Super USB Chapter 467 Super USB Chapter 467 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. One night passed in a hurry. Chester ate a bunch of fast food as usual, then fell asleep under the influence of alcohol. When he opened his eyes again, it was second day in the morning. Looking at the time on the phone, Chester was shivered. He couldn't even wash his face. He grabbed his work clothes and hurriedly moved towards the door of his house. It's only ten minutes before work. Riding on his tattered pickup, Chester rushed to the construction site in a hurry, only to find that the construction site was full of police cars, blocking this traffic cartery. Getting out of the car, Chester immediately moved towards his post. But when he got to the police car, he was stopped. The policeman in charge of the intercept motioned him to stop. Hey, man, didn't you see that our police are working on the case here? If you want to go there, it seems you must take a detour. The police stopped Chester and reminded him. Man, what happened inside? Chester asked immediately, constantly looking inside. This matter has nothing to do with you. Please take a detour. The policeman not at all explained, still urging. Chester agreed. He still couldn't help but poking his head, but suddenly he saw that not far away, the foreman who usually manages himself was busy, and he kept explaining with a man in a suit. At the same time, there was a pleasing look on his face. Although it was the first time that the man, Chester, saw him. He knew from the employee roster that this man was chief in charge from dozens of warehouses nearby. This person's position is probably located in the manager's position, and above that is the general manager of the entire Los Angeles warehouse area, but these positions are really unattainable for Chester. But these thoughts just flashed through my mind, because something more interesting happened before me. Three or four police cars blocked the passage and it was only yesterday that Chester himself outside the gate of the unloading warehouse, there was a large number of yellow cordon belts surrounded, and only a few police officers who were in charge of inspecting the scene with their cameras came in and out. Seeing this scene, Chester suddenly understood something. He looked towards his foreman who was taking pleasure in other people's misfortune, brow beaded with sweat and he was full of malicious thinking about what setback the other people had done. But at this moment, the foreman suddenly turned his head and saw Chester. Chester only saw the other person's eyes light up, and then he waved his hand quickly, Hey, Chester, you hurry up click here, what are you doing there? Chester reluctantly pointed to the foreman at the police officer, and the police were willing to walk away. Chester felt a little guilty in his heart. He crossed the police car defense line and walked towards the foreman. When he walked in front of the opponent, he had just spoken, and the foreman asked impatiently, Chester, you yesterday it seems that night is the last to leave. Did you see Leon before you left? Leon? Chester immediately startled, and a single thought flashed through his heart. Could it be that this big battle is actually related to Leon? Thinking of this, I don't know why his heart is faint like a child who has done something wrong, so he hastily perfunctory, I didn't see it. It was already 6.30 when I finished unloading the last batch. Leon should it's inside the warehouse, I don't see him at all. Are you telling the truth? At this moment, the man in the suit and leather shoes suddenly spoke up and asked in a questioning tone, have you really seen Leon before you left last night? Chester shook the head quickly and looked towards the other side blankly. Oh yes, I forgot to introduce to you, this is Mr. Connor, chief in charge of our team. The foreman hurriedly explained, Chester, if you have any clues, must speak out, understand? Understood. Chester nodded, then asked a little embarrassingly 
But what happened to Leon? Did he? Leon is dead. Before asking, the foreman said regretfully, Joseph discovered this morning he found that the goods in warehouse number 9 hadn't moved all night, so he ran in to look for Leon, but found that Leon was dead. Dot. How did you die? Chester sank inwardly and asked a little heavy. You don't need to worry about this. Before the foreman answered, Connor spoke first and stopped the conversation between the two, and then looked towards the foreman. I will leave it to you here. The police said that warehouse number 9 needs to be blocked temporarily. In that case, you lead everyone to avoid this warehouse and go to work in other warehouses. When Joseph comes back after finishing the transcript, let him start work immediately. Understood. The foreman answered. Immediately, Connor glanced at Chester again. Chester quickly lowered his head, and then saw that the other party immediately turned around and left the scene completely. Call. Until chief in charge completely left, Chester saw the foreman secretly relieved, and then the foreman waved his hand and said to Chester, You also heard Mr. Connor's words. The next nine the goods in warehouse number 12 will not move temporarily, you can go to warehouse number 12 to work. Good. Chester agreed and left each minding their own business. When he climbed to crane in warehouse number 12, his mind was still groggy, maybe it was because of not sleeping well last night, or the news of Leon's death in the morning. In short, Chester the whole day's work is a bit muddle-headed, and the whole person just mechanically unloads goods from trucks. The day's work is not easy. Chester only rested for an hour during lunch, and then a whole day of work. When the last truck cleared all the goods and left, it was evening again, unconsciously. Chester has long been accustomed to this kind of busyness. He left his head empty and finished his work. When he climbed down from Crane, he realized that there were no police officers outside the number 9 warehouse in front of the road. The warehouse door was tight, locked, only a few yellow warning bands remained around the warehouse door. Obviously, after a day of investigation, the group of policemen has also left work. Chester was shrugged, he also moved towards where he had parked, but when he walked to the door of number 9 warehouse, his heart suddenly moved. In warehouse number 9, he has the key. At this moment, Chester's breathing suddenly became a little short. He didn't know why he was so excited. Perhaps it was in the bones adventurous instinct that was suppressed for too long. His life has been repeated for too long, too long, so long that he is even accustomed to it, but when an opportunity for exploration and adventure is placed in front of him, he realizes how fascinating this opportunity is for him. How tempting. Now that the police are off duty, and almost all other workers are off duty, no one knows that they have been in the crime scene. Besides, they just go in and take a look to see what happened. What's the problem? Chester took a deep breath. He only felt that the blood in his whole body seemed to be boiling. When was the last time he had this feeling? I'm afraid it was when I was young, right? Time smoothed his mind and smoothed everything, and now, he is resurrected. He felt like he had struggled thousands of times inside. In short, when Chester came back to his senses, he had already stood in front of the gate of warehouse number 9 in a ghostly manner, and then he touched his pocket. The key to warehouse number 9. Just take a look, just take a look. Chester comforted himself in a low voice, and then he no longer hesitated, stepped over the blocking barrier, then took out the key and inserted it into the employee entrance and exit door by the gate of warehouse 9, Kaka. With a crisp sound, the staff's entrance and exit doors suddenly opened, revealing the dark space inside. A familiar damp musty assaults the senses. For this smell, Chester was very familiar with it. He looked at the sky, but saw that the sun in the west had only half of his body exposed on the mountain. It was obviously late in the sky. In that case, Chester he planned to just look inside and leave without delay. Thinking of this, Chester walked into the already dim warehouse and looked down the rows of goods on either side. In the dim light, the rows of goods are like nether shadows in the darkness, like dreams and illusions. Only when the setting sun shines through the few windows in the warehouse and hits a certain piece of goods will it form a touch of special rays of light. The interlacing of light and darkness creates a special mysterious atmosphere, 
which makes Chester even more illusion of adventure. Patter, patter, patter. Chester walked step by step, his footsteps echoed in the silent warehouse, but he didn't see anything until he walked half the depth of the warehouse. Leon's corpse is definitely not there, but there should be something left at the scene of the corpse. Did you go wrong? Chester showed a puzzled expression. He thought for a while, and suddenly it sounded the place where the other party told him to go before he got off work last night. It was a corner of the warehouse with a lot of steel pillars. Say, where did Leon die? Thinking of this, Chester stopped immediately, then turned around, moved towards the fork divided by the cargo next to him. This time, Chester finally guessed it correctly. He found what he was looking for not far away from the two standing yesterday I a silhouette of a corpse outlined by a white line, and a reminder next to it. Three yellow markers for location. Here is where Chester died. When he saw all this, Chester took a deep breath again and suppressed the beating heartbeat of the peng peng in his heart. He took out the phone and then called the flashlight mode to make himself see all the details on the ground as much as possible. Following the light of the phone, Chester showed a puzzled expression, because from his position, the white outline on the ground really resembled Leon's figure. Obviously Leon was lying on the ground when he died. He stretched his limbs upright, lying on the ground, like the shape of the letter A. But the only thing that makes people feel weird is that the neck of this white human shaped silhouette seems a bit strangely long. It's as if a primary school student can't draw simple strokes. The silhouette formed by white lines is very coordinated, whether it's arms or legs. But when it's above the shoulders, it's a little weird. The silhouette of the shoulders goes up, it turned out to be a neck that was much longer than that of an ordinary person, and the neck was slightly curved just like the neck of a duck, very uncoordinated. Chester was a little puzzled. He dared to swear by his mother that Leon definitely didn't have such a long neck. If the other's neck was really such a long, he would have been able to apply for the Guinness World Record. We'll do this kind of work from five to nine just like myself. So, is it because the policeman in charge of crossing the line made the wrong handshake, or is the dead not Leon? but someone else. Chester scratched his head, thinking uncertainly. But just as he scratched his head with the hand holding the phone, the light from the phone suddenly shone into the corner of a pile of goods on the side. In that corner, one silhouette flashed past. Exclamation mark. Chester suddenly broke into a cold sweat. He quickly held the phone steady and took a photo in the corner. He was completely sighed in relief when he could see exactly what the silhouette was. It turned out to be a false alarm. The silhouette that flashed by was nothing but an Offenham statue. The material of this statue seems to be carved from marble, showing a vivid angel image. It has soft curly hair, the hairstyle is close to the head and there is a circle of hair bands on the top of the head. The arms and fingers of the statue are carved very realistically and roundly. The body is in the pleated tulle outfits that angels are used to, and the most conspicuous is the pair of wings that are folded, like feathers. The only regret is that the angel's hands pressed her face tightly, making it difficult to see her holy eyes and face. Walking up to the statue, Chester patted his chest and sighed in relief. Huh. But suddenly, Chester had divine light flashed in his mind. He vaguely remembered that when he met the opponent yesterday, this Leon seemed to be watching a relief. And on that relief, it seems that there are just a few angels covering their eyes. Thinking of this, Chester immediately turned around and walked deep into the warehouse according to yesterday's memory. He wanted to look for the mural painted on the steel column from yesterday. Soon, he came to the place where Leon led him yesterday. There are steel pillars placed together everywhere, dozens of them are stacked together, occupying the eye-catching sight, while Chester lifts the head, moved towards one of the steel pillars and looks. Sure enough, on this steel pillar, there are three angels covering their eyes, standing or squatting, which is exactly the same as the sculpture I saw before in terms of style and shape. Wait. Chester, who was just about to breathe a sigh of relief, suddenly stopped. He was frowned and felt a little wrong, because in his memory, there should be four angels on the mural, two of which were squatting on the ground, and the other two are standing. But now, 
there are only two angels squatting, and one angel standing. Is there something wrong with my memory? Chester turned his head in some doubt and looked in the direction he came. At this time, the sky was getting darker and darker, and there was only darkness on the way he came. However, the reason Chester looked towards there was not because of the darkness, but because he suddenly had an idea of unfathomable mystery. Could it be that the angel sculpture I saw just now was the one on the previous mural? The one that dropped, the angel on the mural, came out. Super USB Chapter 468 Super USB Chapter 468 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. The angel on the mural, came out. The thought flashed through Chester's mind. Immediately, he shook the head with a little laughter, and discarded the outrageous idea from his mind. I'm not writing SCP gene meeting, where could such an outrageous thing happen? Probably just happened to remember that's all wrong. Although he was comforting himself in the heart, Chester still kept an eye on him. He took out his phone, moved towards the mural in front of him and took a picture and then hurried towards the direction he came. At this time, the sun outside the window is almost completely invisible, leaving only a little afterglow still stubbornly remaining in the sky, and it is still fading towards the mountainside at the speed visible by naked eye, as if the sky has faded white the gauze tent, leaving only the solidified indigo sky. When Chester walked past the angel covering his eyes, he took a few special glances but it seemed that he could only tell that there was a marble sculpture in front of him, although lifelike, there is absolutely nothing unusual. Seeing this, Chester sighed in relief, completely relieved. He settled down, walked in front of the sculpture, then passed the fork out of the pile of goods, and walked to the main road of the warehouse. However, what he didn't know was that the last ray of sunset outside the window finally faded during his delay for such a while. In an instant, the entire world seemed to be plunged into complete darkness. Chester had to turn on the front camera of his phone again, illuminating the somewhat messy warehouse floor, and walked out with one foot and one foot slow. Dong, dong, dong. The sound of footsteps under him is still coming from neither too fast nor too slow and in this enclosed darkness, it exudes an inexplicable weirdness. Just as Chester was about to walk out of the warehouse, somewhere behind him, a voice of Galulu suddenly came out, as if something round fell on the ground and rolled slightly on the ground, something. Then the voice disappeared again. The moment he heard this sound, Chester took a stop to his feet. He slowly turned his head back, but he could only see the darkness in the direction when he came, and he could not see anything. Perhaps something happened to be loose and fell to the ground, right? Chester shook the head, then turned his head again, moved towards the warehouse door. Boom, boom. However, he just took a step, and there was another sound of item falling to the ground behind him. Not only that, the sound was a lot louder than the previous movement, and it also triggered waves in the warehouse. Echo. Chester's heart tightened. He quickly turned his head, and at the same time raised high, the mobile phone in his hand was shining towards the corridor behind him, but he found that the light of the mobile phone was not at all penetrating, and could only reach the 4-5 meters in front of him. Distance. After this distance, the entrance is still dark. Dot. Chester pursed his mouth, and his inner peng peng jumped wildly. He vaguely felt that this time his voice seemed to be closer than before. Could it be that someone followed him? The murderer who killed Leon is still hiding in the warehouse. This thought flashed past, and then Chester only felt cold inside. He didn't hesitate anymore, immediately stepped forward, moved towards the warehouse and ran outside. But after running like this, he didn't hear any more sounds and his ears were pure footsteps and gasping sounds. These sounds were amplified by the warehouse to cover up all movements. The more you run away, the more flustered your heart will become. This is human instinct, but I don't know whether it was the angel's favor or the scaring himself. In short, when Chester completely ran out of the warehouse, nothing happened. Call, call, call. Chester, 
who has been lacking in exercise all the year round, panted heavily. He stood outside the warehouse door, staring at the dark hole of the warehouse door in shock, clenched the teeth, and turned on the warehouse light at the door. Suddenly, dozens of sunlights in the entire number 9 warehouse were lit one after another, brightly lit the inside of the warehouse. When he saw the empty corridor in the warehouse, Chester's heart suddenly relaxed. It wasn't until this time that he was sure that there was simply nothing in the warehouse except for a large amount of goods in the main road that could be seen at a glance. There is no so-called killer, and there is no monster that I imagined as a child. Everything, I scare myself that's all. Seeing this, Chester was completely relieved. He shook the head with a smile, then turned off the lights in the warehouse again, and then stepped over the barrier in front of the door, ready to get in the car and leave. But when he walked to his pickup truck, he remembered that he seemed to have forgotten to lock the door. If tomorrow, the foreman saw him enter warehouse number 9 without permission, he would not know how he would scold him. Thinking of this, Chester turned around silently, ready to go back to lock the warehouse door and leave. However, when Chester turned around, his footsteps stopped completely, because, in front of the isolation belt outside the warehouse door, there was an extra statue at some point. An angel statue with hands folded on the chest and a pair of slightly stretched wings behind it. This statue is almost exactly the same as the statue in the warehouse, but this statue is facing the gate, just facing Chester sideways, as if it just came out of the warehouse plus a pair the slightly opened wings look alive. Seeing this weird scene, Chester was a little surprised. He slowly approached the statue, and then tried to touch the statue's arms and wings. It's hard, and it's very cold, without any facilities. At this moment, Chester suddenly felt a little suspicious. Was the statue standing here when he entered? Or did he say that someone moved here after he entered warehouse number 9? And why didn't you pay attention when you came out? Chester has been completely dumbfounded. He also wondered if this statue was the one he saw in the warehouse before. But when he touched it thoroughly, he was sure it was definitely not because he no movable mechanism was found on the statue. Could it be that an angel appeared? Chester scratched his head, but for the sake of his job. He stared at the statue from one side while stepping across the barrier, fumbling for the locked warehouse door. Until he completely closed the door, the statue remained silent. Gradually, Chester was relieved. After thinking about it carefully, it is likely that the angel statue and the warehouse itself are a pair, but for some reason I was moved out by the police, and I just ignored the statue at the door just because I wanted to go in and find out. Thinking about it this way, everything can be explained. Thinking of this, Chester shook the head, completely retracted his sight moved towards and walked towards the car, but before taking a few steps, he suddenly heard a tension sound from behind him. Chester turned his head subconsciously, only to see one of the warning tapes broke for some reason. However, this is still the second place, and immediately Chester felt something wrong because he realized that the sculpture behind him seemed to have moved a few steps, and the other party's movements were a little different from before. Dazzled, Chester rubbed his eyes in disbelief, but when he put down his hands again, he only felt cold all over. The Ophanum sculpture actually changed an angle completely within two seconds of rubbing his eyes! Exclamation mark. If the angel statue was facing itself sideways before, then at this time, the angel statue has completely turned into a face facing itself. Ward Fat, Chester took a breath of air, and stepped back, step by step, until he retreated to the front of his car, he settled slightly, then he hesitated for a while, then slowly raised his hand again, covering his eye. This time, Chester just covered his eyes and quickly took off, but even so, he still made him stand upside down because he saw that within a second of covering his eyes, the angel statue was no more than two or three meters away from him, and it was no longer the tranquil expression before, but opened big mouth, showing a hideous color, and at the same time making a gesture of lunging forward, it seems that it will lunge in front of Chester in the next second, 
There is definitely a problem with this statue. Chester only felt a chill rising along his spine. He didn't hesitate to jump into the car, and then started the car without even thinking. While staring at the statue, he quickly turned the car along. Go on the road. It was not until there was no more silhouette of the statue in the rear view mirror that Chester sighed in relief heavily, and the vehicle moved forward at a speed of 80 yards. At the same time, he looked towards behind him with a lingering heart but he saw when he came. It was already dark on the road, with only a few faint lights flickering, indicating that there were workers working nearby. What the hell is that ghost? Chester murmured in a low voice, he turned his head quickly. But when he turned his head, he suddenly saw that the statue was standing in the middle of the road without knowing when, and the distance between the two was less than 10 meters. As if reflexively, Chester quickly turned the steering wheel and suddenly the pickup truck under him completely lost control and hit the wall of the nearby warehouse. Bang! There was a deafening impact, Chester hit the steering wheel in front of him hard, and he only had time to sigh this is over in his heart, and then he completely lost consciousness. Dot. On the morning of second day, Rolling Kate yawned and sat up from the bed. He shook his somewhat groggy head, and then according to his past habits, he first went to wash his hands and then gumbled down a glass of water before turning on the TV. Then he listened to the TV in the morning news, while washing in the bathroom. This is ABC News Good Morning North America. I am Marilyn. This morning, the new North American president Miss Ivanka will fly to Beza for a visit. Mr. Vice President tweeted today that the Mengman effect that has occurred is actually a kind of group hypnotism. He said that Mengman has miraculously disappeared as he predicted. Everything is beautiful in North America. Even if there is a dream man, it should be infected from Nakaza district. After washing a little bit, Kate walked out of the bathroom with a towel while wiping her face, but at this moment, she saw a new news on the TV, now an emergency message is issued. Just this morning, several vicious homicides were discovered in the suburbs of Los Angeles. The cases were all located in the Herang Warehouse District in the suburbs of Los Angeles. At present, the police have found eight a corpse. Immediately, the TV screen turned around showing the scene of the scene. I saw a beautiful blonde host standing in front of rows of warehouses and said with a serious face, just this morning, the Los Angeles police suddenly picked up when the murder was reported. The informant was Mr. Connor, the manager of the Highland warehouse area. He claimed that someone had committed multiple crimes in the warehouse area, and then the police went to investigate. Following the host's narration, the cameraman also removed the picture from the host and showed the busy silhouette of dozens of policemen behind the host and the isolation belt of the blockbuster. At present, eight corpses have been found, and each corpse is killed in the same way, that is, the neck was twisted, and the angle of twisting exceeded 360 degrees, which is very cruel. Following this passage, the cameraman continued to pull the lens. Kate immediately saw a small truck hitting the wall in a yellow isolation zone. The front of the truck had collapsed, and inside the car, a corpse with a severely misplaced head can be seen. At present, the police are fully investigating. After reading this news, Kate shook the head, not at all taking seriously. After all, this is Kansas City, not Los Angeles. The distance between the two is 2,600 kilometers. Even if the plane takes two hours to fly their side, not to mention the fear that the murderers over there will run over. But after thinking about it, Kate gave a silent cry, because if I remember correctly, the company's headquarters is in Los Angeles. I just help that colleagues over there can ask for more happiness. Thinking of this, Kate had finished washing, he turned off the TV, then put on his jacket and turned out. Although today is a day off, Kate didn't complain because he had to work overtime, because in his company's medicine laboratory, a very important experimental project was about to be overcome. Foot. That is an experimental project that shocks the whole world. Once it can be broken by their experimental team, then next year's Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine may be my team's. When the time comes, everyone can be famous, future and money will come in full, and at the same time, 
their own experimental team can be promoted to the ranks of world famous biologists, and even after a hundred years, can be in the history books occupies a place in thinking of this. Kate is already full of motivation. As soon as he stepped on the gas pedal, his car made a wang sound and drove forward along the road. Super USB Chapter 469 Super USB Chapter 469 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. On the evening of May 30th, in a small biological laboratory on the outskirts of Kansas City, forgotten by the world, four experimenters were immersed in their own data. These four are an old man, a blonde beauty, a black young man, and a white handsome young man. The old man is a professor and the other three are his subordinates, but from the experiment although the atmosphere in the room is tense, not at all other laboratories with swords drawn and bows bent atmosphere. Not only that, but from the excited expressions of the four people, it can be seen that the experiment has been fruitful and it has come to an end. At this moment, the blonde beauty suddenly took out a test tube glowing with blue fluorescence from the incubator in front of her. She picked it up with a test tube clamp, and then excitedly placed it in front of the old man while opening the mouth and said, Professor Irwin, the sample compound has been separated. Very good ready to drip into the experimental model. The old man called Professor Kelvin quickly said, and then he called the other busy people, Kate, Keffa, you all come and see, Jennifer has separated the compound. The handsome young man and the black young man gathered together, and the four gathered in front of a petri dish, and then watched the blonde beauty drip a drop of reagent into the petri dish. I am coming. The handsome young man picked up the petri dish and observed it under the electronic microscope, and then shouted, Look, after dropping the compound, the IL-1 in the petri dish is actually inhibited. Everyone looked at the screen next to them. As expected, the particles in the petri dish were being continuously dissolved by the drop of compound just like washing powder dissolving stains, very quickly. Not only that, but the deposits are also continuously dissolving. The old professor on the side side, Kate, we may have made a big discovery. Kate nodded, a touch of excitement appeared in her eyes, obviously, this is what you have been searching for, Professor Irvin. I didn't expect that there is no medicine developed by any pharmaceutical company in the world. Researched out by our small workshop. This honor belongs to you, Professor Kelvin. Seeing this scene, the blonde beauty burst into tears of joy. She stepped forward and hugged the old man, and then said, together with us, we will also be touched by you. The four of them are all expressions of excitement and emotion. Although they have long been psychologically prepared for medicine's success, when this innocence comes, everyone has a sense of trance and unreality. This is not my work alone. The old man touched the heads of the three of them and said with satisfaction, Besides me, whether it is you, Kate, or Kefa, you also have a great contribution to this medicine. Professor Irwin, the most important thing now is to think of a name for this new medicine. At this moment, the black youth suddenly said, You are the founder of medicine, this name should come from you. Yes, everyone is nodded as it should be by rights. This medicine is likely to be the first medicine in human history that can perfectly cure Alzheimer's disease. In this case, it is simply called. The old man pondered for a while, then said, or, it's a D O O one yeah? All three young people cheered. Wait. But at this moment, the old man seemed to think of something. He suddenly expressed his expression tightly and quickly stopped everyone. You three little brats, this is not the time to celebrate, now I need someone from you to help me go. Do one thing. One thing? The three of them all looked suspiciously, wondering why Professor Irwin, who should have been celebrating was so serious. I hope someone will take a trip instead of me and send this bottle of medicine and information to Los Angeles, to a person named Parker on the company board. The old man showed seriousness. He turned his head and looked towards Kate. Kate, can you complete this task? Wait, if it's the board of directors, wouldn't it be okay for you to send it in person? And the information is simpler, just send it directly soon. Kate was a little puzzled. He spread his hands, 
Why go and send it in person? Sigh. Hearing this, Professor Irwin couldn't help sighing. You and Jennifer are both transferred from other companies. It may not be clear that part of our company's equity has been maliciously acquired by another company. The board of directors has also been infiltrated. And that company is far stronger than us. Once data is transmitted over the network, it is likely to be intercepted by the other party. I know, is it the famous famous? As soon as the young black man on the side was about to speak, he asked Professor Irwin to cover his mouth. Seeing this scene, Kate and the blonde beauty looked at each other, and there was a dignified look in their eyes. Just listen to Professor Irwin continuing to say, the most important thing is that the other party has a similar Alzheimer's disease response policy. We must not let the medicine obtained by this research fall into their pockets. Understand, right? Understood. Kate hearing this suddenly nodded, if this is the case, then I will deliver it, and for insurance, I will go to Los Angeles by car, so even if the other party knows, I won't be caught at the airport. Very good. Professor Irwin was nodded with satisfaction, and saw that he took out a USB flash drive, put all the medicine related data in it, and then pressed the button to clear all information in the laboratory to let all the relevant information in the laboratory the information of AD001 has been completely deleted. Then, he poured all the liquid in the test tube into a finger-sized airtight bottle. Suddenly, a glass bottle glowing with blue fluorescence appeared in front of Professor Irwin, and he solemnly passed the airtight bottle. Give Kate a kind smile at the same time, go, child. The sooner you go, the better. Kate was nodded heavily, and then he put away the sealed bottle, greeted everyone, and quickly left the laboratory. Dot. However, what everyone didn't know was that at the moment they researched AD001, everything about this medicine was intercepted by a secret existence on the internet. Not only that, in a building far away in the suburbs of Los Angeles, there is a room without any doors or windows. This room is located in the middle of the building, in a crack in the building, relying on the illusion produced by humans, in the whole building there is such a room in the building, whether it is the wall or the floor, this room is made of pure white. There is only one piece of furniture in the whole room, which is a black sphere. At this moment, in the silent white room, suddenly, the black ball located in the center made a low running sound. It seemed that some machinery inside started to operate, the next second, the black ball suddenly burst out and shot out a ball. The light of bright blue, moved towards all directions. Kai Kai. With the operation of the black ball, the rays of light scattered by the black ball resemble a 3D printer. Nine silhouettes continue to surface directly in the blue light. When the blue light dissipates, there are already nine more people in the room. Of these nine people, all of them are wearing all kinds of clothes. They don't seem at all special. But if you look closely, you'll find that these people are all wearing uniform black gloves and a pair of black leather boots. Even, the same black neckline can be seen on their neckline. Obviously, under the coat of this group of people, there is a uniform black special costume. Among the nine people, the head is a young man with a grim expression. He has broken black hair and his eyes are as sharp and cold as a sword. At this moment, the young man stepped out suddenly and he went straight to the wall in front of him. However, something even stranger happened. As the young man stepped out, the wall in front of him opened in response, revealing a room behind the wall. Empty room. A floor tersling window is installed on the outside of the room. When you look out along the window, you can even see the starry neon lights in the distance. The time zone is different from Namibia. Namibia is located in the first district in the east and Los Angeles is located in the eighth district in the west. The time difference between the two is 10 hours. At this time, Namibia is still in the early morning, and Los Angeles has entered the night. Bringing the eight people behind him out of the secret room. The young man couldn't help looking around all around. There was a faint bright light glittering between his eyes. Yes, this is Los Angeles, X. How is the situation in Kansas City? In the Kansas City Laboratory of Osmond Biotechnology, Professor Irwin has successfully researched AD001, 
and everything is exactly the same as in the movie. That Professor Irwin was concerned about our existence, has deleted all primordial data, only keep a backup, and prepare to send it to the company's board of directors with AD001. In the earphones, Xiaox's Oriole like voice came. As time went on, Xiaox was no longer the child's voice that used to be cute, but became a girl's crisp and sweet voice sounding very melodious. Sure enough, the plot in the movie really happened. Chen Chen walked to the floor to sling window and looked unemotional, in this case, let's not break the plot for the time being, let the plot maintain the original trajectory. Understood, the first batch of black riders went to Kansas City yesterday, and they have now arrived there and captured Professor Irwin and his assistant Kefa. Little X replied, Irwin is an elite in the field of biology, remember to tie him back. Chen Chen nodded, then the words changed, said solemnly, but you have to remember that you don't have to keep your hands when you let Black Rider chase down that gate, you must try your best to kill the other person. Can I kill the main character of the movie without violating the plot flow? Understood. Xiao X agreed. What about you now? I'm going to the headquarters of Osman Biological Company and meet the man named Parker. Chen Chen said without thinking, by the way, stay there and wait for the rabbit. Speaking, he opened the floor to sling window in front of him, and suddenly a gust of wind came in. Wait, Lord Godfather there. Just when Chen Chen was about to fly out, Xiao X suddenly stopped talking. Hearing Xiao X's voice, Chen Chen immediately stopped. What's the matter? I found out from the police network that there was a very strange serial murder in Los Angeles. The location took place in the Helen Guerre House district, only a few kilometers away. Xiao X said, there is something wrong with this. What's wrong? Chen Chen's expression condensed. Little X, as the fastest supercomputer in the world, can make her feel wrong which shows that there is a real problem. The location of the incident is the Herang Warehouse District. There are countless items gathered from all over the world. Some are in the district or outside. Even the industrial park of our life science city has a certain relationship with here. International trade? Xiao X whispered, but just the night before and the night before, two murders suddenly broke out. The first was the night before when a worker in a warehouse area was twisted to death by an unknown method. I thought it was just an accident. The Los Angeles police retreated after investigating and collecting evidence. However, just last night, the case suddenly escalated. Eight people were killed again in the same night, and all eight people were the same. All of the deaths were caused by twisting their necks, and even some of the deceased had their spine pulled out. Hearing this, Chen Chen couldn't help showing a grave expression, twist his neck, X, do you suspect this is an abnormal murder case? I don't know, but I just feel that Los Angeles has been safe, but as we arrived, this happened suddenly, Xiao X explained, so I wonder if these changes are related to our actions this time, perhaps, Chen Chen does not at all directly deny that he lifts the head and feels the constant wind blowing in, Maybe this is just a coincidence, maybe all this is really related to the movie plot, but we can't just because of this stop acting, otherwise it's easy to break the plot. I'm not sure what will happen if I break the plot, maybe something will not happen, or it may have a worse chain reaction, and even be rejected by world rule, just like death god is coming. It's killed, but it still needs a little bit of temptation. Speaking, Chen Chen sighed suddenly and then the corners of his mouth raised slightly, X, didn't you find out, are we now the same as before, groping for the rules of the U disk a little bit, yes, little X restless is nodded, for that magical USB flash drive, when we thought we knew it enough, it always showed more changes, just like an iceberg floating on the sea, you will never know about this iceberg below sea level, how many parts are hidden? Chen Chen squinted his eyes and said silently, it's the same at this time. If I want to control the USB flash drive, I must constantly test out more rules, unless I would rather stop. This is something we cannot escape road. I see, we will not escape from all this. In the headset, little X's voice became serious. Very good. Chen Chen said with a smile, 
Go to the computer Adam of the Earth Federation headquarters and let him make a prediction to see who the murderer is behind this murder. This is the only thing we can do now. Everything else, do everything as usual. Understood. With Xiao X's promise, Chen Chen completely stepped out of the building, but the strange thing is that he stood directly in the gust of wind, and Chen Chen suddenly leaned forward, and then only heard a bang! Exclamation mark. Suddenly, there was only a pool of scattered water mist left outside the building, and Chen Chen's silhouette completely disappeared. Super USB Chapter 470 Super USB Chapter 470 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Yellowstone National Park, North America, No Man's Land. A building hidden in thousands of jungles stands tall. There are no villages or roads within a hundred li. There are only a few secret military bases that are tangled and complicated, guarding this square building like a guard. Here is the true core of the Earth Federation Federal Quantum Laboratory, and in this building, there is Adam the most precious thing in the world. Adam is a quantum computer, but its shape is very strange, like an abstract sculpture built by an artist, composed of large and small translucent glass-like gears and irregular parts. Apart from this also there are many tassels hanging down, full of a weird beauty. If one day Adam breaks down or loses the power of fables, then within a month, the entire Earth Federation will fall apart disintegrating like the Soviet Union at the time, and once again form a division of each other. The situation of conquest, but in such a night, the quantum computer Adam suddenly lost its wind and made a ding ling ling sound like placed collision. Ding ling ling, ding ling ling. However, such a small collision is comparable to a century old storm in the eyes of many outside monitors. Report, 14 groups detected abnormal fluctuations. Report. Abnormal fluctuations were detected in 10 groups. 7 groups have also monitored that the analytical curve valves of the 3rd house and the 6th house continue to rise, from an average of 30% to 100%. Second, the 8th house curve has increased by 1000%. What happened? It is a curve disturbance, Adam is predicting the future of an event. As everyone said a word to me, a piercing alarm sounded loudly. In an instant, the entire monitoring team was in a mess. Everyone tried to parse the strings of codes of quantum computer calculations. To my surprise, these codes are all encrypted. Why? Why did Atom suddenly use encryption codes? We don't know, it has never happened before. Quickly parse them, hurry. However, to analyze the encryption code of a quantum computer easier said than done, this group of people spent all one's strength plus using the computing power of the entire world's 200 supercomputers to barely come to a conclusion they want to crack Adam's encryption code requires these super calculations to be cracked for 300 years. After seeing this conclusion, everyone was completely dumbfounded. When the entire federation was shocked by Adam's anomaly, Chen Chen was standing at a height of 1000 meters, and the wind was whistling, causing his clothes to fly in the wind, and his feet were world-renowned the capital of film and television. At this moment, Chen Chen lowered his head, expressionless overlooking the brightly lit city under his feet. Los Angeles is famous, in addition to being the ranked second city in North America. There is also another reason, that is, it is the place where Hollywood is located. Since 1911, after the first film company was established in Los Angeles, Los Angeles quickly became the world's film and television center, and at the same time became the center of cultural output in North America. The name Hollywood attracted the attention of one billion people, leading the general direction of global film entertainment. And this city is Chen Chen's second visit. The last time he came here, it was also for the movie, because he keenly discovered that the movie Life and Death the shocking project had a strange causal connection with reality, so he came to Hollywood specially. I investigated the director and crew who made this movie. The investigation results naturally came back in vain, and this movie showed no signs of being interfered by mysterious forces. So, Chen Chen at the time came to a judgment, 
some movies shot on the USB flash drive are likely to affect reality. Now that three years have passed, the original judgment has really been fulfilled. Although the looks of the actors in that movie are different from those in reality, both the names and details are exactly the same as the plot in the movie, as if everything is reproduced after the plot of the movie. Even at this time, Chen Chen has received a report that the young man named Kate has developed a DO01, and is now being ordered by Professor Irwin to secretly send this medicine to Osman Biological Company, in the hands of the founder. For Chen Chen, he had obtained a DO01 as early as three years ago. Although this medicine has not been made public so far, in the God Forbidden Zone organization, this medicine is already well known and even has more than a dozen members of the Disciple Council family suffering from Alzheimer's disease have received treatment and have been 100% cured. Nowadays, this medicine has been researched by others, and should be used as one zone. Of course Chen Chen would not agree. Not only Chen Chen would not agree, even other disciplined families would not agree. At this time, Chen Chen has arrived at the headquarters of Osman Biological Company. This is a dilapidated office building with a history of at least 20 years. This building is also close to the suburbs. In the dark, all around seemed a bit desolate. Chen Chen landed in a free fall from a high altitude, but when he was about to approach the ground, his speed dropped in vain. The whole person reversed, turning from the head and the feet to the head and the feet and then steadily landed on on the top floor of an office building. From beginning to end, no one saw this amazing scene. In places like rooftops, there are usually no people, even more how it is still late at night, but Chen Chen saw that the bellows of several central air conditioners on the rooftop were still buzzing. According to the positioning information given by Xiao X, now Parker, the founder of Osmond, is in his office. So Chen Chen walked directly to the stairwell on the roof, looked at the dilapidated iron gate in front of him, Chen Chen sneered, and pushed the door directly in. Um. Suddenly, the iron gate that hadn't been opened for a long time made a loud rubbing noise, and Chen Chen pushed it open. When walking down from the top floor, Chen Chen saw that his current position is on a long and narrow corridor, and on both sides of the corridor are offices. Apart from this, there is nothing worthy of attention. In the row of offices on the right side of the corridor, Chen Chen was looking for the first one. The sign of the office was marked with the words Office of the Chairman and General Manager. Yes, this Parker is not only the founder of Osman Biotechnology, but also the chairman of the board of directors and the general manager of the company. It can continuously raise funds for a small biotechnology company into its current size. Although it cannot be mentioned on equal terms with the huge monster of blacklight technology, it is also very good. This Parker has some talents. Thinking of this, Chen Chen walked to the door and directly opened the wooden door of the office. What's the matter? didn't I say? You can solve this kind of thing yourself. As the door was completely opened, Chen Chen heard a male voice from inside the door, and Chen Chen's eyes were caught in the office scene. This office is not big, although it seems to have been cut through a wall and formed by combining two offices into one, the decoration inside is more exquisite, composed of black and white. Whether it is both the floor and the wall are black and white which gives a special atmosphere when surrounded by this. On the opposite side of the door is a large redwood writing desk, and on the opposite side of the writing desk is the Parker Chen Chen was looking for. This is a middle-aged man with a special face, which seems to have a part of Germanic bloodline. He has a long and thin face, broad underneath, black hair and brown eyes, eyebrows almost parallel to the eyes, and sharp eyes. As Chen Chen pushed the door in, the middle-aged man at the redwood writing desk lifted the head a little impatiently. He was about to lose his temper, but when he saw Chen Chen, he suddenly started. Who are you, Michelle? Do you mean your secretary? Chen Chen walked into the office like a familiar one. He looked around and said casually, I didn't see her at the door. Maybe she is off work. After get off work, the middle-aged man became even more confused. He looked at Chen Chen suspiciously and asked again. 
then who are you and why are you here, me? Chen Chen hearing this couldn't help grinning. He pulled the seat on the side and sat on the opposite side of the middle-aged man. At the same time, he showed a smile of harboring malicious intentions, I am the boss of this company, what are you kidding? The middle-aged man became angry. He picked up his side phone and yelled inside, the security guard, what does the security guard eat? There is outsider in my office. Come here. P. After waiting for a woman's voice on the phone, the middle-aged man hung up the phone panting with rage. He solemnly looked towards Chen Chen, I don't know how you got here, but now I don't you have half a minute to get out of my office before calling the security to strip you naked and throw you on the street, right now. Why bother? Chen Chen did not have any unpleasant emotions because of the other party's words. At this time, he at a moderate pace said, Mr. Parker, don't get excited. There is no exaggeration in what I said before. Now I officially introduce myself, my name. It's Chen Chen, you should have heard of it. I don't want to know that you are. Middle-aged man coldly snorted and said, but before he finished speaking, he suddenly widened his eyes and revealed an unbelievable expression, what, who do you say you are? Chen Chen did not answer. Instead, he spread his hands and said casually, I know you have heard clearly. I don't need to repeat my identity, Mr. Parker. I am here to make a deal with you. Dot. Speaking, Chen Chen suddenly leaned forward and said in a low voice, I want the remaining shares of Osmond in your hands, as well as your management rights. Impossible. Middle-aged man not even think immediately refused. At this time, there was already a sound of running from far and near outside the door and it seemed that several people were coming here quickly. After hearing this voice, the middle-aged man seemed to regain a sense of security. His voice became calmer, I will not sell the shares in my hands, and it is even more impossible to manage the company I created. Transfer the right to another person, and I don't want to know who you are. Now you leave immediately, otherwise I will let the security carry you out. Following Parker's words, the sound of footsteps had reached the door, and at the same time five strong men in suits rushed in. Carry him out of me. Seeing the security guard who arrived here, Parker suddenly showed a hint of joy and ordered at the same time. I'm afraid it won't be as you wish. Chen Chen showed a touch of regret, he snapped his fingers casually, and the next second, the five security guards who had just entered felt a pain in the back of the head as if someone had hit himself hard from behind, and then the five people gave him both eyes at the same time. It turned over and fell to the ground neatly. This is the use of field energy. Now Chen Chen can rely on the power of field energy to break through the sound barrier. It is even easy to knock people out, which is a general pediatric behavior. For Parker in front of him, it was as if the young man in front of him had mastered the power of mysterious. He just snapped his fingers and caused five people to fall to the ground at the same time. Seeing this weird scene, Parker couldn't help but suck in a cold breath. He couldn't sit still anymore, stood up with horror on his face, and at the same time quickly retreated back until he reached the window. Come down. It makes no sense to escape. Chen Chen leaned on the back of his chair and continued to persuade neither too fast nor too slow. The reason why you are not willing to be acquired by me is because you have received news from Professor Irwin. AD001 has been successfully developed. Question mark. You, hearing this news, Parker is more like five thunderbolts. He looked towards Chen Chen in shock. How could you possibly know this? Of course I know. Chen Chen waved his hand lightly said with a smile, not only did I know, I also knew that in order to prevent the newly developed AD001 from falling into our hands, Professor Irwin specially ordered Kate to take the road and cross the two thousands of kilometers, to deliver medicine to you personally, do you think that countless money is already very easy? Pike heard this opened his mouth, and fell silent again, it's just this time, with Chen Chen breaking through the secrets his original arrogant expression has become a lot weaker, why don't you listen to my terms, seeing that Parker did not respond, Chen Chen said directly, I am willing to buy all the shares in your hand for 2 billion US dollars, this price is not low, after several financings, you only have 10% of primordial shares, 
and the price of 2 billion US dollars is also much higher than the market value of Osmond. Even if AD001 is really sold in the company in the future, the stock price will rise sharply, you may not be able to get it. 2 billion US dollars, it is better to take the money early and start a new company. Parker seemed to be a little shaken, his eyes kept flickering, but he still didn't speak. And, why do you think we should buy AD001? As soon as Chen Chen spoke, Parker found that the computer in front of him flickered suddenly, and he automatically connected to the internet and visited a special website. On the website, it was the AD001 medicine information. This is seeing the same name on the computer as AD001. Parker was even startled, but when he saw the detailed information below, his attitude of resistance has completely transformed into an inexplicable horror. This document, also named AD001, actually records all the information and pharmacological details of medicine in detail. And the effect of the other party turned out to be a cure for Alzheimer's disease. Super USB Chapter Super USB Chapter Super USB Chapter 471 Super USB Chapter 471 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Blacklight Technology already holds 50% of Osman's shares on hand, and now it has increased by 10% 1, which is 60%. 6, and Chen Chen, as the legal person of Blacklight Technology, naturally gets it legally. Osman's supreme right to speak. Overnight, the entire company had changed. Dynasties. But the employees of the company were kept in the dark. Only Parker, after being forced to agree to all of this, slumped in his seat, his expression obviously getting older. Although he got the money, he lost the future. His once full of ambitions and his belief in making the company bigger and stronger collapsed instantly. At this moment, Parker only felt that his heart was empty, and it seemed that he was missing something. Dot. After persuading the other party, Chen Chen didn't stay too much. Although the Parker's ability was good, Chen Chen had a position to pull the other party in and become the manager of the Blacklight Technology branch. However, after thinking about it, he gave up. After pulling the other party in, this Parker will definitely gradually doubt where the Blacklight Technology AD001 came from, and even discover the movie that hit the street. If you associate rich people, you will even guess Chen Chen there is some way of predicting the future. Even more how, this Parker himself is not the same person as Chen Chen. So Chen Chen finally put out his thoughts. As Chen Chen turned and left the office and returned to the rooftop, he stood on the edge of the building, silently staring into the distance. All the back roads have been paved. Next, just wait for Kate to get in by herself. However, just when Chen Chen thought that everything was under control, Xiao X suddenly heard some meager voices, not good, your godfather, something happened to the Earth Federation Quantum Laboratory. Chen Chen hearing this raised his eyes, what's the matter? After I sent a prediction request to the quantum computer with him, it took only half an hour to automatically generate a video, but after watching this video, I felt a strange and familiar feeling. Little X's voice is uncertain. I have only felt this special feeling on things related to memes. Chen Chen hearing this was suddenly startled, and he stood up straight. You mean, Adam created a meme by himself? Not really. However, Xiao X explained, I analyzed the code of the video itself, not at all, and found anything related to memes, which means that the video is not problematic. The real problem is not the video itself, and is the content of the video. Speaking. Xiao X hesitated, I am familiar with the coding of memes. In this video, I feel a feeling similar to Mengman, which means that this video is very likely it is highly contagious, but I am not sure for the time being that the content of this video has several ways of spreading, and what will be the way of transmission. Chen Chen immediately understood that the mode of dissemination of memes has countless changes, and it is not necessarily limited to one. Although it is a video, it is basically certain that the mode of dissemination is visual communication, but it does not mean that the language describes its content. No transmission phenomenon will occur. Speaking of this, 
Chen Chen suddenly looked towards a certain direction in Los Angeles, which was the direction of the Highland Warehouse area that Xiao X had reported to him before. If the quantum computer predicts that it is a memetic, does it mean that a memetic effect is happening in the Heron Warehouse, and those who died by twisting their necks were killed by memes? Dead. However, everything related to memes is deadlocked in the spy lab. How could it appear outside? or the strongest North America in the world. What is the content of the video, can you describe it? Chen Chen asked eagerly. I dare not describe the content of within the body for the time being, but one thing can explain that the subject in the video is a statue, a statue of an angel covering your eyes. An angel statue covering his eyes? Chen Chen muttered with some confusion, and then he seemed to think of something and then he suddenly came back to his senses, showing a shocked expression, it's that angel pattern. At this moment, Chen Chen suddenly remembered that when he went to the Zongzi Jiatong University to investigate, he was placed with an iron bed that seemed to come from the plain of Silent Hill and almost killed himself. Although humans calculation are inferior to the heavens calculation in the end, the meme of the iron bed was unintentionally deciphered by a university student. But after Chen Chen transported the iron bed back to Namibia, there was still an error. During the memetic detection experiment, Chen Chen not only failed to detect the function of the iron bed, but instead caused an extra mural beside the iron bed. It is a mural painted with blood and it is a woman curled up with her eyes covered, and on the woman's back, there is a pair of wings. At that time, Chen Chen didn't at all, only a part of it was seen. But fortunately, I didn't see the whole picture. Once the meme pattern this thing is seen all over, it is likely to represent a hit. When the time comes, even if it comes to death I don't know how I died. At this time, following the reminder of Xiao X, Chen Chen immediately thought of something, and he asked quickly, didn't the four black riders look directly at the memetic pattern before? How did they get destroyed in the end? I was sent to the steel mill. Xiao X seemed to understand something. She hurriedly said, it shouldn't be. After the chips of these four black riders were dug out, their fleshy bodies were all dissolved in the molten steel. P. Dissolved. Chen Chen hearing this can't help but reveal a puzzled expression. If it has been destroyed, why did it appear in Los Angeles again? Is it just a coincidence? But in the next second, Chen Chen dismissed the idea and asked again, are you sure? Then the pot dissolved the molten steel from the bodies of the four black riders. Where did it go? I will check it now. Xiao X replied, paused for a few seconds, and then said again, your godfather, your guess is correct, because I discovered that after the pot of molten steel dissolved the four people, they were cast into building materials, and it was sold to North America and the buyer was a construction company in Los Angeles. Hearing this, Chen Chen and Xiao X were completely surprised. Sure enough, Chen Chen stared solemnly at the dark night ahead. In the suburbs of Los Angeles, there is an area full of warehouses, and nothing else. It is the famous Herank Warehouse District. This batch of building materials is mixed because of the memetic effect. They were transported to Los Angeles along with the building materials, and then when they were temporarily stacked in the Heron warehouse area, they broke out because of certain conditions they met. It's too tricky. Xiao X's tone was a bit distressed, I didn't expect that the body that might be infected with the meme has been destroyed, and it can spread. This memetic effect is too terrifying, but in this way, I'm afraid the quantum computer laboratory has already it's over. Do you mean that this video has been leaked at the quantum lab? Chen Chen sucks in a cold breath, and only feels his scalp is numb, he really can't imagine what would happen if this meme appeared in reality. Yes, after all, the Adam ontology is on their side. I can't prevent them from getting the answer. I can only choose to encrypt the information, but little X's voice was a little helpless. Originally Como Adam used encryption when predicting the Heron Warehouse incident. It stands to reason that the Earth Federation cannot get an effective answer, but it's a pity that the memes are not justified. After generating the video, not only did I get this video, 
The Earth Federation also got a copy. I originally thought that these encryption methods could not be cracked by the Earth Federation, but they successfully opened it. All encryption methods are in front of this meme, have become invalid means. In other words, at this time, everyone in the quantum laboratory of the Earth Federation saw that video. Chen Chen's face is even more ugly. At this moment, Zhao Shan's face flashed in his mind. And then Zhao Shan's face changed and became the image of Professor Wang Zai again. Chen Chen couldn't help being extremely angry and he laughing. Good means, really good means. Do you mean? Little X's voice is a little surprised. If no one is planning all this, it is impossible. Chen Chen's expression is more cold and severe. The other party would rather destroy the entire human civilization indiscriminately in order to get a USB flash drive or to kill me. Isn't this a good method? What's more terrifying is that the other party is very it may not be on the earth, or even in the time and space and timeline where I am, but in other places that I cannot reach and discover. So what shall we do now? Little X couldn't help asking. Recover most of the black rider who went to hunt down Kate. Chen Chen not even think said, Kate let the flow go, these black riders all go to the Helen district find out everything for me, and see what the hell is that thing is killing. Speaking, Chen Chen hesitated a bit, and finally opened the mouth and said, by the way, contact the president of North America and the mayor of Los Angeles, and let them immediately block the Herank area to prevent the spread of memes. However, the other party will not listen to us. Xi Ao X hesitated. Then tell them what memes are. Chen Chen coldly said, although the time has not yet arrived. We can no longer take care of these. It is just a showdown. We may not be afraid of North America now. X, I'm relying on you here. You have never let me down. In the past, in the present, and I hope in the future too. Yes. Little Xiering this immediately lifted her spirits, and her voice was clear. I understand your godfather. I will leave it to me. Very good. Chen Chen laughed with satisfaction. He suddenly turned his head and looked at the north. At this moment, the night breeze suddenly blew, causing Chen Chen to slightly squint his eyes. There seemed to be an undercurrent surging in his eyes. Then, the federal quantum computer experiment leave it to me over there. Speaking, Chen Chen walked straight to the edge of the building, but when he reached the edge, he didn't stop at all and walked towards in the sky, but the weird thing is that although the foot is 100 meters are high in the void, but every step he seems to have stepped on the real place. At the same time, Chen Chen's body leaned forward slightly, and the field energy in his mind exploded like a spark plug. In the next second, Chen Chen's whole body suddenly produced an extreme thrust, which made Chen Chen an unbelievable acceleration rushed out. Boom! A white mist formed behind Chen Chen, but Chen Chen had already appeared outside of several hundred meters at this time, and then in the blink of an eye again, Chen Chen disappeared completely. Until Chen Chen's silhouette disappeared completely, the Osmond building under his feet could see the panes of glass bursting. In the blink of an eye, Half of the glass of the building exploded in this brief moment, scattered all over the place. At this moment, Chen Chen has flown out with an acceleration that exceeds the limit of humans. This is no longer a problem of field energy. Even Andrew in out of control dare not do it, because Andrew may have more field energy than Chen Chen, but his body has always been the body of an ordinary person. Many people think that the body will become stronger after being irradiated by the super crystal. The source of this rumor is actually a scene in the movie, Andrew used a fork into his cousin's hand when he was playing tricks on his cousin. But the cousin's hand was fine, but the fork was bent. So many unknown people thought that their bodies became harder after being radiated by the crystal. In fact, this was a misunderstanding, because the plot at the time was actually Andrew's ability in the test field. He later explained that the reason why the fork would bend and the cousin's hand was fine is because he could block his cousin in the field. On the hands, the reason for doing this is to show that he can have a higher degree of control over the field that's all, which is not at all related to physical strength. But Chen Chen is different. At this time, Chen Chen is like a mixture of Alice and Andrew. He has both Alice's physical fitness strengthened by the T-virus and Andrew's field power, 
so he only then can it accelerate to supersonic speed in just half a second, without worrying about the body being unable to bear it. In the aviation field, there is an exclusive term called overload, and the unit is represented by g. It can also be called the gravitational acceleration that the object receives on the surface of the earth. It can be expressed as, when standing on the ground it is still relative to the ground, the gravitational acceleration received by a person is 1 g, and what you feel is every the weight of the individual. However, when flying, the aircraft often accelerates, and the pilot will make acceleration movements like the aircraft at the same time, so an acceleration will be generated. The greater the acceleration, the greater the acceleration overload, such as it is said that if the pilot gets 2 g overload data while flying, then the weight of the pilot equivalent to doubled out of thin air. Generally speaking, an ordinary person can withstand an overload of 23 g, and those fighter pilots who have physical fitness selected very carefully and professionally trained at the same time can withstand an overload far beyond that of ordinary people. 7 g, some of the better ones can even withstand 9 g overload. As for Chen Chen, he accelerated from a standstill to the speed of sound, and he suffered several times the overload of pilots and a hundred times that of ordinary people. This is absolutely impossible for Andrew in the movie. Even if he did, he would a few seconds later, he died of cerebral hemorrhage. Super USB Chapter 472 Super USB Chapter 472 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabaj Imiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter come out. After everyone cracked the Adam encryption code, everyone in the technical department couldn't help but cheer, and the group of representatives from all continents, the shield holders, gathered immediately in front of the computer, waiting for the release of Adam new information. What's the matter? Isn't it the encrypted information? Why can the technical department crack it? Who knows? I heard that the technical department didn't spend much effort at all, but this matter is related to super intelligent Adam, maybe it has any significance. This computer is really amazing. Many shield holders gathered in the conference hall and continued to talk anxiously and excitedly until the chairman of the quantum power conference spoke, and everyone was quiet. This emergency meeting, I think you all know the reason. This is an old man from Europe. He only heard excitedly. I won't say more nonsense. Next is the video information cracked by the technical department. Please see it everyone. Following the words of the old man, the screen in front of everyone suddenly turned on, and suddenly a video with a section length of only 10 seconds appeared in front of everyone. But to everyone's disappointment, the picture in the video is not a big secret, but a statue of a woman facing the crowd with her back, her head down and her hands raised as if she was covering her eyes. The lines on the statue are smooth and the textures are extremely delicate, as if they are carefully crafted, and what is more conspicuous is the back of the statue, which has a pair of soft wings. Anyone can see at a glance that this statue is nothing but an angel. This video is only 10 seconds long, and it almost ended before everyone came back to his senses. After watching this video, everyone is you. Look at me and I look at you, everyone feels disappointed. What is this, Adam Prank? This is it. One of the shields spread their hands and looked towards the chairman of the quantum power conference. Are you sure that the technical department did not change the screen? The technical department is absolutely loyal. What you said is impossible. Old man shook the head. Maybe Adam wants to tell us a secret through this video. I guess so. For a time. The conference hall became noisy again, but this group of people didn't notice. When they turned their heads and argued loudly, on the frozen screen, the statue turned his head slowly. Dot. At the same moment, in Los Angeles City Hall, Mayor Parsons was rubbing his temple angrily, stacking a thick pile of materials in front of him. A few minutes ago, the chief of the police department in charge of Los Angeles public security had been scolded with a bloody head, and he ran away from the city hall and escaped from Parsons' angry roar. They are all pigs who only know how to eat dry rice. There is no useful thing at the critical moment. Parsons became so angry at the thought of such a bad murder, 
He pushed off the report on the table, cursing in a low voice, Mr. Mayor, there is probably a vicious murderer hiding in the Herank district. The aides on the side reminded in a low voice, what we should do now is to seal off the Herank warehouse area, take all the workers out of it, and conduct strict interrogation of everyone at the same time, because there is a high probability the murderer is still hidden in the warehouse area. Is the other party so stupid? Parsons looked towards the staff with a cold face. This is not the case, Mr. Mayor. The staff did not panic at all, instead solemnly vowed. Obviously, so many people died at the hands of the murderer, which is beyond the scope of vendettas, so I suspect that these murders are actually random killings. That is to say, the other party is probably taking pleasure in killing. This kind of person's spirit has long been distorted and cannot be treated with common sense. Hearing this, Parsons began to think, obviously, what the other party said made sense. Of course, I'm just speculating. Anyway, it's just a try. We can also send police to carry out a carpet search in the Highland warehouse area. Even if we can't catch the opponent, if we can stop the murderer's actions, is also good. The staff continued to persuade. Hearing this, Parsons finally nodded, then follow your method. We will block the Hernock warehouse area and dispatch at the same time. Before I finished talking, the computer on Parsons' desk clinked and turned it on. The two heard the sound and looked over at the same time. After seeing the computer turned on by himself, Parsons suddenly frowned. He extended the hand, as if turning off the computer again. But in the next second, a clear little girl voice it came out from the computer. Your Excellency Parison, I do not recommend you to do this. On the computer, the girl said in pure English, if I were you. I would directly close the Helen warehouse area and wait for orders from higher authorities, instead of sending police to the Helen warehouse area to die. P. Who is it? When they heard the computer speak by themselves, both showed a surprised expression. The staff member exclaimed, it's a hacker, the other party is stealing our conversation. Speaking, the staff was ready to notify the guards outside, but Parsons hesitated and finally stopped him. Listen to what she said. Seeing Parison's order, the staff glanced at the computer with some anxiety. I saw that the computer at this time no longer has an interface such as Windows. Instead, it turned out to be a pure black screen, and there is a red logo on the screen, and the pattern has within the body content. It is the three lowercase letters. The three I letters circle the city in a circle, and there are two arcs between them, forming a similar radial ring. The structure is like a sign of nuclear radiation. Below the icon is a line of letters, Info Hazard. Information Hazard. Your Excellency Parsons, I don't recommend that you send police forces to the Highland District. At this time, the little girl's voice continued to persuade, because it doesn't help, and it may cause more intense memetic infection. Hearing this, Parison frowned, he waved his hand slightly and the staff seemed to understand something immediately, and hurriedly backed out, seeming to want to call who over. Memetic infection, what is that? Parson's voice continued to remain cold, without mentioning what he had just done. Memes, belong to a subject that has not yet been discovered by humans. The little girl's voice whispered, I believe you should know that the essence of living things is continuation, and continuation is the fundamental purpose of life and the reason why life can continue is because of the continuation of genes, and genes have inheritance. They support the basic structure of life and store all the information about the race, blood type, gestation, growth, apoptosis and other processes of life. At the same time, in addition to heredity, genes also have the characteristics of mutation and selection. Otherwise, our current biological world is impossible to make such countless changes, but do you know that in addition to genes, there is also a world that has both transmission and selection and the three characteristics of mutation? What is it? Hearing the question from the voice on the computer, Parison asked with a flash of expression. It's a meme. The little girl continued. A meme is like a special kind of information that is spread and mutated through human cognition. It can change human perception of things, change the structure of matter and even change the actual rule system is not good, 
and even the entire Earth Federation will be destroyed because of it. What is happening now in the Herang warehouse area, is a serious memetic effect. Hearing this, Parsons' expression changed, he showed a disdainful smile, is this an information hazard? So, what should we do? My suggestion is to lock down the Heronka warehouse area and at the same time isolate all those who have entered it to prevent the spread of memes. While speaking, the little girl suddenly changed her words, but it seems that you don't believe me, otherwise you would not send your staff to launch the Los Angeles Network Reconnaissance Team to track down my IP. Parson's expression changed. So you think I would believe in a hacker who hides his head and reveals his tail and doesn't even want to show up? You can only follow my advice. The little girl's voice continued to say without emotion, otherwise, all of you will die. Is it killed by the so-called meme in your mouth? Parsons looked cold, obviously not cold to the threats on the computer. No, but because I have sent Black Rider to install 50 plastic bombs in the city hall. The voice continued to say without emotion, if you don't want to listen to me, then the entire city hall will collapse into ruins in an instant. This is not a joke with you. You, after hearing this sentence, Parson's face changed. He just wanted to get angry, but right here, the phone on his desk rang without warning. When Parson heard about his reputation, he saw the number of the White House President's office on the incoming call information. When Parson picked it up and heard the order from inside, his face became even more ugly, because the White House only sent him one order, block the Heron warehouse area. Dot. When Xiao X contacted the North American region official, Chen Chen was traversing multiple regions in North America at an exaggerated speed. In less than an hour, he crossed 1,500 kilometers and arrived. The famous Yellowstone National Park, across the Rocky Mountain Range, here is called the Spine of North America. It runs from 4,800 to 1,000 meters from north to south. By this time, even Chen Chen's forehead was sweaty. Looking for a building in such a vast area of mountains is about the same probability as to find a needle in a haystack, even more how it's still dark. If Chen Chen finds it by himself, I'm afraid it will take a few months. In order to find the headquarters of the Earth Federation Quantum Laboratory. Fortunately, all of this was helped by Xiao X in addition, day and night had little effect on Chen Chen's eyesight. Soon, Chen Chen arrived in the unnamed forest where the laboratory is located. At this point, Chen Chen began to lower his flight altitude. After all, as the top secret of the entire Earth Federation, this place is heavily guarded. If it flies too high, it is easy to be detected by a radar. After lowering the altitude, Chen Chen escaped from the supersonic state and flew at a low speed for 10 minutes. After flying over several checkpoints and over a military base, Chen Chen finally found himself here. The goal of the line is the quantum laboratory that can shield all radiation. The quantum lab is a square structure as a whole, towering in the endless forest, but it is very inconspicuous because of the protective color applied to it. Thanks to Chen Chen's eyesight, it can be easily seen. When Chen Chen approached the laboratory, his communicator also began to receive strong interference, and as he flew closer and closer, the interference continued to increase, and finally completely disconnected from Xiao X. It's only an hour before the meme leaked, I hope to catch up. As Chen Chen continued to lower his altitude, he soon came to the sky above the laboratory, but after seeing the scene on the ground, Chen Chen's heart sank suddenly. There was already a mess outside the gate of the laboratory. Dozens of guns were discarded on the ground and the regional flags of all continents were scattered all over the place. Even on the road, several corpses could be seen. Dot. Among these corpses were soldiers in military uniforms, researchers in white coats, and shield bearers in suits and leather shoes. It's just that the necks of these corpses were twisted more than 360 degrees, like long twists. The panic before death and the pressure from the twisting of the neck pressed the eyes of the corpse. All the corpses had their eyes wide open. It seemed that the eyeballs would fall from the eye sockets in the next second, and they looked terrifying. But these are not at all for Chen Chen. He just looked towards the direction of the laboratory with a solemn expression, 
but saw that as the ultimate secret of the Earth Federation, this quantum laboratory even had its doors open. Now, when the tree falls, the monkeys scatter, the politicians and researchers from various countries have fled into the depths of the forest. Seeing this scene, Chen Chen knew that he was late, and the memes had completely spread and infected the core center of the Earth Federation. However, Chen Chen is not at all eager to go to the forest to pursue it. The matter is over. The spread of memes is inevitable. At this time, he focuses on the most mysterious laboratory in the entire Federation. Perhaps there may be clues related to memes. Thinking of this, Chen Chen walked straight into the laboratory. Super USB Chapter 473 Super USB Chapter 473 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. What made Chen Chen a little surprised is that there is an inexplicable depressive atmosphere in the laboratory. As he stepped in, at first didn't feel it yet, but as he gradually deepened, a cold breath slowly enveloped him. In front of a corridor with no end in sight, on either side of the corridor are rows of office doors. An arc-shaped corridor interrupted Chen Chen's vision leaving Chen Chen in a semi-enclosed space. This feeling, Chen Chen frowned, this feeling is similar to the feeling of being trapped in the Li world when I went to Jiatong University. There is a sense of inexplicable depression, but the only difference is that the depression at this time is much stronger. Moreover, it is not the world memes that envelop the laboratory. Otherwise the group of scientists and politicians will not be able to escape the laboratory. At this time, the field energy has been heavily enclosed in Chen Chen's all around, as if Chen Chen was wearing an invisible armor, but Chen Chen still maintained his height in the face of the depression in the laboratory watchful, a string tightened in his mind. Every four five meters above the head of the laboratory, there is a light to provide illumination, but it seems that the light is very dim because of insufficient voltage, just like one after another formation. It can only illuminate the respective section of the corridor, and between the two sections of lighting, there is a special dark area. At this time, Chen Chen is walking in a very quiet metal corridor, every time he takes a step, there is an empty echo, which makes the corridor empty and weird, and all kinds of things are scattered on the ground. Item, there are messy materials on the ground and various experimental equipment. It's as if a certain kind of crisis broke out during the previous emergency evacuation of the laboratory, so the people who were still in order abandoned the materials in their hands for their own lives. Chen Chen continued to walk forward. This time he walked around several hundred meters. When he reached the end, a double leaf metal door suddenly appeared in front of him. This door is completely transparent. Through the thick glass, you can see the huge light emitted from the door, which is much brighter than the corridor. Inside the door, there is a cliff-like space and a completely suspended laboratory in the depths. Chen Chen remembers that the shape of the quantum laboratory is like a back shape, with a completely enclosed space in the middle, where the air is drained and it is in a vacuum state. The quantum computer is stored inside the laboratory using only electromagnetic force. Suspended in midair, the advantage of this is that it isolates all the electromagnetic radiation in the universe and is as clean as the universe has not yet been born. At this time, as Chen Chen looked at it, he could see an elevator floating on the other side of the gate appearing in the vacuum chamber, and this elevator was the only channel leading to the quantum computer, but this channel at this time, it was not on Chen Chen's side but on the side of the internal quantum laboratory. Chen Chen once used the quantum device in the movie Nether to manipulate a person into the laboratory, so he knew very well that this situation meant that someone had entered the quantum laboratory. Sure enough, as Chen Chen's gaze continued, he immediately saw an old man standing on the other side of the laboratory. He and Chen Chen passed the glass wall big eyes staring at small eyes, and the old man was even more exposed unbelievable look. Apparently, he doesn't understand how Chen Chen came here. Chen Chen tried to knock on the glass wall in front of him, but found that only a dull voice sounded slowly. Obviously, the voice couldn't pass, so he immediately stopped asking the old man about what happened. Dot. This old man Chen Chen didn't know him, but looking at his suit and leather dress, 
he should be a new shield bearer, and his race should be spokesperson from North America and Europe. However, after seeing Chen Chen, the old man started slamming on the glass door in front of him, and at the same time he kept yelling, as if he wanted to tell Chen Chen something. Chen Chen was a bit unclear, so, he tried to read the other party's lips, only to find that the other party was just continuously hey at himself and didn't say any valuable information at all. So Chen Chen thought about it, he turned he glanced at a door with no sign beside him, cautiously turned and walked in. As Chen Chen pushed the door and entered, suddenly, a room with a large number of surveillance cameras appeared in front of Chen Chen. The furnishings inside the door were swayed, messy paper scattered all over the floor, and at the front, there was a huge electronic platform embedded in the wall. As can be seen from the furnishings here, this place should be the same as a command room. Chen Chen's field energy swept across the room. After feeling that there was no special danger here, he looked down and looked for it. Soon, he found a few pages of A4 paper and a black pen. Holding paper and pen, Chen Chen walked out of the room again. As expected, the old man was still lying on the door. Seeing this, Chen Chen laughed. He took out the pen and wrote what happened here. English words. Seeing Chen Chen's behavior, the old man showed an inexplicable expression. He suddenly became extremely excited. At the same time, he pointed at Chen Chen happily and shouted loudly. From his lips, Chen Chen could only read two words danger. Just when Chen Chen was a little unclear, suddenly, a kai kai sound was heard from the top of his head, and the lights in the corridor he was in suddenly began to flicker violently. What's the matter? Chen Chen heart startled. I saw the lights flickering non-stop, making a babbling sound and it seemed that something inexplicable was slowly attacking during the extinguishment. At this moment, Chen Chen instinctively had an indescribable sense of crisis. He couldn't tell what it was like. He clearly had nothing behind him in the induction of field energy, but that feeling was still approaching. The hair of Chen Chen's body was almost exploded. This is a kind of instinctive fear from life. On this one, Chen Chen suddenly realized that the old man might not be pointing at himself, but behind him. Aware of this, Chen Chen turned his head back in a flash. Shua. Under Chen Chen's shocking glance, he really saw that at the junction of the two lights, a dark shadow appeared vaguely. This dark shadow is only ten meters away from Chen Chen. He stood between the shadows of two lights, making Chen Chen unable to see what it was. However, as Chen Chen's field energy was covered, he found that silhouette is nothing else, but he's a humanoid statue with wings. The statue held up its hands, as if crying before. At this time, it was in a state of just crying. The hands had just been taken off the face, revealing a pair of Kazlan's big eyes and a very anthropomorphic face. What the hell? Chen Chen couldn't help but narrowed his eyes. The light above my head is still flickering, but because behind me is the quantum laboratory. The laboratory seems to use another electric system, so the same failure occurs not at all. The light follows the two complete glass the door shone, and even if the hallway lights above his head were completely off, Chen Chen would not be blinded. However, now is not the time to care about the overhead lights, because with Chen Chen's memory, he can be absolutely sure that when he came over, this statue was completely non-existent. Not only that, but he can also be sure that when he turned his back, there was no such statue in the field energy test, as if the statue appeared the moment Chen Chen turned around. Chen Chen was even more shocked that the moment he turned around, his crisis instinct derived from within the body disappeared without warning. When he looked towards the statue in front of him, it was as if the other party was really just a statue, nothing unusual at all. Chen Chen subconsciously took a deep breath and recalled everything in his mind again, because he had taken the initiative to come to the quantum laboratory to face all this before, Xiao X still told him what the quantum computer predicted, Adam predicted what came out was a 10 second video file, and the file was an angel statue, exactly the same as the statue in front of Chen Chen at this time. In addition to the mural of a crying woman that appeared out of nowhere when he was doing a world memetic experiment, Chen Chen can already be sure that he is facing the meme at this time, 
but a completely unknown one. Memetic effect. So, how is this meme contagious? Chen Chen didn't move forward rashly. He just stood still and stared at each other motionlessly. However, to be cautious, he only stared at each other's footsteps instead of looking at each other's whole body, because the previous meme patterns had similar patterns. Nature. Once the meme picture is fully read, even if it is unintentional, it will cause infection. Thinking of this, Chen Chen's heart moved, and he used his field energy again, trying to push the opponent back. Crunch. With the sound of a stone rubbing against the metal bottom plate, the statue not far away was actually pushed back. Chen Chen's field energy can extend as far as 215 meters, and because the corridor is curved, Chen Chen's line of sight can only see the scene more than 20 meters away, so Chen Chen tried to the other part he pushes out the corridor and pushes out his own line of sight. However, Chen Chen did not at all think about destroying the other party first. After all, he didn't know the nature of the meme. In case the statue was destroyed before the infectious ability would be produced, then Chen Chen would be active courting death. I have to say that field performance is really a good thing. As Chen Chen kept pushing the opponent away from the corridor, the opponent gradually disappeared in front of him. But when Chen Chen was a little wondering whether the opponent could be resolved so easily, he suddenly felt that the field was empty. After pushing it completely out of my line of sight, the statue disappeared out of thin air under the shroud of field energy. Chen Chen couldn't help but eyebrow raised. Why does the opponent disappear into the field at the same time when the opponent is out of sight? Chen Chen not at all catches up to check, but stares at the end of the corridor, showing the color of thinking. At this time, that statue can move and kill people. This is already a certain fact. Those whose necks were broken are likely to die in its hands. In that case, why did the other party not at all come forward and attack him when he saw this statue? I can't help it, I can use the field to push it out of the corridor, and the other party does not at all resist, until it disappears from my line of sight, and then disappears in the field energy detection. At this moment, Chen Chen recalled the previous details again, and then he eyes shrank, as if thinking of something. Could it be that this is the case? As a certain thought came into his mind. Chen Chen took a deep breath, and he slowly backed away until he clung to the glass wall behind him and closed his eyes at the same time. As soon as he closed his eyes, Chen Chen opened them quickly and vigilantly, but as his gaze saw, nothing happened in the corridor in front of him. Could it be that the statue saw that it was difficult for itself, so it left? Chen Chen shook the head, he knew this was impossible. After all, memes are not life. They have no thoughts and consciousness, just like wind, thunder and rain. It's a phenomenon, just memes. That's all rarer. Since it was not the other party leaving, it can only be another reason. Thinking of this, Chen Chen looked towards behind him, but he saw the opposite side of the glass door. The old man was staring at him in amazement. Seeing Chen Chen turning his head, he knocked on the door excitedly. Seeing this, Chen Chen gave the other party a don't be impatient gesture, indicating that someone would come to rescue him later, and then walked deep into the corridor without looking back. This time, Chen Chen has left without 10 meters, and once again saw that statue at the arc end of the corridor. At this time, the statue actually changed a movement. It used to raise its hands, but now it becomes standing upright with its arms folded down while its eyes are fixed on Chen Chen. Time direction. Chen Chen sees all of this with extra light, so he can only see the opponent's general movements. However, Chen Chen found that while he could see the opponent clearly, the opponent was also affected by him at the same time. Field energy found. This is a very uncoordinated feeling. As a special induction, field energy is even much clearer than Chen Chen's vision. It can observe behind and blind spots that Chen Chen can't see. But at this time, facing this weird statue, there is a feeling of nowhere to start. Thinking of this, Chen Chen has gradually realized something. He can push the statue toward the depths of the corridor again, keeping the opponent out of his sight. Sure enough, when the statue was out of sight again, Chang Nen lost his sense of the statue at the same time. It's as if the statue disappeared out of thin air. Seeing this, 
Chen Chen took a deep breath again, his inner Peng Peng was beating wildly, and a special uneasiness came slowly, he couldn't tell what it was like, as if he was a man extreme sports hobbyists, at this time, are preparing to do a life and death challenge, the next second, Chen Chen slowly closed his eyes under the pressure, at the moment of closing his eyes, Chen Chen suddenly felt an extreme sense of crisis, although the field energy was still empty, the feeling of adrenaline soaring made Chen Chen reluctant at all, close his eyes for an extra second, almost at the same time as he closed his eyes, Chen Chen opened his eyes again, at the moment he opened his eyes, Chen Chen immediately saw that the angel statue appeared in front of him, and this time was one step closer to him, less than five meters away, not only that, the statue's look and actions at this time are also very different from before, its arms extend forward like a ghost, and at the same time there is a hideous look on its face, and the whole body is leaning forward, it seems that the next second will be in front of Chen Chen, Super USB Chapter 474, Super USB Chapter 474, to you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter, looking at the statue that was already close at hand from the corner of his eye, Chen Chen's pupils shrank slightly, but he couldn't help not backing back, but showed a sudden expression, so that's how it is, this time, Chen Chen did not continue to choose to move the opponent away or back, but began to walk, at this time, he was like a visitor, and he even went around the statue leisurely, but from the beginning by the end, the statue showed no signs of movement, Chen Chen's strength control of the body has reached the extreme, after feeling a bitter sensation in his eyes, he stood back to the previous position, and then used the field energy to continue to push the statue out of his sight, crunch, there was a harsh rubbing sound on the ground, until the statue once again disappeared from the field energy, Chen Chen blinked again, sure enough, when he blinked again, the statue once again appeared in front of him about 5 meters, is this how the statue moves, Chen Chen showed a clear look, and quickly sorted out everything in his mind, obviously, when I first encountered the statue, I was in a state with my back facing the statue, when I turned around, I saw a statue suddenly appeared behind me, but Chang Nen didn't notice it, but everyone understands a truth, that is that the statue impossible moves by itself, can bypass the field energy, and appears behind him, the natural impossible is a real statue, but something else, however, following my observation, the statue did not at all continue to move, but was nailed to the spot like a real statue, not only that, even if the field can be used to observe, the statue does not have a weak spot, or it can be said that at certain moments, the statue can only exist in the form of a statue, however, when I used the field energy to push the statue out of my sight for insurance, the statue disappeared from the field energy out of thin air, although this is strange, it confirms the fact that when you look at it when the statue is not there, the field energy cannot observe the statue, of course, this is just a guess, in order to verify this guess, Chen Chen took the initiative to get out of the sight of the old man and walk two dozen meters deep into the corridor, so that it would not interfere with the subsequent verification, dot, then, the next experiment really confirmed my thoughts, when I closed my eyes and opened them again, the statue really approached me again, and the moment I open my eyes, the other party freezes again, the only change is that the opponent's actions have changed, at this point, Chen Chen has figured out a vital element of this statue, that is the line of sight, obviously, this statue is not a real statue, but a special meme, it's just different from ordinary memes, it has its own independent structure, which is what Chen Chen currently sees, however, unlike ordinary statues, this statue will become a motionless statue when it is observed by a human, but once a human blinks, turns his head, etc., this statue becomes will move, and when the statue is moving, even the field energy cannot be observed, this is not the first time Chen Chen has discovered this situation, when he was entangled by the sound meme on the plane of Slaughter City, he also had contact with the white silhouette, which is like this, 
although it can be seen, observed, but if the user can detect it, he will find that there is nothing in front of you. This shows that the essence of memes is actually a concept, and the concept is intangible. In this way, everything Chen Chen faced just now can be explained. As for what happens when the statue rushes over, Chen Chen looked at a corpse with a twisted neck in the corner and immediately understood. But Chen Chen can also confirm that the statue is not actively turned into a statue. This state is more like a passive state. Only human eyes or human attention can make it change into a statue, just like the famous double slit interference experiment. Because of the observer's observation, the electron will change its behavior. At the same time, when the witness is not observing, there are countless possibilities for the result and when the witness turns his head, the result is certain. At this time, the statue in front of Chen Chen seems to be in such a similar state. When humans observe it, it is a statue, but when humans look away, it becomes a human head. Death God twisted down, and it seems to have the ability to interfere with electricity, because at this time the light bulb above Chen Chen's head is still flickering, just because the number of light bulbs is not small and the light bulbs are not uniformly flickering, so there is no reaching out the situation is missing. However, Chen Chen can also guess that once the entire corridor is completely plunged into darkness, then the statue will no longer be restrained. All these thoughts flashed through Chen Chen's mind. After understanding all this, Chen Chen narrowed his eyes again and pushed the statue out in front of him, but this time Chen Chen not at all pushed him out the sight range, but when it was pushed to the corner of the corridor, it suddenly exerted force, so that the field could turn into a giant hammer, fiercely moved towards the statue smashed down. Now that you have mastered part of the nature of the statue, the next step is naturally to try to destroy the other party. After Chen Chen completes all the super crystals, both the field energy increase potential and the increase speed are comparable to Andrews. At this time, Chen Chen is not enough to throw dozens of cars like Andrew at the end. The strength of the police car, but it is still very simple to destroy a few statues. Not to mention destroying a statue. Even if the statue is made of steel, Chen Chen can crush it. At this time, the invisible sledgehammer that could be transformed into fell, and the statue was directly transformed into countless small pieces and flew away after hearing a bang. Not only that, but the metal bottom plate at the foot of the statue collapsed in this brief moment, and the whole ground made a wailing of metal distortion, sinking into a shallow pit one meter in diameter. Seeing the statue that was instantly shattered into powder, Chen Chen couldn't help but was stunned. He had planned to fail, but he didn't expect that the opponent was actually smashed to pieces like an ordinary statue. Impossible. Chen Chen couldn't help being frowned. The more relaxed he was the less he could believe it. At this time, he thought for a while and he simply closed his eyes again and opened it quickly. While opening, Chen Chen couldn't help but eyes shrank. Because it was only the moment I closed my eyes and opened my eyes, the statue that had been shattered into powder was restored to its original state again and appeared in front of Chen Chen intact. Is it indestructible? Seeing this, Chen Chen completely extinguished the mind of destroying the other party. While staring at the statue, he stepped past the statue, and then walked backwards out of the quantum laboratory. Chen Chen ran for thousands of miles. The purpose of coming here was to prevent the spread of the memes. However, since the laboratory staff were running dead at this time, Chen Chen naturally did not have to stay on. When Chen Chen retreated and left the laboratory, he even actively closed the door of the laboratory before turning around. However, the scene outside the laboratory scared Chen Chen, because he unexpectedly saw that, at some point in the forest outside the laboratory, there were piles of statues standing in the forest. These statues were covering their eyes, standing brightly or darkly at a certain place outside the laboratory place. In this scene, Chen Chen's forehead oozes cold sweat instantly. How come there are so many? Chen Chen looked at the ground from the corner of his light, but saw the corpses still staying on the ground, which means that these statues were not transformed from corpses, 
but were born in some other way. Is that the video? Chen Chen knows vaguely that perhaps the video generated by Adam is the real source. Thinking of this, Chen Chen opened the door of the laboratory behind him again, not even think, and then dashed in at a very fast speed. At the same time, he closed the door and turned back quickly. Shua. As soon as Chen turned his head, a pair of tenacious sharp claws appeared in front of him. The statue in the laboratory had already come behind Chen Chen. If it weren't for Chen Chen's turning around very fast, I'm afraid it's already his neck was broken. This time Chen Chen didn't stop at all. He walked directly beside the statue, turning around as he walked, so that he was always facing the statue, and when he was about to walk deep into the corridor, he could use the field to control the door of the laboratory opened again, and then quickly moved towards the depths of the corridor and retreated. A few minutes later, Chen Chen retreated to the end of the corridor again, where the quantum computer was located in the magnetic levitation elevator. At this time, the old man hiding in the quantum computer core room was still standing there and saw Chen Chen coming, shouted something immediately, it's just that the glass in front of me and the vacuum partition between the two laboratories cut off all sounds. Chen Chen just glanced at him and ignored the other person. The reason why he came back here was to help him stare at the corridor with the help of the other's eyes. After all, the eyes of the two are better than one. It seems that because the eyes of the two were locked in this time, no statues were seen from the beginning to the end in the hallway. In this case, Chen Chen waited for ten minutes before heading forward again. Go. After turning a corner, Chen Chen really saw the statues chasing him, and this time it was no longer one, but there were twenty-three in total. Each of these statues covered their eyes and was densely packed. Living in the corridor, it seems that Chen Chen is going to be trapped here. However, this also happened to fit Chen Chen's mind. He hardly had any hesitation, and the field in his mind could explode again. This time, all the statues seemed to be struck by bombs in an instant, and burst into explosions almost within a second, turning them into dust on the ground. At the moment when all the statues collapsed, Chen Chen stepped over all the statues at the same time. Then he repeated his tricks and walked out of the laboratory while retreating until he walked out of the laboratory. He closed the door of the laboratory tightly and locked the group of statues inside. After doing all of this, Chen Chen looked back at the forest again vigilantly, and he was relieved when he saw that there were no silhouettes of other statues in the forest. Fly high again. After leaving the quantum lab for a certain distance, the communicator resumed its signal. He only heard Xiao X suddenly say, My godfather, what's the situation on your side? North America is sending the nearest military base soldiers rushed to the laboratory for rescue. Tell them that it's okay to go to search and rescue. Maybe many people ran into the deep forest, but after meeting that group, remember to isolate them. Chen Chen moved towards I looked under my feet and I saw two or three people in the forest running away in the forest. I don't know if these people have been infected with the statue meme. Isolated? I have notified them and told them about the dangers of memes. Little X replied. You tell them again, there are twenty-three murder statues in the laboratory. Chen Chen continued to add, these statues have extremely strange properties. When they are looked at, they can only exist in the form of statues, but once you turn your head or look away, the other party will quietly but very quickly came behind you and broke your neck. When he said this, Chen Chen suddenly said something, because he was keenly aware of a detail, that is, these statues were in a posture of covering their eyes when he found them, whether it was a statue in a laboratory or a forest. The statues outside are so. However, after the first statue found itself, it put down its hands covering its eyes, and has not resumed the action of covering its eyes until the other statues followed into the laboratory and onto the corridor. Next, when Chen Chen saw the group of statues again, he said that they also kept covering their eyes, and even the statue that had been in the laboratory before had resumed the action of covering their eyes. Then the question is, why would a statue not do this? but do it when multiple statues are gathered together, unless, Chen Chen thought for a while, not at all, said his guess, but continued, 
it's better for these soldiers to look at a target at the same time as a group of three, blink each other in turn, and then install these statues in some sturdy containers, it's just that we don't know how sturdy the container is to trap them. At the same time, tell them not to watch the video predicted by the quantum computer Adam. That video is the source of the memetic infection. Super USB Chapter 475 Super USB Chapter 475 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Remember, don't blink. It's dead in the blink of an eye. Don't look away. Watch it. Don't divert your attention. Don't blink. Don't blink. Good luck everyone. Dot. In the office of the mayor of the city hall, Parsons read the responding guide sent by the hacker. This video has been sent to many confidential departments in North America. The video includes the image and nature of the statue, and the law of killing are all clear. Statues that will twist people's necks. There are really strange things these days. Parsons turned off the video casually, a little disapproving, he looked towards the staff on the side and asked, has the police blocked the warehouse area of Hank? It has been blocked. The side staff immediately replied, Mr. Mayor, our people have already entered the warehouse area and strictly follow the rules in this video to find the potential murder statues, but according to the speculation of the black light technology, there may be a total of four statues in the Herank area. It's ridiculous. Parrotson speechless shook the head. If it weren't for the White House's overnight order to let himself follow the content of this guide, he would not follow the hacker's advice. When did the great North American regional government listen to the words of those Midlanders? But just when Parsons was dismissive, the door of his office suddenly rang, coming. Parsons turned his head and looked towards the door, but saw a person quickly pushing in with a hard drive. Mr. Mayor. According to your instructions, we have ordered someone to check the warehouse in the Highland monitored and successfully found the kind of statue you described, which is currently in the hard drive. Why is it so slow? When he heard the news of the statue, Parsons became frowned and became a little dissatisfied. Sorry, Mr. Mayor, the surveillance in the Heronka warehouse area is not at all connected to the network, so we must first go to the Heronka warehouse area to retrieve all the surveillance systems before we can see the murderer, but the murderer has not been found, but again received your order to find the statue. The man helplessly said, okay, but move faster next time. Parsons just sat up, took the hard drive with interest, and plugged it into his computer. But before opening the video, Parsons seemed to think of something. He lifts the head look towards his side staff again, you go out first and help me close the door. Yes. The staff, nodded, walked out of the office with the middle-aged man from the technical department. It wasn't until the backhand came up to the office door that the staff exchanged greetings with the man in front of him. Robin, is your technical department busy lately? It's okay, it's better than before. The man replied somewhat helplessly, but it seems to be busy tonight. Ha ha ha, this is no way, just treat it as bad luck. The staff member patted the shoulder of the man, and suddenly became a little curious. By the way, Robin, where did you buy this cosmetic contact lens? Same contacts. I didn't wear them. The middle-aged man was a little stunned. He rubbed his eyes and then said, it's just that I've been checking the monitor before and my eyes are a bit dry, so it looks a little red blood. The staff heard this shrugged, casually comforting, and then the two completely separated when they turned. At this time, in the mayor's office, Parsons moved the mouse to the computer screen after letting his staff leave. But when he wanted to click on the video, he suddenly thought of the hacker who came and go without a shadow or trace before, and suddenly felt nervous. Thinking about it, he simply unplugged the network cable and left his computer offline. In this way, you won't be afraid of hackers stealing your videos. Even if the farce ends, you can only do it yourself. The Lank warehouse area is very old, most areas are not monitored, including inside and outside various warehouses. On the road in the warehouse area, there are some monitoring devices that were installed more than 10 years ago, but after years of wind and rain, 
These monitoring devices have long been broken, malfunctioning and malfunctioning. Few of them can still operate, fortunately. Although most of the monitors have been damaged, under the investigation of the technical department, a few were found in good condition, which can be said to be a blessing in misfortune. Thinking of this, Parsons double-clicked on the video in the hard drive. This video is obviously a picture taken by a surveillance camera located under a street lamp. It seems to be due to the dark night and the street lamp has already failed. So the whole video shows black and white pictures instead of color, and the two sides of the monitor are black hole warehouses, the scene is very monotonous. However, it is obvious that this video has been intercepted by the technical department. Parsons looked at the progress bar. The video display time was only one minute. The original surveillance screen may be very lengthy but now it is only reduced to 50 with a length of 9 seconds. Obviously this Sona Minute video is the only clue to the murder case in the Haranko warehouse area. Thinking of this, Parsons settled down and kept watching. 1 second, 2 seconds, 3 seconds. Time passed by second by second? But when 30 seconds passed, the video was still empty. This scene suddenly made Parsons frown and he subconsciously wanted to flip the progress bar and directly pull it back. However, after thinking about it, there was only half a minute left, so he was patient and kept watching. Until the 31st second, finally, the screen under surveillance changed. On the computer screen, a panicked middle-aged man ran past the top left of the camera, moved towards the bottom right he ran and looked behind him as he ran, but because of the insufficient monitoring angle, he couldn't see what was behind the man. Although the monitoring pixels were extremely poor, and it was more blurred at night, Parsons still recognized that this middle-aged man was one of the eight dead who died the second time. At this time, this video finally aroused Parsons' interest. He couldn't help but put his head together, waiting for the thing chasing the middle-aged man to appear. The silhouette of the middle-aged man only appeared in the video for three seconds and then ran out of the surveillance range but the chaser behind him did not have a silhouette for a while. Parsons looked at the time impatiently again, but by this time the progress bar has reached the 50th 5 seconds. Just when Parsons thought it was possible that the technical department intercepted the video by mistake, suddenly, the video picture suddenly distorted, as if it was interfered by some kind of signal. The whole picture became blurred, but the progress bar but it was still moving forward until a second later the picture suddenly cleared again, and a statue did not know when it had appeared on the monitor. It's out. Seeing this statue, Parison was refreshed, but before he could take a closer look at the details of the statue, the picture suddenly distorted again. After a second, the statue regained clarity, but once again disappeared. Immediately, the progress bar passed the last second and ended completely. Looking at the end of the video, Parsons still didn't come back to his senses. He was frowned, showing a thoughtful expression. This statue is what hackers said before that it can kill people. As long as you stare at the opponent, it will turn into stone. If you don't stare, the opponent will move. Parsons murmured. But why can't even the surveillance record its activity? Thinking of this, Parsons dragged the progress bar again to the 50th 5 seconds of the video and watched the last four seconds of the screen several times. It's just that no matter how you look at it, this statue always disappears before he takes a closer look. After all, from the 50th 6 seconds, the picture begins to be distorted, the 17th second the statue appears, and the 50th 8 seconds the picture is distorted again. The statue in the video only exists for one second. If you follow the instructions sent by the hacker, that is to say, the middle-aged man who flees in this second glanced back, just in time for the surveillance to record the picture of the statue being frozen, and then one second later the middle-aged man turned his head again, the statue disappeared again. After analyzing all of this briefly, Parsons simply found the right time for the fifth viewing and quickly pressed the pause button when the progress bar reached 57 seconds. This time, 
Parsons finally got his wish and saw the statue under surveillance clearly. Although the statue in the video is a bit blurry due to equipment problems, he still sees that there is a pair of half-spread wings behind the statue in the video, which is not at all different from the angel statues in the church. At this time, the front of the statue faces the lower right side of the video, which is the direction where the middle-aged man left. Seeing this, Parsons is still a little reluctant, but he gradually believes this statement. What the hacker said may be true, not a conspiracy against North America. Thinking of this, Parson couldn't help feeling a little irritable. He took out a cigarette and at the same time took the lighter on the table and lowered his head to light it. After lighting, Parsons took a deep breath and inhaled all the smoke into his lungs before lifting the head looked towards the video again. But when he looked towards the video again, he was taken aback. I don't know if it is an illusion. On the freeze frame video screen at this time, the angle of the statue seems to be slightly different from the previous angle. Illusion? Parsons raised his eyebrows and looked at it intently, only to see that the statue in the picture seemed to have turned his head, and his entire face looked over here. For a while, Parsons was a little puzzled. He wasn't sure if this angle had existed before, was there a deviation in his memory, or was this a second stage video? Thinking of this, Parsons lowered his head again and looked towards the progress bar, but saw that the video was indeed 15 in seconds, and there was no second stage video on the hard drive from beginning to end. Then, I probably remembered my memory wrong. Parsons hesitated to lift the head again. But at this moment, he suddenly eyes shrank, because he discovered again that the statue in the video has turned its entire body around, and those hollow eyes are fixed in front of the screen, as if the statue is looking through the screen, looking at Parison himself. Parsons stared at the screen. At this moment, his heart jumped violently, the cold sweat on his forehead rustled, and an inexplicable chill slowly gushed out. At this time, he was already sure of all this it is not that there is a problem with my memory, but that the statue under surveillance is really moving. But, how is this possible? Parsons murmured in a low voice. At this moment, all the warnings flashed in his mind. Among the warnings sent by the hacker, he must stare at the other party, because once he looked away, the statue would rushed forward and broke the target's neck. However, he originally thought that this rule only applies to statues. Didn't he expect that even the surveillance images are no exception? Damn. The warning from black light technology doesn't say that images can trigger this kind of ghost. Parsons complained, but after all, he was the mayor of a city. When he felt something was wrong, he responded quickly. He directly moved the mouse to the upper right corner of the video and quickly clicked the cross. Suddenly, the video window on the computer flashed, and the option of whether to close it appeared. I saw that Parsons quickly clicked the yes button, and then the video window closed, directly, revealing the Windows desktop pattern behind the window. Ha! Huh. Is it over? Seeing that the statue disappeared, Parson was about to breathe a sigh of relief but the desktop suddenly flashed again. The video that was just closed turned on automatically, and was reframed at the moment the angel appeared. Seeing this scene, Parsons only felt soul flew beyond the heaven. He pressed the button to close the video again, but this time the surveillance video was not even turned off, but the screen flickered after pressing the close button after the flash, it was frozen on the spot. Seeing that there was no response after more than a dozen consecutive presses, Parsons simply bent down and pressed the power switch, but no matter how he pressed it, the computer screen still flickered. Only then did he realize that at some point, the computer had completely crashed, and even the shutdown button had failed. Not only that, as he bowed his head and then raised his head again, the statue under surveillance was still approaching. At this time, the statue's entire face was already in front of the computer screen, and it seemed that he would be able to leave the screen in the next second, come to the real world within the realm. At the critical moment, Parsons seemed to have finally thought of something. He bent down again and unplugged the main unit at the fastest speed in his life. Pa, as the computer issued a light sound, 
The computer finally stopped running. Parsons lifts the head in horror, he was completely sighed in relief when he saw that the computer screen went dark. He stood tremblingly, showing a look of rejoicing that avoided a catastrophe. Almost died, damn ghost. Chirst in a low voice, Parsons wiped the cold sweat from his forehead, just about to call the staff outside the door, but suddenly felt that his eyes seemed a little strange. Rubbed his eyes. Parsons touched a small hard object. He lowered his head and looked at it, but found that the hard object in his hand was a white sand grain smaller than sesame seeds. It disappeared after a breath, but at this time, Parsons had no thoughts and associations. After the weird thing just now, how dare he stay in the office? I saw him yelling the name of his staff and running away leaving the office. Super USB Chapter 476 Super USB Chapter 476 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Herlang warehouse area, in a warehouse. Found it. A fully armed SWAT with tactical goggles suddenly raised his right hand and made a stop gesture while staring at the corner full of debris in front of him. The other two special police officers were hearing this, and they aimed their guns at the front left according to the gaze of the leading special police officer. Then they saw that there was a slightly old statue in the corner quietly placed there. Dot. The sculpture is extremely finely carved and lifelike, but it exudes a simple atmosphere, as if this statue has been placed in an old warehouse for a long time so long that it will even be forgotten by time. However, these people have been prompted by their superiors, so they understand that this kind of simplicity and obsolescence is a protective color, allowing them to integrate into the environment more easily. Boss, are you sure this is it? One of the special police officers was a little confused. After all, no matter how you look at it, this is just a statue. This is the order from above. We just need to follow it. The head of the special police team leader said in a cold tone, Now according to the instructions given above, none of the three of us should look away. We must stare at it. If anyone wants to blink, we must report. Do you understand? Yes. Both of them were nodded, and stared at the statue in front of them unblinkingly. The special police team leader took out the war key and began to report to his superiors, Call the headquarters. This is the number 23 Hound Squad. We found the target in the 6th area. We are currently under observation to lock it, please the headquarters dispatched a containment team to compulsorily contain the target. It's over. As he finished the report, an order from the superior immediately came from the war Kayatoki. Call the number 23 Hound Squad. Your request has been received by the headquarters. Please confirm that there are several statues on your side. Only one has been found so far. Understand, the containment team is rushing to your location. Over. Facing the end of the call, the three of them not at all felt that something was wrong. They just followed the orders given by their superiors and waited for the arrival of the containment team. And while waiting, the three of them were still chatting casually, and they seemed very relaxed about this task. Boss. Do you think this thing can really twist people's necks? Suddenly, a team member asked curiously, if we say that as long as we look away, they will come up and break our necks, then as long as we change our eyes, can we keep it still? What? I don't know either. The SWAT team leader shrugged. Well, I will blink in two seconds, and you two will watch it. Speaking, he lowered his head and rubbed his eyes, and then looked towards the statue again. But I don't recommend you to do this, although I know that many team members don't believe that the statue can move, but what if it is real? Imagine that the neck was twisted into twists like in the photos of the corpse that I showed us before. Just as the three were chatting, suddenly, behind them, there was a sound of ding ding dong dong at the same time. The sound came from the door of the warehouse, as if something had knocked over. The furnishings of the warehouse came in from outside. Is it the containment team? We are the hound team. We have one of the targets in front of us. Please contain it now. The special police team leader said immediately, but he didn't wait for the expected answer. But when he waited, there was a clear cackling sound, as if something was broken. 
The moment he heard this voice, the special police captain eyes shrank, but before turning around, he heard another companion's exclamation, Charles, Charles is dead. What happened? The special police team leader wanted to turn around and look at the situation behind him, but when he thought of the superior's order, he actually held back his instincts for a long time, and asked loudly. It's another statue. The voice has changed from disdain to crying, it broke Charles's neck before I came back to his senses. Hearing the other parties wailing, the SWAT team leader suddenly felt cold, wait, you mean, are you looking at another statue now? Yes, I am watching the statue that killed Charles. It still keeps the posture of reaching out, boss. I don't want to die. Hey, you will be fine, but only if you don't blink, you understand? Hearing this bad news in vain, the SWAT team leader almost wanted to soul flew beyond the heaven, and even he heard a low ho ho sound. This sound was that after Charles was screwed off his neck, his lungs could not store air, a little fading sound. But even so, he still didn't dare to turn around and even continued to comfort his companions behind him. For a while, the cold sweat on his forehead fell off, but the boss, I can't hold on anymore. Shut up, you must hold on, the containment team is coming soon, you must hold on. I heard the desperate voice of teammates behind him, and the team leader of the special police was extremely nervous, but before he could finish speaking, the familiar cock boom sound came again. Could it be? The special police team leader finally couldn't bear it anymore. He drew a gun and shot at the statue in front of him. But while shooting a few holes in the statue in front of him, he was just about to turn around and shoot another one, but the next second he suddenly I felt numb all over, and then a third cock sound came from my ear. Only this time, the voice came from his own neck. Puff dong. The body of the SWAT team leader fell heavily to the ground. He twitched all over. In his increasingly blurred vision, he could only see two angels standing in front of him. They extended the hand, as if thinking to redeem my soul. Ho dot ho. The special police team leader's lips squirmed slightly, but the God bless was never heard. After a few seconds, he lost consciousness forever. A few minutes later, a large pickup truck drove along the road. The windows of this pickup truck were reinforced with a lot of steel, and in the compartment behind the front of the car there was a steel cast, one meter wide and two meters long, of large iron cabinets. There are a lot of welding marks and thick iron bolts on the iron cabinet. Obviously, it hasn't been polished carefully but it was moved over as soon as it was built. In the car, there are four also fully armed special police officers. This is the temporary containment team formed by the Los Angeles police. Their task is to imprison the statue in the iron cabinet for effective containment. It's just that when they arrived at the scene with the iron coffin, all they saw were the corpses of the three of the hounds team getting cold. The two statues have disappeared without a trace. Dot. When the first morning light appeared in the sky, a black shadow fell rapidly from in the sky, and finally landed on a high-rise rooftop not far from the Highland warehouse area. The camera pulled in, and it was Chen Chen returning from the Rocky Mountain range that landed. However, Chen Chen's face was not good looking at this time, and he couldn't help looking tired and complexion pale. And when he landed, he gasped for breath, obviously for him. It is still a bit reluctant to fly at supersonic speeds continuously across thousands of kilometers. It has been a long time since there has been such a high intensity application field. Chen Chen took a deep breath, looking anxiously at the warehouses that stretched into the sky. X, what's the current situation in the warehouse area of Hylank? The casualties were heavy. Little X's voice came different from the containment results of the quantum lab. Although there are more angel statues in the quantum lab, the containment is extremely smooth because they are all locked in by you. P. However, because of the large area of the Herank warehouse area, it is difficult to search, so more than 20 special police officers have been lost at this time, and only two statues have been housed. At least two have not been found. This is something that can't be helped. Chen Chen waved his hand, but sighed in relief, as long as the two statues did not run out. 
it will be fine if they run into Los Angeles, then the consequences would be unimaginable. My godfather, I have one more thing to report. Speaking, Xiao X said again, at present, four black riders are chasing down the man named Kate, but the situation is a bit bad. What's wrong? Chen Chen raised his eyebrows. As an intelligent being, I know that I shouldn't use the metaphysical unit of luck to judge something, but the fact is that the human named Kate does have indescribable luck. P. Xiao X's voice was a little aggrieved, in order to improve the efficiency of the pursuit, I divided the four black riders into two groups. One group was chased behind the target, and the other group lay in front of the target, but no matter how the black rider took action, even using firearms, did not chase the opponent. Not only that, during the pursuit, two black riders were seriously injured. One black rider was crushed by a truck behind him by half of his body after being thrown from the car by the target. Quit the hunt. Apart from this, another black rider was chasing the target into an alley, and was shot in the back of the neck by the opponent, detonating the god chip on the spot, and the remaining black rider had to stop. Hunt down first deal with the dead black rider body. Little X's voice was eloquent, and the target almost never stopped when fleeing. He was always able to meet other people's help on the way. Even black rider had caught the target once, but he hadn't before he could crush the target's neck. He was hit by the chandelier destroyed during the previous fight. In short, our black rider is like a curse, and the opponent is a lucky child. No matter how desperate he is, he can turn peril into safety and keep on marching. I am afraid that the target can reach Los Angeles by tonight. Hearing Xiao X's complaint, Chen Chen did not show a strange expression at all. Because of these scenes in Xiao X's mouth, he even saw it in the Life and Death project as early as three years ago. Over with Chen Chen's memory ability, as long as Xiao X said it, he can find the corresponding scenes in the movie because these are all plots that have appeared in the movie, and the episode that crushes the lower body of Black Rider is in the middle the scene of the road chase scene during the scene. Not only that, Chen Chen originally planned to send ten Black Riders to chase Kate together, but who expected Los Angeles to have an out of control memetic effect, so Chen Chen finally sent only four Black Riders to go there. So it seems that even the number of villains in the movie is right. It's a pity that I'm stuck and can't get out of my body, otherwise I'll go see it myself. Chen Chen was a little helpless, but then the topic changed. Isn't the time to consider these, X? Have you found the reason for these angels? Do you mean? Xiao X hesitated. Why are there more than 20 angel statues in the quantum laboratory? Chen Chen asked immediately, are those statues formed by humans after watching the video calculated by Adam? This guess can basically be confirmed. Xiao X immediately replied, the representative of each continent in the quantum lab, that is, the number of shield bearers totals 23, which corresponds to the number of statues you found and the number of shield bearers they are the most powerful people in quantum lab. Every time Adam calculates something, they are also the first people to get the answer, so it is certain that they have all watched that video. So that's how it is, after watching that video, will you be infected with angel memes and become a new angel statue? Suddenly, Chen Chen asked again, then looking at the angel statue, Will there be a memetic pattern? Currently not found. Xiao X continued to answer, neither the Quantum Lab or the Highland Warehouse District, all the police and army responsible for containment, did not appear to be infected with the meme because of contact with or staring at the angel statue. Signs. Very good. Chen Chen nodded, he thought that since the video predicted by Adam had a memetic infection, there was a high probability that the statue itself had this infection ability so he didn't even dare to look at each other with his straight eyes. But now it seems that the statue is not at all so lethal. However, since this is the case, then the next situation is easy to handle. Although the Los Angeles police suffered heavy losses, under the high pressure, they are still searching for the remaining two hidden in the Highland Warehouse area. Statue. As long as you find the remaining two Offenham statues and successfully contain them, then this memetic event can draw a perfect end. Then, 
it is to get the protagonist Kate and show down to the whole world. However, just when Chen Chen thought everything was about to settle, Xiao X's voice suddenly became anxious. She hurriedly said, My godfather, just received the news that there was a special situation in Los Angeles City Hall. Situation. Chen Chen hearing this couldn't help raising his eyebrows. He lifts the head and looked in the direction of downtown Los Angeles. He worriedly said, don't tell me that the city hall has a memetic effect. Unfortunately, yes. Little X immediately replied, I intercepted it from the city hall's network. Suddenly there was an angel statue inside the city hall without warning and there was more than one. Super USB Chapter 477 Super USB Chapter 477 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Hearing this news, Chen Chen felt cold at first, and then became angry. Why is there an angel statue over there? Could it be that the quantum lab prophecy leaked? It shouldn't be. Little X's voice was a little hesitant. After you left the post-quantum laboratory, I closely monitored the dialogue between the rescue army and the superior. What is certain is that the White House is indeed doing what we ordered, although I dare not I promise that they will not open that video in the future but at least they have no plans to open it now. After hearing Xiao X's explanation, Chen Chen was nodded. Indeed, if the video was leaked, the angel statue should have appeared first at the White House instead of the Los Angeles City Hall. It's a pity that I went in a hurry before and didn't destroy the video that Adam predicted, but then I thought about it. At that time, there was a murder statue in Quantum Lab. If it was half-hearted, I am afraid that the statue would have its neck broken before deleting the video. Thinking of this, Chen Chen had to sigh helplessly, and his expression became more solemn, since it is not the meme that leaked the video. Why is there an angel statue in the city hall half an urban area from Herank district? Thinking about it and couldn't find the answer, Chen Chen simply opened the brass ring in his hand, took out a crystal pill from it and quickly put it in his mouth. With the strengthening of the T-virus and the changes in the unnoticeable influence of medicine efficacy on the brain during the previous medication, Chen Chen's brain computing power is also rapidly improving, which is no longer what he used to be. But because of this, the effect of this medicine on him is getting smaller and smaller. But at this time things are urgent, and eating an NZT-48 is better than not eating it. As medicine entered within the body, Chen Chen's thoughts cleared again within 30 seconds, and his thinking ability slightly improved. But this little improvement made Chen Chen's short-handed clue completely connected. So that's how it is. Chen Chen exhaled, and his frowning brows were completely stretched out. He asked Xiao X. Have you not checked the surveillance of the Herang warehouse area before? Yes. Xiao X immediately replied, because the equipment in the Heilang warehouse is at the level of more than 10 or 20 years ago because the equipment is old, their monitoring is not at all connected to the internet. I originally planned to use Black Rider to manually adjust to take surveillance, but the Los Angeles police have already blocked it so in the end not at all get effective surveillance information. If that's the case, it makes sense. Chen Chen nodded, X, in fact, we all fell into a misunderstanding before, that is the video predicted by the quantum computer Adam. We always thought that the video predicted by Adam was a meme modeled after reality, in order to remind us of the nature of the meme, but now am I want to come, but it is not like this. Xiao X suddenly became a little puzzled. But he did generate a video with mimetic effects, and he killed the people in Quantum Lab. What you said is true, but it is not entirely correct. Chen Chen asked back, if I say, that video is okay, but, little X is a little dazed. Have you ever thought that there is no problem with that video? The real problem is not the video, but the angel statue in the video? Chen Chen continued, that is to say. The angel statue will not cause memetic infection when people look directly at it in reality, but when the angel statue is shot in the video or picture, it has the ability to infect humans. Ability. Ah. Xiao X suddenly exclaimed, will it be like this? Holmes has a saying, after abandoning all impossible, no matter how absurd the remaining answer is, 
It will be the final fact. Chen Chen nodded, resolute and decisive said, only in this way can we explain why the angel statue will not be infected when looking directly at the angel statue, but a new angel statue appeared in the city hall. That is because someone at the city hall saw the monitor the video of the angel statue recorded, and this video, like the video predicted by Adam, has the ability to assimilate human beings into angel statues. After saying all this, Chen Chen didn't stay there anymore. He activated the field energy in his mind again and flew directly into the sky. Seeing Chen Chen moving again, Xiao X quickly asked, Your Excellency, are you going to the city hall? Yes, I must prevent more people from being infected by memes. Chen Chen replied while flying, X, your task is also very important, that is, before the statue incident spreads, cut off all the surveillance and people shooting of angel statues on the internet, videos, destroy these videos completely, understood, little x just agreed, and then disappeared, the reason Chen Chen is so close to an enemy is that only he understands how serious this matter is, if, as he guessed, Anyone who saw the video and pictures of the angel statue would be assimilated into a new angel statue by the meme, then I am afraid that mankind will face a life and death crisis. After all, now is the 21st century, with the rapid development of human civilization, and the standard of living advanced by leaps and bounds. In this era, surveillance cameras are everywhere and who doesn't have a mobile phone that can take pictures. It can be said that angel statues are completely tank human beings. As long as a photo circulates and 10 people from the world see it on the internet, then these 10 people will become new statues, and then they will begin to kill and be more people take pictures and spread out. It's like a single spark. Within a few days, humans will face a huge calamity tribulation, especially in large cities, where the environment is extremely complex and they want to find a come and go without a shadow or trace, for the statue, the manpower and material resources required are an astronomical figure. At the later stage, even if humans find a way to deal with it and eliminate all pictures and videos, there are probably hundreds of thousands and even several millions statues in the whole world at that time. These statues will still kill people continuously. It can be said to be it will cause no end of trouble. The situation is even worse, and human civilization may be shattered. This is already a battle of genocide, and it is closely related to everyone's fate. That's why Chen Chen is so nervous that he even took it personally. After all, there are no eggs under the nest, Chen Chen does not want to be like a stray dog flee to other planes with his parents. These thoughts flashed through Chen Chen's mind. At this time, he entered a supersonic state again and flew directly over the downtown area of Los Angeles. Wherever he passed, bursts of explosions came, and countless people covered it. I looked in the sky with my ears, but I couldn't see anything. Until five minutes later, when Chen Chen arrived at the Los Angeles City Hall, he was finally freed from the supersonic speed. At this time, he stood in the sky and looked down, but saw people screaming and escaping from the city. In front of the gate of the City Hall, there is actually an angel statue standing there. At the feet of the statue, there is also a corpse with a twisted neck. Seeing this scene, Chen Chen's expression suddenly became cold, he narrowed his eyes, and suddenly, an invisible force shot out from the center of his brows. It was like a bomb exploding in the air. In an instant, a shock wave spread out in a fan shape. There was no fear or explosives. Only the air waves visible to naked eye roared out, and even the air was twisted into pieces. The shape of the waves. In the next second, this shock wave slammed into the statue and the surrounding ground with an overwhelming force. Suddenly, the statue's body shattered every inch, and was directly twisted into powder by the raging shock. Hong long long long. Until this time, there were countless thunderous noises rolling in all directions, pouring down with the sky full of sand and gravel, and the few survivors left in the city hall seemed to have seen the natural disasters come, and they never dared any more. Stay, cry and escape. As countless smoke and dust fell, 
It was only then that I could see that the blow that Chen Chen launched just now directly hit the ground like a deep crater like a meteorite, and the statue is even more scattered ashes and dispersed smoke. Lost at race. Of course, Chen Chen knew that the other party was not so easy to die. He blinked slightly. Sure enough, as he blinked, the statue appeared in front of Chen Chen intact, in the deep pit! Exclamation mark. However, this is exactly what Chen Chen planned. In the next second, Chen Chen activated his field energy again, and suddenly a large amount of knocked out mud was recovered again. The mud piled up in the deep pit, directly burying the statue. Up. This time, Chen Chen was more cautious. He directly raised his figure above 100 meters, then closed his eyes slightly again, and then opened them again. But this time the statue not at all rushed out of the mud, it seems that the way of burying it really restricted the opponent. Seeing this, Chen Chen finally exhaled, and then there was a dull pain in his mind and a slight heat in his nose. Chen Chen felt his nose, and sure enough, there was a bright red in his palm. It seems that we need to speed up. Chen Chen ignored the angel statue buried in the ground. He landed again, and at the same time, he dashed into the city hall, only to see that the city hall was already in a mess, and countless materials were scattered in the hall. Several corpses fell to the ground, all in a dead state. Chen Chen looked up and looked at all around. In the next second, all the monitors in the hall crackled at the same time, and they exploded. After finishing all this, Chen Chen moved on and walked into the corridor of the city hall. As Chen Chen moved forward, the surveillance above his head also exploded. He stopped slightly when he walked to the gate marked with the mayor's office. With his hearing at this time, he can already hear a human heartbeat from inside. However, the voice jumped very hard as if the other party was already seriously ill. Chen Chen opened the door of the office casually, and a fire suddenly flashed in front of him in the next second. A bullet shot directly in front of Chen Chen's chest, but was blocked by invisible field energy. Chen Chen extended the hand, took off the warhead suspended in midair, and then looked towards the room in an expressionless look. Only a hair grey white, Middle-aged man with a frightened expression was staring at him. Mr. Mayor. Chen Chen walked directly into the office and closed the door with his backhand, while remaining calm and composed while handling pressing affairs said, Is this your way of welcoming guests? There is a monster outside the door. Outside the door. Parsons looked at Chen Chen, his trembling right hand revealed his mood at this time, and he held a smoking revolver in his hand. Who are you? come to rescue me is it? No, I'm just here to solve the trouble. Chen Chen looked at the palm of the other party's exposed clothes, suddenly stepped out, and came to Parsons in lightning speed, and at the same time pinched the opponent's right hand wrist. You! What are you doing? Parsons let out a scream, he wanted to struggle, but found that the opponent's hands were like iron tongs around him, no matter how hard he struggles, he is completely motionless. Pap. Even the only weapon fell to the ground. It wasn't until this time that Chen Chen could see that Parison's right hand seemed to be coated with a layer of paint. The hole presents a weird azure white, but this is not an acrotic color, but rather like it's like marble. Has petrification already begun? Chen Chen provoked a sneer at the corner of his mouth. He looked back at the computer on the desk in front of Parsons but saw that the network cable had been unplugged. Sure enough, seeing all this, Chen Chen immediately sorted out all the processes. He beckoned directly, and the hard disk in the mainframe of the computer flew out through the mainframe. Then Chen Chen squeezed it with one hand and the whole hard disk was broken into pieces. Countless pieces. After doing all this, Chen Chen looked towards Parsons again. At this moment, Parsons was stunned by Chen Chen's actions. He stared at the opponent in a daze, forgetting the struggle. Apart from you, who else has watched the angel statue video? Chen Chen asked, technical and technical department. Parsons stammered and replied, the technical department also watched that video. Do you mean that video made me like this? I wasn't a stupid person. When Chen Chen asked this, he immediately came back to his senses and said in horror, Help me, 
I don't want to be like that. Chen Chen frowned, I just wanted to continue to ask how many people there are in the technical department, but before I can ask, Parsons in front of him suddenly looked dazed. At the same time, in Chen Chen's eyes, Parsons skin began to spread uncontrollably, one after another white bloodshot, like countless thick white worms, squirming quickly under the surface of Parsons skin. Help, help me. Parsons wanted to open his mouth and shout, but he only felt an indescribable numbness within the body, he could only desperately extend the hand, trying to catch the mysterious man in front of him. Okay, I'll give you a ride. Seeing this scene, Chen Chen put his hands on Parison's head without the slightest hesitation, while gently twisting. Crack it. A sound similar to the fracture of a stone came out, and Parison's head was twisted off. It's just that there is no trace of blood on the fracture of his neck. Some, instead, are an irregular marble section. As his head was screwed off, Parison's body stopped moving. In the next second, his whole person turned into a marble stone sculpture completely fixing everything he had in his lifetime. Super USB Chapter 478 Super USB Chapter 478 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Chen Chen held the other person's head in his hands, and stared at the mayor of Los Angeles who turned into a statue. After waiting for a while, he did not see the other person turning into an angel statue. Is it because the meme process was interrupted and I was killed by myself in the process of transforming into the angel statue, or did my own eyes stop this transformation? Thinking of this, Chen Chen looked at the wall behind the statue, and at the same time he thought about it, just hearing a bang. The wall of the mayor's office was blasted by some force out of thin air. A lot of smoke and dust floated and more sunlight came in along the big hole, but Chen Chen just waved his hand, and the statue transformed by the mayor flew out with a swish and flew onto the lawn outside the city hall, shattering one side, cracked one side to plow the lawn into a deep hole, the statue was pressed into the deep pit to avoid the gaze of passers-by outside the city hall, and at the same time to draw a distance from the statue, then, Chen Chen tried to close his eyes, and then quickly opened it in less than a second, but the headless statue still lay there quietly, not moving at all. Seeing this scene, Chen Chen can basically be sure that before the other party transforms into a new angel statue, as long as the other party is killed first, this transformation can be prevented. After summing up this experience, Chen Chen told Xiao X about it first and then returned to the inner corridor of the city hall and continued searching along the corridor. Today, Los Angeles City Hall can be described as heavy casualties. I don't know how many statues are hidden here. Anyway, Chen Chen basically didn't see alive people along the way, only saw corpses with their necks broken all over the floor. However, it seems that a large number of police forces have been used to block the Heronka warehouse area. From the beginning of the incident to the present, no police have arrived. Instead, pedestrians passing by the street are constantly looking towards this. On the side, even some bold ones have stopped and stopped to watch. Seeing the pedestrians outside the window, Chen Chen couldn't help frowning. If the group of people accidentally shot the angel statue, then the problem would be big, but he was ready to pick up a security gun and fire a few when the gun frightened the group back, my heart suddenly moved. The gaze of this group of people may also be a good cage, which can restrict the angel statue in the city hall from leaving here and prevent larger scale spread. Thinking of this, Chen Chen directly pressed his headset and said, X, a group of people outside the city hall are taking pictures of this side with their mobile phones. You pay close attention to the internet. If I or the angel statue are posted to on the internet, must be deleted and destroyed the first time, and then write down the identity of this person. Understood. Xiao X replied. As for what to do after writing it down, X of course knows what to do, because it is this person who photographed Chen Chen or an angel statue, and Chen Chen was photographed. It's okay. At most, Dark Knight who came to the end will reward him with an amnestic, but if the angel statue is photographed, 
it will default. He himself saw the statue in the video. Although it is ruthless, if you scare away these people and cause the statue to leave the city hall and enter the city, it will be even more difficult to find it again. Immediately, Chen Chen continued to move towards the depths of the city hall. Originally, Chen Chen thought it was not difficult to find the angel statue, as long as he walked with the corpse was enough, but when he walked all over the first floor, he did not find the second statue. It seems to be a step too late. Seeing this, Chen Chen couldn't help sighing, since the Ophanum statue was located outside the city hall when it was discovered, it seems that other statues have already entered the city. Indeed, I also found relevant news from the internet. Xiao X also became a little dejected. Just half a minute ago, I monitored the police station in Los Angeles. Someone had reported that someone had a broken neck but the statue was not at all found on the spot. If the city hall didn't find them, they would have to look for them outside. Chen Chen said that he was just about to move towards the second floor of the city hall, but at this moment, a burst of sirens from far and near suddenly heard. This sirens is very noisy. Obviously, at least a dozen police cars can do this, not just police cars. Chen Chen also heard a beep from far and near. It was the sound of helicopter propellers. Chen Chen walked to the break in the wall and looked in the sky, and he saw several black spots in the distance from far to near. Those black spots were the iconic Chinook helicopters in North America. Reinforcements from nearby military bases? Chen Chen frowned. Since the reinforcements are here, he naturally does not need to continue to venture here. Besides, he just killed the mayor of Los Angeles and is in such a city hall full of corpses. Even if he wants to explain it is also unexplainable. Thinking of this, Chen Chen shook his head slightly, rushed out of the city hall from the window, and quickly moved towards the sky and flew away. Dong. There was a sound of sonic boom, and everyone watching at the city hall only saw one silhouette rushing out of the city hall. At the same time, a large cloud of mist burst out from the whole body, and the whole person rushed directly to 100 meters. The high sky, immediately disappeared. Oh my god, Superman. The crowd of onlookers exclaimed, and at the same time frantically pressed the shutter of the phone, hoping to shoot the amazing scene just now. After flying up to an altitude of 1000 meters, Xiao X's voice prompted, My godfather. The police in North America is about to arrive at the city hall, you must leave immediately. I have left. Chen Chen took a deep breath and replied with some gasping, you contact the mayor of the police station here and tell them to be careful of the deep pit buried in soil in front of the city hall with the murder statue inside tell me all the alarm addresses where angel statues are found from now on, and I will solve them. But your body, Xiao X hesitated. You have been fighting for a night. Excessive use of field energy may be at risk of brain damage. I don't care about these now. Before finishing talking, Chen Chen interrupted Xiao X's persuasion. There are a lot of monitors that are not connected to the internet. Once these monitors are seen, they will generate new angel statues, and everyone uses them. Mobile phone. If I don't do it myself, it's hard to clear all of this. If it really causes a memetic explosion, then it will cause no end of trouble. Dot understood, I will send Dark Knight to cooperate with you. Xiao X had to say, there have been only three alarm cases, located in the Broad Museum of Modern Art 0.8 kilometers west of City Hall, and the Grand Central Market 0.7 km southwest, and the entrance of the church 300 meters northeast of the city hall. When I heard these three locations, Chen Chen did not even think and moved towards the church in the northeast, but this time he simply took out a stealth device that he hadn't used for a long time to keep him from being photographed, invisible. At the same time, because he did not enter the supersonic speed, when Chen Chen quietly landed in front of the church gate, not at all anyone noticed. This is a medieval Romanesque church. At this time, a large number of people have gathered in front of the church. These people are all gathered in front of a corpse. There are even better people taking pictures of all this with their mobile phones. Looking at the crowds who are not too busy, 
Chen Chen was speechless, then he looked around and saw dozens of angel statues of various shapes on the walls and dome of the church. These statues are inlaid on the outer wall of the church, permeating a strong medieval Roman atmosphere, but at this moment, these statues seem to contain indescribable murderous intention. No one knows which one of these statues of proximity is wrong, and which one is false. Chen Chen remained invisible walked in through the church door, and suddenly saw a vast and splendid main hall with dozens of rows of seats neatly arranged in the hall, and a large number of murals surrounded all around, dazzling. It's just that because of a death incident outside, everyone left the church, and the whole church was empty. At this moment, Chen Chen suddenly saw an Ophanum statue on each side of the cross of Jesus at the top of the church hall. One of the Ophanum statues stretched out their hands, as if ready to welcome the embrace of God, while the other statue remained quietly standing, with its hands folded on its chest, as if it were doing mass. Chen Chen stood in front of the gate, watching the two statues quietly, and then blinked slightly. Suddenly, the statue with folded hands disappeared. Chen Chen eyes shrank, he hurriedly looked around, only then did he see that the statue actually appeared on his right side 340 meters, and the action also turned into spreading his hands and looking down, the posture of both hands. Seeing this, Chen Chen was just about to move, but at this moment, an indescribable feeling of heart palpitations struck, and Chen Chen had to choose to turn his head at all. The moment he turned his head, he saw the statue with the hands spread out before changed its position and appeared in the aisle of four five meters in front of him. The two statues are both real. At this moment, an indescribable sense of crisis broke out. Chen Chen not even think retreated quickly, but as he retreated, he only felt a slight pain in his neck followed by an indescribable numbness. Come, Garba. It wasn't until this time that Chen Chen heard a crisp sound. It was the sound of his neck being twisted. The field energy around him could not be resisted at all, and even the detection could not detect the presence of the opponent. Boom. Chen Chen retreated quickly under the inertia of the field energy, and at the same time bursts of water mist broke out all over his body. He almost retreated at a speed that reached supersonic acceleration in an instant, but even so it was still too late. Completely twisted by the rules, Chen Chen flew out of the church like a muddy puddle, and then rolled over on the ground, until after all the inertia was removed, it stopped like a sack. Ho dot ho. Chen Chen only felt a sharp pain in his head. He wanted to breathe but he couldn't breathe in air no matter how hard he tried, because his neck was completely broken and he couldn't control the inhalation of air in his lungs. Not only that, his perception of the body also began to disappear rapidly, leaving only the unspeakable pain in the neck and the gradually blurred consciousness. My godfather, what happened? Your godfather, Chen Chen. X's exclamation was heard in his ears, but Chen Chen couldn't respond anymore. His figure withdrew from the invisible state and appeared on the ground without reservation, plus the previous escape from supersonic speed. The movement suddenly shocked the people outside the church. Most of this group of people fled here screaming like a ghost, but there were still several people surrounded by surprise. Are you going to die? Chen Chen looked at the sky, and his eyes flashed with nostalgia for his life. At this moment, his brain was even clearer than when he used an ZT-48. Scenes of the past flashed out of Chen Chen's mind. The joy of his parents when he was born, elementary school, middle school, and then admitted to a prestigious Zongzhu school. Then, his life began to take a turn. You disc, Xiyin, experiment, suspension of school, small x. During these few seconds, Chen Chen seemed to have countless memories flickering before his eyes, but his thinking remained unusually clear. Are you going to die? No, I will not die. I have supreme rights, rich in money from an enemy country, and I can still change the world's USB flash drive. How could I die? Exclamation mark. I have to take care of my parents and let them gain eternal life. I have to take charge of the Earth Federation. I have to fly out of Earth. I have endless time to complete all this. How could I die? Exclamation mark.
I will not die, never die. The endless desire to survive came out of his heart. At this moment, the field in Chen Chen's mind surged again. In the next second, the skin of his neck was torn out of thin air, revealing the red muscle tissue at the bottom and a lot of blood. At the same time, the muscles of his neck were disconnected out of thin air, exposing deeper trachea, veins and arteries. At this time, his two blood vessels had been completely broken, and gurgling blood erupted as soon as they were exposed. But then, as if two invisible hands appeared, his blood vessels suddenly healed a little bit. No, it was not healed, but was bound together by an invisible force and held forcibly. The blood continues to circulate. This scene was seen by a few passers-by, these passers-by shouted as if they had seen a ghost and some took out their mobile phones to shoot them in surprise. At this time, Chen Chen didn't care about this. Next moment, Chen Chen's lungs expanded again and resumed work. But this recovery is still driven by field energy. Chen Chen uses field energy to force his lungs to contract and expand it. After doing all of this, Chen Chen continued to do three things at the same time and he separated out another field that could hold up his body and let himself stand up again. The devil, the devil. After seeing this scene, everyone finally realized the weirdness of the middle and are in front of them. One by one they screamed harshly and fled. Super USB Chapter 479 Super USB Chapter 479 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Outside a towering major sect hall full of Roman atmosphere, a man covered with blood and a bloody throat seemed to be a ghost like floating in midair, and passers by screamed and walked away. No matter how you look at this scene, no one will think of words such as God's vestige and God, but will think of words such as Satan, the devil, evil, etc. At this moment, far away from several dozen meters, a bearded man with a mobile phone was shaking like a chaff sieve. He watched the central continent man float from the ground and twisted strangely. His head turned back to its previous position. Seeing such a scene where he has one's hair stand on end, he wants to run away, but his whole body feels weak and weak because of shock. Even moving his fingers is a luxury. At this moment, an even more frightening scene upped while turning his head. The man in central continent froze in his direction for a second, staring at him with an extremely strange gaze. Yourself. At the same time, the mobile phone in my hand, which is still working faithfully to maintain the shooting state, just suddenly par and exploded without warning. Oh my karma. The piercing pain in the palm activated the bearded man's will to survive, and he finally woke up not even think, threw away the remains of the phone, and ran away, while running and screaming at the same time, he disappeared into the buildings across the street, Chen Chen turned away the passers-by who was still recording videos for himself, Chen Chen turned his head back, at this time, the call of Xiao X continued to be heard in the headset, he tried to speak, but found his vocal cords, it was also broken in the attack of the angel statue, so he used the field energy to temporarily engage the vocal cords again, and then made a low voice again. X, I'm still alive. Hearing Chen Chen's answer, Xiao X said in a crying voice, Your godfather, are you hurt? Black Rider is on the way to arrive, and there are 20 seconds to reach your location. Must support you. Ah, don't worry, you can't die. Chen Chen's voice was hoarse. He looked at the door of the church again but saw that at the open door of the church, the two statues had appeared again, and they were standing the motionless at this time. This time, both statues are already in Chen Chen's eyes. However, Chen Chen did not at all, his injuries did not allow him to continue fighting, so he just stared at the two statues and quietly waited for the arrival of Black Rider. Sure enough, after 20 seconds, a truck quickly arrived at the square inches front of the church with a harsh horn, and then four black riders walked down carrying the iron box like a coffin, well trained put the two statues into the iron box. Then, the iron box was quickly sealed by a huge iron bolt, and then thrown back into the truck by the black rider. Your godfather, 
your neck. Through the vision sent back by Black Rider, Xiao X finally saw Chen Chen's injury. At this time, Chen Chen's neck was completely broken. Not only was the arteries and veins directly exposed to the air, but even the cervical spine was also disconnected. For most people, this kind of injury is simply a dead end and is completely irreversible. My body has lost consciousness, but it doesn't matter. The spinal cord is not at all completely damaged. The brain can control the heartbeat, but I can't breathe. Chen Chen floated to the driver's seat of the truck like a ghost and closed the door smoothly. As long as the user can maintain the expansion of the lungs while allowing the arteries and veins to flow freely, I will not die. I will take you back to Life Science City now. Little X said quickly. Don't worry yet. Chen Chen waved his hand, with the physique brought by the T-virus, my life force is much stronger than that of humans. Now my wounds have begun to heal and it will take a few hours to recover. Don't worry. Now the most important thing is to leave here. I just don't know how many people have photographed angel statues. All these need to be dealt with. I have used Gantz to send another group of Black Rider troops. They will deal with them before they are transformed into new angel statues. Xiao X immediately replied, and if I stare on the internet, nothing will happen. Very good. Chen Chen was nodded now and then he slowly closed his eyes and began to close his eyes, soul nurturing up. Seeing this, Xiao X immediately stopped talking. She knew that Chen Chen had been fighting since last night and had not rested at all. Now both physical and field energy are on the verge of exhaustion, so she can't bear to continue to disturb Chen Chen, and it is to let Black Rider drive the car and move towards the suburbs of Los Angeles. Chen Chen kept himself in a hazy state of half dream and half awake. As the car bumped, his neck began to feel tingling, as if thousands of ants were crawling on his within the body. He knows that this damaged part of the body is beginning to be repaired. If an outsider sees it at this time, he will immediately find that Chen Chen's neck wound is constantly sticking out red muscle fibers, wriggling like thousands of small insects. He got up, almost at the speed visible to naked eye, Chen Chen's neck began to repair automatically. This is the recovery ability comparable to a tyrant after being injected with a customized version of the T-virus. As long as it is not on the spot death or brain damage, then no matter how multiple injuries it is, it can quickly recover. Half an hour later, Chen Chen returned to the headquarters of Osman Biological Company, but instead of going in at all, he rented a room in the hotel in the vicinity and then moved in. After this period of time, Chen Chen's neck has finally been repaired to a certain extent. Even if the field energy is lost, he can maintain basic physiological activities. At this time Chen Chen finally let go of the field energy and gave himself a few injections. After the nutrition injection, I fell asleep immediately. Chen Chen did not sleep well. The night of fighting made his cerebral cortex extremely active. Even in his sleep, it was a nightmare. He dreamed that the angel statue was finally not suppressed and began to spread madly throughout the world. Countless people died overnight, and the situation has reached an irretrievable level, so Chen Chen had to reluctantly abandon this place and took his parents and relatives into the USB drive channel and went to another world for refuge. It's just that, in that world, he encountered far more terrifying existence than memes. In the end, Chen Chen stood alone among the corpses of parents and close relatives, and screamed at the sky, and in front of him was a weird shadow that covered the sky! Exclamation mark. In the darkness, Chen Chen suddenly opened his eyes. He looked at all around in confusion, only to find that he was in a beautifully decorated guest room, and the window was already dark. Chen Chen sat up slowly. It was only then that he felt like fire in his stomach. The intense hunger and thirst made him very unbearable. I picked up the water bottle prepared by Xiao X next to me, poured all of the not even think into my belly and then picked up the energy bar next to it and ate it with big mouthfuls. These energy bars almost entered the stomach. After being digested by Chen Chen's powerful digestive ability, 
Chen Chen felt that his hunger was relieved a lot after eating dozens of energy bars. Throwing the finished package to the ground, Chen Chen opened the bed and got out of the bed. Only then did he realize that the entire bed was soaked, obviously because of the injury, his body was in his sleep. A round of upgrading. Seeing this, Chen Chen felt his neck. At this time, his neck has completely recovered, not only the muscles and skin, but even the broken spine has healed. Just like during the day, the injury was just an illusion. It's just that the field energy in my mind is not at all recovered, and it is still in a state of exhaustion. It seems that I heard the sound, and Xiao X's voice came directly from the computer speakers in the room. My godfather, how do you feel when you wake up? Fortunately, I am almost restored. Chen Chen twisted his neck and made a click, confirming that his neck was back to normal before he asked again. How is Los Angeles now? We have contained four statues in this day, and roughly three statues are still being searched and pursued. At the same time, we also destroyed all North American citizens who might be infected by memes, a total of 134 people. However, North American officials reacted. They also sent troops to conduct a secret search operation, and even had a conflict with our Black Rider but not at all caught evidence of our existence. Xiao X said, their officials also called our headquarters and asked if we sent armed forces to attack Los Angeles. Hearing this, Chen Chen did not have any surprises. When the angel statue appeared before, he had to ask Xiao X to warn North American officials in the name of black light technology. Then the Los Angeles police blocked the Herang warehouse district scene. The reason for this is also because if Xiao X does not reveal his identity, the North American region official is hard to believe, and it would never be so fast to lock down the Herang warehouse area. However, this does create a hidden danger that is, after this incident, Blacklight technology will inevitably move from behind the scenes to the front desk. At least on the Earth Federal high level side, part of the strength of blacklight technology is no longer hidden lived. But this is nothing. As the blacklight technology becomes more and more influential, sooner or later it will be a showdown with the Earth Federation. But the emergence of this incident disrupted Chen Chen's plan and made the showdown time a little earlier. Moreover, the situation at that time should have ended in the Highland warehouse area, but I didn't expect that the final development of the meme was beyond control and evolved into the current situation. Thinking of this, Chen Chen did not at all feel regret or regret. He was just nodded, said without thinking, in this case, let the North American officials doubt it, as long as we don't admit that we sent armed forces to Los Angeles, that's it. So now do we need to continue hunting for the remaining three angel statues? Xiao X asked again, otherwise they may eventually fall into the hands of North American officials. Chen Chen pondered for a while, and then vetoed, what we have to do now is to prevent the memes of angel statues from spreading. Even if some angel statues fall into the hands of North American officials, there is no way. They have been told about the memetic nature of the statue. If the meme is allowed to spread out, it can only be said that humans are destined to suffer this disaster. Okay, I see. Little X agreed. By the way, what's the situation with Kate? Chen Chen suddenly thought of the situation on Osmond's side. He looked at his watch and saw that it was already 2300 hours on June 1st. He didn't know if Kate, who was chased by Black Rider, arrived. Los Angeles. Kate has come to the boundary of Los Angeles, only half an hour away from here. Xiao X replied, if you didn't wake up in half an hour, I would be ready to wake you up. Is it finally here? Chen Chen hearing this refreshed. For today's scene, he has been waiting for three years. Even the reason he came to Los Angeles was not for this memetic infection, but to welcome Kate's arrival. The reason why Chen Chen attaches so much importance is that this matter is related to the secret of the USB flash drive. It can even be said that the final result of this matter is related to the success or failure of Chen Chen and even the black light technology. It's just that Chen Chen was greeted the opponent with a victorious attitude, but now he has suffered heavy casualties before even seeing the opponent. This scene caused Chen Chen to have an unclear thought. Could it be said that Kate is really the so-called protagonist, 
and the so-called son of the plane is not possible? In the next second, this thought was quickly abandoned by Chen Chen. He slowly walked to the bed and looked at the brightly lit city outside the window, with a glimmer of light in his eyes. Rolling Kate, even if you are the son of the plane, how about the protagonist of the entire world? I want to see if it is the better luck for the children of the plane, or the harder life for me and blacklight technology. Chen Chen murmured in a low voice, then he opened the window directly, and his whole body flew out suddenly. In the blink of an eye, he was completely integrated into the dark night. Super USB Chapter 480 Super USB Chapter 480 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. A red pickup is speeding along the suburban road, like a fish, moving flexibly in the traffic. In the pickup truck, Kate Browse tightly knit. He looked at the rear view mirror, then gritted his teeth and stepped on the accelerator. Peng. Suddenly, there was a loud crash, and the pickup slammed into a car in front of him that had always been unwilling to give way. As Kate's body leaned forward, he stubbornly grabbed the steering wheel, without being too big. The inertia flew off the windshield. The car that was knocked down immediately lost control and stopped. A red-bearded old man flustered and exasperated got out of the car. He raised his fist and cursed loudly at Kate's taillights, but at this moment, he found there was a dazzling light behind him, and it was getting closer. Seems to realize something, the red-bearded old man slowly turned around, but saw that two huge car lights were already close at hand as if he was about to swallow him, so close that he could even see the license plate on it. Ah, the red beard old man instinctively blocked his hand in front of him, but in the next second, a huge monster drove by with a defining roar, and elderly's body seemed to be smashed into a pile of paper. Blood mist, boom. All the cars that could not be dodged were knocked away by the huge iron body of the heavy truck. These vehicles were like toys and could not stop the heavy truck at all. Seeing the tragic situation of elderly behind him, Kate can only silently mourn in her heart, and then continue to run forward. The exhaustion came like a wave. He has not slept for two consecutive nights, but the chase behind him is still stimulating his nerves causing his adrenaline to continue to secrete, forcibly maintaining with a sober and excited posture. Kate had to sigh. After researching the medicine named AD001 and accepting the commission of Professor Irwin, he found that he had fallen into a whirlpool. A mysterious and weird organization began to pursue and kill itself irreconcilable. At first, he also planned to spend a good night with his beautiful colleagues and waited until the second day to go to Los Angeles to deliver the medicine, but he did not expect that he would encounter the first pursuit in his life when he was in the ballroom that night. If he was not lucky enough to be blocked by a passerby, he would be shot to death by the opponent. Unfortunately, the beautiful colleague Ella Jennifer was taken away by the mysterious organization. Then he secretly returned to the research institute, trying to inform Professor Irwin, but found that the research institute had also been looted, and both their research results, the professor and another black colleague had disappeared. Without a trace, Kate understood that they might all have suffered an accident. The mysterious organization is for AD001. As Kate reacted, he immediately understood the principle of an innocent man treasuring a jade ring becomes a crime, as long as he owns AD001 for one day, the other party will never let him go. However, Kate is born with a special sense of justice. The more rampant the opponent is, the more he will be inspired by a fighting spirit that refuses to admit defeat. Whether it is a subsequent pursuit or an interception by the opponent, he is forcibly escaped. Even, two or three of the people who chased him were seriously injured and disappeared among the team chasing him. I just don't know, who is that group of people? A cloud of haze flashed in Kate's eyes and I had to say that the strong physical fitness and fierce and unafraid of death spirit of the mysterious organization members who chased him gave him a great shock, no matter how severe the injuries he received the expression was cold, and even his face had not changed, just like a robot without emotions. What makes Kate even more crazy is that no matter where he hides or where he escapes, within ten minutes, 
those who chased him will find his hiding place and make him have to continue to flee. Dot. Furthermore, after several confrontations, Kate also discovered a pattern, that is, this group of people are expressionless, and they seem to wear different clothes, but they all wear uniform leather boots and gloves, all of them a piece of matte black, even, through the outer clothing. One can still see the exposed black parts on their necks. It seems that there is a uniform black dress in their outer clothing. In short, this group of people are definitely not official agents. The official people are impossible to pursue and kill themselves regardless of the lives of citizens. Silently analyzing the identity of the other party, Kate murmured, and it doesn't look like an agent from another continent, at least Fib is not eating dry food. Then doesn't it mean? Suddenly, Kate thought of an idea, but this idea even became a little puzzled by himself. Could it be that, as Professor Irwin said, it was the African Blacklight Biotechnology Company that maliciously acquired most of our shares? Apostrophe. Immediately, he quickly discarded his unreliable thoughts. How could it be? Dot. Not filmmaking. How could a company have such a terrifying and well-trained private army? This kind of strength can already be beaten. The cutting-edge troops of any continent. No matter how Kate thought about it, he couldn't figure out who was chasing him, so he could only run away in silence, in order to reach the Osmond corporate headquarters as soon as possible, and send medicine to the shareholder named Parker. Hands. And now, he is finally almost there. Boom. There was a violent crash again behind him. The heavy truck accelerated again and kept approaching Kate's pickup. It seemed that it would not take long before it would catch up and crash everything about the pickup. However, seeing the stars gradually appearing on the skyline, Kate was certain that after one day, one night escape, he had already arrived in the suburbs of Los Angeles, only a dozen kilometers away from Osmond headquarters. I just don't understand what happened in Los Angeles. The heavy truck behind me didn't know how many private cars it crashed into, but so far I haven't seen any policemen. This inefficiency is unimaginable in North America. Furthermore, even if you are desperate to deliver medicine, will the people who chase you stop? Or, can Parker protect himself? Seeing the other party's crazy energy, even Kate couldn't believe it. But at this point he had reached this point and he had no turning back. Either serve the medicine or be killed by the force that hunts you down. Thinking of this, Kate fell completely and continued to move towards Osmond's headquarters. However, things really seemed to have turned around. When Kate approached Osmond's headquarters a little bit, she suddenly realized that the chaser behind him was gone. The heavy truck that had chased him for hundreds of kilometers disappeared somehow in the darkness. Only his riddled with scars pickup was driving lonely and the engine roared. Seeing this, Kate couldn't help thinking silently, and then when passing a gas station, he suddenly turned the front of the car and let himself into a deserted path. After driving a certain distance on the small road, Kate abandoned the car and quickly returned to the previous road. He stood on the side of the road for a while, then waited for a black classic car to come, Kate quickly beckoned. And luckily, the old classic car stopped on the side of the road. Want to take a ride on the youngster? A middle-aged man with a beard and a greasy scent poked his head out of the car window. He showed a mouthful of yellow teeth and chuckled with harboring malicious intentions, saying, I am going to the western suburbs of Los Angeles. Where are you going? If you drop by, I can take you for a ride. I, Kate just wanted to say her address, and then she seemed to think of something and quickly changed her words, I'm going to the city, sir, you just need to take me for a ride, and I will be in the right place, get off the bus, if this is the case, then come up, the middle-aged man beckoned with a grin, and then opened the passenger's door, after hesitating for a while, Kate saw that the opponent's hands and collar were not lined with black material, so she touched the gun in her pocket secretly and sat on it, an hour later, Kate held the gun with a gloomy expression and parked the old car on the corner of the street near Rosmond. At this time, the original owner of the car had a big hole in his forehead. He was lying in the rear driver's seat, 
gurgling blood flowing from his forehead. This man is really not a good person. He was originally planning to rob Kate, who would have expected that the handsome and weak Kate would be so decisive, but he just turned away from the guest and killed him. Chen Chen did not get off the car directly in front of the company building, because he knew how crazy the group of people chasing him was. If he appeared directly in front of the company building, he would probably be directly ambushed by the mysterious organization here. Take away. So, he got off the car in the vicinity, and then climbed to the top of a nearby tower, looking down by the night wind. Besides, several hundred meters, the headquarters of Osman Company is impressively listed, but beside it, there are also two buildings with similar heights standing on the left and right, even the three buildings are only less than ten between each other. The distance in meters. Seeing this, Kate's eyes lit up. He quickly climbed down the tower, and then found a hemp rope, following the memory of the past, from the building next door to the top of the building. At this time, the sky is still very dark, but fortunately there are a lot of lights between the floors to illuminate and the lights from these windows also cover up Kate's silhouette on the top of the building. Tie the slip knot, and then move one end towards the other side and throw it away. After tossing several times, the slip knot was finally tied to the opposite railing. Kate tugged again, and the slip knot was immediately fastened tightly. Then Kate tied her side again, and the rope suddenly became a high altitude passage connecting the two buildings. Took a deep breath. Kate climbed up the railing, then twisted the rope with both hands and legs at the same time, moving towards the opposite side a little bit. In this way, Kate finally relied on this method to suffer untold hardships to the top of the Osmond headquarters building, which is the location of the rooftop. After arriving here, Kate still did not relax his vigilance. He quietly walked down the stairs of the roof to the lower floor, and he saw rows of offices and on the sign of the first office, it is marked with the words Office of the Chairman and General Manager. Finally here, Kate exhales one breath saying, he walked slowly to the door of the office, only to see that although it was late at night, the light could still be seen in the crack of the office door. Obviously there were people in the office, so he no longer hesitated, and directly opened the door in front of him. Suddenly, a dim office appeared before Kate's eyes. This is an office decorated with a strong personal style. The area is not large, but the interior decoration is very particular, black and white, and it seems that there is no reason for full lighting. The office is very dim. The office facing the door is a large redwood writing desk. At this time, a middle-aged man sits opposite the writing desk. This middle-aged man is no one else. It was Parker, the founder of Osmond, who was mentioned by the professor. Mr. Parker, seeing the Lord, Kate only felt relieved. He quickly walked in and locked the door quickly, I introduce myself, I am. You are rolling Kate. Seeing Kate's arrival, the middle-aged man in front of him didn't have any surprises. He just said with a bitter smile, I heard Elvin say that you will bring me something. Yes. Kate stepped forward immediately, put his hand into the neckline, and then took out a sealed bottle wrapped in thick sponge and a USB flash drive and placed it on Parker's desk. Professor Irwin developed a D001. He asked me to deliver it to you personally. Very good. Pike nodded, he extended the hand gently took out the sealed bottle in the sponge, and then touched it fondly, then he didn't know what he thought of, and the movement of his hand suddenly stopped. Immediately, Kate only saw the other person suddenly took a deep breath, as if made up his mind, solemnly picked up two things, stood up and walked backwards at the same time. Seeing this scene, Kate couldn't help but feel a little puzzled. For some reason, he found that the other party didn't have any joyful expression whether he saw his arrival or got the medicine of the year for something even in dreams. Instead, he revealed something that made people happy. Can't figure out the emotions. It seems to be a pity, it seems to be reluctant. Just when Kate was puzzled, he saw that Parker went straight to the window and handed over the two things in his hands respectfully. Wait. Kate was shocked and it was only then that he suddenly realized that there was still a person standing at the window deep in the office. I came in for so long without even noticing it, because of the dim light in the office, from Kate's position, 
he could only see the outline of a group of human figures. The other party reached out and took the medicine and information, and then slowly walked over. As the black shadow walked into the light underground, Kate finally saw him clearly. Standing in front of him turned out to be a young man from Central Continent with evil eyes in his eyes. Mr. Kate, thank you for your medicine. The young man raised a smile at the corner of his mouth and slowly extended his hand in a handshake posture. However, when Kate saw the black matte gloves on the opponent's hand, Kate suddenly widened his eyes, and he lifted the head abruptly, revealing a ghostly look. Super USB Chapter 481 Super USB Chapter 481 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. When he saw the black matte gloves on the opponent's hand, Kate suddenly rounded his eyes. He quickly lifted the head, and he saw the black lining on the young man's neck. This costume is unique to the mysterious organization that chases you. Moreover, unlike the costumes of the mysterious organizations that chase them down, the black lining exposed on the neck of the young man actually has a few buttons glowing with blue light. Obviously it looks more advanced. Suddenly, Kate showed a ghostly expression. He quickly stepped back and stood at the door guardingly looking at the youth in front of him. What's the matter? Didn't you give me this thing? The young man asked with a smile. He moved towards Kate step by step. Why are you running away? What are you afraid of? Would I have eaten you? Damn it. A panic flashed in Kate's eyes. I don't know why. This young man from Central Asia clearly looked ordinary but for some reason he gave him a great oppression. He quickly took out his gun and warned, Don't come here, come here I'm going to shoot. At this moment, there was a tutor pitching propeller sound outside his window. Not only Kate, but even the mysterious youth followed the sound, but saw a military helicopter flying slowly outside the window, seemingly searching for something. Seeing this, Kate gritted her teeth and pulled the trigger without the slightest hesitation. Peng 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 bang. There was a series of huge gunshots. Kate didn't know how many shots he had fired. When he saw everything in front of him, he showed an expression of incomparable shock. It's like there is an invisible barrier. All the bullets were frozen in midair when they approached the midair youth and were forcibly intercepted. Stupid. A coldness flashed in the young man's eyes as if he was lifting a chicken, he pinched Kate's neck. The speed was so fast that Kate didn't even react. He only felt a sore throat. In the next second, his toes had left the ground. Dot. A sharp pain and a sense of suffocation hit. Kate threw away the bullet that hit the bullet and instinctively tried to break the opponent's arm, but he felt like he was breaking an iron pipe. No matter how hard he tried, I can't shake the other party the slightest. Just when he thought he was going to die, the sound of the propeller reached the window again, not only that, but also shot a dazzling beam of light. The people inside listened, immediately put down their weapons and lay on the ground, waiting for the arrival of the patrol team. However, upon hearing the other's voice, the young man in front of him did not move at all. On the contrary, his eyes suddenly flashed fiercely. Suck. The strength on the neck increased in vain. When Kate thought he was about to crush his neck, suddenly there was another gunshot. Then he just felt the opponent's hand shook, and his body slammed directly behind him. The door of the room, then turned round and escaped. Someone on the helicopter shot that mysterious young man. This thought flashed past, Kate had no time to think of anything else. So he rushed directly into the hallway and quickly fled to the stairs. Can this kind of desperate situation escape? Until Kate escaped, the mysterious young man murmured while looking thoughtful. Then he slowly turned around, took a finger-sized, deformed bullet from the back of his hand, and then looked out the window aiming at his helicopter. Repeat. The people in the room immediately put down their weapons and lie on the ground, waiting for the arrival of the patrol team. The warning sound was heard again on the helicopter broadcast. Seeing this, the mysterious young man tilted his head and suddenly waved his hand. Boom. There was a sound of body shattering, and the helicopter seemed to have been subjected to an invisible impact, and suddenly lost control, spinning up and down to the ground. Hong Long. A few seconds later, there was a fierce fire from downstairs, 
and even a deafening explosion sounded, and it seemed that the whole building had shaken once. Mr. Chen Chen, you, looking at this scene in front of him within a few seconds, Parker was already dumbfounded. He lay on the ground dumbly, looking at Chen Chen as if he had seen a ghost. Chen Chen ignored Parker, but turned around slowly and walked out of the office door slowly. After walking out of the room, Chen Chen suddenly frowned, he shook his head, and then he felt his nose hot again. One after another, blood flows directly. Your godfather, we have already alerted the North American army who came to search for the angel statue, and the other party is coming here. Xiao X's voice came from the headset, and she suddenly became a little confused. You just had the opportunity to kill the other person, why? I just want to see this desperate situation, whether he still has a chance to escape from me that's all. Not waiting for Xiao X to finish asking, Chen Chen replied, but now it seems that this Kate is really evil. The moment I saw each other, my head started to hurt, apparently during the day. At that time, my field energy was exhausted, and now I continue to use it without taking a long time. In addition, the injury during the day has not fully recovered. Now there are obvious symptoms of repercussions. Then you should retreat first, anyway, he has lost the medicine and information, and there is no threat to us. Little X persuaded, you are still too naive, X. Chen Chen shook the head. Do you really think the medicine and USB flash drive he sent are in? This guy is so cautious, how could he put the medicine on his body to see Parker before he was sure that it was safe? P. Speaking, Chen Chen took out the medicine from his body, opened the cap of the bottle and smelled it, then threw the medicine bottle on the ground. Sure enough, the medicine is fake. You can't kill him, maybe I can, and from now on. I won't keep my hands. Chen Chen wiped his nosebleeds, and instead of using almost exhausted field energy, he went straight to the stairwell and jumped to the railing of the next stair opposite with one hand. Boom. A loud noise came. Chen Chen stepped firmly on the railing again. Then he turned around, moved towards the other side and jumped again. Boom. Boom. Bang. A huge sound echoed in the bottomless stairwell. With this speed, Chen Chen dropped down almost at a rate of three seconds, but he went down to the first floor in two minutes. But at this moment, Xiao X's prompt sound came again, my godfather, the target has already driven away, and the direction he flees is the direction of the Heilang warehouse area, and Black Rider is currently pursuing it. Chen Chen frowned, the other party apparently didn't know what happened in Los Angeles, but he still ran immediately toward the Helen warehouse area, which is no coincidence to describe. But now is not the time to think about this. As Chen Chen walked out of the building, a black rider had already drove and waited outside the door. Chen Chen pulled the car door and sat on it, and then the vehicle moved towards Heilank Drive quickly in the direction of the warehouse area. There was a murder statue in the city, and even the city hall was devastated. At this time, the manpower from the blockade during the Helen warehouse area has been completely evacuated, and there are only densely packed lines in the entire warehouse area. The isolation zone that's all. At this time, when a car was passing through the intersection of the Herank warehouse area, suddenly, a car rushed out of the side road and directly hit the car's body. Suddenly, the white car he rolled straight up, and rolled all the way to the gate of Herank's warehouse area. Finally. The whole car turned upside down, and a weak groan came from the already deformed compartment. After a while, Kate crawled out of the car with blood on his face, and his head was covered by glass. A deep gap was drawn. Afterwards, several cars clinging to the back of the sedan stopped one after another. Amidst a dozen black riders, Chen Chen walked out of the car wearing a blanket. Cough cough dot Kate. You can't run. He covered his mouth with a white handkerchief and coughed softly. If you tell me where the real AD001 information is, I can consider letting you go. I won't tell you, you will never get it. Kate shook the head, with a touch of despair in her eyes. I just didn't expect that even Mr. Parker would betray us, but unfortunately I can't fulfill the promise of Professor Irwin. Seeing Kate's pretentious and affectionate performance, 
Chen Chen's eyes flashed a touch of irritability. The next second, Kate suddenly saw a flash. It seemed that something guard-like thing flew in front of him, and then his whole body suddenly soaring into the air, flying out completely. In Kate's sight, he only felt that his body became extremely light, and the whole person kept spinning in midair, but in the process of spinning, he saw a strange phenomenon that is, spinning on himself at the same time. He actually saw his body standing firmly in place. Could it be that Kate just realized something, but before he could fully wake up, his consciousness quickly blurred. Bang! There was a sound of the ball landing, Kate's head flew out 20 meters away, and hit the ground heavily. Kate, it's dead. Looking at Kate with the corpse separated, one of the black rider walked forward again, his right foot was raised high, and then fiercely stepped on Kate's head. Only hearing Pukai, Kate's head was trampled into a pool of meatloaf by Black Rider's boots. A lot of blood and brains splashed all over, completely covering the small square inches front of her Anx warehouse area. A blast of night wind blew in, bringing the blood reeking chi breath on the corpse. Chen Chen watched all this slightly shook the head. So far he could be sure that Kate could not die anymore even if he put it in immediately. It can't be saved in Medbud 3000. Withdrawing Nanopoker casually, Chen Chen once again felt a sharp pain from deep in his head. He knew that this was a performance of overuse, but he didn't expect that even the use of graphene poker would be barely extreme. But at this moment, Xiao X reminded again, your godfather, the military is behind. They have already chased you. Almost at the same time as Xiao X reminded, several military helicopters appeared again in the sky. These helicopters locked Chen Chen from a distance. At the same time, military vehicles also came from a distance. Hundreds of soldiers with live ammunition jumped out of these military vehicles. After arriving in the square inches front of the Heron warehouse area, they began to erect their own fortifications. Chen Chen, completely surrounded, looking at the many soldiers approaching, whether by land or by air, it is almost impossible to escape, but Chen Chen did not show any expression, but suddenly said, X, the military satellite is blocked, so that they cannot get it from the headquarters. Contact, understood. Xiao X agreed, and after waiting less than 10 seconds, he said again, I have hacked their military communications satellite system, and it cannot be repaired in at least 24 hours. Chen Chen was nodded, and then looked at Legion ahead. The number of soldiers surrounding them was between 700 and 800. At this time, the officer in charge stood on the roof of a jeep and shouted with a horn, Chen Chen sir, I introduce myself, mine is Lieutenant Colonel Wilson, belonging to the 50th 2nd Battalion, 3rd Division, Army regular army in North America. The purpose of coming here is to arrest you, because you are now involved in the violation of the Earth Federation North America. The District Independence Act includes many crimes such as killing, attacking the army, and instigating war. Now please surrender immediately and strive for leniency. Do you know who I am? When he heard his name being called out, Chen Chen was not surprised. But a strange smile was provoked at the corner of his mouth, he asked, it turned out to be Lieutenant Colonel Wilson. So, Kate is the medicine and things left to you. Yes, my soldier did receive something from a citizen just now, saying that this thing was donated to the North American region official. Lieutenant Colonel Wilson continued, now is not the time to discuss this. We have witnessed a murder case with our own eyes. Mr. Chen Chen. Do you still have to defend it? No, I killed people, of course I won't argue. When he heard the medicine in the opponent's hand, Chen Chen grinned suddenly, exposing Bei Sensen's teeth. At the same time, his wrist shook slightly, and a weird, slender metal rod appeared in Chen Chen's hand. In the hollow layer of the metal rod, you can faintly see the fluorescent red liquid flowing slowly, and there are two buttons on the tube wall one blue and one green. At this time, Chen Chen decisively pressed the blue button, only to hear a swish, a black and slender needle came out from the top of the metal tube. Very well, Mr. Chen Chen, 
we will record your words throughout. Now please don't resist, after we arrest you, we will transfer you to the FBI department. Hearing Chen Chen's self-destruction words, Lieutenant Colonel Wilson's eyes lit up, as if seeing a bright future beckoning to him. He quickly made a gesture and ordered a class of soldiers to move towards Chen Chen rushed here. Seeing this, Chen Chen didn't hesitate anymore. He directly raised the metal rod in his hand, pointed the needle at his heart and reinserted it. Chen Chen only felt a cold in his heart, and a needle of more than 10 centimeters long pierced directly into the heart, and then Chen Chen pressed another green button again. Kai. A sound of aerodynamic force came and all the red liquid in the metal tube was injected into Chen Chen's within the body. What are you doing? Seeing Chen Chen's actions, Lieutenant Colonel Wilson's expression became even more stunned. Then he seemed to realize something. Turn pale with fright said, quickly stop him, he will commit suicide. Hearing this, many soldiers speeded up and rushed towards Chen Chen, but at this time Chen Chen had begun to tremble all over his body was shaking rapidly, and it seemed that an extremely violent force was about to be excited. All the soldiers looked suspiciously, and then, an unforgettable scene appeared for them. Under the gaze of everyone, Chen Chen's body suddenly began to grow huge. First, there was a burst of Kai Kai tearing, and then everyone saw Chen Chen's coat completely shattered, but he was exposed. Black tight clothes with blue light spots. Under tight clothes, the muscles of Chen Chen's whole body quickly bulged, and Chen Chen also began to kneel on the ground at this time. He curled up and shouted hoarsely at the same time. Ah! In the roar of Chen Chen's roar, he also heard a humming sound within the body at the same time, and then his back kept bulging out, as if something wanted to break out of the cocoon. Pukai. In the end, the black tight clothes finally did not resist Chen Chen's swelling and huge bone spurs protruded from behind Chen Chen. At this time, Chen Chen seemed to have become a full-length body, wild beast full of spikes. Seeing this terrifying scene, the group of soldiers suddenly stopped, and an unbelievable expression flashed in everyone's eyes. However, Chen Chen's changes did not stop at all. After the tight clothes were completely broken, everyone saw that Chen Chen was still swelling rapidly even breaking his skin, exposing the scarlet muscles inside. Then, the cracked skin healed at an even more amazing speed, but the healed skin changed from the color of ordinary person to ash gray, filled with a large amount of bone layer, these bone layers had continued to spread on Chen Chen's body, covering Chen Chen's whole body almost in the blink of an eye. On the face, Chen Chen's changes heaven and earth turning upside down. The corners of his open mouth suddenly split out of thin air, revealing two rows of densely packed canine teeth, and the left and right canine teeth are much sharper and thinner than usual. Long, as Chen Chen lifts the head, everyone who saw Chen Chen's face was covered with an ash gray layer of bone, like a skeleton without flesh and blood. In short, Chen Chen is almost in full view. From a human image to a monster with a height of 3 meters, a large number of barbs on his back, and an ash gray bone armor covering his entire body. Super USB Chapter 482 Super USB Chapter 482 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. My god! How would it feel for a human being to become alive in front of him? Lieutenant Colonel Wilson could not explain this feeling. Facing a scene that can only appear in science fiction movies, at this moment, he has only endless fuck in his heart, and the group of soldiers sent out to arrest Chen Shen even more it was involuntarily stopping, and a few people even instinctively stepped back. In the focal point of ten thousands, Chen Chen, who has turned into a huge monster, slowly stood up. With his breathing, two white water mists spurted out of his mouth like jet valves. Everyone saw the moment Chen Chen lifts the head. At this time, Chen Chen's eyes are like two huge black holes, 
and in the center of the black hole, one can even see a pupil the size of a needle tip that burns like charcoal. Are they really pupils that humans have? As those pupils swept over everyone, everyone including Wilson had a kind of palpitations that seemed to come from in the depth of one's soul. It seemed that at this moment they were not facing humans at all but from hell. The devil crawling out of the abyss. What the hell is that? Finally, Lieutenant Colonel Wilson reacted first. He pointed to Chen Chen again and brace oneself again. What are you doing? Please go up and arrest him. Hearing the urging of Lieutenant Colonel Wilson, all the soldiers who were planning to arrest Chen Chen were in a dilemma, but the military order was like a mountain. Just when they were about to grit their teeth and rushed forward, Chen Chen suddenly took a step and half turned. I hung my waist and made a low roar. Roar. Like a subwoofer, Chen Chen's roar even formed an echo. The soldiers who rushed up were hit hard, and their bodies trembled and fell straight to the ground. Damn. Seeing this scene, Lieutenant Colonel Wilson's expression changed. Although Chen Chen himself is extremely valuable, but seeing this scene, he also understands that he can't keep his hands anymore. Just the wind pressure can hurt people. What kind of power will there be under the devilish body? Thinking of this, Wilson felt an irresistible chill, and he no longer hesitated to shout loudly, shoot, everyone shoots. Suddenly, the dozens of soldiers at the forefront of the fortifications immediately executed their orders, not even think they pulled the trigger. DA 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 DA. A series of gunfire resounded like a thunderstorm, countless firepower poured on Chen Chen's body in this brief moment, and then an even more incredible scene appeared. Chen Chen was just beaten back after a few steps. The white bone armor actually blocked countless bullets, and fell to the ground. The huge 7.26 rifle bullet can't penetrate even the shell of the monster in front of you. Ha 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 ha. You know nothing about power. In the rain of bullets, Chen Chen laughed wildly, his voice resounding like thunder, even overshadowing the roar of bullets. He suddenly leaned forward while bending his legs slightly, and then he shot. So, there was a sound of tearing the air, everyone just felt saw a flash. Chen Chen's huge body actually went directly to the height of several dozen meters. How can such a huge body be possible? A single thought flashed through everyone's hearts. They looked subconsciously in the sky, but saw Chen Chen already appearing above their heads. Then there was a bang, the front of a military truck was directly Chen Chen collapsed. Ah! The soldiers on the side screamed. They just aimed their guns at Chen Chen, but before they could fire, Chen Chen's arms swung like a pendulum. Puff 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 puff. Chen Chen's tomato long barbs at the elbow are like two sharp sickles. With just one stroke, several soldiers in the range suddenly all split up and in pieces, and a large amount of blood and internal organs are thrown out and splashed. All the soldiers behind. Ah! Everyone screamed like a ghost and some soldiers could no longer avoid avoiding their own people. They started to pull the trigger frantically. However, at this time Chen Chen already seemed to be a beast in the flock. He bowed his legs again, and rushed into another pile of people like a bomb. Then there was another wave of limbs splashing around, four or five. A soldier was directly smashed into mud. Disperse, everyone disperses immediately. The battle commander near the crowd yelled loudly. All the soldiers screamed and dispersed towards all directions, but their speed was like a toddler in front of Chen Chen, and Chen Chen was like an agile cheater, wantonly rush in the crowd. Where's the sniper? Where's the grenade platoon? Get it on me. The Wilson eye socket cracked in the command car. He yelled frantically, but the adjutant next to him rushed forward and yelled, No way, Lieutenant Colonel, he is in our crowd now, we don't dare to fire at all. Go on, let them go with confidence and boldly, and must kill this monster. Wilson roared while being heavily protected by the guards, and he himself was stuffed into the command vehicle by the guards. Wilson's command vehicle is an infantry fighting vehicle. After seeing this horrific scene of Chen Chen, the command vehicle quickly started, ready to move towards the distance to escape. Can you escape? Suddenly, Chen Chen suddenly turned his head after killing dozens of soldiers next to him. He roared in a low voice, and then suddenly exerted force under his feet, 
and went directly to an altitude of 2,030 meters. Boom. In the next second, Chen Chen's huge body hits down high, and he landed directly in front of the infantry fighting vehicle. His sharp teeth snarled out like two rows of jagged teeth, and at the same time he half arched his body, making a counter attack. Attitude. Weng. There was a huge impact, and the infantry fighting vehicle fiercely hit Chen Chen's body. Suddenly Chen Chen was hit by the infantry fighting vehicle and retreated quickly. But as he mastered his balance, Chen Chen suddenly straightened his legs. As the infantry fighting vehicle continued to move forward, Chen Chen plowed the ground into two deep ditches. After plowing a ditch of more than 10 meters on the road, the infantry fighting vehicle was forcibly forced to stop. At the same time, Chen Chen let out a roar. His arms suddenly exerted strength, the whole armored vehicle was lifted directly, and then it was turned upside down in a loud noise. But at this moment, on a helicopter not far away, a flame suddenly lit up. Chen Chen had just taken off the armored vehicle, and suddenly felt a head shake. He scratched his head, and then a caliber over three centimeters the deformed warhead slid down from his head and hit the ground with a clang. This is the caliber of anti-material sniper rifles. N. Chen Chen turned his head abruptly, moved towards in the sky and looked around, and he saw a helicopter hovering at an altitude of 340 meters, and then the helicopter was light flashed again. This time, Chen Chen tilted his head directly, and a whistling sound came from his ear. Another bullet passed through Chen Chen's ear, and a deep hole with the thickness of a bowl was exploded behind Chen Chen. Come, small insect, you hurt me. Seeing the opponent's provocation, Chen Chen couldn't help letting out a roar, and then his legs bent again. Not good. On the helicopter, the pilot saw this familiar scene. For some reason, he suddenly felt a sense of horror. He didn't even think he started to raise the helicopter, as if he was preparing to avoid the monster's attack. But how does the flexibility of helicopters compare to creatures? In the next second, Chen Chen's body bounced like a cannonball. At this moment, the air seemed to be torn apart, bursting out a pattern like one after another water wave. Boom! Chen Chen's body directly hit the helicopter, and the sniper in the back seat was hit by Chen Chen into a puddle of mud before he could even react, and the plane directly lost its balance and whirled towards the ground. Boom! At the moment the helicopter hit the ground, a huge fireball suddenly rose up, but Chen Chen rushed out of the fireball as if nothing happened jumped again, and returned to the crowd. A massacre that seems to come from hell has begun. Everywhere Chen Chen goes, there are corpses everywhere across the field. These soldiers are as fragile as mud and paper. With just a wave of hands, several lives spread out like bursting fireworks, then annihilated. This group of soldiers wanted to escape, but before they ran far, they would be blocked by Chen Chen, and some of those who fled by car would be shot and killed in the middle of the road. Finally, some of the single-handed soldiers escaped from the Herang warehouse area, but suddenly a few twisted transparent silhouettes appeared in front of them, and the corpses separated before they could react. At this time, the second batch of black riders sent by Xiao X has arrived. Although there are not many people who cannot fight head, the way out is blocked and the killing is still with no difficulty. Under the powerful shooting ability of Black Rider, even those high altitude helicopters were easily killed, one by one fell down. Ten minutes later, the periphery of Herank's warehouse area has been corpses everywhere across the field. There are exploding military vehicles and corpses everywhere, and the flames are soaring, illuminating the periphery of Herank's warehouse area. A soldier with torn legs made a low moan. While looking not far to the side, he moved his hands with his hands, as if he wanted to escape from the war zone, but in the next second, he was half full. A sharp claw the size of a body stretched out, threw him high, and then threw him down. Pukai. A sound of body fragmentation sounded and the scream of the wounded soldier stopped abruptly. In the light of the fire, more than a dozen translucent silhouettes emerged from the darkness. All of them wore black tight clothes that covered the whole body, with weird weapons in both hands, 
expressionless looking around. They are walking in a battlefield like hell. Any soldier who pretends to be dead or unconscious but still has a breath will be shot by them, and then continue to search for the next life that has not yet died. While Chen Chen was panting for a misty breath, he walked slowly to the overturned chariot. He bent slightly, but saw that the entrance and exit door of the infantry chariot had been opened. The inside is empty. N. Chen Chen looked around with his charcoal like pupils, and suddenly saw a row of bloodstains and footprints extending into the interior of the Highland warehouse area. There is a fish that escaped the net, Chen Chen murmured in a low voice. He tilted his head while stroking his neck and then strode into the Herank warehouse area with dull footsteps. At this time, on the other side, a soldier was holding Lieutenant Colonel Wilson constantly shuttled through the Highland warehouse area, and the other soldier was in charge of the interruption. The three kept breathing and wandering in Highland. The depths of the warehouse district, who dot who, Wilson only felt hot in his lungs. After the armored car was overturned by Chen Chen, he fiercely hit his chest. At this time, he didn't know how many ribs were broken, so he could only be supported by his soldiers. Escape. At this moment, he looked behind him while panting, only to see the light of fire from afar straight into the sky and the sound of sporadic gunshots. Obviously, the battle was over. Damn, what the hell is that? Why can't it be killed? Wilson growled unwillingly, but was immediately persuaded by the side soldiers. Lieutenant Colonel, it's not the time to talk about this. I can't contact the headquarters for some reason, so the most important thing for us is to flee. Here, explain everything to the top, otherwise the casualties of this battalion today will be covered by black light technology. Hearing the persuasion of the soldiers, Wilson's face became even more ugly. He was just about to say something, and suddenly there was a loud noise behind him. It seemed that something fiercely hit the ground, boom. Hearing this sound, both of them were complexion changed, and at the same time, the soldier who was responsible for the severance not far behind also ran over, Lieutenant Colonel, the monster is chasing me. Hearing the confirmation from the soldier, Wilson finally realized that he could not escape. He pushed away the soldier who was supporting him, and shouted, run separately. Only in this way can someone have a chance to escape. Here, expose everything today. Hearing Wilson's order, the two soldiers also understood that what he was talking about was the truth, so the three of them stopped hesitating, and immediately moved towards three directions and fled. Just ten seconds after the three of them rushed into the darkness, a huge black shadow suddenly hit the ground from in the sky. Amid the smoke and dust, the huge non-human body slowly straightened up from the ground. He looked around for a week, and his keen hearing suddenly heard three footsteps gradually moving away. Small insects, do you think you can run away by running separately? Chen Chen grinned two rows of Bei Sensen's teeth, picked a random position, and then made a big jump. Boom! When a soldier just ran to a fork in the road, Chen Chen fell directly in front of the opponent and the huge shockwave knocked the opponent directly to the ground. Seeing that his way of life was completely blocked, the soldier finally had a sense of despair in his eyes. Before he could get up, he raised his gun and moved towards Chen Chen and swept away. Da 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 da. There was a burst of intensive gunfire, but the bullet did not even fire one third and his body collapsed like a meatloaf. Pukai. Chen Chen slowly retracted his palm and glanced at the corpse of the soldier who had been hit by dimensionality reduction, and then moved towards the other direction in his previous memory and jumped again. A few seconds later, as a scream came, Chen Chen looked at another humanoid corpse in his palm, then threw him down like trash, then moved towards the other direction and jumped again. Exclamation mark. Boom. This time, Chen Chen blocked Wilson directly. Looking at Wilson, who was standing at the end of a wall with his eyes rounded, Chen Chen walked towards the opponent step by step, and at the same time asked in a low voice, Run, small insect, why not keep running? Could it be that you are already give up? Hearing Chen Chen's rhetorical question, 
Wilson's eyes flashed with a flash of light. He suddenly raised the corner of his mouth and laughed heartily up uncontrollably, Monster, whatever the hell is that, it's over now, because you are dead. Oh, Chen Chen hearing this paused, his charcoal-like pupils moved slightly to the right, did you mean? Before finishing speaking, Wilson, who kept his eyes wide open, suddenly closed his eyes. In the next second, Chen Chen suddenly felt a chill coming from behind him. Before he could turn his head, he felt a slight dingling in the back of his neck. Kaka. There was a sound as if something was shattering. Wilson suddenly eyes opened after hearing this sound, but then his eyes widened, revealing an expression of unbelievable. Behind the huge monster in front of me, a statue was wrapping his arms around the other's neck, but the monster in front of me only pulled the angel statue in front of him. Very good, crushed my outer skeleton. Chen Chen touched the cracked nape carapace, and then the carapace quickly healed at a speed visible with naked eye. After a second, the carapace returned to smoothness, as if the crack was just an illusion. Crushing the angel statue in his hand. Chen Chen turned his head again to look at Wilson who was stunned. He grinned and uttered a low voice like Hong Zong, Lieutenant Colonel Wilson, now only you and me are left. Dot. Super USB Chapter 483 Super USB Chapter 483 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. By the time Chen Chen returned to the battlefield, all the survivors had been cleaned up. Even the corpses with gunshot wounds were piled into a high pile, which was covered with gasoline and burned. Not only that, the onlookers who were affected also received amnestics, forgetting everything they saw, and replaced by a new memory of angel statues slaughtering the army. Your godfather. I have finished processing on my side and I have not found any emissions. At this moment, Xiao X's voice suddenly came from the headset. Although Chen Chen has transformed, his headset is still stuck in the ear hole. Very well, I also got my things back. Chen Chen nodded, casually threw a bottle of medicine bottle glowing with blue light and a USB flash drive to the Black Rider aside, while looking at the sky, suddenly said, time is up. Following his words, Chen Chen's body seemed to be leaking, and white mist began to pour out. Then the white mist became more and more dense, and even covered Chen Chen's huge body. Stand up. In the next second, Chen Chen's body shrank rapidly like a leaking ball, and the outer skeleton of his whole body directly turned into a powder, and an unpleasant smell of corruption drifted away. When the white mist dissipated again, Chen Chen regained his previous size, and on the surface of his body, there was still a layer of monster skin that gradually dissolved. Puff Kai Chen Chen came out of the corrupt shell naked body, then he staggered under his feet, and two black riders immediately supported him. Until now, we can see that Chen Chen's body has changed from a muscular body to a skinny appearance, just like a severely malnourished refugee who has not eaten for several years. Furthermore, not only has his body become emaciated, but all the hair on his body has also disappeared. It's like an insect that turns a cocoon into a butterfly. At this time, Chen Chen is full of newborn skin from top to bottom. These skins are smooth and delicate and can be broken like a baby. However, no outsiders will see all of this. The Black Rider, which was already prepared, immediately put a warm duvet on Chen Chen, and then a few people carried Chen Chen into a black car and quickly grew, and go. When the car left, the rest of the Black Rider also re-entered the stealth state and turned and left the battlefield. One hour later, Chen Chen returned to the minaret experiment base outside 10,000 Li through the black ball gants. Chen Chen, who returned to the base, immediately received top level medical services. Glucose and nutrients were transported into Chen Chen's body without money. What Chen Chen had to do was to restore his body. Unlike ordinary people, Chen 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 Chen's physique and the medical methods of the steeple laboratory will not take long for Chen Chen to return to peak status. Dot. One day later, Chen Chen woke up from the hospital bed quietly. He stretched lazily, looked at all around, 
and saw that he is now in an intensive care unit with bright white metal walls and a few bunches of flowers before the bed. It exudes a hint of fragrance. The room was not at all, but it was warm and bright. Because there was a bright sun coming in from the window, Chen Chen followed the sun and looked out the window. You can even see that the outside world is a huge park with mountains and mountains. Water, there are dozens of tourists walking slowly by laughing at each other. If you calm down, Chen Chen can even hear the laughter and the chirping of birds from the group of tourists outside the window. Seeing this scene, Chen Chen is not surprised, because he knows that all this is not real. The so-called scenery outside the window is actually a 3D holographic image, and the warm sunshine is also it's just an LED light that simulates the real sun. This kind of light was invented by a genius scientist dug up by the Life Sciences City a long time ago. Humans discovered that the natural light they perceive is actually sunlight and other particles of nitrogen, oxygen and carbon dioxide in the air. The interaction spreads down. So this genius scientist used an LED floodlight to simulate the sun, and at the same time replaced the atmosphere with an unimaterial layer, reconstructing the Earth's atmosphere of more than 10 kilometers, so as to obtain a claustorial sunlight experience. At this time, when Chen Chen sees outside the window, an additional optical system is added to enhance depth perception. When someone stares at the LED light outside the window, no matter what angle, it seems to see the sun in the sky. The high suspension can almost be fake. Just 10 seconds after Chen Chen awakened, Xiao X wore a white dress and pushed in. She swaggered to Chen Chen's bed. Godfather, you are awake. Do you need breakfast? Come on. Chen Chen replied, after a G virus injection mutation. His stomach was already hungry. Xiao X immediately agreed, then jumped up and sat down on the chair next to Chen Chen's bed, slumped and shook his legs slightly. My godfather, I have received news from North America. All the angel statues have been being contained. The situation you were worried about will not happen. I hope so. Chen Chen shrugged indifferently. I am afraid that it will leak again in the future and cause an irreversible human crisis. By the way, the dead Kate's body has been transported back. Xiao X said again, and he has been dissection of his body, but nothing has been found. It is normal not to find out, and I am just a suspicion that's all. If there is something abnormal, it means there is a problem. Chen Chen waved his hand. Yes. Xiao X also murmured directly, obviously, the four black riders chased and killed people who could not kill for a day, and they died so easily in the end. It does give people a sense of incongruity. Chen Chen hearing this showed the color of thinking, and then said, if there is no wrong guess, it is because his mission has been completed. Mission? Xiao X blinked with some confusion. Is it his mission to send AD-001? Yes. Faced with the increasingly anthropomorphic little X, Chen Chen explained patiently, you should know that there is often such a rule in movies that once he becomes the protagonist of the story, before the end of the story, he it will never die. Everything about the protagonist represents the development of the story. Losing the protagonist means that the story cannot go on. Until the end of the movie, the protagonist loses the value of advancing the story, and then he may die. Dot. Just when Chen Chen said this, the door of the intensive care unit was pushed open again, and a black rider walked in with a dining cart and placed him next to Chen Chen's bed. Chen Chen didn't hesitate. He first raised the bucket of milk and drank it. After the bucket of milk was wiped out, he grabbed the barbecue and various high-calorie foods on the dining car and swallowed it. While eating, Chen Chen continued to speak, remember, in the movie Life and Death, the shocking project. The protagonist just puts medicine in the hands of the other party and the movie ends. This also represents the protagonist. There is no need to continue to advance the story, so the protagonist's aura begins to disappear. Since the movie does not say whether the protagonist is dead or alive, then he has the possibility of being killed. Hearing Chen Chen's explanation, Xiao X suddenly felt a little stunned. It turned out to be like this. Then. She saw Chen Chen still frowns, so she asked again, then Godfather, 
Why are you still frowning? Because I am thinking. Chen Chen swallowed a piece of butter, and then pointed to his head, I am thinking. How does the U disk interfere with reality to cause the scene in the movie to reproduce in reality? This principle is very important, even it may involve a branch of science that is more terrifying than memes. No, it may have gone beyond the scientific system and reached the category of philosophy. Have you determined that the USB flash drive interfered with reality and caused the plot in the movie to happen, instead of the USB flash drive for seeing the future? and then interfered with us making the movie? Xiao X is a little puzzled about Chen Chen's affirmation. Of course, Chen Chen without the slightest hesitations replied, X, do you know that we have obtained a DO01, and we have also unlocked the medicine manufacturing process, and can produce this medicine at any time, even until Osmond when Germany's medicine is on the market, we can still sue them for stealing technology, so why should I pay so much attention to Osman's medicine? Because AD001 is not important, what is really important is to understand the rules of the USB flash drive. Little X replied, the answer is correct. Chen Chen affirmed, the reason why I wanted to kill Kate was not to vent my anger, nor was it because I was afraid that he would become a dragon slaying hero. Well, the second one does have a little bit. But the most important thing is because I need to test to test whether I can kill him. According to the plot of the movie I shot before, Kate has already delivered medicine to Parker at this time. The movie is over. If I still cannot kill Kate due to various coincidences, so it represents one thing Kate is not only the protagonist of the movie, he is likely to represent a more terrifying identity. This identity is difficult to explain. So let's call it the son of the plane. If according to the fantasy side, the son of the plane represents the will of the world, and heaven and earth love in one body, then no means can kill the other party. And if according to the scientific view, the sons of the plane should represent the laws of a world, for example, the founding fathers of the unified dynasties in ancient times, after the chaos of the world. There must be someone who can restore the troubled times and set the world. This is at that time, the law of human society in the central planes, even if the first person fails, there will be a second and a third, and there will always be one person who succeeds. After this person is completely successful, you will see his deeds in his life, and you will find that he seems to be opening the door to him. No matter how you kill, you can turn peril into safety. The ultimate achievement of great cause. Speaking of this, Chen Chen swallowed the last bite of the food, showing a grateful expression, it's just at first I'm not sure whether Kate is such a son of the plane or not, until I kill him. He, no, because how could the son of the plane be killed by me so easily? Since Kate is not the son of the plane, the speculation of Wu Disc foreseeing reality and interfering with us to make movies is naturally ruled out. Then there is only one result Kate's existence, and everything that happened these days, are the result of Wu Disc interference in reality. So that's how it is. Hearing Chen Chen's explanation, Xiao X's eyes lit up and finally understood, in other words, the U disk is likely to have the power to control cause and effect. That's right. Chen Chen nodded. In fact, before experiencing this incident, I still had some doubts about whether cause and effect existed. After all, I think that only after a person has done something, he is the son of the plane, and it's not that he becomes the son of the plane and then does this, but now I am basically sure that cause and effect are likely to really exist. Speaking of this, Chen Chen's eyes can't help but look forward to, it can be said that after memetics, we have discovered a new ability of USB flash drives, which is different from conventional science and the mysterious meme is a more obscure and more abstract force. For the time being, we can define it as dot the law of causality. Hearing Chen Chen's summary, Xiao X clapped his hands immediately, showing a sudden realization of joy. If you say this, then the specific form of causality of the USB flash drive should be the USB flash drive holder once he takes the lead in filming the movie. It will cause the film plot to appear in reality, right? There is another prerequisite, that is, the filmed movie can be recognized by the USB flash drive. Chen Chen added, 
and it doesn't necessarily appear in reality. Didn't you see that out of control too didn't appear in reality? So when writing screenwriters, you must be as close to the real world as possible. If a movie made by a U-disc holder becomes a reality, then as long as we shoot a movie with black light technology in it to unify the world, doesn't it mean that we are destined to rule the world? Little X asked again. You can try, but not very hopeful. Chen Chen shook the head, said with a bitter smile, you didn't see that we made more than just life and death, the shocking project. Later we also filmed Cancer Man and Immortality and other science fiction films, but none of them were successful. Why is this? Combined with everything that is happening in reality today, it is very possible that life and death, the shocking project can be recognized by the USB flash drive because of the final open ending. Openness implies unlimited possibilities. Infinite possibilities represent the infinite parallel universe, and the extremely reasonable cancer man and immortality were rejected because the ending was too fixed. So what is the use of this rule? Hearing Chen Chen's guess. Xiao X was dumbfounded. We can shoot movies to supplement a technology we urgently need, but it is best not to have any great plot conflicts. Chen Chen decisively said, This is the experience I have learned from this incident. You should see that in order to match the reappearance of the plot in the movie, the angel statue first appeared, and then the North American army appeared. I am going to die in it and all this is not shown in the movie. This is the backlash of the USB flash drive. In other words, this method of filming is not only a shortcut, but it is also a double-edged sword. If we use it well, we can go smoothly, but if it is not used well, human civilization may perish. Dot. After all, the information that can be presented in the movie is limited. Impossible presents everything, and the parts that are not presented can represent life, death, and infinite possibilities. Super USB Chapter 484 Super USB Chapter 484 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. However, the evolution of the angel statue is not an end. On the contrary, all this is just the beginning. The beginning of a human opening Pandora's box. A few days later, at the Earth Federal Headquarters and the Earth Federal United Front Office, representatives of each continent were sitting in their respective positions. These seats were trapezoidal around the podium, separated by a three to four meter wide corridor. Go up entirely different. Earth Federal United Front Office, a department unknown to 99% of the people of the entire Union. As one of the many authorities of the Earth Federation, unlike other departments, it only exists within the Earth Federation, not like a federal investigation. Departments and other departments have their own branch offices on all continents. You only know the name of this department when you are close to the core of each continent. At this time, at the meeting of the Earth Federal United Front Work Agency, more than a dozen representatives gathered together. These people represented the officials of their respective continents. Although many continents have long been in name only, such as Africa, Europe and the Middle East continents, but at least on the surface, these continents still maintain the dignity they deserve. At this time, a hair grey white, elderly walked to the front desk as the chairman of the United Front Work Department. The chairmanship of the Earth Federal United Front Conference is held by the member continents of the United Front Work Department in turn according to the English alphabetical order of the continents. The term of each round of chairmanship is one month. It is now in June. In order, the chairmanship is from Julian Costi in Europe. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Julian Costi the chairman of the Earth Federal United Front Work Department this month. It is an honor that I, as the representative of our continent, once again stand on this podium. Costi's voice was a bit hoarse. He raised his eyes and lowered his head to read the copy in his hand. I believe you all know that the United Front Office emergency meeting held by the Earth Federation is because of the quantum laboratory caused by an accident. Just three days ago, on the night of June 1, 2020, North America suddenly received a warning, a warning passed into the White House by hackers, warning that, 
Los Angeles is having a life and death if the disaster happens, if it is not stopped, human civilization will even be destroyed immediately, Costi raised his head and pushed his glasses, I won't elaborate on the specific warning details here, but I want to emphasize that at the same time this warning came, the top secret of the Earth Federation, the Quantum Power Lab also experienced the first major event since the establishment of the Earth Federation. In this accident, 90% of the researchers, as well as the shield bearers of all continents, died in this accident. The total death toll reached 95 people, of which the shield bearers 23 people died and 5 of the researchers died 70. Hearing this important news, representatives from all continents immediately whispered and talked in a low voice. At this moment, the representative of the central continent suddenly raised his hand and said that he needed to speak. Does Mr. Yu Chi, the representative of Zongzi district, have anything to ask? Kosti asked. Mr. Chairman, we are all aware of the death toll in this tragedy, and what we are eager to know now is, what is happening in the quantum ability laboratory? Yuchi is a middle-aged man with a resolute face. Although he was asking the chairman, he looked at the representative of North America on the opposite side. Why did this accident happen? Who was involved in the accident? Responsibility? We have the right to know all this. Of course. Costi as it should be nodded by rights. He also looked to the representatives of North America, Mr. Nancy. Can you tell the whole thing now? Yes. Hearing this, the representative of North America gave out a pile of information gloomily, and then asked, Ladies and gentlemen, deputies, do you remember the responsibilities of the Earth Federal United Front Office? The United Front Work Department, as one of the six major departments of the Earth Federation is also the centralized department with the most concentrated power and the highest degree of confidentiality. Our responsibility is simple, and that is to deal with everything that the quantum computer Adam predicts is related to human therefore, it can be said that our department controls the rise and fall and security of the entire human civilization. If the well-known Federal Investigation Agency is an internal department aimed at itself and eliminating internal threats, then our Federal United Front Office is an external department that unites with each other and targets foreign enemies. Our enemies, including but not limited to aliens, and any abnormal accidents that may threaten human civilization, this is the responsibility of our United Front Work Department. So Nancy, you mean? Costi and everyone in the audience couldn't help but look over, waiting for the words from the North American representative. Yes. This accident belongs to an abnormal incident stipulated by the Earth Federal United Front Work Agency. Nancy replied, he looked around at everyone, this is the first anomalous event that the Earth Federal United Front Front has faced that can threaten human civilization, and it is also the second anomaly encountered in North America. Hearing this, everyone's expression changed and they whispered to each other again. The so-called anomalous events refer to events that can threaten human civilization and cannot be explained by science. This article was stipulated when the Earth Federation was founded. Even the purpose of the existence of the quantum computer atom is actually to deal with such incidents. It's just that since the founding of the Earth Federation, there has never been such an incident. And no one knows why the founder of the Earth Federation United Front Office deliberately classified such a type of incident. When they heard Nancy's words at this time, they naturally understood that the reason why Nancy said that this was the second anomalous incident encountered in North America was because at the end of last year, there was a the Mengban incident in the Americas almost disrupted the social order in North America. Although it finally disappeared. North America has always insisted that this incident is a so-called abnormal incident. Is there any evidence? Hearing Nancy's words, Kirsty's expression couldn't help being solemn again. Of course there is, but the data in my hands can't be compared with Zongzi district. However, Nancy suddenly changed her words and looked at Yuchi on the opposite side. I think the representative of the central region should be more aware of it. Hearing this sentence, Everyone almost looked towards Yu Chi subconsciously. Yu Chi looked confused, and then frowns, saying, Seriously, protest. I oppose the transfer of contradictions in North America. This kind of groundless accusation, 
We firmly oppose it, Mr. Nancy. Costi was a little impatient. We all express our deep sympathy for the accident in Giza district, but now is not the time to blame each other. At least please tell us what happened. Nancy's face looked a little better when he heard these words. He was nodded, and then said, in this case, I will clarify the source. This incident started at 20 o'clock in the evening on June 1, 2020. At that time, the White House was suddenly attacked by hackers. All White House computers were automatically turned on, showing an unfathomable mystery statement. The representative of the North America region continued, This incident alarmed the president, so he came to check with his bodyguards, only to see that the passage turned out to be a warning warning that Highland, Los Angeles, North America a memetic incident is taking place in the warehouse area of Helen, which may threaten the entire mankind, requesting the president to order the blockade of the warehouse area of Helen. When I heard this, everyone showed a weird look. Even the White House network could be breached. Does the North American Network Department eat everything? Not only that, Nancy continued to add, when Mr. President approached, a little girl's voice came from the computer. The other party claimed to be a member of the Black Watch Company and used all kinds of sufficient evidence to get the president to give orders. We preserved all those evidences, and then the president gave this order under the dubious belief. It turned out to be Black Watch again. When I heard this, everyone looked at Uchi subconsciously. The Black Watch Company is a company under the Mid-Continent District. Uchi is also frowned but he just opened his mouth, but not at all interrupted him. Next, everything that happened was like a tragedy. Nancy's expression gradually became heavier, after the president gave the Los Angeles City Hall an order, she was just about to conduct a full investigation of the matter, but suddenly received news from the quantum lab saying that it was an anomaly occurred in the quantum laboratory and the quantum computer Adam actually began to use encryption to perform data operations. Not only that, but no results have been obtained. The quantum lab lost all contact after half an hour, and no one knows what happened. Hearing this, everyone was stared wide-eyed, because they already knew that some kind of accident occurred in the quantum laboratory which caused the death of all the representative shield bearers of all continents. This is a huge loss. When our troops stationed outside the quantum power lab arrived there, we only saw the bodies of the experimenters and the closed door, and the inside of the door was. When talking about this, Nancy was silent again, and then said with a sneer, I believe you absolutely can't believe it. Our soldiers opened the door and saw a row of statues and a row of angels. Statue. Angel statue. Everyone is a little puzzled, don't understand the relationship between the angel statue and the accident. I know that it is difficult for you to understand. I don't know what I am talking about, so I will just say it. Nancy looked at the gate of the gate venue and said, this accident originated from a video that can transform humans into a kind of angel statue, and this kind of statue has a kind of horror they can. Wait a minute. When I heard this, many people couldn't help it. Kirsty even coughed and interrupted the other person, Mr. Nancy. Are you sure there is nothing wrong with the previous sentence? What is it? That video can transform humans into angel statues? It means literally. Nancy expressionlessly said, the content of that video is an angel statue covering her eyes and facing away from the camera, and as you blink, you will find the angel statue moving in the camera, seemingly wanting move to the camera. This is what we saw when we sent a volunteer to conduct an experiment after the accident, and he would relay the content of the video. So he is still alive? Costi immediately grasped the point inside. He was indeed alive at the time. But, Nancy shook the head, we isolated him in a room and monitored him with a camera, but only a few hours later, the camera suddenly lost its function, and then we sent someone into it and found that he had already turned into an angel statue. Hearing this sentence, everyone was in an uproar, and they showed half-believing expressions. Quiet, everyone. Costi immediately shouted loudly suppressing the noise of everyone on the court. I know you must be a little unbelievable, but I will prove it later. Nancy couldn't help but emphasized one sentence, and then continued, 
and this video was originally predicted by a quantum computer, that is, the encrypted data before, so everyone understands why all the shields no one is spared, right? Because all the shield bearers chose to watch this video after Adam predicted, so they all became statues. Everyone hearing this reveals an unbelievable expression. And these shield bearers who were turned into statues by that mysterious video, they dot they will lose their lives and become a kind of weird monster. This kind of monster has a special property, that is, to break any the human neck with his back to it. Nancy continued, in other words, the accident in the quantum ability laboratory was caused by 23 shield bearers who turned into angel statues and then slaughtered the laboratory. Is there any evidence? Many representatives did not wait to obtain the qualifications to speak through the podium, so they asked impatient. Yes, of course. Nancy nodded without a guilty conscience, but we will definitely not release that video because it is extremely lethal. At the same time, it is not only a video but also photos and other carriers with angel statues. The ability to infect humans and assimilate humans into angel statues, so audio-visual evidence needs to be verified by other means, provided that you come to North America in person. Hearing this, Yuchi couldn't help but ask, then I would like to ask the representative of North America. What do you say has anything to do with black light technology? Of course there is a big relationship. Nancy coldly said, one of the survivors of this accident, once witnessed the legal person Chen Chen of Blackwatch Company, came to the laboratory when the accident happened. Super USB Chapter 485 Super USB Chapter 485 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. How is it possible? Hearing Nancy's words, many people once again looked in Yuchi's direction, and Yuchi was even more stunned. This is impossible. The quantum laboratory is the top secret of the Earth Federation, knowing that the laboratory exists. The high rise building does not exceed four digits, and the laboratory is all around a hundred miles away and there is no man's land. How can the legal person of blacklight technology appear there? This will ask you about the central continent. Nancy coldly snorted, no one knows exactly what happened, but the witness did see it, and the witness was a shield bearer in our North America who just resigned. He was originally intended to be a technical the consultant handed over the new shield bearer, and when the disaster happened, he suddenly divine light flashed and hid in the quantum core area. Only then did he survive the disaster and became one of the few survivors in the laboratory. Hearing the argument between the two, Kirsty, as the chairman of this month, suddenly had a headache expression. For political reasons, most of him need to maintain a consistent position with North America, but this fact is too unimaginable. It made him a little difficult to end. But when there was a hustle and bustle in the venue, the door outside the venue was suddenly knocked on. Kirsty immediately picked up a hammer and knocked on the table, quieting everyone down, and then saw a man wearing a United Front soldiers in uniform walked in. As soon as the soldier walked in, he went straight to the rostrum, and then he said something to Kirsty's ear. Kirsty heard this with an expression of astonishment, looked at the soldier, and then looked at it again. Outside the gate, this opened the mouth and said, Today's emergency meeting is temporarily terminated, well, the meeting is over. Speaking, knocked on the wooden hammer again, then winked at Nancy and hurriedly turned and left the meeting. Seeing Curtis's sudden departure, everyone was even more astonished. For a while, the meeting was messed up, and many people gathered together and whispered about the precious information they had just heard. Seeing Kirsty leaving in a hurry. Nancy seemed to have thought of something. He glanced at Yuchi who was opposite, then followed out and disappeared outside the conference hall gate. Seeing these two people leaving embarrassingly, Yuchi expressed gloomy and uncertain. After all, before he was attacked against him, the above not at all gave him any warning. He was completely ignorant of all this. Moreover, Although the open strife and veiled struggle between the various states of the Earth Federation is so lively, in the United Front, there are not many things like buckling the feces basin, 
even more how even if you really want to buckle your own feces basin, I would not choose such a bad reason. So, Blacklight Technology really got involved in this matter, thinking of this, Yuchi's heart is also stunned. For the sudden rise of Blacklight Technology, he is actually repulsive in his heart. As a politician, he has the natural instinct that every politician has, that is, to control everything in his hands maintain stability and not any unexpected situation occurred. Civilization needs stability, so there is the Earth Federation. The country needs stability, so there is an army and nuclear weapons. The people need stability, so there is a law. The existence of blacklight technology has broken this stability. What this company has done in Africa is well known on all continents starting from the construction of nuclear power plants four years ago and then based on the advantages of blessed by heaven brought by nuclear power plants, a whole city has been built at the same time, vigorously develop the industrial system and tie the entire country's population to its own chariot of interests. Take the people of the whole country as hostages and take the power of this country little by little. Up to now, how many rights does Namibia have? Apart from this, Looting all kinds of rare resources in Africa in the form of transactions is also the company's specialty. Even in order to obtain a small country's germanium mine, it secretly funded the rebel army to launch a coup until this germanium mine was completely lost in their own pockets. Originally, this kind of company should have been disbanded by the Earth Federal sanctions a long time ago, and that legal person should be sent to the Zestate in Turcourt but this company has attracted countless large European and American consortiums with its ultra-high biotechnology. Joining instantly turns the enemy into an ally, eliminating 80% of the resistance. All of these strategies are strictly speaking not at all. It's not unimaginable by other companies. It's just that those companies are technically far from reaching the black light technology level that's all. As early as the beginning of this year, the Earth Federation analyzed the biotechnology of blacklight technology. Many experts believe that the level of biotechnology currently possessed by blacklight technology has exceeded the level of Earth Federation for more than 50 years. Blacklight technology has increased the level of biotechnology in the Earth Federation, and even caused the entire human society to be affected by the biotechnology of blacklight technology. However, this is a good thing for the entire mankind. Officials of all countries can only enjoy it painfully and happily. In addition, the other party is not monopolizing these technologies, but is willing to sell to all continents. Technological talents are getting bigger and bigger, reaching the stage of this huge monster today. Otherwise, the Earth Commonwealth will give this company a monopoly or war crime, which is enough to make them unable to eat. But later, this company became more and more wrong. First, the company suddenly entered the electronics industry across fields, and even shot the black technology of holographic projection and brainwave control, and then simply tore the camouflage and began to get involved in military and aerospace. Dot. At this time, the North American region finally couldn't sit still and began to prepare to create conflicts and start working on blacklight technology. It's just that, as everyone knows later, blacklight technology is suspected of controlling a certain secret weapon, which once disrupted the normal social order in North America, and eventually led to no action. At this moment, a sentence flashed in Yuchi's mind blacklight technology will become so powerful and everyone here is responsible. He shook the head and walked out of the conference hall of the United Front Work Department behind everyone, and retrieved his mobile phone at the entrance. Immediately he saw that the indicator light on his phone turned out to be green. He subconsciously turned on the phone, and as expected, there was a caller ID, but when he saw the caller ID label, he suddenly felt refreshed. The one who called me turned out to be my immediate boss. Although Yuchi is a representative of the central continent of the Earth Federal United Front Office, he is not the top leader of the central continent in the United Front. He is not even the top three in command, just equivalent to a spokesperson. The real control is actually the big guys behind the group. Without much thought, Yuchi cleared his throat quickly and then immediately pressed the callback button. However, just as the beep sounded, 
The phone was connected on the other end. Secretary Lin, are you looking for me? You started to return to Chinese, and the words were round and round. I am about to report to you that a major event occurred in the Quantum Tongshan Laboratory, which is suspected to be related to the company Blacklight Technology. I already know. During the call, the other party's voice calmly said, Now you come out of the conference hall and come to see me in front of gate C in Hall 1. Ah, Secretary Lin, have you come to Earth Federal Headquarters? Yu Chi was suddenly stunned. It is no ordinary thing to allow Secretary Lin who is always wise, to come to the federal headquarters of Earth in Switzerland. After all, as a leader at the continental level, every move will cause endless suspicion. These people the safety protection of the company is to be done to the extreme, which can be said to affect the whole body. But in the next second, Yu Chi knew that he had asked the wrong question. He didn't wait for the other person to answer, and said quickly, I understand, I'll come right now. After that, Yu Chi hung up the phone. He kept moving towards Hall 1 under his feet, but he saw Nancy and Kirsty also walking in front of him. Seeing his hurried footsteps, he seemed to be preparing to see some great character. Yu Chi was even more puzzled. He followed them and walked to Hall 1. But at this moment, Nancy and Kirsty in front of him suddenly separated and moved towards A and B. Dot. The two directions are also the entrances of Hall 1 just like the terminal of an airport. In order to better welcome tourists, the airport has multiple terminals to welcome passengers from all corners of the world. The same is true in Hall 1. In order to welcome the leaders of various countries, the two sides will not be embarrassed to meet at the entrance. Therefore, every time a high-level person from various countries arrives at the Earth Federation, they will be diverted and entered through various entrances. Seeing this scene, Yu Chi's heart was stunned. Sure enough, not only his immediate boss, but Nancy and Gersty, the old man's immediate boss also came. It seems that the Earth Federation really seems to have a major event. Thinking of this, Yu Chi no longer paid attention to the whereabouts of the two of them. He directly followed the route of Door C to the gate of Door C. Suddenly, Yu Chi saw a group of real thing guards walking out of the car surrounded by his boss, Lin. Secretary Lin. Yu Chi hurriedly greeted him, just about to shake hands with the other party, but elderly, known as Secretary Lin, just waved her hand and moved away from her body. Until this time, Yu Chi discovered that there was still a person behind Secretary Lin. It was an elegant looking man, about 60 years old, with a back and his hair meticulously combed. At this time, he was smiling and walking in front of Yu Chi. When Ji Chi saw the opponent's face clearly, his head buzzed, almost completely down. Less than comrade, I have worked hard on you here. Seeing Yu Chi's expression, the man couldn't help but lightly said with a smile, and at the same time stretched out his hand towards Yu Chi. After all, he is an elite. After seeing the man talking to himself, he immediately came back to his senses from a dazed state. Both of his hands grasped the opponent's hand, and excitedly said, No hard work, no hard work at all. Seeing this, the man laughed kindly, and then moved towards the inside of the hall surrounded by guards. Less than, let's go to. Behind him, Secretary Lin patted Yu Chi on the shoulder and said, You are our representative on the Earth Federal United Front Office. You have many years of diplomatic experience and outstanding workability. So the chief called for you to participate. An important meeting. Speaking, Secretary Lin secretly warned, Remember, talk less and watch more at the meeting. Must remember every detail in the meeting. This is very important to us. Understand? Yes. Seeing this, Yu Chi naturally has no possibility to shirk. He repeatedly nodded. After Secretary Lin took a step, he was half of his body behind and followed Secretary Lin. Being able to participate in this kind of heavyweight conference is an opportunity that may come by with luck, but not by searching for it. An opportunity to continue to climb up, and even enter the core layer of Zongzu. Thinking of this, Yu Chi only felt agitated in his heart. He quickly took a deep breath and followed everyone into an elevator. It's just that, Yu Chi looked at the buttons in the elevator, but found that no one had pressed the buttons from beginning to end. 
he couldn't help but looked at his immediate boss in confusion, but he seemed to know what he was thinking, just shook the head calmly. About ten seconds later, the elevator doors closed with a tink. When Chi was wondering why the elevator didn't press the floor button, he suddenly felt a sense of weightlessness. He looked at the elevator floor display subconsciously, but found that the floor display on the screen was actually a negative number. Of, in other words, at this time, the elevator is not running upwards, but facing downwards. What, after staying for so long, I don't even know that the Earth Federal Headquarters has underground facilities. Yu Chi was extremely surprised, but when the elevator arrived on the floor, he was a little surprised when he saw Secretary Lin first step out of the elevator and expertly guided the elegant man forward. Secretary Lin used to be his own spokesperson. It was after several years of training in the position of the United Front Work Department, and finally he got ahead and became the current Secretary Lin. Now, I finally got this opportunity, this kind of opportunity to learn the deeper secrets of the Earth Federation. Suddenly, Yu Chi only felt that all the hardship he had suffered over the years was worth it. Just as he was thinking about it, everyone finally arrived at the destination a deep red log gate full of heavy breath. This door does not have any glass observation windows, nor any locks. It seems to be opened with one push, but Secretary Lin, who takes the lead, has a serious face. He walked in the front and slowly retreated and opened the door to confirm after the safety of the inside. He turned sideways and let the person in front of him enter first. Super USB Chapter 486 Super USB Chapter 486 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabaj Imiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. For the scene that he saw before him, Yu Chi felt like Peng Peng in his heart. This was definitely not an ordinary international conference. The leaders of the four strongest continents of the entire Earth Federation gathered together. What happened? A major event can do this? And what kind of opportunity is it for me to be fortunate to be able to visit this venue in person? Yu Chi only felt that the blood in his whole body was about to boil. His breathing was heavy and his adrenaline surged. If he hadn't kept his calm on the front lines of the world through years, years of experience, he even wanted to laugh three times. Regardless of the excitement in Yu Chi's heart, after everyone walked into the venue from their respective doors, they all naturally sat in their own positions, and occasionally people would be polite and nodded when they looked at another camp, even if they were fighting after greeting, the whole venue was silent, without any conversation. Yu Chi looked behind him, but saw that, except for the two bodyguards. The remaining soldiers stood at the end of the venue with their hands behind them, guarding their respective entrance gates. Until the quartet was all seated, Secretary Lin in front of Yu Chi looked towards the people in Europe, and at the same time asked in English, Is that person here? When I heard Secretary Lin's rounded English, Yu Chi was taken aback for a moment and then he was relieved immediately, obviously because it was a secret meeting and not a formal occasion, everyone used it by default in order to facilitate communication. English. He has already come and will enter the venue in three minutes at most. On the location of the European area, a senior official in the European area replied. However, after hearing the exchange between the two, Yu Chi was even more surprised. Obviously, the reason why his group of people came here was to meet someone, who is it that actually needs the top four leaders of the Earth Federation to meet together. Just when there was a sense of surprise in Chi Chi's mind, he suddenly heard a deep cough. The sound came from outside the door behind him. Because the meeting hadn't started yet, the door behind everyone was not at all closed, so the coughing sound easily spread along the corridor into the venue. The cough sounded weak as if there was a dying patient, and there was a slow sound of footsteps. Before seeing his voice, Yu Chi subconsciously made up the appearance of an old man with white hair and dying old man. Then, the footsteps gradually became louder, and he was clearly approaching here. Yu Chi looked back subconsciously and finally saw a complexion pale, stubborn, 
and Ilft man appearing outside the gate. It turned out to be a Midlander. Cough cough cough. The soft cough came again. The man was wearing a white pajamas. He covered his mouth with a white handkerchief and moved towards the front desk step by step. This man seems to have lost his eyebrows and hair after a long period of chemotherapy. Not only that, his whole body is so thin that he has lost his human form, and his face is so thin that he can't see what he originally was, the face. But it is such a dying ill man. He actually ignored the eyes of everyone and moved towards the front desk very naturally. He is what the supreme leader of the four great continents district is waiting for. Seeing this man, Yuchi was surprised. He watched the man walking by his side. At the same time, the politicians he had ever seen flashed in his mind, but no one could match him. His looks. Who is this man so thin that he can't even tell his age? It's just that, obviously, no one will answer Yu Chi's doubts in the silent venue at this time. Everyone just watched the man walk up to the podium step by step, and even Yu Chi was a little worried in case the other person was walking. What to do if you die suddenly? At this moment, Secretary Lin on the side suddenly touched Yu Chi lightly under the table. Yu Kairuo turned around but saw that the chief and secretary Lin both turned their heads and glanced at him. Yu Chi's heart moved, and the clear comprehension came over immediately. He quickly stood up and walked directly to support him, Old mister, I will help you up. Thank you. The man immediately responded with a smiling nodded, Ren Yiki supported him, and immediately walked to the podium under everyone's attention. After supporting the other party to the podium, Yukikai walked down a little embarrassed and returned to his seat. Everyone, I, uh, cough cough cough. The man just wanted to speak, and then there was another rapid cough, which made Yuchi feel painful. After coughing for a while, the man sighed in relief. He slowly put down the handkerchief, and lifted the head slightly for breath. Suddenly, the man's eyes and everyone present met each other for a moment. When the man's gaze was too open, Yu Chi suddenly heart shivered with cold, because he was suddenly shocked that the man's eyes were completely different from his dying Leal image, but extremely dark and bright, just like the night sky. The unchanging stars are like black holes that can inhale human souls. The two extremely contrasting feelings are intertwined together, creating a strange feeling. He has never seen such a unique pair of eyes. Good afternoon, gentlemen. You are welcome to come here in your busy schedule, cough cough. The next second, the man suddenly spoke, with a tired and hoarse voice, at the same time, I am very grateful for your presence, because it represents that you are willing to listen to me to explain all this and give me such a huge trust. I believe that in the coming time, I will definitely make you feel that this trip is worthwhile. Well, there is no need to say more about these scenes. At this moment, the President of North America suddenly waved his hand impatiently, with a gloomy expression, go straight to the topic, I hope you can give us reasonable explanation for the Los Angeles incident. No problem. The man was nodded, he showed a smile, but compared with his own skeleton-like image, this smile was full of weirdness. First of all, I would like to ask everyone, do you still remember when the Earth Federation was established? When will it be established? Hearing the man's question, the President of Northern Sea Continent turned around, showing a look of remembrance. It was around 1992. I still remember that year one just returned from East Germany and witnessed the collapse of the Soviet Union. Even though more than 70% of the people in the last referendum hoped to keep the Soviet Union, the upper level rulers had already made up their minds. To be precise, it should be April 20, 1992. The president of the European region added, I also remember that day when the upper level suddenly heard a resolution to integrate the whole world, strengthen the ties between various countries on the basis of the United Nations, and form a huge institution. Hearing the answer from the two, the man was nodded and said slowly, So, what happened back then? And why did the Earth Federation appear? This is classified. The leader sitting in front of Yu Chi immediately reminded him kindly. I understand. The man immediately replied, In fact, although I don't know the details, I know a general idea. There was a person who united many countries and created the Earth Federation, 
and that person's name. It is a blank. Hearing this sentence, the leaders of all continents were face changed. Among them, the president of the European region asked in shock, this is the top secret, and the number of people in each continent will not exceed five. How do you know all this? Not only did I know, I also knew that he left behind the quantum computer Adam, an instrument that can predict the future. With this instrument, the Earth Federation can continue to this day. The man was likely coughed and continued, am I right? Hearing the conversation among the people, Yuchi even felt heaven and earth turning upside down in his heart. The Earth Federation was actually promoted by an unnamed person, who is it that has such a powerful energy? You are not wrong. At this time, the president of Northern Sea Continent suddenly said with a laugh, I was shocked when I heard about this news, and even used secret power to investigate the identity of that person, but the strange thing is, the entire world seems to have erased his traces, whether it is the secret information of the Earth Federation or the Northern Sea Continent, there is no information about him, that's right, cough cough, the man was nodded, showing a serious look, if there is something in this world that can make you wonder, I think that mysterious person disappeared out of thin air, should he be ranked first? Not only the name disappeared, but the identity, family background, nationality, and all traces of life of the other party were all disappeared. If it were not for the existence of the regional federation to confirm his existence, I am afraid that this disappearance would not even be noticed. Don't you think it's terrifying? Do you have information about that person? The president of North America asked again, please don't sell it, okay? The man hearing this slowly nodded. He held the podium, took a deep breath a little, and then continued, I don't know who that person is, but I know why he disappeared. P. What? What is the reason? The presidents and other high-level officials of various countries showed unexpected expressions one after another, and they couldn't wait to listen to them. I believe you all received the information I shared before you came, right? Information about MEMS. The man answered not at all directly, but sold it off and spoke slowly. The term meme is based on the ancient Greek and evolved from the term gene of biology. Dawkins wrote in the book The Selfish Gene that evolution does not depend on the specificity of genetics. The chemical basis, which only relies on the existence of self-replicating transmission units, is called a meme. Many people may mistakenly believe that memes are so-called internet buzzwords, which are stalks. In fact, this is not right. The man coughed and continued to explain. The meme defined by our human civilization is indeed a stalk, but the meme I define here is a kind of stalk that includes stalks, but it is far more influential than internet buzzwords. The existence of force. Speaking, the man waved his hand slightly, and the word meme written in several languages appeared on the white screen behind him. A meme is a unit of information not an entity. It is a new type of discipline that can change human civilization. It is also a discipline that has never been seen before humans. The reason why we humans have never I discovered this subject, not because we humans did not discover it, but because it did not exist on our earth before. You just said for, right? Listening to what the man said, the elegant man in front of Yuchi suddenly spoke, in other words, now they have appeared in earth, it's almost like that. Men nodded, no one knows how memes are born, but I tend to think that the internet has spawned. As the internet world has become more developed, more and more internet buzzwords have emerged. These internet popular some of the language can only be very popular for a while, and some have been praised for a long time. I suspect that this wireless possibility led to the birth of the first batch of memes, the angel statue a few days ago is a meme that is extremely threatening to humans. Speaking of this, a paragraph of text appeared again on the screen behind the man. This text was densely packed. On the right side of the text, a cartoon of an angel statue standing in place with his eyes covered was drawn. Everyone immediately moved towards the screen and looked at it and the content of the text is, meme name, weeping angel, special containment procedures, 
weeping angel should be placed in a location that cannot be observed by anyone. Direct or indirect observation is not allowed. Anyone who sees the full picture of weeping angel must undergo permanent isolation measures. Description. Crying angel is a pattern painted with blood. The pattern is composed of 13,236 blood spots. Each blood spot is between 0. 30.5 cm in diameter. The blood spots together form a pattern of angel statues covering their eyes. Weeping angel is contagious. The transmission method is visual transmission. Anyone who sees the whole picture of crying angel will be infected, and the infected person will be transformed into a strange memetic derivative within 90 minutes. Things in an operation, four mercenaries inadvertently saw the full picture of crying angel. So to prevent memetic infection, all four were destroyed at the Blacklight Steel Making Plant in the Life Science City Industrial Park in Namibia, Africa. In the furnace, more than three months later, when the steel produced in the steel making furnace arrived in Los Angeles, North America, a memetic infection occurred and a large number of derivatives were produced. In order to distinguish the crying angel from its derivatives, Special instructions for distinguishing. Name of the derivative, Crying Angel 1. Special containment procedures. According to the size of Crying Angel 1, it should be placed in a closed space that is more than 2 meters high and 1 meter wide. The containment material is not limited, but it should be at least MOS hardness 4. Above, otherwise, Crying Angel 1 has the risk of escape. When entering the Crying Angel 1 containment chamber, the number of personnel must not be less than three at any time and the door must be relocked. At least two people must maintain eye contact with the crying angel throughout the entire process until all all personnel left the containment chamber and locked it again. Description. Crying Angel 1 is an angel statue similar to granite. The general posture is that the face is covered with hands. The head is slightly lowered at 1525 degrees and the wings are slightly open, observe from human eyes it is in the form of a stone statue, but once humans look away, crying angel one will change its movements and approach humans at a very fast speed, the known method of killing is to twist the neck, no other killing methods have been found, it is known that weeping angel one is a derivative of weeping angel, which has indestructible characteristics. It is infected through human observation of weeping angel. At the same time, anything that carries weeping angel one imagery includes but not limited to photos and videos, they all have the same infectious power as the crying angel body, but the portrait is not among them. Seeing this densely packed explanation, both Yuchi and the others showed extremely surprised expressions. Could it be said that this was the cause of the Los Angeles incident and the Quantum Power Lab incident? Super USB Chapter 487 Super USB Chapter 487 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Finally, a senior official in North America suddenly said, that is to say, that is why that many angel statues appeared in the quantum power laboratory? Yes. Men nodded, presumably you should have experimented with people on death row. The quantum computer Adam predicted is nothing but a video about the crying angel. You don't want to believe that Adam will betray own, but in fact Adam did not betray you, because that video is indeed okay. The real problem is not the video but the meme. Everyone was silent when they heard everything the people on the stage said keep on saying. Although this incident happened in North America, whoever can sit here does not have a wide range of information acquisition channels. He knew everything that happened that day, but he always knew it and didn't know why. Now the other party it explained all this with something called memes. Yuchi didn't know what others were thinking, but he already believed it a little, because Nancy the former representative of the United Front in North America, said something similar and held himself accountable. Wait. Suddenly, Yuchi immediately cleared the comprehension. The man on the stage turned out to be a person with blacklight technology. No wonder he didn't know each other. It's just that the person who came was not the founder of blacklight technology, but a terminally ill patient. At this time, the man on the stage is still constantly explaining. Later, 
In our experiments, we found that the statue has a very strange nature. It has the ability to influence any monitoring equipment. This ability is invalid in the petrochemical state. But once the observation is lost, the crying angel will come alive and the equipment responsible for monitoring it will immediately fail. In other words, no one can see what the crying angel looks like when no one is watching, even the monitoring device itself cannot observe. When we look at it, it is completely a statue, and even the hardness is comparable to that of a statue. It can be easily broken into pieces, but no matter where we throw these statue pieces or how many small pieces we disperse, we only need if we look away a little, we will find that the statue has recovered again. This is the indestructibility of the statue. As for why it is so, we tend to say that the statue itself does not exist. We cannot kill a meme because a meme is a concept, and a concept is immortal. So, do they have any weak spot? Under the stage, a senior official sitting next to the president in a European group suddenly asked. Weak spot is simple and simple, it is sight. The man coughed twice and continued, I believe you have also discovered, why the crying angel can't break our necks directly, but has to play with you and two three wooden people. It's not actually this, do you and memes must have such a hobby, because memes have no thoughts. It is like wind and rain. It is a natural phenomenon, a natural law, and the law of this meme is like this, with the sight of it it will never be able to harm humans. Hearing this sentence, many people showed disappointed expressions. This is completely nonsense. But the next second, the man suddenly changed his words, apart from this, we found that the crying angels always cover their eyes, not because they really like crying like its literal name, but because of their the line of sight also has the effect of observation. Once two or more crying angels look at each other, these crying angels will never be able to move. Yuchi hearing this suddenly brightened. Although he had never seen a real crying angel, he could still think of it at this time. If this article is used well, it is indeed a killing move for the crying angel. Also, we have also found in experiments that if we can kill the transformer in advance during the process of transforming the statue from a human, it can also stop the transformation of a human to a crying angel. The man continued to speak. He sighed and said with satisfaction, Above, these are all our research on crying angels. After listening to all this, everyone subconsciously looked towards North America, seeming to want to get the verification of these words from the mouths of everyone in North America. Temporarily not at all found errors and omissions. Seeing this, Nancy in North America is a bit reluctant to nod it, but he is suddenly frowned and asks faintly in his tone, what you said has several points of truth, but if you say everything if it is true, then how should your black watch company compensate for the loss of the quantum power lab and Los Angeles city? After all, all of this is caused by your black watch company. Hearing this, several high-ranking officials in the European area also joined in, and Nancy continued to speak and overbearing said, in the middle of the night of June 2nd, outside of the Highland Warehouse area in Los Angeles, one of our army units suddenly lost contact with their headquarters. When they found out, they had already been wiped out. Don't say this. Also made by the crying angel. We Black Watch Company does not know about this. The man's expression replied flatly, and without waiting for Nancy to continue to ask, he changed his words again. Then back to our previous topic, I think after this example, you should understand that the one who contributed to the United Nations synthesis the Earth Federation, but the mysterious person who doesn't even have a name, has disappeared. When I heard this, everyone had an expression, and Nancy swallowed the words he was about to say. Do you mean that the mysterious person who united the whole world and created the Earth Federation? He also disappeared because of memes. Suddenly, all questions began. That's right. The man showed a solemn expression, but what I want to say is that he is not relying on ordinary memes, but a kind of heterogeneous meme and time m. And time m? Everyone murmured in low voices, wishing to break up all these words, and analyze each word clearly. If a meme is a unit of information and its meaning is to copy, mutate and spread, 
then anti mem is the opposite. A haze flashed in the man's eyes, and he whispered, any anti mem is unknowable, because its existence does not emit any information, just like the black hole in the information, all perceptions will be in contact when the opponent is involved, he is involved in a black hole, in other words, maybe that person was by our side, even we know him well, the president of the northern sea continent district was a little bit ridiculous, but because of anti-memetics, we forgot about him, yes, ma'am nodded, however, the impact of anti-mem on memory is not only to make people unable to remember it, but also to make people lose interest in it and eliminate all traces of themselves in reality. This is the most terrifying. Ignorance is fearful, but if you are ignorant and don't try to acquire knowledge, then it's true despair. It is through the use of anti-memetic that that person can hide himself and eliminate everything about human world and himself. If what you are saying is true, doesn't it mean that our human civilization could use memetic technology more than 30 years ago? Secretary Lin frowned suddenly asked, but doesn't this contradict your previous statement? You said that there were no memes on earth before, don't these two sentences contradict themselves? It's not really a contradiction, gentlemen. When pointed out the weak spot, the man showed no embarrassment at all, but showed a weird smile because I didn't say that the anti-mem came from earth, don't take the rhythm. After hearing this sentence, Secretary Lin immediately started, and everyone also showed their looking thoughtful expression. The representative of the United Front Work Department, Nancy, was just about to say something, but at this moment, he suddenly saw the President of North America look at him, he took a deep breath, slammed the table and stood up. Enough. I admit that if you are a speaker, you are indeed qualified, but what you say should at least stand on the evidence. Now, I only see a series of hypotheses, which are not enough believe it. Evidence? The man turned his head in some confusion, he raised his handkerchief and lightly coughed. I am the evidence. You? Nancy showed a trace of sulking anger at being played. He just wanted to say something, suddenly felt that he saw a flash. The next second, the silhouette of the man who was still 10 meters away suddenly flashed and suddenly appeared in front of him. Nancy was so frightened that she stumbled back. It took less than half a second. The man who was dying Leal crossed a distance of more than 10 meters. This strange speed shocked everyone, almost a condition. The reflection was normal. The three bodyguards in North America took out their guns at the same time and aimed their guns at the sudden man. However, the man only showed a weird smile. He was beckoned with one hand. The guns in the hands of these bodyguards seemed to come alive. They flew out from the hands of a few people with rustling sound, and flew directly in front of the man. Suck. A single thought flashed through everyone's hearts at the same time. Now, not only the high-level bodyguards in North America, but the bodyguards and soldiers in the entire venue all pulled out their guns and a dozen guns were aimed at the man in the center. For a while, the atmosphere fell into freezing point. Chen Chen, what do you want to do? Several senior officials stood up and looked towards the man in front of them inexplicably angry. Don't be nervous, I'm just doing a demonstration that's all. The man looked all around. At this moment, he suddenly changed his previously sick temperament. He seemed to be a different person. His eyes were sharp and his whole body exuded a disturbing breath. Kakaka, click, jingle bells. Following the man's words, the three pistols were automatically decomposed directly in midair, almost in the blink of an eye, the three guns were completely decomposed into the most basic parts, scattered like a puzzle ding ding dong dong together. Seeing this scene, everyone was stunned. They watched the three guns automatically disintegrate as if they were alive. Deliberately deceiving themselves is just magic, but what kind of magic can do such a step? If this is not enough to explain. Then, the man spoke again, spreading his hands to face everyone, and then he moved towards the podium directly. Even when everyone was shocked by the fact that he had disassembled the firearms in the void before, he even walked towards the wall at the end of the podium, and even stepped on the wall after reaching the end. Next, a scene that made everyone feel unimaginable even more opid like a hydrogen balloon. 
the man directly broke away from gravity, and his body stepped on the wall 90 degrees vertically. This is not the end, he is still continue to walk forward. When he reached the top of the wall, he stepped on the ceiling again. Patter, patter, patter. With the sound of footsteps, the man has completely stood on the ceiling. He spread his arms to face everyone, and even the hair and the corners of his clothes have not changed as if gravity does not exist. Dot. At this moment, everyone looked up at this man, and the entire conference hall absolute silence. Click. The president of Northern Sea Continent was stunned at all of this. He didn't even notice that the subconsciously turning pen dropped to the ground, the heads and officials of the countries were shocked. Everyone was in a petrified state. But this is not the end. In the next second, everyone suddenly felt lighter. Many people subconsciously cry out in surprise, and then amidst the exclamation of everyone, except for the president of the four great continents district, the rest all of them floated uncontrollably. Yuchi only felt that there seemed to be countless pairs of invisible big hands all over his body beginning to pull himself. He was struggling subconsciously, but no matter how hard he struggled, he couldn't resist the power in the dark. Float towards the roof. Excuse me for being unreasonable, guys, do you still think all this is magic? The man on the stage showed the expression of remaining calm and composed while handling pressing affairs. At this time, his words already had an incomparable persuasive power. Super USB Chapter 488 Super USB Chapter 488 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Just when everyone was shocked and inexplicably shocked, Yuchi felt his body suddenly loosened, and he started to fall head down at a speed of free fall. The ceiling of the venue is 5060 meters high from the ground. Once it falls with his head to the ground, he will not die or be injured. Yuchi suddenly screamed, not only him, but also all the people who were pressed on the ceiling dumplings fell one after another, and the screams of the whole venue were one after another. However, because Chi instinctively closed his eyes, when he was about to make intimate contact with the ground, the imaginary impact came not at all. Yuchi slowly opened his closed eyes, only to realize that he was once again frozen in midair, only about one meter away from the ground. Immediately, an invisible thrust came, and Yuchi's body suddenly turned 180 degrees, from the top of the head and the feet back to the top and the feet. His feet stepped on the ground again. Call back to his seat in shock. Yuchi was already face deathly pale. He looked at all around in a sweat, but saw that the others had regained their freedom just like him. At this time, everyone looked at the ceiling. The man on the floor had a hell expression on his face. If I could use magic to explain before, then everything I have experienced now is no longer what magic can explain. Wait. Suddenly? Yuchi seemed to realize something. Just now, the group called out the man's name, which means that except for himself and a few people, everyone who came to the meeting knew that this man was who. And the other party's name is Chen Chen, huh? Hearing this familiar name, Yuchi thought a little blankly, and then he seemed to realize something and suddenly raised his head. He is Chen Chen. At this moment, Yuchi finally understood why the number one leader of the four great continents district was gathered together, why a non-political person would appear in such an important venue, and why he would act as the speaker stand here. There is only one reason, and that is that he is the founder of Black Light Technology a person who can defy the North American government, can make the arms business into the Earth Federation in a private capacity and even use his own technology to impact the entire human society legendary characters. Chen Chen. Only in his memory, Chen Chen was clearly a young man, but now standing on the stage is a patient who is so thin that he is extremely ill. At this moment, a famous online picture flashed in Yu Qi's mind. There was an old man with white beard and hair and a few lines of accompanying text beside it. A person who is a real scientific researcher is wise, calm, and understands life. His derived secret is scientific research in the morning, scientific research at noon, and scientific research at night. You see, he is almost 30 years old now, 
and his spirit is still very good. Leave aside you cheese inner thoughts. At this time, this thin man opened his arms, slowly floated from the ceiling, and then stood firmly on the ground. Everyone, now you still think this is everything magic? Everyone wiped their sweat silently, and there was silence in the audience. Actually, the crying angel incident was not the first memetic incident that occurred in Earth. Seeing that no one spoke, Chen Chen continued talking. His voice gradually became low and reverberated in the conference hall with a sense of depression. I believe you should remember the dream that happened in North America. The male incident and three statues incident two years ago were also similar incidents. They were only quietly resolved after being detected by our black light technology. This made a human civilization not encounter to the corresponding crisis. What? Several high-level officials in North America immediately patted the table. Among them Nancy stood up angrily. You did the three statues missing two years ago? Sorry. Chen Chen slightly nodded, with an apologetic smile. If human civilization needs a person who is hiding in the dark and walking forward, then all sins, let us blacklight technology to bear it. You, Nancy wanted to say something, but was stopped by the senior officials on the side. Putting it that way, your black watch company does master the technology of controlling memes. The president of North America's expression grave looked towards Chen Chen, please answer this question truthfully. Yes but only fur. Chen Chen stared at each other, calmly nodded. As this passage is said, everyone present is complexion changed, and everyone's eyes looking towards Chen Chen are instantly full of complexity. Whether it's the angel statue incident or the last Mengman incident, everyone understands that the meme this thing is far more dangerous and unstable than nuclear weapons. After all, Nuclear weapons can only destroy human civilization at best. Memes can destroy everything known. Therefore, Chen Chen, who claims to have acquired memetic technology, has instantly upgraded from being an ordinary person to being on an equal footing with the four great continents area. Memetic technology is far from being thoroughly studied by human civilization. At this time, Chen Chen said frankly, and the reason I know this is because I am a successor. I inherited the legacy of the person who disappeared in this world, so I was able to establish a famous black light technology, and finally stand in front of you. Hearing this sentence, everyone's expressions even flashed, thinking about the truthfulness of Chen Chen's words. I believe that with your intelligence, you should have already noticed something wrong. What is the purpose of the existence of the Earth Federation? Isn't it to unite the power of all mankind? But why do we have to have no foreign enemies? Unite? Chen Chen stood on the stage and slowly said, Also, the quantum computer Adam is the legacy left to us by that man. What is his purpose? And why should he leave this machine that can predict the future? If the first two are not and so on. Then the existence of the Earth Federal United Front Office is even more suspicious. Hearing Chen Chen's rhetorical question, Yu Qi couldn't help but flash through the United Front Work Department's classification of various incidents, one of which was the so-called abnormal incident. It turns out that the Earth Federal United Front Office and the quantum computer Adam existed for memes such as human disasters. As Chen Chen said so many things that only the real high level can know. Yu Qi's heart surged, and countless previous doubts collapsed at this time and were completely exposed to the sun. Next, at this moment, the leaders of the four great continents district also flashed to days, who could tell the secret of Theblank, and at the same time they could create something from nothing to know all this, plus Chen Chen now for his achievements, everyone believed at least half of his words. If you really are the heir of Thenon existent, what are you going to do now? At this moment, the president of the Northern Sea Continent suddenly spoke. He took a deep look at Chen Chen, and what did you invite us here today to get? I don't need anything, because it is not me who really needs it, but human civilization. Chen Chen lightly said with a smile, I think the reason why you didn't at all disband the Earth Federation should have found some clues. I have to say that the current human situation is actually very dangerous. P. The man told me that this world is far more cruel than we thought. In the vast universe, 
Earth is like an isolated island in the ocean, and human civilization is a castle built by children with fine sand, exquisite but fragile, any big wave hits, the civilization that mankind is proud of will completely collapse, and even a splash of water will not appear, apart from this. He also said a theory called the great filter of civilization if the planet is compared to a whole, then a planet with life is actually a human being with a soul, but we I don't understand that the emergence of civilization for the planet is not a surprise, but like a cancer cell, it is developing at the cost of harming the planet itself, therefore, each ecosystem develops a corresponding civilization and needs to withstand the resistance of the planet immune system. As long as the civilization is not destroyed, this resistance will continue. Chen Chen continued to speak with a solemn expression, our human perception until now is wrong. From the experience of World War II until now, almost no large-scale disaster has occurred, which made us produce this world which is very safe, but if you look at history, you will find that this kind of security is just an accidental phenomenon, the history of human civilization has always been based on countless natural and man-made disasters, so he united all mankind to create the Earth Federation, in order to deal with this crisis from the planet and even the depths of the universe, this is what told me, speaking, Chen Chen stood in front of everyone, spread his arms, as the successor of that person, I must inherit its will, so I hope that the entire human race can unite, at least everyone here can unite get up and jointly deal with the crisis that may appear in the future. This is the purpose of my trip, a real union. After hearing Chen Chen's words, everyone did not immediately reply, but bowed their heads in thought. If we agree, what needs to be paid and what can we get from it? The president of North America suddenly asked, I will share the legacy I got from that man. Chen Chen replied without the slightest hesitation, in this legacy, in addition to the technologies that I have released today, there are some more secret technologies not at all announced. Speaking, Chen Chen suddenly waved his hand, and dozens of flying papers fell in front of the leaders of many continents. These people picked up the papers in their hands and looked at them. Everyone showed shock and inexplicable expressions. Dot. Because, although there are only a few directories in this material, all it contains are things that are difficult to obtain for humans yearn for something even in dreams. Super AI technology, normal temperature superconductor, star simulator reactor, Super Tokamak Reactor, Mini Hadron Collider, Nuclear Power Spaceship, Fully Automatic Medical Instrument. The densely packed catalog almost dazzled everyone's eyes, because everyone present knew that every kind of thing in it was enough to trigger a new industrial revolution. At this moment, a stormy sea is completely born in everyone's hearts. In addition to commercial use of these technologies, I can take them out and share them with everyone. Chen Chen spread out his hands, facing the crowd with a bewildering tone. The fully automatic medical device can cure all human diseases so far, and at the same time greatly extend the human lifespan by up to 300 years. Normal temperature superconductors, abandoning low temperature superconductors must maintain the ultra low temperature of 100 degrees below zero and can maintain superconducting properties at room temperature, which is enough to subvert the entire industrial system. The mature super tokamak reactor can have a maximum Q value of over 10,000. Once completed, human civilization will enter the era of unlimited energy, and human beings will officially evolve into a transplanetary species. There are more legacy, I can share with you all continents. Chen Chen continued, and what you need to pay is very simple, and that is to protect all mankind with me wholeheartedly. I hope that everyone can work with me to establish a special institution dedicated to protect a civilization. The agency will have extremely high authority, become a legal armed department independent of the federal government, and have privileges equivalent to the Earth Federation Army and can operate anywhere in the world without being obstructed by the law. Until Chen Chen's request, everyone came back to his senses. Among them, the elegant man Yukisai thought for a while, and then chuckled slightly, 
if you can really lead the entire human civilization to resist the harm from the planet, what's wrong with giving you this permission? The premise is that you cannot interfere in the internal affairs of all continents, let alone use this department for warfare. The president of North America added, of course, Chen Chen nodded, seriously said, please rest assured, my ambition is not in rights, but in immortality, which should be able to be seen from my first technology. In that case, what is the composition of this organization? The president of the Northern Sea Continent District said curiously, and how do you plan to establish this institution and what is its function? The composition of the organization. I allow each continent to send one person to the highest decision-making level of this organization. One is responsible for the management and control of the organization, and the other is for supervision. The specific identity of this person should be the organization's one of the top secrets can only be replaced by a code name. Chen Chen not even think said, the decision-makers at the highest decision-making level have the right to vote and can make effective suggestions to the organization and I am also a member of the highest decision making level. If you can, I hope you can invest in this institution to form a foundation like institution jointly invested by four great continents and our black light technology, and the name of this secret institution, we can call it, black light foundation. Super USB chapter 489. Super USB chapter 489. To you can search for I have a super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. A few hours later, Chen Chen's body, which looked malnourished, walked out of the black ball transfer chamber. With the completion of the third reactor with a power of 10 million kilowatts, the speed at which the U disk can obtain energy is getting faster and faster. During this time, he has taken in several Gantz black balls and hidden one of them in Earth is near the federal headquarters so you can come and go anytime. However, Chen Chen now has deep sunken cheeks, looks pale, and has no hair and beard all over his body. No wonder some people regard him as an old man who is dying of illness. You know, this is the result of Chen Chen's two days of cultivation. When he just turned into a body, his complexion was even worse. However, this is only temporary. According to Dark Knight's recovery speed, Chen Chen can smoothly recover to his previous appearance within a week at most. At this time, Chen Chen walked out of the teleportation room with a relaxed look in his eyes, and in great spirits, he was not as sick as before. Obviously, Chen Chen had a great degree in that meeting. Performance Ingredients Your Godfather, it seems that this negotiation is going well. But as soon as he returned to the Spire Experimental Base, there was a little ex's voice beside him. Chen Chen turned around and saw Xiao ex standing aside. She jumped out from the side like a little girl prank, seeming to want to scare Chen Chen. Yes, it went well. Chen Chen nodded, I promise to provide them with a few technologies that can change the productivity of the entire society, enough to make them more than a few times in military strength. Speaking of this, Chen Chen couldn't help but smile at the corner of his mouth. Apart from this, I also agreed to provide them with a blacklight automatic medical platform for each continent in the four great continents area. After all, if they can only stare at them if they design the drawings. After all, the technology inside is completely beyond our current technology. Under such favorable conditions, how could they not agree to my proposal? But we also need to be cautious to prevent the other person from turning their faces. Hearing Chen Chen's words, Xiao X rarely reminded him, after all, the other party is four polities, especially when they gradually know us. Don't worry, of course I know that this is seeking a tiger's skin. Chen Chen slightly laughed, and then seriously said, that's why I didn't give them information about memes, nor did I give them Gvires and Blackwater and other weapons capable of destroying mankind. We have to hold on to these things what we have is like nuclear deterrence. We don't need to release these things, we just need to let them know that we have it. Then why did we establish this multi-party secret agency? Xiao X tilted his head and was a little confused. Is it really like the former owner of the USB flash drive Zhaoshan said? in order to resist the revenge from planet. Of course it doesn't stop the Chen Chen not even think said, 
This can only be regarded as an excuse at best. The reason why I pulled them into the water and established the Black Light Foundation, apart from responding to disasters from the planet and the universe, is another more important use. That is to deal with the guy hiding in the dark. The one who keeps setting traps and wants to put me to death, whether he is Wang Zai or Zashan, or even someone else. Since he is ready to go to war with me, then he must be me preparations for counterattack, and this organization is the means to tie the entire Earth Federation to my war chariot. Speaking of this, Chen Chen suddenly laughed, and a cold light flashed in his eyes, from today on, this new organization will become a legal armed department independent of the world government, and has far more authority than the Earth Federation army, can move anywhere in the world without being hindered by the law. At the same time, I have hired hundreds of aerospace experts from them in the name of loan. These talents will assist our space center and improve our space level. Why is Musk so obsessed with space flight? Because once he takes control of space technology, he is equivalent to controlling the future of mankind. Speaking of this, Chen Chen suddenly looked towards the girl who gradually became slim on the side, and at the same time a secret smile was provoked at the corner of his mouth. Are you ready? Blacklight technology is about to open a new chapter, from now on, we are about to enter the era of space flight. Dot. On June 5, 2020, the Earth Federal Central Continent, Northern Sea Continent, Europe, and North America, the top four regions almost all released at the same time, with an amazing preferential policy, all the way the green light was given and the conditions for black light technology to open branches in all continents were agreed. Suddenly, Xia Yin's intense negotiations that lasted for nearly five months finally came to an end. The news instantly fermented on the internet and shocked countless people's attention. In an instant, the stocks of all famous pharmaceutical companies in the world plummeted, and electronic technology companies on all continents were also affected. For a while, there was a global uproar! Exclamation mark. In the fields of biomedicine and electronic technology, they continue to shout the wolf is coming. The senior executives of these companies have put pressure on the government and inquired about the inside of the negotiations of the continental government. I was frightened because this document came from the top of the four great continents district. At this point, everyone fully understands that in the entire Earth Federation, no one can stop the development of this Black Watch company. However, this is just the beginning. When Blacklight Technology announced its cooperation with four great continents, it suddenly announced that the company has developed a medicine that can completely cure Alzheimer's disease. Carry out clinical trials immediately in the four great continents area. This will be the 139th clinical trial conducted by Blacklight Technology all over the world at the same time, and the first 138 will be trials of various anti-cancer targeted drugs. At this moment, almost everyone has only one idea left. The black light technology is crazy. According to this new medicine, if it is mild and moderate Alzheimer's disease, it can be completely cured. But if Alzheimer's disease is severe, it can be cured. But it is also impossible to make the patient reach the level of intelligence before the illness. The reason is that the essence of Alzheimer's disease is the death of a large number of brain cells and this death is an irreversible state. It is normal for the IQ to decrease significantly, and there is only one way to improve in this case, that is neural stem cell transplantation, ventricular puncture transplantation, lumbar puncture subarachnoid injection transplantation, or intravenous injection transplantation is the only way to transplant neural stem cells into the brain to replace the necrotic part to generate new brain cells. In order to improve part of the loss of intelligence, the human brain is the most mysterious organ of the human body, so this method can only be said to be improvement, not cure, because even if it is replaced with new brain cells, those brain cells are not the brain cells they used to be no matter the memory or personality of the patient, there will be considerable changes, which is also inevitable. Of course, for this situation, Chen Chen can also use the brain repair chip in Robocop to solve it, just like the father of DNA, 
but at least 50% in that technology. It cannot be popularized within years, so there is no way for ordinary person. However, this is just an appetizer. Just before the heat has completely dropped, the top four strong regions of the Earth Federation, such as the Central Continent District, announced again, the four Great Continents District will cooperate with Black Light Technology, launch a large-scale cooperative project on the artificial sun, commonly known as controlled nuclear fusion. This project is called CURB Project named after the initials of the continents and black light technology. Even North America and Europe have openly declared that this project will be completed within three years the research and development of nuclear fusion reactor. When the time comes, mankind will completely master controllable nuclear fusion, and put an end to this most difficult project in history. As soon as the news was sent, it shocked the world again without any surprise. Outside the four great continents area, countless countries and polities seemed to smell the fishy cats to inquire about the inside story, but at this time, the four great continents area the position of the company has remained surprisingly consistent, that is, no matter how you coax and pester, I will never let go. Obviously, just like nuclear weapons in the past, the four great continents area is ready to monopolize the technology of controlled nuclear fusion. For this matter, the remaining continents can be said to hate gnash the teeth, but they are still helpless. What these people really can't understand is why the four great continents area has to bring black light technology. This private company? Don't say. At this moment, many people have the idea of send cold shivers down one's spine, perhaps. Some of the core technologies of controlled nuclear fusion are related to black light technology, not to mention the shock after the clues were analyzed by all parties in the world from the CURB project. A few days later, a small shield machine with a diameter of about 5 meters was assembled in the Minaret Experimental Base and was planned according to the previous plan. The track, bit by bit, got into the rock formation. Suddenly, a new secret project started at the Spire Experimental Base. Chen Chen intends to build a ring-shaped particle accelerator more than 700 meters deep underground around the periphery of the Spire Laboratory. This troidal accelerator does not need to be too huge. The circumference is only about 3 kilometers, which is only an tenth of the largest particle accelerator in the world. Once completed, it will surround the entire minaret experimental base and move the minaret surrounded by it. As for some of these core devices, Chen Chen has already acquired them in Europe and North America. At the beginning, this was originally a task assigned by Chen Chen to Xiaoyin, but the plan could not keep up with the changes. With the complete leak of the memetic technology, Chen Chen had to show off to the Earth Federation in advance, and finally evolved into the current situation. The reason why this particle accelerator is not built larger is because technically, this particle accelerator will be much more powerful than the world's largest particle accelerator in Geneva, Switzerland. It is just room temperature superconductor technology. Let the equipment reduce the volume of 23. Apart from this, the technology of black light technology is obtained from Elysium. Compared with the actual particle accelerators built in Europe, it is undoubtedly much more advanced and the power is hundreds of times higher. Therefore naturally, it does not need to be too big. Moreover, with this accelerator, in addition to studying high energy physics, Chen Chen's most annual for something even in dreams is the so-called high offset armor. Once it can be called the hardest in the solar system Chen Chen's strength will be greatly improved, and even instantly widen the gap with the Earth Federation. In short, in the expectations of many scientists at the Spire Experimental Base, the Black Light Technology Particle Accelerator project has finally started. However, this is only one of the projects of Black Light Technology. At this time, at the South Pole, the former Amundsen Scott Scientific Research Station has been evacuated, leaving only the empty barracks, and the 4,270 meter long airport. At this moment, Several military transport planes with different shapes and logos are parked on the airport. What is strange is that among these transport planes, there are not only the C-17 transport plane with the North American trifling emblem, 
but also the N-70 transport aircraft with the Northern Sea Continent trifling emblem. The A-400M in the European area and the Yun-20 in the Zongzhou area. The military transport aircraft in the four great continents area was parked unprecedented on the same airport in the vicinity of the barracks. There are several other large transport helicopters parked on the ice shelf. At this time, at the South Pole Pole, a huge drill with a diameter of more than 3 meters is being erected with iron a little bit. Originally, in accordance with the Antarctic Treaty signed by the continents of the Earth Federation, the use of Antarctica was restricted to peaceful purposes, and all military activities and any nuclear explosions or radioactive waste disposal activities were prohibited, but at this time the four great continents area he blatantly breached the contract and drove military forces into Antarctica, and their purpose is nothing else, but to build the first main base of the Black Light Foundation under the ice cap at the South Pole, according to Chen Chen's plan. This main base will be built under an ice shelf 2,000 meters deep in Antarctica. Once completed, it will have the ability to withstand any known disasters in the world. Unless Earth is destroyed, even if Earth deviates from the orbit of the solar system and wanders alone into the deep space of the universe, the people in this space can successfully survive. As the first four great continents area joint unprecedented military project in human history, Chen Chen expressed his sincerity and actively invested 10 billion US dollars in the construction of this space. The same is true for other four great continents areas. Invest tens of billions of dollars and dispatch military forces to guarantee and protect this project. On the external side, this project is completely confidential, and the level of confidentiality is even comparable to that of the quantum power laboratory. Even in order not to reveal any secrets, all satellites seem to be shut down actively when they fly over Antarctica, while other continents when they want to explore the news of Antarctica, they will also get a warning from the four great continents area, warning them not to step on the red line, otherwise they will be sanctioned by the four great continents area. This scene shocked the eyes of countless people. There has never been such a day in human history when the four great continents district, the strongest of the Earth Federation was unprecedented and united. Super USB Chapter 490 Super USB Chapter 490 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Blacklight Technology, its full name is Blacklight Biotechnology Co., Limited, also known as Blacklight Group. Its main industries focus on biopharmaceuticals, bionic medical, electronic technology, service security, military aerospace, mineral resources and other industries. An emerging industry group committed to diversified development. Blacklight Technology has nearly a hundred branches, among which the core locations are, Blacklight Technology Central Region Parent Company, Blacklight Technology Africa Division, Blacklight Technology North America Division, Blacklight Technology Northern Sea Continent Division Company and Blacklight Technology European Division Company and so on. Among them, under each branch company, there are more subordinate branches and offices in its own jurisdiction. Almost every first-year city in the world can see the silhouette of Blacklight Technology. Apart from this, Blacklight Technology also has a number of subsidiaries, among which is included, Los Angeles Osman Biotechnology Co. Limited, Preston Co., Limited, Switzerland, Africa Terra Strategic Resources Co., Limited etc. Dot. I have to say that Blacklight Technology is like a legendary, from the very beginning of obscurity, to gradually emerging internationally, to the internationally renowned Criminal Day Project, to all kinds of cancer and Alzheimer's disease with the emergence of the terminally ill medicine of the century. Blacklight technology only took a few years. In the past few years, Blacklight technology has also extended its tentacles to the electronic luxury goods industry, military industry and aerospace fields, and the results are gratifying. Until the middle of 2025, the CURB project that shocked the world started. The world suddenly discovered that Blacklight technology has become a technology giant, walking in the forefront of technology in the world. Dot. 
one day in three years, a decadent, stubble-faced young man in a wheelchair came to the gate of the Blacklight Technology North America headquarters in the Reston neighborhood of New York City. His arms are intact, and there are no urine bags or other facilities on his body. Obviously he is not a paralyzed patient, but his trouser legs are empty from the knee position. Pedro Leon is a young man who lost his legs. At this moment, he was sitting in a wheelchair, ignoring the weird gaze of the passing crowd looking up at the huge building with several hundred meters in front of him. This building is a modern five-a-rank office building with a height of about 300 meters. The office building has 101 floors and is a polygonal heterogeneous structure. It has also become a scenic line in the Reston neighborhood. And on his lap, there is also a well-filled application form with the Black Watch Company logo. At this time, the huge LED screen on the wall of the building floor is broadcasting various news related to black light technology. As the last piece of news ended, suddenly three figures appeared in the picture, and then came a piece of impassioned jazz music. In the background of black and flames, three dark figures stand straight, and as the camera pulls in, they gradually reveal the complete appearance of the three. These three people are two white people and one black person. All three of them are both hands crossed near chest, and each of them has extremely high confidence and justice on their faces. At this moment, among the three, the man standing in position C suddenly said, We will crack down on any form of crime and resolutely defend the legal rights of every citizen. Then another man with a relatively young appearance said in awe inspiring manner, try to race against the clock, every second will pass, innocent citizens may lose their lives. Finally, the black man continued, justice may be late, but it will never be absent. Courage, honor, sacrifice. The three spoke in turn, and then the three of them reached out and put their hands on top of each other, and at the same time looked towards the camera, we are the BHB police team, join us. In order to maintain world peace and protect the personal safety of citizens, Black Watch will always looking forward to your joining. Finally, the figures of the three were dimmed again, but a line of subtitles suddenly appeared on the screen, Black Watch Company's Men's Police Department is expanding, welcome to try out. Seeing these three internationally renowned legendary characters, especially the leader captain, Pedro Leon's eyes showed a touch of coldness and a touch of hatred. Next moment, the screen turned again, and a girl who looked pretty, but a little stiff appeared on the screen. She faced the camera and made an enthusiastic gesture of opening her arms while opening the mouth and said, Xingxian series of home bionic robots will soon enter thousands of households. I am your family nanny, Xiao AI come and take me home, boom, but the ad was not over yet, suddenly a wine bottle flew out and slammed directly on the large screen more than 10 meters high, a big hole visible on the letter screen was smashed by naked eye, Leon was taken aback by this sudden situation, he couldn't help but look back, only to see a dozen middle aged persons with slogans and banners standing behind him, constantly pointing at the black light. The technology building clamored loudly, and those banners were written in crooked red paint, Bionic Man stole the work of the poor, Bionic Man is the original sin, God created mankind, but did not create Bionic Man, human the purity of should not be desecrated and so on. It turned out to be the parade that recently boycotted the Black Watch Company's Bionics. Pedro Leon shook the head, he turned his head, but saw seven or eight security guards wearing black light technology logo bulletproof vests, holding batons and explosion proof shields pouring out of the gate, from Leon passed by, moved towards those ragged middle aged person and rushed over. Then, it's a piece of chicken flying. Ignoring the commotion behind him, Leon took a deep breath, adjusted his appearance and pushed the wheel of his wheelchair into the headquarters of Blackwatch. In the gate, there is an extremely vast welcoming living room. Unlike traditional office buildings, the lobby of this office building obviously has a lot of effort in the decoration level. The black marble floor represents the high-tech silver decoration. There are furniture made of transparent glass, 
which is full of strong postmodernism everywhere. Leon swallowed a little nervously. He slowly came to the front desk, and the girl at the front desk suddenly showed a smile that could dispel any unpleasantness. This distinguished guest, I'm the bionic number 3199. Receptionist, can I help you? Hearing these words, Leon understood the identity of the woman in front of him. He stared at the other person in a little amazement, then tentatively asked, Hello, I'm here to apply, I want to apply. This is the Bionic War Police speaking. He passed the registration form in his hand. Sure enough, the Bionic girl opposite immediately raised her hand, and politely took the registration form from Leon. Through the first observation, Leon keenly discovered that although the girl's movements in front of him are very smooth, it is indeed not like Daoist, because the whole set of movements of the girl can be said to be well regulated, far from being as agile as a real human being. However, this is already quite remarkable. If you don't pay attention, it's difficult to immediately distinguish the difference between humans and bionics. The girl just looked down and lifted the head again. She laughed at Leon happily. Dear Mr. Leon, you are welcome to apply for our Blackwatch Company Men's Police Department, our Blackwatch Company I have already cooperated with the North American District Police Department. Now I enter your information into the company intranet and the New York City Police Department database. This is your number plate. Now please go to the second floor to register and remember to line up. Speaking. The girl extended the hand again and passed a silver electronic card to Leon. Okay, thank you. Leon nodded, reached out and took the electronic card, and at the same time subconsciously touched the other's slender fingers. The girl's skin is warm, and at the same time it has the unique creaminess of human skin. Leon almost has a touch of Taoist feeling. But obviously the bionic person has no self-awareness. The girl didn't respond to Leon's behavior just smiled and watched Leon move the wheelchair away, up to the second floor, as soon as he got out of the elevator, Leon immediately saw rows of applicants sitting on the sofa in the corridor, some of these people were wearing bionic prostheses, and some of the poor couldn't even wear them, can only curl up in a wheelchair, like myself, these people are all disabled people who are applying for the Black Watch Company's police department, in cities around the world, as long as there is a black light technology branch, there will be a local police department responsible for the security of the city. This department belongs to a semi-public and semi-private department. As long as you enter this department and become a bionic policeman, you are equivalent to two identities. One of them is a policeman and the other is a black watch company employee. This job can be said to be very rewarding for the disabled, but unfortunately not everyone can join the military police department. First of all, you must be a disabled person, and preferably a police or military background. Of course, an ordinary person can also be used, but unless you are extremely strong or have high fighting qualities, the chance of being selected is not great. Leon chose a corner and waited quietly. He looked towards the electronic screen above the closed office in front of him. At this time, the screen was marked with the words North America, New York City Bionic Men's Selection Site. And below is a number. The number displayed at this time is 21. Then Leon looked at the silver number card in his hand again, and the number on it was 39. Well, it seems that there are 18 people in front of me who have to wait. Wait slowly. In this way, Leon took out his phone and put on headphones and began to immerse himself in his world. About half an hour later, Leon couldn't help but look up at the number plate outside the office, only to find that the number on it was only 25. It was frowned at once, but fortunately, there was a bionic waiter serving tea on the second floor. Water continuously provides considerate service to applicants here. Looking at the release waiter, Leon had to secretly sigh that the bionic person developed by Black Watch is indeed very suitable for the profession of nanny, hardworking, dedicated, and not lazy. And I don't know whether it was intentional or unintentional, these bionics are designed to be extremely beautiful, almost comparable to the stars in reality. Apart from the stiff movements and the fact that they are not Taoist at a glance, 
they have almost no flaws, and Leon has heard from sand sculpture netizens on the internet that these bionics are very realistic even on the top and bottom, and can be used as advanced inflatable dolls. Until three hours passed, it was finally Leon's turn. As soon as he entered the door, Leon immediately saw four men and women in suits sitting in a dimly lit office. One of them was wearing a bionic prosthesis. The other three were perfectly healthy and normal, and four in front of him, there was a sign of head examiner. Hello mentors, my name is Pedro Leon. I was born in Ropede, North America. I am here to apply for the Bionic War Police. Leon bowed slightly in his wheelchair and said softly, disabled legs. At this time, a man sitting on the far right frowned, he asked unceremoniously, Leon. How is your leg disabled? Is it disabled because of criminal's injuries? No, I was disabled due to an accident. Leon pondered then said, that accident was. But before finishing talking, the man interrupted him, then your previous occupation was the police or the army? Neither. Leon shook the head, with a pleasing smile on his face. I was a college student before, but I took free combat courses in school and the ranking is not low. Hearing Leon's words, the four of them looked at each other suddenly, and at this moment the only man wearing a bionic prosthesis suddenly said, tell me about your understanding of justice, and you are how do you look at the profession of bionic war police? I think the so called justice is to combat all potential crimes. Leon immediately replied, my dream is to become a superhero. In my opinion, Justice is pure and not contaminated with the slightest flaw. Any selfish behavior cannot be called justice. As for how to look at the profession of bionics, in my opinion, they are not real heroes, because real heroes should not be grandstanding. I think they are more like a group of actors, because real heroes are nameless. Hearing this, the remaining two people lifted the head one after another, looked at Leon in surprise and then they talked a few words in a low voice. Immediately, the man wearing the bionic prosthesis nodded, Mr. Leon, thank you for your participation. Now you can leave. If you are selected in the first round, we will notify you by email. Well, Leon bitterly nodded with a smile, he moved towards everyone again and bowed before turning to leave. By the time we left the Black Watch Company building, the demonstrations outside the door had already been calmed down, and the huge lead screen above the head had been repaired, and the recruitment advertisement of the BHB war police team was again played on it. Dot. Leon couldn't help but glanced back again, but when looking towards the man standing in the middle of the BHB police team, there was a faintly hidden resentment in his eyes. But at this time, a silhouette stopped in front of him. He turned to look, but saw a sturdy, sturdy man standing before him. Leon. Did you apply for the job successfully? No, I seem to. Failed. Super USB Chapter 491. Super USB Chapter 491. To you can search I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. This man's idea is very interesting. Looking at Leon's wheelchair. Leaving the room. The burly middle-aged man with the right hand was a bionic prosthesis and suddenly spoke and gave such a comment. Neither a policeman nor a soldier, and the degree of physical disability is not enough. Beside, a blonde woman without the slightest hesitation said, this kind of person is not suitable for being a bionic warrior. I think so. The man who interrupted Leon's words before was nodded. The most important thing is that there is a problem with his thoughts. His character is too rebellious and is not in the company's interests. I don't recommend letting him pass the primary election. Secondary, then forget it. The last person also echoed. Speaking, the three of them directly gave the failed option on the computer in front of them. Only the middle-aged man at first opened his mouth. He looked at the three of them unwillingly and at the same time looked at the screen in front of him. Name, Pedro Leon. Age, 26. Physical condition score, C. Political thinking score, C. Mental health score, B. Comprehensive evaluation. Thinking about it, he gently typed this paragraph on Leon's comprehensive evaluation form, the subject is rich in justice and personality, with a strong self-awareness, 
and thinks it can be used as a key observation target. Please review. After typing this passage, the middle-aged man gave the past evaluation alone, and then closed Leon's message. Seeing the middle-aged man's actions, the other three didn't say anything. All four of them were in charge of the initial review. After submitting the information, there will be a high-level review of the information. The odds are unlikely that's all. Few candidates who are failed by three head examiners at the same time will change the evaluation and make it possible to enter the next round. The blonde woman faced the middle-aged man nodded and pressed the button of the next brand. Then another patient with frostbite was sitting in an electric wheelchair and slowly moved in. This incident is just an episode and the interview with the men's police department is still going on. However, what the four of them didn't know was that after Leon's information was submitted, in the data backend database, the newly submitted information did not know whether it was a system failure or what caused it, so it was automatically transferred from the failed group in a ghostly manner arrived in the passing group. Not only that, the red failed stamp judged by the three head examiners also flashed and it automatically became a green past stamp. Dot. Bang! There was a loud noise. A tall and strong man in a vest kicked open the iron door in front of him, and strode into a dark and damp garage. The garage is in a mess. There are a lot of unused parts and wires on the ground. These bits and pieces cover the whole ground. Apart from this, there is a parking in a corner of the garage SUV. On the other side of the garage, a server cluster consisting of five or six servers was placed, which caused a sultry heat in the whole garage and a low buzzing noise all the time. At this time, a young black man who was debugging the instrument turned around abruptly, took out a gun and aimed it at the door, until he saw the identity of the person at the door. He fouled and came back to his senses tune up the instrument in front of you. I said ghost fire, can't you just open the door? At this moment, in the shadow of the garage, a woman wearing a baseball cap, dyed pink hair, and a hairstyle covering her right half of her face came out gracefully, chewing gum, while whispering, what makes you so angry, don't talk and let me guess. Speaking, the woman looked behind the man in the vest with a narrowing expression but saw Leon walking in by herself pushing the wheelchair, it turns out that it was because the lamb messed up the selection of the black watch police department, you guessed it, see monster, the man in the vest was somewhat flustered and exasperated, Leon this guy is always reluctant to do what we have agreed with, damn it, speaking, the man in the vest turned his head and pointed fiercely at Leon in the wheelchair, do you know how much time and energy we spent to help you wash away the traces of the past? No, you can't imagine. Sorry, ghost fire. Leon smiled bitterly, I won't have another time. Of course not, because we have no chance again. Ghost fire loudly roared, turned around angrily, and moved towards the compartment inside the garage. Then he closed the door with a bang. The entire garage fell into an awkward silence. Hey. Relax, Ghost Fire has always been this character since his wife and daughter died. At this moment, in the off-road vehicle in the corner, a young man covered in oil slipped out of the car. He said casually to Leon, and then slid in again before Leon could answer. Under the car, thanks, buddy. Leon had to be nodded, and moved to the corner somewhat lostly, took out a picture frame from the table and wiped it quietly in the photo frame. The background is a grassy lawn, and in the center of the photo is a woman with a kind and maternal radiance sitting on a summer chair. Besides the woman, there is a young and shy young man standing beside her. If you look closely, this young man is simply what Leon looked like a few years ago. Leon, just as Leon looked a little disappointed at the face of the woman in the frame, the pink-haired woman came behind him again. The woman bent down slightly and looked towards the frame in front of Leon. The smell of cheap perfume mixed with the faint body scent of women, passed into Leon's nasal cavity. Lamb, what happened today? The woman asked with some concern. No, nothing. It's just that I didn't answer the interviewer's questions according to the previously agreed content. Leon scratched his cheek stiffly. His face was itchy with the hair of the opponent, he moved subconsciously to the side, Christina, I, call me sea monster, 
thank you. The woman reminded, well, see monster. You know, I have some persistence I want in my heart, so, Leon shrugged, let's think of another way, maybe we can find the evil evidence of the BHB police team through another way, and ruin this group of guys. That's all there is. The woman had some regrets in her expression, and then she lifted the head and looked towards a black young man tinkering with a server in front of her, digital, do you have another way? I'm just a hacker, I'll leave it to you and the maintenance worker to use tricks. The black youth replied without looking up, don't ask me, I don't know anything. Another voice came from the bottom of the off-road vehicle. It seems that we have no other way for the time being. The woman suddenly felt a little disappointed and helpless. She straightened up, stroked her hair, but accidentally exposed her right cheek and on the right half of her face there was a scary scar that looked like a wave. Dot. That is the scar left after chemical corrosion. But at this time, Leon's cell phone suddenly heard the sound of a message. Leon lowered his head subconsciously and took the cell phone out of his pocket, only to see that the message was an email. Leon seemed to realize something. He heart startled and slowly opened the email. Only then did he see that the email was sent by the official account of Blackwatch. Could it be that? Leon swiped across the top of the screen quickly, revealing the content of the email. Dear Mr. Leon, after a preliminary review, we have determined that you have excellent potential and a sense of justice beyond ordinary people and your conditions are in line with our Blackwatch company's recruitment requirements for bionic men. Starting next Wednesday, you will be allowed to participate in the second round selection of members of the men's police department at number 311, Reston Street, New York City. Please come and participate on time Blackwatch North America Division Company Men's Police Department. Lion's eyes widened when he saw this email. He lifts the head and looked towards the same dumbfounded pink-haired woman, Christy C. Monster. I passed the primary election. Thank God. The woman took the phone and showed ecstasy. The black youth and the man under the car also got up, rushed to the woman and looked towards the male in the phone. Oh, good job Lam. It's so cool. The chance of this audition is no more than 1%. Lam, you did a great job. Really passed. Hearing the carnival of the people in the garage, the man in the vest who had been hiding in the back room also rushed out. With a face full of disbelief, he snatched the phone from everyone, and suddenly laughed loudly when he saw the text above. Ha 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 dot dot good job Leon. You're quite something. Speaking, the man in the vest even stepped forward to kiss him on the cheek, to change his tantrum before. Leon hurriedly pushed the vest man away, so as to avoid the end of the big man. After a brief carnival, the five people calmed down again. They stopped their work and started sitting at a table to discuss the next plan. Our next goal is to let the lamp pass the Black Watch Company's second screening. On the conference table, the man in the vest drank a sip of beer and warned repeatedly, for the second screening, how can digital help you? I can try to invade the internal network of the Black Watch branch to see what they will test for the second screening, and then we can predict in advance. The black youth thought for a while, but then he was uncertain, but I have not succeeded in several intrusions. Obviously, Black Watch is very cautious in terms of network defense. If it is not necessary, I think it is better to do this kind of thing less. The pink haired woman shook the head, is it rare for hackers to invade this company on the dark web and get arrested by the other party's IP? Although the digital technology is superb, I'm afraid it's hardly the company's opponent. So, we can start from other aspects, such as finding ways to improve Lamb's fighting ability, shooting ability, etc so that he can stand out from countless competitors. I agree with Christina's point. The man in the vest chuckled, and then looked towards the man covered with oil. What do you mean John? Please call our code name in the organization, Mr. Huo. The woman with pink hair was frowned immediately, sooner or later we will be killed by you because of your carelessness. Well, Miss C. Monster. The man in the vest shrugged indifferently and drank the beer in front of him. With a bang. The man in the vest put down the bottle again, and then looked towards Leon, Leon, starting tomorrow, 
I will hold a devil training for you to improve your shooting and melee ability, I hope don't continue to be willful this time, ok, don't forget, our ultimate goal is to make the BHB police team and the evil company behind them deserve punishment, this is for us and the whole society to recognize their ugly side, no problem. Ghost fire. Leon solemnly nodded. A meeting ended amidst everyone's discussion. Five people left the garage in batches, while Leon returned to his low rent housing. At this time, the sky was also dark. When Leon was in front of the door of the return to house room, he deliberately checked the mechanism he had set up when he left. After seeing that no one had entered when he left the room, he rolled the rim comfortably and moved in. Back home. Leon sat in the bathroom to wash up first, washing off the smell of cigarettes and alcohol from his body, and then lay down on the bed a little tired. Just closing his eyes, Leon involuntarily fell asleep. In my dream, it was a small square with green grass. A middle-aged woman full of mature charm and an inexperienced youth wandered in the square. In the breeze, the woman's hair was flying like silk. Obviously, the woman is the mother of a teenager. However, in this quiet atmosphere, there was a sudden gunshot from a distance, and the woman showed a look of horror, pulling the young man and starting to run, but she was still dispersed by the startled crowds all around. The young man was rushed and trampled by the crowd, almost fainting, but he did not make himself unconscious, but tried to look up towards his mother's direction. However, when he saw clearly, he only saw the mother held by a few criminals, and three people standing not far from the opposite side facing the criminals. The appearance of the three people has long been deep in the memory of the teenager. He almost called out the name of his favorite captain, not even think, praying for the other party to save his mother, but the other party just looked indifferently. I took a look at myself, then took out the gun and pulled the trigger directly. Immediately. The whole dream was completely overwhelmed by the deafening gunfire. When he came back to his senses, his mother had already fallen in a pool of blood, but his favorite superhero only uttered a few ugly curses, then glanced at himself, and then became indifferent as turned and left. In the end, all he received was a handful of mother's ashes and a hush fee of more than 100,000 US dollars. Super USB Chapter 492 Super USB Chapter 492 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. AFP reported that Black Quake, after conquering the field of cancer and Alzheimer's disease, and using bionic organ transplantation instead of human organ transplantation, is the third time to benefit all mankind. Its biomedical department announced today because of the renewed technological innovation in the field of stem cells, the cost of the aging reversal treatment project will also continue to be reduced, from 200,000 US dollars per person in the previous year to 30,000 to 50,000 US dollars. The aging reversal treatment project dropped from the original Anepison price of 1 million dollars, and it took only six years. Blackwatch Company fulfilled its promise that year and put the aging reversal treatment project pull down to civilian prices. According to the big data analysis of the Earth Federal Health Research Group in the past three years, from the start of the aging reversal project in 2023 to now, the average lifespan of the human population has soared from 70 years old to 78 years old today. In North America, Europe, Central Continent, East China Sea and other federally developed continents, the average lifespan is over 85 years old, and this average is still rising rapidly over time. Experts predict that by 2050, the average lifespan of all humans is expected to break through 110 years old. A few days later, in a garage in a dark corner of New York City, three men, one woman, and four were sitting in front of a projection machine, watching the Black Watch Company's North America exclusive TV channels. At this time, it seemed that it was time for dinner. The four of them were carrying various fast foods in their hands gorge oneself in their respective positions, and one of the men in a white vest had several cans of empty beer in front of them. At this step, 
The next step is to delay retirement. Suddenly, a woman with pink hair suddenly spoke, and she said dully, this proposal has been supported by several states until it is set in Congress. I have to say that Blackwatch's move is still very good, at least the aging of the population has been alleviated. Another black man shrugged, it's just suffering from our group of leaks. Enough digital, don't say good things about this company in front of me or I will fiercely kick your ass. Before the young black man finished speaking, the man in the vest interrupted the conversation. He put down the beer can with a bang and said fiercely, spitting alcohol. Okay, no problem. The young black man raised his hands innocently, made a gesture of aiming, and turned and left at the same time. Don't make any noise, let's watch this live broadcast, after all. The lamb is inside. The pink haired woman stopped the two of them, and was persuaded. Following her words, the screen in front of everyone finally finished the advertisement and started to enter the theme as the screen flashed. The words Mission Summon suddenly appeared on the screen, followed by then came a burst of impassioned music. Next, the image of the three men of the BHB police team was first shown on the screen, and then the images of the three gradually faded and then they became the iconic red, blue and white flags of North America. In short, after a burst of exciting opening animation, I finally entered the theme of this time. A bald man with a strong figure and wearing a camouflage uniform appeared on the screen. The man not only has a strong figure, but also has tough and three-dimensional features, similar to the young Van Diesel has several points of. At this time, he just started to talk about it. Dear viewers in front of the TV, welcome to the 2028 Mission Summon program Bionic Men's Police Trials. I am the host of the North American Division, Algernon. This year's and last year's trials are different because with Blackwatch's technological innovation, there are fewer requirements for Bionic prosthetic users. Therefore, starting this year, our contestants will no longer be severely disabled soldiers or policemen but have joined many mildly disabled people. Because of this, the number of contestants this year has greatly increased. The number of contestants in North America has reached a hundred. We will follow the triathlon, fighting test, gun accuracy test and other processes participants are inspecting, and at the same time, everyone in front of the TV is asked to support their favorite players and the way to support is on the barcode at the bottom of the screen. Following the words of the TV host, the program flow started on the screen. This show is a talent show launched by Blacklight Technology to promote bionic prosthetics. This selection method can not only expand the local police force, but also can become a qualified bionic soldier as long as they have undergone a part of system training and passed the examination. Some outstanding players can even get the chance to make their debut, and have the opportunity to become internationally renowned superheroes like the BHB police team. Because of the existence of various superhero themes in the movie, these bionic men are almost worshipped as idols in the world which has led to countless teenagers dream of becoming a policeman, and all major political systems are happy to see this. Yes, so not at all prevented it at all, which led to this show becoming bigger and bigger, and even making it an entertainment show that surpassed WWE in the NBA. At this time, as the program began, I interviewed the first batch of contestants who passed the primary selection and asked them to talk about some ideas about bionic prosthetics and social crime rates, so that the audience had a preliminary understanding of this group of people. Immediately there is a test of various abilities, including physical fitness and mental quality. At the end of the program, the audience in front of the TV will vote to select a part of the contestants who are eligible for promotion. And this time, Leon on TV still showed his unique insights. His thinking and pursuit of justice really aroused the interest of a part of the audience, and these people voted for him. Dot. At the end of the two-along program, Leon was promoted without any accident, entered the third round selection with 12 people, and got an employment contract from Blackwatch on the spot. In fact, at this step, Leon entered the Blackwatch company and became a bionic policeman. It was a certainty. In the next few days, the third round selections, 
semi-finals and finals, etc., were actually more like selections who can make a C debut and become a superhero like BHB. Looking at the screen where Leon succeeded in breaking into the Blackwatch company as a promoter, and becoming an employee of Blackwatch company, everyone in the garage suddenly cheered and threw beer. It's great, our efforts until now finally succeeded. Leon finally entered this damn company. The man in the vest yelled, the good fortune for Blackwatch is coming to an end. Everyone is noisy. A frowned woman with only pink hair, Leon can only say that he has initially entered this company, but he wants to get the black history of BHB or even the handle of this company. I don't know how many efforts it will take. Now it's not a happy time. Once persuaded, and finally persuaded these hot-headed people. The woman secretly sighed a sigh of relief and silently looked towards the garage door. Can your group really beat the company that spans the world? Dot. When the first round competition ended, it was late at night. Leon alone wandered the streets in the middle of the night in a wheelchair. The night breeze was blowing. Although there was a hint of coolness, he only felt an excitement flowing throughout his body. When facing the camera. He seemed to see countless people. Waved to himself, it was the first time in his life that he stood under the focal point of ten thousands. And he really enjoys this feeling. After he got on the subway, the impatient found a place to stop and started to turn on the phone to check the barrage and comments of the previous show. How about the performance of these people in the show? Whether they have potential, whether they are liked by the audience, these can all be answered from the barrage and Leon found that his popularity in this selection competition was even better than expected. Except for one contestant who performed equally well, the number of people who supported him was the most. Looking at the barrage of cheering on him, Leon couldn't help but provoke an irresistible smile. Excuse me, is it Pedro Leon? Just as Leon lowered his head and was immersed in joy, a crisp female voice suddenly heard in his ear. Leon subconsciously lifts the head, and suddenly saw a 5-10-16 year old, well behaved little girl standing by herself in front of him, asked nervously, I am, you are, Leon asked subconsciously, ah, it's really you, the girl let out a cheer, and then she hurriedly took out a book from her backpack, Leon, I also watched the mission summon program at school today, your performance is really good. You can give me do you sign it? Sign, sign? Leon was suddenly blushed with shame, he laughed a little awkwardly, but I'm just an ordinary person that's all. No, I think you will become the same superhero as the BHB police team. The girl shook the head quickly, and seriously said, I believe you. Well, Leon was nodded. He took the pen and book handed by the girl, and at the same time wrote his name crookedly on it, sorry. My handwriting is not pretty. It's okay. The girl took back her notebook with joy, and cutely stuffed her school bag back like a treasure. Come on Leon, you will definitely win this competition. The conversation between the two seemed to have disturbed the people next to him. A few more teenagers rushed up and surrounded Leon. One of the boys was shocked and joyfully said when he saw Leon's face. It turned out to be Leon, I saw you just now. I just feel like but I'm not sure. Leon, sign me too. Little fatty next to it is not to be outdone. Suddenly, Leon was surrounded by a group of teenagers. Leon dealt with a group of teenagers strangely, unconsciously, his originally empty heart had a subtle sense of satisfaction. Perhaps, I can really become a world famous superhero like the 3 BHB. No, they are all hypocritical actors and only I am the true hero of justice. Slowly, Leon deep in one's heart as such an idea. Dot. In the next period of time, the other four people suddenly discovered that Leon, who was originally relatively introverted and easygoing, began to become more active, full of motivation throughout the day, and every day all was immersed in virtual VR training. In order to get a better ranking, the three raised money to customize a pair of high-end bionic prostheses for Leon in advance, allowing Leon to stand up from the wheelchair. In fact, starting from the third round knockout competition, Blacklight Technology brought together contestants from all regions of North America, and customized the corresponding bionic prostheses for them. If you are familiar with these in advance, 
you can naturally get more advantages. After all, starting from the third round, it is necessary to test the combat capability of the contestants. From fighting to firearms to actual combat drills, all these require a lot of experience to accumulate especially when Leon's opponents are basically retired soldiers or police. But it is precisely because of this that Leon, who is young and has a green face, naturally stands out from the crowd and has gained a lot of attention. When the third round mission summon game started, Leon had accumulated a lot of practical experience, and the third round game no longer ended in a day like the second game, but became a week-long Taoist show. During this week, the competition will record the mentality of each participant and regain the training images after the customized prosthesis. Until the last day, it will be the day when everyone will be tested. But Leon also lived up to expectations once again, in the third game with the second score, but the most popular score successfully advanced to the fourth semi-final. In this game, Leon's popularity also began as the tide rises, the boat floats and became a hot topic player in North America. And Leon, who was immersed in applause and spotlight, found that he had to face another fact. What, want me to give up the next game? In the dim garage, Leon was standing at the door, looking towards the four people in front of him, somewhat incredulously. Sorry Leon, the plan has changed, you must do it this way. The pink haired woman whispered to persuade. You have to know that our activities are funded by an employer named Kane. Yesterday he sent an order to stop you from participating in the competition because we there is another plan to be executed, and we must all participate. I don't quite understand. Leon shook the head. I will soon become the regional champion of Mission Summon, and even hope to become the global champion. When the time comes, I will be the same famous superhero as the BHB police team. Dot. Super USB Chapter 493 Super USB Chapter 493 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Late night, Leon alone sits on the rooftop of the building, silently watching the full moon in the sky, and beside him, there is a picture frame. That was the photo frame in the garage of the revenge team's base. Leon took it out of the garage and placed it next to him. It seems that something has been thought of. Leon suddenly picked up the photo frame and wiped it silently. The night breeze brought a chill. As one of the most prosperous cities in Earth, the moon and starry sky in New York City have long become something that can only exist in dictionaries and memories. Only when Leon was a child, did he accidentally remember the past the bright night view of the starry sky. Now, the night scene has been replaced by endless neon lights. But Leon is still looking at the night sky quietly, with inexplicable thoughts constantly flowing in his eyes. Leon, I knew you were here. At this moment, a crisp female voice came from behind him, and then Leon only felt a gust of fragrance coming from him, beside him. The pink-haired woman turned up without being invited, sat beside him, following his appearance. His feet droop on the outside of the building. Christina, what are you doing here? Leon didn't look back, just asked silently. I'm just worried about you. The woman was silent for a while, and then said with a slight smile, I know you paid a lot to get into the Black Watch Company. Now it is unfair to ask you to give up the game. But this is no way. Kane has his own plan. We just need to follow his plan. Hearing what the woman said, Leon was just laughed. But my purpose is to get close to a member of the BHB police team called Brooke and personally ruin him. Leon whispered, I am advancing step by step and approaching my goal step by step, but now, you are telling me to give up. Sorry, I understand your inner hatred. The woman shook the head. A night wind hit her blowing away her messy hair, revealing a hideous scar on her right face. She turned her head subconsciously to block the scar, but just happened to see the photo frame in Leon's hand. She extended the hand, took the photo frame out of Leon's hand, put it under the light, and then said again, I've heard of your story, 
Did she accidentally die by forcibly killing the gangster? The difference between me and you who only want to avenge Brooke is, I joined the Black Watch resistance team because I want to completely destroy this company. Speaking of this, a deep hatred appeared in the woman's eyes. I originally had a wealthy family. My father was an entrepreneur. His company was a cooperative enterprise that provided anti-cancer medicine ingredients to giants such as Pfizer and Johnson and Johnson. But because of the anti-cancer medicine cancer medicine, my father is not only bankrupt, but also owes a lot of money. So, in the middle of the night one day, when we were surrounded by person demanding repayment workers, my father forced our family to drink nitric acid for pharmaceuticals. Hearing this, Leon couldn't help but feel a little moved. Until now, he only knew that the revenge team he was in was all because of the Black Watch company. The wife was separated, but everyone's big sister we Christina changed he didn't know it, and the woman in front of him had never told everyone. Until today did he understand how the scar on Christina's face came from? I was struggling at the time. So the nitric acid was only spilled on my face, but I was not at all drinking it. But my parents and five-year-old younger brother, they... The woman's voice was slightly choked, she paused, and then continued, I don't know whether Black Watch is right or wrong. I only know that if it weren't for them, my father would not go bankrupt, and my family there will be no misfortune, and even I will not become what I am today. So I want to destroy this company and let them fall apart. For this, I am willing to give my life. Leon opened his mouth, but in the end he still didn't say a word of comfort, because he knew what the other party needed was not comfort. Leon, so promise me, let us fight together. The woman went on persuaded, we must unite all the forces that can be united, only in this way can we have a chance to defeat Blackwatch and complete our revenge. I understand. Leon nodded, then fell silent completely. The two of them looked at the sky in silence like this until the sky gradually showed a grey dawn color. It's dawn. Dot. It seems that Leon was moved by the night's conversation. In the next few days, Leon returned to normal. He stopped training in guns and fighting but stayed with everyone in the revenge team as usual. In the stronghold, study the weaknesses of Black Watch with everyone, eat and drink together. Even, he took off the bionic prosthesis tailored for him by the Black Watch company and returned to the wheelchair. Seeing this, the people who had disagreed with Leon finally felt relieved. The unhappiness that had been disappeared after Leon had compromised, it seemed that everyone had restored the harmony of the past. However, this situation was completely changed when the fourth semi-final started. Dot. Why hasn't the lamb come to the meeting until now? After today, in the dim garage, four people sat in a circle on stools, only the place belonging to Leon remained vacant. Everyone waited for a while, but they never waited for Leon to arrive. For a while, Everyone was a little surprised. As the leader of the team, Christina is slightly frowned. Is the lamb late to bed? Ghost fire. Call him and ask where he is now. I have called three times, but no one answered. The man in the vest, ghost fire, patted the table violently. This idiot, every time I call in the past, he will answer the first time. Does lamb still go to participate in mission summon? At this moment, Digital spoke with some uncertainty, expressing everyone's doubts. I believe that Lam is not such a person. However, Christina shook the head confidently. It is likely that there was another accident. Digital, please check his GPS location. Okay. Hearing this, the black youth just got up, walked to his server cluster, opened several software with densely packed options and kept inquiring about something at the same time. I'm hacking into the communications satellite network, wait a minute. So everyone began to fidget and wait, until ten minutes later, the black young man suddenly turned his head, he sighed in relief, showing a reassuring expression, Lamb's cell phone shows that he is still in his rental house at this time, not at all leaving, putting it that way, this guy really overslept, Christina was relieved. She stood up and said with a smile, I'll go find him personally. Even the meeting of our revenge team dare to be late, I must teach him a lesson. Wait, see monster, 
But before she finished her words, the digital who had been controlling the computer suddenly said, he turned his head in a little surprise, see monster, there seems to be something wrong outside the door. Everyone is hearing this, subconsciously looked towards several high definition screens in the garage. These screens all display the monitoring images outside the door, and at this time, on the hanging screens, there are several people wearing black clothed and wearing a stranger with a hood covering his face slowly approached outside the garage. Suck. Christina took out her guns not even think, and shouted at the same time, everyone is going to evacuate from secretly thought, quickly, the other party is about to come in. I will lock the door. One of the small men rushed to the front door, trying to lock the iron door, but before he had time, he heard an exclamation from behind, maintenance man, come back, huh? The little man looked back blankly, the next second, a fire flashed past, he only felt that he was flying up suddenly, but he completely lost consciousness before he could figure out what was happening, bang, a violent explosion broke through the garage door, the fire almost filled half of the garage, and the three of Christina and others had only time to squat down and hide behind the table and then felt a deafening sound. At this moment, the air becomes extremely hot. When the smoke cleared, the three people coughed and sat up from the rubble. Among them, the black man wanted to sit up with his body, but found that his legs had been pressed against a huge cover. Under the board, it has been pressed into mashed meat. Ah, my legs, my legs. The black man suddenly screamed. Digital. Christina rushed over, trying to remove the cover but no matter how hard she could, she couldn't remove it, it's useless, see monster, you and ghost fire hurry up and leave from secretly thought, seeing this, the black young man pushed Christina away, and he directly took out his gun and aimed it at the blasted door, hurry up, here I will stop them, you leave quickly, digital, Christina showed a hesitant expression, hurry up, hurry up, the young black man loudly shouted, he even pointed his gun at his head, if you don't leave again, I will shoot myself. Go, Christina. At this time, the man in the vest who suffered a serious injury finally got up. He grabbed the hesitant Christina before moving towards the cabin in the garage and ran. However, as soon as the two men opened the wooden door of the cabin, four silhouettes wearing black robe appeared outside the warehouse. But before these people entered the warehouse, the black youth shot, peng peng peng, a series of gunshots came, and the young black man cursed loudly, come on, you mess, come and kill me, or I will, so, there was a scream that was almost inaudible, and the clamor of the black youth stopped abruptly, Christina turned her head subconsciously, but saw the black youth's head burst open instantly, like a broken watermelon, scattered all over the ground in red and white. This gunshot is an electromagnetic weapon unique to Blackwatch. This thought flashed through Christina's mind, and she suddenly understood that her group had been betrayed. Leon, how dare you betray us? At this time, not only Christina, but even Ghostfire, the man in the vest, understood everything. He saw five people approaching quickly, not even think, pushing Christina into the room and shouting, Leon, you don't die. Then he started shooting like crazy. Hearing the gunshots outside the door, Christina forced herself to hold back her grief. She immediately moved the toilet and crawled into the dark secretly thought below, and then returned the toilet to its original position. The next second, Ghost Fire, a man in a vest, was shot into a hornet's nest and crashed to the ground. Then a crowd of black robed men poured into this small room. Kaka, the headed black robed man wore high heeled leather boots. She looked all around first, and then seemed to think of something and stepped on her foot. Suddenly, a deep and dark secretly thought was exposed to everyone. After that, she took off her hood, revealing a glamorous face. No one expected that, on this face, Mian and murderous intention Senran are so perfect, as if the two are perfectly blended, and they blend into a cup of poisonous but extremely delicious cocktail. Notify the second team that a target has fled along the passage. The woman turned her head and said coldly at the people behind her, 
this person must stay alive. I want to take a look at the mysterious cane behind them. Who is it that dares to talk to us? Black all amazing work. Yes, Sir Sarah. Everyone hearing this immediately promised, and at the same time they swarmed out, leaving only the cool and elegant woman in the cabin. The woman thought for a while, she suddenly lifted the black robe, revealing a valiant and formidable looking battle suit inside, and then she took out a black object from her body, and then buckled the upper ring with her thumb and gently pulled it. Hey! With a clear sound, the safety bolts and safety grips popped out, and the woman took one with one hand, and the pitch black spherical object fell into the gloomy passage with a thud. After all this was done, the woman showed a sneer, and then strode out of the warehouse. Bang! A deafening explosion sounded, and the woman's black robe surged with the explosive airflow behind her, suddenly revealing the woman's combat uniform, and on this combat uniform, there were three BSS printed on it. Letter Super USB Chapter 494 Super USB Chapter 494 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Chen Shen slowly opened his eyes from Medbud 3000, the black light automatic medical platform. The entrance is a creamy white room with a simple style. There is only an automatic medical platform like a CT machine and a simple but luxurious carpet. There is an oil painting hanging on the wall. The Chen Shen in the oil painting has sharp eyes and his unbelievable eyes almost form the substance, which is arbitrarily transmitted from the oil painting. Only with this look, you can know that the artist's skills are probably world class. At this time, Chen Chen sat up from the medical platform as usual, and stretched slightly. What a long dream. Chen Chen yawned slightly and murmured in a low voice. Then he stepped barefoot on the tapis hand woven carpet and stood up. My godfather. Do you need to use it earlier? While talking, a beautiful looking girl in a white dress walked in from the door pushing the dining car. On the dining car, there are many extravagant foods, which are arranged in various forms. All kinds of shapes look pleasing to the eye and expensive. X, is there any interesting news today? Chen Chen walked to the silver table full of high tech style and asked indifferently. There are a lot of new news. The girl showed a smile. In an instant, the entire bright room seemed to be overshadowed. She put a few dishes on the table, and then tilted her head cutely. Suddenly, four overlapping images appeared in front of Chen Chen. Web page together. The one on the top level is an elderly man with weird white hair. He is talking excitedly at this moment, and the picture freezes at the moment he speaks. Chen Chen looked down, but saw below the photo of the man, showing this title in bold bold face. The man is back. Today, Boring Teng Langpu announced on Twitter that he will continue to run for the 48th President of North America. The Republican Party has now expressed its full support. Very good. Chen Chen took a bite of the food in his hand. He swiped across the first web page and swished. The web page fell into the shadow of the edge, and then the second web page appeared in front of Chen Chen. Steven Spielberg announced that he will shoot the Taoist version of Evangelion. The film is adapted from the animation of the same name directed by Hideki Anno in 1995. It tells the story of Evangelion. Dot. Chen Chen expressionless passed by, and then the page Olala in Chapter 2 shattered itself, revealing the third page below. Earth Confederation announced that the Curb project three years ago has been perfected. The world's first commercially available super tokamak reactor has been officially put into operation in Switzerland. As of yesterday, the reactor has been in continuous operation for 24 hours. The total power is 24 million kilowatt-hours. The reactor is currently stable, and the Q-value breakthrough is 100. Your godfather, do you watch them commercialize this technology? Little X pouted and asked unwillingly. X. You are not a child anymore, don't be so stingy. Chen Chen waved his hand and said, I have provided them with multiple technologies, and only nuclear fusion reactors are the ones I allow them to use in the commercial field. Do you know why? Without waiting for Xiao X's answer, Chen Chen explained it himself, in other technologies, 
whether room temperature superconductivity or super artificial intelligence, they can only be used in the military field, and only we are qualified to use it in the commercial field to make money. The reason is just because even if these technologies make money, they can only grab tens of billions of fortunes every year. But what about nuclear fusion reactors? As everyone knows, electricity is the first energy source for modern life, and almost the only energy source. Once nuclear fusion reactors are officially commercialized, it will represent the official elimination of thermal power, hydraulic power, wind power, and even nuclear fission power plants. The world will only have nuclear fusion as an energy model. What kind of monopoly will this be? And which country is willing to hand over its own interests and be controlled by a foreign company? It can even be said that the wealth earned by all other technologies combined is less than an e-tenth of the money earned by nuclear fusion reactor technology. This is why I agreed to provide nuclear fusion reactor technology unconditionally to the four great continents area. Speaking of this, Chen Chen sighed slightly in relief, because I have only two choices, either for free or war, and my purpose is to cooperate with four great continents, do I still need to say how to choose? P. That's right. Little X's nodded with deep conviction. Chen Chen shook the head, did not go on, but scribbled across the third page, revealing the last one below, sponsored by Blackwatch. The world famous rule of law variety show Mission Summon ended in the second season semi finals. The winner of the North American division was Pedro Leon from the New York division. Following this description, a handsome and full fledged young man is moving towards the audience, waving his hands, and his legs are two exquisitely shaped black bionic prostheses. It seems that he chose to betray his partner in the end. Seeing this, Chen Chen finally showed a weird look. Where are his four little friends? Captain Sara of the 3rd Squad of the BSS Squadron personally took the lead. Three of them died on the spot, and a woman was captured alive. Sara wanted to get the identity of the investor behind it from her. Xiao X replied, Unfortunately, Sara didn't know. Christina actually didn't know who Kane was. She didn't even think that the so-called Kane was actually Captain Brooke of the BHB police team. It doesn't matter. What to do next is their business. Chen Chen and different expression, if Sara reports the report, tell her to let her handle it. By the way, how is Leon's popularity in North America now? Very good. Little X replied, in the semi-finals, he won 3,500 and 230,000 support votes. The audience support rate exceeded 35% which completely crushed the second place. Although there is our special the makeup artist and stylist hinted at the inducing ingredients, as well as the editing and appearance rate, but he still needs his own hard work, his own quality is really good, and it is enough to rank in the top 5 among all contestants. Chen Chen hearing this laughed, since this is the case, then we will add another fire. Before summarizing the game, we will promote his reputation to the whole world, and at the same time let out the wind. Every future mission someone will always champions are eligible to join the BHB police team. Xiao X is nodded, then he is going to face his enemy, but I don't know what he should do. I have seen his files. His goal is not to fight our blacklight technology, nor to kill Brook to avenge his mother but to find Brook's black material and pull the opponent off the altar. Chen Chen drank the nutrient solution in the cup in one breath, and then said, and Brook's use value is almost drained. In the past two years, he has been making small actions in private, and even investing in this kind of hostile organizing things. It's time to find someone to replace him. Understand. I will make Leon an emerging superhero. Little X nodded suddenly said again, in fact, not only the outside world, but also the good news from the steeple experimental base. The high energy physics experimental team led by Professor Charles has broken through the last technical difficulty and created a small mass produce die offset metal. What, did you finally succeed? When he heard the news, Chen Chen's eyes suddenly brightened. At this time, he had also eaten up his breakfast, so impatient stood up, turned and walked outside the door, let's go, let's go and see, dot.
Three years ago, Chen Chen carried out a second expansion of the long-completed Minaret Experimental Base, which not only increased the area by 300%, but also dug a ring of tunnels all around the base to build the whole world as a particle acceleration device yearn for something even in dreams. Relying on the technology brought back from the plane of Elysium and some key equipment purchased from Europe, this particle accelerator will be the most advanced accelerator in human history, none of it. At this time, after nearly a year of installation, this multi-billion dollar particle accelerator has already been installed and operated for two years. Actually, this price is very rare for this high-end instrument, but its power is very huge. The highest power can reach 100 tef. At this time, Professor Charles is leading dozens of people to join God physical scientists and hundreds of assistants in the restricted area who are observing the physical experiments in the accelerator. Atoms have entered the sublight speed in the linear acceleration device, ready to introduce the toroidal acceleration rectifier. The strong magnetic field is turning on. Successfully entered the toroidal accelerator and started a new round of acceleration. The current speed is 93.735% of the speed of light, and the speed is still increasing. Enough speed. Ready to turn on the ultra high field strength magnetic generator, prepare the resonance machine, prepare to collect those neutrons. Atoms have passed through the strong magnetic zone immediately detect. The report shows signs of tearing of the atoms are detected, the protons and atoms have been successfully stripped, only the neutrons are not affected by the strong magnetic zone, and the particles start to slow down. Prepare the strong electric combiner, prepare to bond electrons and neutrons, don't let the neutron speed decrease too much. Dot. Successfully complete the mission, the virtual particles have been formed. Start the second round to accelerate. It has accelerated to 98% of the speed of light. Professor Charles, do I need to continue to accelerate? The speed is almost the same. Ready to introduce a linear orbit. Must hit the proton into the aluminium atom. Only success, no failure. The vacuum chamber has been charged. Ready to. In the entire high energy physics laboratory. Everyone has a solemn expression. They looked at a boiler-like device in front of them. Suddenly, the device shook violently, and Charles even felt something coming from under his feet. A slight tremor. Next, a large amount of data appeared on the screen responsible for collecting the data again. These data flowed down like a waterfall. The scientist in charge of the observation wiped a sweat and stared at the screen, when he saw one of the data finally revealed a look of surprise. Success. The scientist suddenly smiled like a child. He stood up abruptly and yelled at the crowd, we succeeded. The protons were actually shot into the aluminium atom. We created the hardest substance in the world! Exclamation mark. After hearing this sentence, everyone present couldn't help cheering loudly. Amid the carnival of everyone. Chen Chen also stepped into the high energy physics laboratory. Mr. Chen, Mr. Chen, Chen boss. Seeing the appearance of Chen Chen, many people stopped cheering and looked at Chen Chen. Chen Chen just waved his hand and walked directly to Professor Charles. At this time, the professor of Mediterranean hairstyle has become much younger than before. He pointed at Chen Chen nodded, boss, did you hear that the experiment was successful? Of course. For two full years, your high energy physics laboratory has burned billions. Now that the results have been produced, of course I will come and see. Chen Chen cracking a joke, and then looked towards the huge high pressure vacuum chamber, how about it, can I open it now? The pressure is being relieved. It will take about 10 minutes to open, Charles explained, and then continued to direct and get busy. Chen Chen waited for a while, and after about 10 minutes, a piece of metal the size of a fingernail and the overall normal silver white was taken out by an experimenter with pliers. Chen Chen took a look, and it was the so-called high offset metal, a piece of isotope made of metal aluminium. The so-called isotopes are actually different atoms of the same element. Their atoms have the same number of protons, but the number of neutrons is different. For example, protium, deuterium, and tritium. They all have one proton in their nucleus, but the number of neutrons in their nucleus is not the same. 
so they are isotopes of each other. Since the number of protons is the same, their nuclear charge and the number of extra nuclear electrons are also the same, and they have the same electronic layer structure, so the chemical properties of the isotopes are also the same. However, Due to their different numbers of neutrons, the mass of each atom will be different, and certain physical properties related to the nucleus level will also be different. As a result of the large scale strikes of this particle accelerator, the metal aluminium filled with a large number of neutrons has undergone earth shaking changes in its physical properties. At this time, as the aluminium block was taken into the test room, it was quickly placed on a hardness testing machine for the first time. After all, it is the first time everyone has produced a high offset metal. Seeing the start of detection, all the scientists gathered around the observation room and looked towards the inside through the observation window. Under the operation of an assistant, a continuously rotating cutting device was turned on, and the disc shaped cutting blade was high speed rotation. At the same time, the assistant pressed the instrument fiercely and cut it directly on the aluminium plate. Suddenly, there was a huge noise, and at the same time the aluminium plate burst into flames and sparks splashed. However, the assistant only cut for a few seconds, then stopped again, showing a surprised expression. How is it? Professor Charles outside the observation room asked immediately, no cut marks are seen on the sample. The assistant took the nail sized aluminium block from the fixture and raised it to everyone. Sure enough, everyone showed surprise expressions. Chen Chen also walked to the window personally, staring at the assistant's movements. Looking from his position, after the high speed cutting just now, the sample is still smooth and discernible, and there is no trace of being cut. It is almost impossible to put on a piece of aluminium. After all, the hardness of aluminium not high, not to mention the strength. Try changing to a tungsten molybdenum universal high speed steel cutter head, and the cutting time has been extended to 30 seconds. At this moment, Professor Charles then ordered. Understood. The assistant took the sample to another cutting machine and experimented again. With another burst of fire, huge noises continued to sweep the laboratory, but this time less than 20 seconds. The assistant stopped again. Why did it stop again? Someone couldn't help asking. The assistant said, It's not that I want to stop, but the cutter head has been ruined. It's just such a sentence, everyone was shocked immediately, although they were prepared in their hearts, when they really saw this magical metal appear in front of them, everyone had an unreal illusion. Super USB Chapter 495 Super USB Chapter 495 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Seeing the cutter head as if it had been gnawed by a dog. Many people couldn't help being sucked in a breath of cold air. Professor Charles was also somewhat blushed with shame. He simply continued, continue to replace the harder cutter head. By the way, all the strength, toughness, plasticity and tensile strength of the metal will be detected. After that, there was a long test, but with the completion of one after another data test. The metal the size of a fingernail is still very strong. When all the performance tests are completed, everyone's gaze is looking towards this piece of metal also become more blazing. If the MOS hardness is used for statistics, the hardness of this metal has exceeded 10 M. Professor Charles took the test sheet from the tester, and at the same time murmured and explained that he seemed to be afraid that Chen Chen would not understand it. So he began to explain it. The so called MOS hardness actually refers to the ability of a substance to scratch another material. It was first established by a German mineralogist MOS to identify the hardness of minerals. He took the report and placed it in front of Chen Chen. In this hardness table, the hardness of our common metal lead is only 1.5 m, while the hardness of human nails is 23 m and the hardness of metal aluminium is it is 22.5 m, iron is 45 m, glass is 5.5 m. And as the hardest diamond stone, its hardness is 10 m. Chen Chen hearing this expressed his understanding that the cutter head made of diamond stone could not leave any cut marks on this piece of metal. 
The hardness of this piece of metal is indeed far beyond the range of human measurement. Not only that, Professor Charles continued to explain, the isotope of this aluminium also has strong anti-war and anti-corrosion capabilities. The room temperature tensile strength exceeds the measurement limit of the instrument by 5000 megapascals, and it can withstand the extrusion test of a 1,200 ton hydraulic press. The melting point also exceeded the limit temperature of the hafnium alloy in human materials of 4,215 degrees Celsius reaching an astonishing 12,000 degrees Celsius. The reason is that its neutron content is highly imbalanced, energy transfer is very insensitive, and thermal energy and fluctuations are also very high. The reason why it is difficult to communicate at the atomic level. Chen Chen hearing this nodded, and then said with a smile again, very good, but compared to these, I am more interested in its price and capacity. $100,000 per gram. After thinking about it, Professor Charles was somewhat blushed with shame, these all are particle accelerator maintenance costs that's all, and the production capacity is also very low. Even if the particle accelerator is continuously operated for a month, it can only produce about one kilogram. Isotope of aluminium. Chen Chen hearing this not at all say more, this price is in his expectation. The high offset metal is called this name because the metal atoms are filled with a lot of extra neutrons, which causes the element structure to shift, so the finished product is called high offset metal, which actually refers to it. The aluminium has neutron shift phenomenon. Because of this, the price of this isotope has far surpassed that of gold. Although it is not as difficult to produce as some artificial elements of the periodic table after 100, it is almost the same. It seems that if you want to produce this element, you also need a special production equipment. Chen Chen meditated. Dot. Next, Chen Chen asked Professor Charles to continue his research work. After all, Professor Charles is a high energy physics professional not an engineer in charge of production. Researching high offset metals is just taking advantage of the trend that's all. If you let him specially manufacturing this material is simply reckless waste of natural resources. Now that this isotope of aluminium has been produced, the next step is to develop a special equipment for manufacturing this substance, thereby reducing operating costs and increasing production. These projects will be little X finds others to complete. After coming out of the Department of High Energy Physics, Chen Chen thought for a while, not at all, went to the training field according to the plan of the past. Now the field energy has passed the exponential growth period and started to level off, but Chen Chen found exercise, field energy is still increasing, but the magnitude is very small that's all. Compared with three years ago, Chen Chen's field energy has improved several levels in both explosive power and precision, and it is basically incomparable. But today, Chen Chen decided to do another thing. Entered the teleportation room at the top of the spy lab again. As the black ball was teleported, when the eyes opened again, Chen Chen appeared in another teleportation room with a black ball, and waited until he walked out of the teleportation room. I saw myself appearing on a huge black cruise ship. This cruise ship is completely dark, with a length of more than 400 meters and a width of 810 meters. Even if Bold comes in person, it will take 8 seconds to run from one side of the ship to the other. And the displacement of this cruise ship far exceeds that of the aircraft carrier reaching a staggering 400,000 tons. This cruise ship is the black light that Chen Chen spent 1.5 billion US dollars to customize and launched for six years. At this time, the black light was driving on the open sea, and the sea was endless. Only a hundred black riders were working on it, driving the entire cruise ship wandering on the surface. Now, we are in the sea territory on the high seas of the Indian Ocean. There are no ships passing by within a radius of 5,000 kilometers, and there is no satellite surveillance overhead. You can start working with confidence. At this time, Xiao X's voice came from the headset, My Godfather, are you really ready to start the test now? Get ready to start. I have been thinking about it for a week. I need to face it anyway. Chen Chen nodded. Then he walked directly out of the transfer room, 
then followed the elevator to the deck on the first floor of the cruise ship, and at the same time took out a shiny long strip from his pocket. This long strip is white all over, and the fluorescence on its surface can be seen even in bright sunlight. Only at the end can you see a metallic USB port. This is a USB flash drive. That's right. This USB flash drive is the basis for Chen Chen to call the wind and summon the rain since he started with nothing. It's just different from the unremarkable U-disc that used to be black. At this time, the outer shell of the U-disc is already covered with fluorescence. These fluorescences are actually nothing but the starlight that appeared on it. Dot. A long time ago, Chen Chen discovered that after a USB flash drive is charged with a certain amount of power, the surface will start to flash a little bit of rays of light, just like the starlight in the night sky shining brightly, and the more power is charged, starlight will be more and more. Now, Chen Chen has not used it again in the past three years. At the same time, the spy laboratory has three high-power nuclear fusion reactors that charge it day and night. Now that the power has accumulated to a certain level, the U-disc is actually the first stopped absorbing power once. This U-disc is actually full. All of this surprised Chen Chen. This is the characteristic of a full charge. The fragmented starlight on the surface of the USB flash drive is completely connected, turning the black USB flash drive into an LED light, which is like a fluorescent light that glows all the time. Great. It looks very funny. Now. The USB flash drive has been filled for a whole week. Chen Chen every day all thinks about how to experiment, because Chen Chen remembers that the USB flash drive has undergone a change. That was the first time starlight appeared on a USB flash drive. At that time, the USB flash drive suddenly opened a new function, creating a Schwarzschild's throat that can be freely accessed, allowing creatures to be in reality and film shuttle within the plane. Now, the USB flash drive has undergone a second change. According to the previous rules, can it be considered that the USB flash drive has once again opened a new function? No, it is inaccurate to use on to describe it. It should be said that unlocked is correct, because the functions of the USB flash drive are originally there and these functions will only be unlocked after the battery reaches a certain level. Therefore, in order to verify the U-disc changed at this time, Chen Chen finally selected an unmanned sea territory and prepared to test it on his own cruise ship Black Light. These thoughts flashed through Chen Chen's mind, and then the two Black Riders moved a desk and a laptop and placed them in front of Chen Chen. This was all the preparations. Seeing this, Chen Chen pondered for a while. And finally he took a deep breath and slowly inserted the luminous USB disk into the laptop in front of him. Ding dong. With a soft beep of the Windows operating system, the USB flash drive was recognized successfully, and a new removable drive letter option appeared on the screen. Seeing this, Chen Chen's finger slid lightly on the touch panel, and then with a cacker, he clicked on the removable drive on the computer. Suddenly, rows of familiar but unfamiliar movie names appeared on the laptop screen. Seeing these names, Chen Chen thought for a while, instead of opening those movies rashly, he dragged a copy of Resident Evil from the computer into the USB flash drive. The reason for this is that Chen Chen understands that in the face of infinite unknowns, there is only one way to minimize potential dangers, and that is to two powers harm each other, whichever is less. Although it took three years to fully charge the USB flash drive, there is probably only one opportunity for experimentation, but as nuclear fusion reactor technology becomes more mature in the future, the charging speed will become faster and faster. So Chen Chen I would rather open a Resident Evil with no use value but a very low degree of danger than open another plane with extremely high use value but full of unknown dangers. Thinking of this, Chen Chen dragged Resident Evil into the USB flash drive, and then tapped it gently, click. With a light sound, Chen Chen suddenly felt a gust of wind blowing on his face. The breeze messed up Chen Chen's hair. But Chen Chen seemed to feel that something was wrong, because although he was on the deck, 
The sea was calm at this time, and even the sea wind was blocked by the Sixten Mater ship building, and this gust of wind came from the direction of the screen. Subconsciously, Chen Chen quickly stepped back, far away from the computer screen. Oh la la, the next second, the entire black light suddenly made a violent turbulence, and at the same time a wailing sound as if the giant beast was dying. The moving ship started to be torn apart a little bit. This kind of tearing started from the ship building on the deck. The black light cruise ship is as high as 715 meters. There are 15 layers of buildings above the deck, which are like skyscrapers. But at this time, these buildings are the naked eye's visible speed twists and tears quickly, and the part under the tear disappears. Strangely, no, not disappearing but seems to have entered another space. Chen Chen's pupils shrank slightly. He hurriedly separated from the black light and hovered in midair. Only then did he discover that a strange light spot appeared out of thin air on the deck of the black light. This light spot is irregularly circular, with a diameter of nearly 100 meters. It hangs above the height of the black light deck. At this time, as the black light sails, the ship building passing by the light spot disappears a little bit, and at the position where the edge of the light spot is in contact with the black light, it is tearing at a speed that naked eye can see. For the huge kinetic energy of the black light, even steel is as fragile as a piece of paper. That spot, Chen Chen's pupils shrink slightly. The light spot looks as fragile as a soap bubble, but it is firmly fixed in the void. While the black light is like a paper boat, any position that touches the light spot is fast. The tear disappears. That light spot is a wormhole. At this moment, Chen Chen has a clear comprehension in his heart, which is different from the black Schwarzschild throat produced by the previous U disc, which is only the size of the screen. This is a larger wormhole, and it will not move with the screen. Could it be said? Chen Chen gave a chuckle in his heart and he faintly had a bad guess that this is a permanently solidified wormhole. No, at this level, it can no longer be called Schwarzschild's throat or wormhole. The huge light spot in front of it should have a more serious name in the physics world Rosenbridge. The reason why Chen Chen has a permanent presence in Chen Chen's heart is that the light spot did not move with the computer screen. This is the biggest evidence, because Chen Chen has tried the channel opened by the U-Disc many times before. Although the previous channel can pass through human beings or at least large machinery, it is always only the size of a computer screen from the outside and even if the computer moves or even moves being destroyed will not affect the stability of the channel. The only way to close the channel is to unplug the U-Disc. Nowadays, this light spot is not only bigger, it even stays in place when the computer screen moves with the black light number, which is 2nm ridiculous. Not only that, Chen Chen moved towards the USB flash drive plugged into the laptop again only to see that the USB flash drive has long lost its luster and restored to its previous dark appearance, which means it is stored in the USB flash drive. The electricity was consumed again. Without power, the channel can still exist. The corners of Chen Chen's mouth twitched uncontrollably. At this moment, the vibration in his heart was no less than that of the black light and he could only watch the black light's deck building being torn and swallowed by the light spots, and those torn floors all entered the world on the opposite side of the spot. X, I seem to be playing big. Looking at the huge light spot under his feet, Chen Chen didn't know whether to cry or laugh. The damage of the black light was second. The key was that he opened a door to earth in an unprecedented way. A Rosen bridge leading to another world. Super USB Chapter 496 Super USB Chapter 496 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. As more and more parts of the ship building fell into the light spot, the entire black light was finally stuck on this huge light spot, stuck in the Rosen Bridge leading to another world. Chen Chen sighed, he hovered in midair and began to walk around in front of this light spot, and finally determined that this light spot was transparent from front to back. That is to say, no matter the front or back of the light spot, you can enter from it the world across the passage. When viewed from the side, 
The light spot does not have any thickness. Chen Chen took a sandal chair and threw it over. The sandal chair also penetrated the light spot smoothly, that is to say, it is 90 degrees to the light spot on the side. The channel does not exist. My godfather, can you be sure that the light spot is in a static state? So far, this is indeed the case. Chen Chen nodded. I know what you are worried about. What you worry about is whether the Rosen Bridge is in a relatively fixed position or an absolutely fixed position. Yes, Little X replied, if it's relative, it's nothing, but if it's an absolutely fixed position, then it's troublesome, because of Earth's revolution and the solar system's revolution, the existence of the Rosen Bridge may even change. Cut the entire Earth into one blade, don't worry. The solar system is moving at a speed of about 240 km per second in the universe, I have not noticed any changes in the position of the light spot in the past few minutes. It's the power of you disc. Chen Chen replied, in other words, this Rosen bridge should be in a fixed position in sync with earth, then rest assured. Little Xiaed in relief, what kind of situation are you in the now? Do you need help? No help is needed. I can try to remove the USB flash drive, maybe. Speaking, Chen Chen beckoned with one hand, and suddenly the black USB flash drive on the computer on the deck flew out and flew directly into Chen Chen's hands. Chen Chen put away the USB flash drive and looked at the light spot in front of him again, but found that the light spot still existed. This step completely confirmed Chen Chen's prediction that this is a permanent solidified Rosen bridge. It seems that removing the U-disc does not turn off the light spot. In that case, I have to try another method. Seeing this, Chen Chen is no longer entangled in how to turn off the light spot. He is ready to solve the problem from the root, that is, to remove the black light number and escape. As for this huge light spot that appears out of thin air, sorry, what does the Rosen Bridge appear in the Indian Ocean have to do with Chen Chen? Thinking of this. Chen Chen ordered the black rider driving the black light to start reversing the black light, but after a few minutes of running the propeller in the opposite direction, an awkward situation occurred. The black light has been completely stuck and can't get out even when it reverses. See this, Chen Chen shook the head. He couldn't even back up, so there was only one way left. I saw his expression congealed and the black light stuck on the light spot began to slowly break from the place where the ship building and the light spot touched, and a low sound of metal tearing came, and the sound was sour, extremely. It is as if an invisible blade cut from the top floor of the ship building, part of the ship building of the black light began to tear apart by itself, bang. Suddenly, a ball of fire rose from the sky above the black light but it extinguished out of thin air before it burned completely, as if a pair of invisible hands had extinguished the fire. This process has lasted for more than 30 minutes. At this time, Chen Chen floating in midair has already seen sweat on his forehead. The position where his eyes are staring is constantly torn apart, sparks and lightning all the way, and finally followed by a sound with a huge wailing. The huge body of the black light slowly shook and with the scars and billowing smoke, it broke away from the light spot. It's just that, at this time, the buildings above the black light deck seem to have been chewed by a dog. Nearly half of the residential area disappeared without a trace, while the remaining half of the residential area was completely deformed, as if it had been hit the cake looks a mess. Fortunately, it was just a problem with the building on the deck, and the cab is still intact. Chen Chen breathed a sigh of relief not enough as if he had thought of something, and immediately ordered, 30 black riders bring enough food, weapons and shooting equipment to enter the light spot for preliminary exploration. If you encounter problems, please send them at any time. People return to report. Following his orders, 30 black riders rushed in like warriors, and then the silhouette of these 30 people flashed, and disappeared in the light spot. Seeing this, Chen Chen landed on the black light again but the black light not at all left immediately, but anchored in the peripheral zone of the light spot and waited quietly, including Chen Chen, all black riders are not afraid of T-virus, because black rider itself is the product of T-virus fusion with human embryos, 
and Chen Chen has also been injected with a modified version of T-Virus to enhance physique. This is also Chen Chen the movie Resident Evil was chosen as the reason for this experiment. The other reason is that compared to Chen Chen opening a plane every time, that plane is in a state of being destroyed, so Chen Chen naturally refuses to open those planes that have not been opened before, otherwise that the plane is like Elysium space. There is some weird thing that can instantly the entire human civilization, what to do, in comparison. The Resident Evil plane is the best to get it done. No, now although there is an accident, Chen Chen not only has no guilt, but wants to laugh a little. He knows the nature of the T-Virus, and he also has the antidote for the T-Virus. He is not afraid of the virus leaking. Therefore, this completely open Resident Evil plane is almost equivalent to a new world without defense and threat! Exclamation mark. However, it is a pity that this new world cannot be fully owned by Chen Chen. After all, it is exposed to the sea. Even if it is not discovered by other forces, it will be a matter of time. Even more how Chen Chen alone it is also difficult for Chen to develop an entire world ruin alone. But after thinking about it, Chen Chen left these questions behind. Now the character hasn't been written yet. It's not for this reason. Although it is the same channel opened by the U-Disc, no one knows. For the situation on the opposite side of the passage, Chen Chen did not enter the passage in person for this reason. But very quickly, about three hours later, a black rider returned from the opposite side of the passage. It had just left the passage and immediately got empty and landed on the deck of the black light. However, at this time, a negative pressure tent has been temporarily erected on the deck of the black light. This black rider first walked into the tent to isolate him, and then several black riders rushed forward to carry on his whole body. The microorganisms are extracted and then the whole body is disinfected. The shooting images he brought back also appeared on a new computer screen. Under the control of a black rider, this image opened quickly, and Chen Chen's eyes were first seen by the half of the ship building lying on the ground, with the black light technology logo on it and then the screen moved slowly. A desolate large plane was exposed in the screen. The video was recorded after entering the spot, and the time was also marked on it. At this time, it seemed that it was the morning on the opposite side. There were fragments of plants on the ground, apart from this, was a lot of rubble and gravel. Only from a distance can you see scattered buildings on the horizon. Next, the black rider who was in charge of filming kept moving forward moving towards the direction where the buildings existed. Because there is no transportation machine, Black Rider can only run on its legs, and gradually there are some flattened house ruins along the way. These ruins are almost buried by dust and gravel, a scene formed by stacking stones piled together. Seeing this, Chen Chen seems to understand the location on the opposite side of the passage. Sure enough, about an hour later, this black rider rushed to the locations with sporadic towering buildings. These buildings were two layer small buildings. At this time, they had already collapsed and were buried by yellow sand, showing only the topmost position. The more you move forward, you will find that the terrain is getting flatter and flatter, and eventually it even sinks downward. When I saw this, Chen Chen was already certain that this was the city that initially leaked the T-Virus and was subsequently hit by a nuclear warhead raccoon city. Along the way, Black Rider did not find any zombies, nor any traces of living people. Everything was like returning to the most primordial state. After losing humanity, Earth was smoothing out the traces of the old time little by little. From the video, the world on the opposite side seems to have been a long time ago even longer than the biohazard plane that Chen Chen once visited. He once went to the biohazard plane six years ago. That time it was to find a solution to the black light virus that broke out in reality, and the changes in that seat are even greater than it was then. No, or it's not the seat plane that the channel opened this time, but another similar plane, as if Chen Chen could repeatedly take out the same item countless times. In the multiverse, Resident Evil there are countless parallel planes. But when he thought of this, Chen Chen expressed cold, he thought further, whether he found the Rosen Bridge first, or the cruise ship Blacklight left a huge ship building on the opposite side. It's nothing, 
you can play foolishly, as long as there is no evidence, nothing will admit that the Rosen Bridge was opened by himself. However, if the other side finds that this seat is the resident evil plane, then the situation is complicated. The technology of the Honeycomb Underground Base must not be known by the Earth Federation. After all, there is a biotechnology comparable to black light technology. Once acquired by the Earth Federation, it is easy to break Chen Chen's technological monopoly on the biological level. Apart from this, if the Earth Federation knows that this is the plane of Resident Evil, it is even more difficult to explain. Although Chen Chen is not afraid of the other party's use of coercion at this time, this is not the reason for letting himself be secretly exposed. At least in the past few years before flying into space, thinking of this, Chen Chen ordered the black light to be stationed here temporarily, and then he returned to the teleportation room and teleported back to the Spire experimental base. The first thing to return to the minaret, Chen Chen directly took out an effort wired suitcase from the arsenal. This was taken from a movie a long time ago, just to prevent just in case. The name of this movie is Special Forces, The Rise of Cobra. What's contained in the suitcase is a weapon called a nano insect missile. Simply put, this weapon contains 7 million mechanical insects with a diameter of only nanometers. Once launched, these the mechanical insect will rush out to destroy all the matter in front of you, whether it is humans, plants, or reinforced concrete, everything is within the target it destroys, and it never stops. The only way to stop them from moving is to use a short circuit device that matches these nano insects. A nano insect missile has only one matching short circuit device. Just press the short circuit switch can make those nano insects completely short circuit and self destruct. In other words, this weapon is completely more deterrent than a nuclear bomb. Its formidable power can be large or small, as small as killing a building or even a group of citizens, and large enough to swallow a city. It is with no difficulty. It doesn't even have the nuclear radiation problem of a nuclear bomb. If you want, the user can launch it first and then deter the other party. As long as the other party doesn't want to watch their city swallowed up, they can only agree. The conditions of the user do. This is completely a strategic weapon. Chen Chen officially valued the value of this weapon, so he took a total of four at the time, one of which was used for research, and the remaining three were all placed in the arsenal. At this time, Chen Chen picked up two nano insect missiles at once. Then Chen Chen returned to the black light through the teleportation room again. This time he personally carried two suitcases and crossed the huge light spot with a diameter of 100 meters in front of him. Wow! At the moment of crossing the light spot, it was like Schwarz's child's throat that had been opened through a USB flash drive. Chen Chen first felt that his eyes were dark. As if he was plunged into a dark mud, his eyes completely lost the light, and at the same time an inexplicable sense of suffocation followed. It's like falling into an endless abyss. In this brief moment, Chen Chen even felt a sense of weightlessness, which was due to the disappearance of gravity. However, this feeling only existed for a moment. Before Chen Chen could react, his feet stepped on the ground again. Immediately Chen Chen opened his eyes. At the entrance, the first is the wreckage of the ship building of the black light. The wreckage is more than 40 meters high and stands on the plane like a half building. It looks magnificent but a little abrupt. Super USB Chapter 497 Super USB Chapter 497 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. A few days later, a video suddenly appeared on YouTube, the world's largest website. This is a common vertical screen video recorded on a mobile phone. It was sent by a little unknown tubing blogger. I saw a sea of stormy clouds, storms and thunder, and the clouds above my head seemed to be it is only a hundred meters away from the sea giving people a sense of depression as dark clouds are pressing on the city. The photographer seems to be standing on a freighter, and a large number of red and blue containers can be seen in the lens. At this time, the lens also follows the freighter one after another. However, as the photographer's lens turned, something special appeared in the lens. It is a huge light spot, 
emitting rainbow-like multicolored colors, and the whole is translucent, like a rainbow standing on the sea. At this time, the photographer is still a little far away from the rainbow spot, but the spot is really conspicuous in the dark weather, and in the video, it is obvious that several people are constantly talking, and these people's topics are also around this spot of light. Some people guessed that it was a rainbow, but they were immediately rejected by others, because it is now in the rainstorm phase, and no sunlight can shine through the dense dark clouds to form a rainbow. Some people believed that the seabed biog is leaked, but it was quickly denied. As the freighter approached, the full picture of the light spot gradually emerged. In the previous shooting, the freighter was at the right rear of the light spot, so the light spot seemed completely flat, like a vertical strip, but as the freighter came to the right side of the light spot, everyone finally saw the light spot. It turned out to be irregularly round. Moreover, the light spot is not connected to the sea surface, but it is obviously higher than the sea surface. It is just because of the freighter route problem. The freighter is not at all too close to the body of the light spot and there is no comparison with the surface of Shanghai. When everyone talked, they agreed on how big the light spot is, not at all. Then, the freighter gradually moved away from the light spot, and the photographer stopped shooting until almost out of sight. This video, which was less than 10 minutes in length, immediately attracted a crowd of people eating melons on YouTube. They also discussed what the light spot was, get lost, so, what exactly is that thing? What was taken in this video? What did I watch? Dean of Zanhu Medical Academy, I'll come first, that is a plastic bag. Psycho, isn't it a rainbow? I thought it was really a rainbow, but what if it wasn't a rainbow? The illiterate said it was embarrassing. Kill, why is the quality of a video so confused now? The hands are still shaking, as everyone knows. With the improvement of mobile phone pixels, the chances of Earth all players getting UFOs or dragons less and less. Dresds, that is obviously a wormhole, the kind that can lead to the foreign world. The account has been cancelled, some people actually said that this kind of video is fake, is it absolutely true? I was there at the time, I was the dark cloud dog. Leal, it seems that things in 1999 can't be concealed. At first, this video not at all attracted the attention of any department thinking that this is just the daily behavior of a certain special effects producer, but as the second, third and even more and more people issued similar in the video, gradually, a strange light spot appeared in the sea territory somewhere in the Indian Ocean also gradually spread. At first, some people thought it was a means of propaganda for movies, but as more and more people came forward and said that they saw it with their own eyes, even after the coordinates on sea were completely exposed. Gradually, many people finally started believe in the authenticity of this video. Some people even publicly claimed that they had rented a Mauritius boat to explore, and indeed found the spot about 2,000 nautical miles southeast of Mauritius. However, the spot of light was located in the high air of several 10 meters. Although it was not reachable, he still tried to throw things into the spot of light. The strange thing was that the spot of light was actually swallowed. Objects thrown in, as soon as the news came out, it immediately attracted the fire of countless people. Many people who had time and money flew to Mauritius to try to get to know the space wormhole that has been making a lot of noise recently. It's just that when the first group of people went to Mauritius, they were prohibited from going to sea at the port. The reason was that a hurricane was about to hit nearby and any ships with long distance capabilities were prohibited from going to sea. Even, some tourists who came to explore even found the silhouette of the Earth Federation Coalition Army in the harbor. As soon as the news broke on the internet, there was an uproar. If this group of people were still half trusted before, but they were not even allowed to go to sea at this time, isn't it true that the spot is really problematic? but just when everyone was discussing spiritedly that the light spot was really something extraordinary, new news broke out soon, a tourist who went on an expedition posted a post saying that he had discovered a great secret, it turned out that all this turned out to be that Mori asked for a large boat charter to attract tourists to increase business, so they sent out these false news, and those videos they are all p. 
and those who spread the evidence are all hired by the chartering yard. The whole incident is a premeditated and planned propaganda method. Sure enough, within a few hours, more people began to expose the crimes of the chartering yard, from making false videos to forging evidence to attract tourists and chatting records. For a while, I felt that the people who had been deceived were excited and condemned again and again. The website of this chartering yard was completely shut down due to complaints. Until a day later, the chartering yard personally apologized and repeatedly promised not to commit such cleverness again. This allowed the anger of the public officials to calm down and slowly dissipated. So, a wave of rumors that was raging died down. When I was in a frenzy about this rumor on the internet, Chen Chen was in a huge empty room. He was sitting cross-legged in the center of the room, with his eyes closed, and he could see his eyeballs through the eyelids turning violently. This room is as huge as a football field, but it's empty. The weird thing is that the room doesn't use any supporting pillars. The floor is black marble, and the overhead is a shed structure. The light shone from the roof illuminating the entire room without any shadows. This is not so much a room as it is a quiet room. At this time, Chen Chen meditated in the quiet room. This is a set of methods he gradually summarized in three years to improve the accuracy of field energy. In this extremely quiet and extremely empty area, he cannot disturb to observe everything in the world, but to perceive the flow of every trace of air, to perceive the touch of every trace of field energy. At this time, Chen Chen's field energy accuracy can be described as advanced by leaps and bounds compared to three years ago. Once he could only magnify reality up to 300 times, barely seeing the presence of bacteria, but now he is right the control accuracy of the field energy has reached more than a thousand times magnification, and he can use the field energy to perceive many microorganisms, and those bacteria are like ants in his perception. If he wants to, he can see all of them. At this level, Chen Chen can already easily perceive the fine dust and microbes around him with the help of the field. When the field can scan a person's face, if he wants to, he can see every hair of the other person. A paw. More than that, the mites and various parasites in human paws are as conspicuous as a cockroach on his face in his perception. At first, Chen Chen was still a little uncomfortable, but after such a long time, he gradually adapted to it. In his eyes, the world is completely different from the world in the eyes of ordinary people, and even the aesthetics are different from humans. The gap. At this moment, Chen Chen, who closed his eyes, was suddenly frowned and slowly opened his eyes. At the end of the quiet room, a red light was lit on the intercom next to the door that entered and exited. This was a sign that Xiao X had something to tell him because the quiet room should be kept as quiet as possible, Chen Chen will take away the headset that is in contact with Xiao X every time he trains. Only in some emergency situations, Xiao X will come through the red light on the door. Call yourself. Now that the light is on, it means that Xiao X has important things to inform himself. Thinking of this, Chen Chen stood up slowly and he took a step forward. He searched his entire body and crossed a distance of more than 50 meters, and came to the door. Then Chen Chen just glanced at the red light, and suddenly the button next to the red light automatically sank and turned green. Your Excellency, the meeting application initiated by the two supervisors has been activated. The Lilith Council will be opened in 10 minutes. If you do not participate, you will automatically be regarded as abstention. Little X's voice came from the intercom, are you going to participate in this Lilith Council? Of course. Chen Chen nodded, he closed his eyes slightly, put away the field energy in his mind, and immediately opened the door in front of him. Suddenly, what appeared in front of Chen Chen was a standard transmission room with a black ball. Immediately afterwards, the black ball emitted a slight blue light shining on Chen Chen's body, and from Chen Chen's perspective, he could only feel the blue light flashed in front of him, and then the blue light disappeared again without a trace. It's just that when this blue light flashed past, it represented Chen Chen's displacement in space. At this time, he had returned to the Spire experimental base. Yes, the quiet room used for practice field is not in the minaret, 
or even in Namibia, in the entire black light technology, except Chen Chen and Xiao X, no one knows where the quiet room is. After returning to the minaret, Chen Chen walked directly into a conference hall with a huge conference table. This conference hall did not have any dress up, only painted white wall paint, almost kept the most the only state of primordial that can show that it is the symbol of a conference hall is the huge round table and five luxurious chairs. After sitting on one of the chairs, Chen Chen said, I'm ready. Then his eyes flashed. The holographic environment simulator located in the four corners of the room suddenly started. Chen Chen only felt saw a flash. When he saw it thoroughly, he realized that he had appeared in a luxurious conference hall. Furthermore, four people have been seated on the other four chairs in the conference hall, but these four people are all dark shadows, not only can't see their faces, even men and women, tall, short and thin. The only thing that can distinguish who is who is the number plate in front of everyone on the conference table. From Chen Chen's perspective, the numbers of the four people on the conference table are 01 to 04. The same is true for Chen Chen himself. He has completely transformed into a humanoid figure, and in front of him is the 05 brand. The reason for this is to keep the identity of the top decision-making level of foundation confidential. At the beginning, Chen Chen asked for Great Continents District to send a person to the highest decision-making level of foundation to control and supervise the organization. The specific identity of this person is the highest secret of the organization and can only be replaced by a code name. Looks like, behind these dark shadows, may be the president of a continent, may be a group of staff, may be many people share a number, may be dozens of people. Even Chen Chen doesn't know who is sitting opposite. Who is it? Very well. The last supervisor has arrived. In this case, our meeting can begin. At this time, seeing Chen Chen appearing on the seat, the black shadow sitting opposite Chen Chen spoke immediately, but his voice seemed to have been processed, and there was an electronic sound that made people confused. Who is it? Let's get started. Chen Chen nodded, lightly said with a smile. I heard that two supervisors joined forces to initiate a meeting application. Did they find any important clues? Of course yes, otherwise we will not initiate this Lilith meeting. One of the supervisors replied, with the number 01 in front of his position, I believe you should have noticed. In the past few days, a set of weird videos has appeared on the YouTube channel. It's a huge light spot that stands above the sea. I think everyone has noticed it. Chen Chen hearing this nodded. At first not at all people taking seriously, but then I gradually realized something was wrong, because some people even went to see the spot in person, and there was a rumor that Space Wormhole was there. Oh one continued, so for insurance, I personally sent someone to check it out and I found that weird spot, and as far as I know, that spot really has the ability to swallow objects, so I contacted after 04, and then communicated with Mauritius through the Earth Federation, blocked the port there, and interfered with the internet public opinion, finally suppressing this matter. Good job. Chen Chen patted, then what is that spot? Oh one have you found it? Not yet. After all, the incident happened suddenly. 04 and I joined forces to initiate this meeting now, in order to discuss a countermeasure. Isn't that our foundation's obligation? Not only to study what the spot is, and keep the outside world secret, never let the information leak out. Super USB Chapter 498 Super USB Chapter 498 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. I agree to explore that spot. Hearing O One's words, Chen Chen agreed, this kind of thing does not actually require voting, just let the people below do it. After all, investigating the unknown is indeed our responsibility and obligation to the Black Light Foundation. Dot. I agree too. O2 and O3 on the side expressed their opinions. The problem now is that we need to cooperate with the Mauritian official, but the other party not at all joined the Black Light Foundation agreement. At this moment, O1 suddenly turned his head and looked towards Chen Chen, 
our foundation is not established. Many countries and continents have not joined the Black Light Foundation Agreement. If we send a task force to investigate, what if Mauritius obstructs it? It is always impossible to communicate with Mauritius using our original identity. Chen Chen hearing this leaned back in his chair somewhat speechlessly. I have to say that it's not good for the power sharing parliament. In order to borrow the name of the four great continents district and at the same time to closely unite the four great continents districts. Chen Chen has added a lot of good things. Now he has indeed borrowed the power of the four great continents area, but it seems to be looking for a tiger's skin. It is not a day or two for this new organization to run smoothly. In desperation, Chen Chen had to say, Oh one, your idea is wrong. Oh, oh one lifts the head with some surprises and surprises. Foundation is really just in its infancy. Both funds and manpower are seriously insufficient. Chen Chen spread his hands, a little serious, and the Black Light Foundation is more like an extension of the rights of the four great continents area, a truly international military organization. I don't think the four great continents area and black light technology are perfect different forces, we should be more of a family. Everyone is stunned for hearing this. I know that your identities are all related to your whole body, but have you ever thought that your identities have a time limit? What if the time limit expires? Chen Chen Ernest and well may aunt advised. The Black Light Foundation is different. Our supervisory status is the real power. After your presidency is over, if you still have such a layer of real power, so is it also equivalent to a more generous political bargaining chip. So I think that the four great continents area should establish a logistic stocking department for the Black Light Foundation. Even in countries that have not signed the Black Light Foundation agreement, we can successfully make Black Light Foundation performs tasks locally, after all, some crises cannot be alleviated. After saying all this, Chen Chen sincerely looked towards everyone. A very good idea. After a short silence, O3 suddenly speaks slowly, although I am not the person you think of, I can indeed represent the meaning of him, but the premise is that the Black Light Foundation can really stand great use. Yes, it is difficult to increase departments in vain, and it is difficult for Congress to pass it. After all, North. Our continent is not my word. O1 also echoed, but the idea of O5 is very good. You can discuss it again. As for now, since O5 has said so, then I am willing to contact the Mauritian official in an open identity and let them tell us about the Black Light Foundation the task force temporarily releases and cooperates. Me too. Secondary. Secondary. Everyone expressed their opinions. So, the first action meeting of the Black Light Foundation came to an end in such a discussion. Then, the silhouettes of everyone flashed and disappeared in their respective positions. Chen Chen was the last one to leave the venue. After he quit the holographic conference, he leaned back in his chair gloomily, rubbing his temples and meditating silently. Godfather, don't worry, after all, this is only the first time. Foundation still needs to run in. Little X comforted on the side. Please don't mind. I understand. Chen Chen nodded. Actually, I had predicted this situation a long time ago, but I am used to it in black light technology, and I am still a little unhappy with this kind of pester and chirp. But you do need to pull on the tiger skin of the four great continents area. X helplessly said, otherwise, the Black Light Foundation wants to become a legal military department of the Earth Federation, and it is almost impossible for them to have unimpeded access anywhere in the world. Moreover, they have not experienced anything after all, so they don't know how to like Foundation taking seriously. So, we must highlight the role of Foundation. Chen Chen suddenly chuckled, only when you have experienced war can you understand the value of peace. Only when you have suffered humiliation can you understand the powerful truth. Only when you have experienced pain can you be willing to be treated with tenderness. The inferior nature of speaking, a cold light flashed in Chen Chen's eyes. He crossed his hands on the table and muttered in a low voice, So, it's time for the world to feel pain. Dot. The Indian Ocean night and June is often calm. On this day, 
several patrol boats were cruising on the high seas sea territory somewhere in the Indian Ocean. This sea territory was calm and waveless, but as the sun went down, a strange and huge light spot gradually emerged. If tourists see it at this time, they will find that this huge light spot is actually a supernatural phenomenon that has been raging on the oil pipeline recently. It's just that the video was finally falsified by netizens, and they didn't expect that it actually existed. However, this sea territory has been closed off by various countries for various reasons. For at least one month, no cruise ships or freighters will pass this sea territory. And on these patrol boats, the flag of the African island nation Mauritius is also marked. At this time, on the deck of one of the patrol boats, two maritime policemen were chatting with cigarettes in their mouths. Their faces were shining with a big flame. The flames illuminated their cheeks and could be seen vaguely. The rough skin of the two men eroded by the sea breeze. Jace, have you heard that there is a new bar on the Lynn Wharf recently opened by a hilly? If this mission is over. How about going there to be happy? Of course, but I don't know what the consumption level of the new bar is. I will definitely not go if the price is too high. I still like the atmosphere of Simpson Bar. Come on Jace, I don't know you yet. You don't like the atmosphere of Simpson's Bar. You like Emily the dancer there, right? Ha ha ha, you found out. As the two laughed, Suddenly something seemed to flash past the corner of one of their eyes. He turned his head subconsciously, but saw the huge light spot beside him. At this time, the ship was parked in front of the light spot. The huge light spot seemed to be the second round moon, even covering the misty moonlight. What Jace are you looking at? Haven't you seen enough of this spot after watching it for a few days? No. I seemed to see something flying into the spot just now. Are you sure? Could it be a seabird? If something is abnormal, we must report it. It's possible that I'm dazzled, maybe. Obviously, the two did not at all take this matter seriously. At this time, on the other side of the Rosen Bridge, Chen Chen has re-entered the land of the plane of Resident Evil, but at this time, unlike the last time he came, the entire world has become empty. Whether it is the wreckage of the former black light, or distant buildings, disappeared without a trace, and disappearing together is the honeycomb laboratory located underground. Chen Chen flew up into the sky along the light spots and flew a circle in all directions. This was nodded with satisfaction. After the past few days, the nano insects have swallowed all the artificial within a radius of thousands of miles. Trace. Seeing this, Chen Chen felt that it was almost two. He directly pressed the buttons of the two short circuitors, and immediately, the two groups of nano insects that had swallowed countless substances finally died and turned into dust everywhere. However, Chen Chen has to do more than just this. He flew over the big pit where the hive disappeared and suddenly took out a few transparent petri dishes. These petri dishes are only palm size and transparent. But what is strange is that there is a piece of meat in these petri dishes. These meat chunks are red all over, and they slowly creep in it seems to be breathing, and at the same time, you can even see the densely packed tentacles extending all around the meat. This photo show is really disgusting. When any normal person sees this mass of flesh and blood, they will have an inexplicable heart palpitation, and even suspect that it should come from hell. At this time. Chen Chen could use it to open the lid of the first petri dish, and together with the petri dish, threw the weird mass of meat into the big pit constructed by the honeycomb. But this is not the end. Next, Chen Chen started flying at full speed in midair. At this time, his flying speed was no longer inferior to the world peak fighter, but within an hour he found a vast forest, and then Chen Chen threw the first two petri dishes. In this way, Chen Chen spent a whole night flying over a dozen locations, and even dropped petri dishes in some urban ruins. After throwing everything away in one night, he returned to the spot with satisfaction, then suddenly turned around and looked towards this already desolate world. In fact, during the sowing of the seeds, he tried to find survivors, but perhaps because of being close to the outbreak center. Chen Chen did not find a single survivor on the map of North America, but only some traces of survivors, but those traces have long been empty. Apart from this, Zombie found some, 
but the number of zombies is also very small. After all, decades have passed since the outbreak, most of the zombies have disappeared long ago, and the few surviving zombies have also fallen like dead shady areas with slow air circulation have entered a deep sleep state. Unless humans pass by them during their lifetime, these zombies will be awakened again like living dead, chasing the footsteps of survivors. In most chances, they will only stay dormant until they run out of the last trace of nutrients within the body and die out. A long time ago, Chen Chen asked his men to experiment with the effect of T-virus. The final conclusion is, T-virus is like a program that can restart the human brain whose brain cells have not yet died leaving humans in a state of extremely low energy consumption. In this state, the dead body can move for months or even years, but it depends on the environment. If the nutrition is insufficient for a long time, their zombie will be starved to death, and if the zombie is injured, the wound will be inflammation and purulent. Necrosis can also occur, but this process is longer than that of a living person. As for T-virus brain cells, this is not unscientific, because in reality, scientists have done similar examples. They connected pig heads that had been dead for five or six hours to a special blood delivery system, through which artificial blood was pumped into the pig's brain to deliver nutrients and oxygen to the pig's brain cells, and the result was, part of the brain cells of the pig's brain are resurrected, some neurons have synaptic activity, and some brain cells have restarted their metabolic functions, and even the immune system continues to work. This experiment confirms that the brain after four hours of death still has some salvable properties, and the brain tissue may survive the body longer than modern medicine thinks. This is why the T-virus can restart the brain of the dead. Of course, if the death is too long, then the T-virus is also impossible to restart the dead body. At this time, Looking at the desolate and de-civilized world in front of him, Chen Chen slightly shook the head, the first lunar manned spacecraft of black light technology is about to launch, and the next step is to land on Firestar and Europa, pave the way for the next space colonization. This is a layer of insurance against the demise of mankind. Moreover, the establishment of the Black Light Foundation is also a layer of insurance. Apart from this, Chen Chen and the black light technology behind him are still a layer of insurance. With these three layers of insurance protection, the plane you are in will definitely not follow the old path of the biohazard plane. Thinking of this, Chen Chen used the invisibility device to return to the real world. Dot. Three days later, two transport ships of neither too big nor too small tonnage, under the escort of the only two small warships in Mauritius slowly pulled out under the spot of light. The two transport ships are loaded with grain, and there are also some unnamed equipment. The two transport ships are not so much transport ships, but more like scientific research ships. And on these transport ships, there are many soldiers wearing weird costumes. These people are uniformly wearing black combat uniforms, holding all kinds of exaggerated firearms, and the race is black white and yellow, and they are mixed with each other. The reason these people are soldiers is because they all have the logo of the Earth Union Army, and it is the Earth Union Army that has so many races mixed together. As the ship approached the light spot, on the crane of one of the ships, a device with a special shape and a long cable was lifted up, looking like a huge camera. Are you preparing to shoot a movie? Seeing this scene, the soldiers of Mauritius were stunned. Super USB Chapter 499 Super USB Chapter 499 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive, imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. Those from the Mauritian military were invited to the periphery. Speaking nicely requires them to block the sea territory, and talking less nicely, just don't watch what you shouldn't. Don't listen to what you shouldn't. Although everyone is uncomfortable, after all, it is only a small island country, facing the coalition army, it still has to be a human being with its tail sandwiched. And these new soldiers seem to be under the banner of the United Army, but in fact their true identity is the task force of the Black Light Foundation, a contingent independent of the world's military, 
even independent of Earth Special Forces of the Federation. This group of people come from special forces on the four continents. They can pass through various selections, and everyone has been signed a special confidentiality agreement. Not only are their salaries several times that of ordinary soldiers, but they must also hide their identity, whether it is relatives, friends, or even family members. They can only call themselves a coalition army, not a Black Light Foundation task force. At this time, as the two ships moored at the bottom of the light spot, the crane like device on the ship began to rise, and went a little deeper into the light spot. Suddenly, an amazing scene appeared. The task force saw that with the length of Crane's robotic arm, the weird machine at the top was slightly submerged in the light spot. But the light spot seemed to become a kind of channel, and the part of the light spot was basically does not extend from the other side of the spot. Suddenly, everyone couldn't help but their eyes widened, revealing an unbelievable expression. Although when signing the agreement, they were told that they might encounter many incredible supernatural events in the future, and their group was born to deal with supernatural events, but the agreement is after all an agreement. After this kind of thing, the impact on everyone's spirit is still very strong. The exploration mission was also composed of several mid-level officers selected from various continents, but they had obviously received news before, so when they saw the camera disappearing in the light spot, they were not at all too surprised, just there was a little surprise in his eyes. Immediately, several people were called into the cockpit of the ship. At this time, in the cockpit, a huge screen was emerging in the sky. Several researchers in white coats were constantly discussing what to do. When they saw a few people came in, they said, Our landing vehicle has landed. On the opposite side of the spot, the above judgment is correct. The spot is indeed a wormhole. No, more accurately, it is an einstein rosen bridge. Is there any danger across the light spot? A Central African officer asked subconsciously. Currently not at all, you can check it out here. One of the researchers pointed to the huge screen in front of them, now what is shown on the screen is the scene opposite the rosen bridge. It can be found that neither electromagnetic waves nor air can spread to this area of rosen bridge out of thin air. On the one hand, if you increase the physical channel, there is no problem. We extend the wireless electronics detector into the opposite world, and then use wireless electronics to control the landing car on the opposite side of the channel, while the transceiver is connected to the actual console through a cable, so we don't need to go to the opposite side to control it. The landing car on the opposite side of the rose and bridge moves forward. Everyone looked at the screen but saw the entire world was desolate, the dry soil on the ground was directly exposed to the surface, without the slightest vegetation cover, and the sky was blue and shining, with a huge sun high, hanging high, a scene on the screen is not much different from reality, this is the first thought in everyone's mind, our landing vehicle has analyzed the air and soil structure, ah, how do you say it, the researcher scratched some messy hair, and then said with a weird expression, if we didn't know that the Rosen Bridge in front of us, we would almost think that the other side of the light spot is also Earth, because whether it is air or land, the opposite is the same as Earth. Putting it that way, can we go directly across the passage without wearing protective gear? Another North American officer asked. That's not. The researcher hurriedly said, we are still testing the microorganisms on the opposite side of the spot. If the microorganisms on the opposite world are different, you still need to wear protective clothing when you enter the spot, because we don't know what the opposite microorganism world is. The ingredients are harmful to the human body. All right then. Everyone is nodded. Then, the picture on the screen continued to move and the landing vehicle as the main perspective kept moving towards all directions for exploration, but no matter which direction it faced, it was endlessly desolate, as empty as a desert. One hour, five hours, ten hours. Ten hours later, when the sky was filled with the evening glow, the power of the landing vehicle was finally about to run out. It returned to the spot from a few kilometers away and started charging on the charging port where the ship entered the spot. It has been probed for 10 hours, 
but nothing has been found. A researcher was a little embarrassed, the biggest discovery is some plants, these plants belong to the earth species, even very common on earth and the microbiological test did not find any microorganisms beyond the earth category. Will it be that the other side of the spot is actually somewhere in earth? Suddenly, an officer asked. This is impossible. An older bold researcher immediately replied, because we can judge based on the time zone, the Republic of Mauritius is the east fourth district. Now our time is seven o'clock in the evening and the opposite is in the afternoon. The time difference is about in three hours, it can be seen that the other party should be in the Estate District, which is part of the Zongzu District and the Oceania District, but the geomorphic structure on the opposite side does not correspond to the sun angle measured on the opposite side, even more how these two the continent area also not at all found similar light spots, which denies the possibility that the opposite side of the light spot is in Earth. Hearing this series of answers, the officer suddenly got his head big and shut up quickly. The test results have come out. At this moment, a researcher hurriedly walked over, and he handed the report in his hand to everyone in front of the screen, but after seeing the judgment result, everyone had a strange expression in their eyes. Are you sure you made a mistake? The bald researcher couldn't help questioning. This is the most detailed analysis. If this is all wrong then geographers don't have to go on. The researcher next to shook the head, I really didn't expect, it turned out to be. Hearing this, several military officers immediately came up and looked on the paper. As the most direct action personnel, they naturally have the right to view this secret. However, when these people saw the results of the report, they were all dumbfounded. According to the solar altitude, light and shadow measurement, geological inspection, and geomagnetic field analysis, the final diagnosis confirmed, the location opposite the Einstein Rosen Bridge is Oregon, North America, with a latitude and longitude of approximately 42 degrees 46 degrees n 117 degrees 124 degrees w. The other side of the light spot is North America, impossible. The officer in North America immediately shouted, impossible. North America is located in West 4th to West 8th. It is now in the early morning. How could it be North America? Calm down, Captain Allen. The bald researcher immediately explained. We did not say that the opposite of the light spot is the location of North America in reality, but the location of North America in the foreign world. Understand? Professor Will is right. We all know that the opposite is not North America. The officers from the central continent are also comfortable, as everyone explained. The officers in the North American region calm down. Now that the microorganisms have also passed the test, are we in? Another officer from the Northern Sea continent area suddenly asked. Although no abnormal microorganisms were detected, the opposite is the foreign world after all, so I have to prevent it. The Zongzu district officer immediately retorted. I think it is safe to wear protective clothing. That's right, we have only detected an area of tens of kilometers in a radius, and we don't know anything about the world on the opposite side of the spot. Many researchers are also in agreement. So, in the evening, the task forces on the two ships finally took action. They brought various marching supplies and then entered the light spot through the raised fire ladder. The name of the lieutenant in charge of the Zongzu district is Li Qiang. After intensive evaluation and selection into the foundation task force, he has maintained extremely excellent results. At this time, the foundation sent him as one of the lieutenants for this operation, and he was also well thought out of. At this time, he watched the soldier of task force climb up the fire ladder, and then tried to put his hands and arms into the light spot, and then boldly put half of his body out until it disappeared completely. This scene at first was a bit surprising, but as more people entered, everyone gradually became bolder. Finally, four officers from the four continents also disappeared one after another, leaving only a few team members here to respond. While passing the light spot, Li Qiang felt a momentary suffocation of vacuum. At the same time, his eyes became dark, and he seemed to have completely lost the light source, 
but in the next second he returned to normal again. His feet were already on the opposite side of the light spot on the world. Different from the reality where the light spot is located at an altitude of about 40 meters, at this time, on the other side, the light spot is flush with the ground. As long as the light spot is crossed, it is easy to find a balance point. But as soon as they stepped onto the ground, two soldiers stretched out their hands and pulled Li Qiang away from the previous position. Li Qiang turned back subconsciously, and he saw someone stepping over again in the spot, and he stood staggeringly, set it in place. This is the foreign world. Li Qiang looked all around and looked around. There was almost a wasteland around him, not to mention the traces of life. Even the plants were pitiful. I don't know if it is an illusion. In Li Qiang's feelings, the entire world exudes a breath of death. This is the world opposite the light spot, it is really desolate. At this moment, another officer suddenly sighed, and then he looked towards the other three people, three, we are based in front of the light spot, and one person is responsible for one direction. How about exploring all directions? Yes. I meant it a long time ago. Everyone did not think about it, and they all agreed. So, the four people divided their positions. Central continent was responsible for the east, North America was responsible for the west, Europe was responsible for the south, and the northern sea continent was responsible for the north. Some of the four contingents set up camps here. The others moved towards their respective directions to explore. In this operation, the foundation sent a total of 80 people, 20 people from each continent. It has to be said that even if they are the same foundation task force, the four teams still cannot be completely integrated, all of which are separate actions. In addition to historical reasons, the more reason is that each continent does not trust each other. Everyone is afraid that if officers from other continents come to command, they are likely to treat soldiers from a certain continent as soldiers cannon fodder. So, since no one can trust each other, it's okay to play with each other. The four parties don't bother each other, so there is a situation where there are four highest action officers. At this time, the officers of the Northern Sea Continent area were leading a group of people to explore the past, but because of the endless distance, everyone was not too nervous wearing protective clothing talking and laughing along the way. It wasn't until two hours of marching, when the sky was approaching the evening, that the officer drank a little to stop everyone, now the sky is dark, everyone rests in place, and when the striker returns from exploration, we are ready to return to the camp. So everyone sat down on the ground, some sang songs, some chatted with each other, if they weren't wearing protective masks, these people even wanted a drink. However, something strange happened. About half an hour later, the officer in the Northern Sea Continent area looked at his watch, but still did not wait for the forward to return to the camp to report the situation. It stands to reason that the forward must come back every half an hour. Thinking of this, the officer suddenly complexion changed. He took out the contact device. Call the porcupine. Call the porcupine. This is the Dongwu team. Sha sha sha. On the intercom, there was only a rustle, and apart from this did not answer. Damn. Call the porcupine. Call the porcupine. Please answer immediately if you hear it. The unwilling officer asked again, but his frequency is still the same. Gradually, all the soldiers stopped talking, they looked towards their officer captain and everyone's eyes flashed a solemn expression. It looks like something has happened to the porcupine. At this point, the officer finally gave up. He looked into the distance with some worry, but saw that the sky in the distance was grey and it seemed that a rain cloud was slowly approaching. He hesitated slightly. He wanted to tune to the channels of the other three teams, but after thinking about it, he finally did not do so. Instead, he held up the electromagnetic rifle in his hand and pulled the bolt skillfully at the same time. Make the sound of caca. Guys, it seems we are in trouble. Perhaps the porcupine is not satisfied with the water and soil, and he may be dehydrated when he squats in the pit. Someone echoed the sentence, which immediately caused a burst of laughter. It's just that, after all, the jokes are just for adjusting the atmosphere. Everyone still stood up one by one 
and began to check their weapons and supplies. The first class waited on the spot, ready to respond, the second and third classes will come with me, let's see what happened to the porcupine, the officer strode forward and waved his hand at the same time. Thirteen people immediately followed along, leaving only seven to stop in place. The sky is getting darker. Super USB Chapter 500 Super USB Chapter 500 To you can search for I have a Super USB flash drive. Imiabajimiabaj.com in Baidu to find the latest chapter. After the officer took the second and third squad on the road for 20 minutes, he finally stopped at one spot. Report, according to the footprints, the porcupine was missing here before. Another scout in charge of detecting the road crouched down and looked at the remaining footprints on the ground. I don't know how long no one has passed by here, and there is a layer of inexplicable floating soil on the ground so the previous scout left behind the footprints are clearly visible. The squad officer hearing this looked along the front, only to find that the final direction of the row of footprints was a huge deep pit. This deep pit is about two to three hundred meters in diameter and has an area of seven or eight football fields. It is like a geological collapse, because of the caverns in the ground, the ground collapsed. The footprints of that scout disappeared on the edge of the pit. Seeing this scene, the officer immediately stretched out his fist and made a gesture to stop alert, and the people more than 10 meters behind him immediately stopped and formed a defensive gun formation in a circle. Seeing this, the officer ordered the scout to join him and slowly approach the edge of the pit ahead. The two were not moving fast, and they moved forward a little bit with their guns. Before they even approached, the officer suddenly had a heart move. He took out a palm-sized drone from his body and then took out one. The remote controller with the thickness of the finger started to drive, and suddenly, the drone moved towards the deep pit with a low sound of wind. Immediately, on the night vision goggles that everyone was wearing, a screen began to be separated, and the drone began to play. As the drone slowly approached, the people gradually saw the side of the pit, but saw the opposite edge of the pit several hundred meters, there seemed to be a bright red thing creeping. Those squirming things resemble pythons and some resembled the tentacles of certain creatures. What the hell? The officer's footsteps were lighter. He held up the gun with his eyes flushed. While guarding the edge of the pit, he stared at the sight of the drone on the split screen, but the drone hadn't completely reached the depth. Above the pit, suddenly, a scarlet shadow rushed out of the deep pit. The drone was shot down before it had time to dodge. At the same time, a huge red tentacle suddenly sprang out from the edge of the pit, and it struck in the direction of the two of them like lightning. Fire! The officer loudly roared, pulling the trigger again and again, but the electromagnetic rifle in his hand did not at all produce the familiar peng peng gun sound. Instead, it was a series of low buzzing sounds, and when the sound passed into the ears of the two, the thick tentacles that were approaching them exploded, exploding a series of head-sized cavities. Pa pa pa. Suddenly, the bright red flesh exploded as if money were not needed. Because the tentacle couldn't bear more strength, it finally exploded forcibly, blood spattered the officer and another civilian scout. Fortunately, the two wore tight protective clothing, so they were not at all hurt. Crack. The tentacle slowly retracted, and at the same time the other half of the tentacle fell to the feet of the two of them like rotten flesh. However, before the two of them breathed a sigh of relief, a few more tentacles stretched out at the edge of the pit, and the officer's heart tightened. The electromagnetic rifle in his hand instinctively pulled the trigger, forming a metal in front of them. Storm. Buzz buzz om. The three tentacles exploded out of thin air, but the remaining two still broke through. The bullets built the ground barrier. One of them was wrapped around the scout. With just a flick, the scout didn't even say a word and was caught, dumped into the pit. The remaining one was wrapped around the officer's body, but it happened to block the muzzle of the electromagnetic rifle. In the next second, the tentacle had no time to exert its strength, so it snapped and blasted off. Exclamation mark. The officer walked a circle from the gate of the palace of the Lord of Gods, and he was startled in a cold sweat. He didn't even think back quickly. At this time, 
a crowd of people behind him finally came to the officer, tearing the remaining tentacles one after another. Broken, call, call, call. A palpitation appeared in the officer's eyes. He led the crowd to withdraw from a hundred meters away before stopping. The tentacles that stretched out from the deep pit also had limited sensing range. After feeling the target disappeared, he at the moderate pace retracted back. Captain, are you okay? Until this time, someone looked towards the officer who was in a panic, but then found that the arm position of the officer's protective suit was torn by the tentacles just now. Not only was it torn, but the arm under the protective suit was also torn. A large piece of flesh was dropped, revealing a bloody wound below. It's okay, it's just skin trauma that's all. The officer waved his hand and allowed the part-time medical soldier to take out a bottle of wound adhesive and sprayed it on his wound. Soon the wound was covered by a layer of gelatin. Also stopped the blood. The officer only felt that the hot pain suddenly eased a lot, replaced by a cool feeling. This wound adhesive is from the Blacklight Science and Biology Department. It contains disinfectant, which can not only clean and disinfect the wound, but also an analayer protective film which is breathable, can stop bleeding and help the wound healing, it's just that the price is ridiculously high, only the rich and imposing foundation in the whole world can afford it, what monster is in that pit, a soldier next to him couldn't help but ask, are they the aboriginals of this world, it is very likely, the officer nodded, he reluctantly took out the war kayatau key and adjusted it to a channel that the other three teams could hear. This is the Dongwu team. We are now at coordinates 145.436.053. Just now we encountered the enemy. I will send you the video just now, please come and gather immediately, repeat, please come and gather immediately. After saying all this, he pressed the button of the war kayatau key imported the camera device on his head into the war kayator key, and then sent it directly. To be on the safe side, everyone withdrew 100 meters back. Anyway, the tentacles in the deep pit didn't look like smart things, so everyone started camping, leaving only two soldiers to be responsible for guarding. The officer sat in front of the camp and touched the wound on his arm, but for some reason, a strong sense of hunger suddenly appeared in his stomach. When he was hungry, he was dizzy and eyes blurred, as if he had low blood sugar. This kind of feeling is unfathomable mystery. It is clear that everyone has eaten a full meal before entering this world. Although a few hours have passed, they will not be hungry like this. However, in order to guard against the unexpected, the officer took a highly concentrated glucose injection from his backpack and then stuck it and through the closed rubber opening next to his protective suit. After the nutrition needle was injected, the officer felt that his hunger was weakened a lot. He touched the wound on his arm again, and he couldn't help feeling a little nervous. After all, he was exposed, and now he can only pray for this world. The air is not toxic anymore. What the officer encountered was not only passed on to the hands of the other three teams, but also passed to the temporary transfer base in front of the light spot. Then the news was passed along the optical cable out of the Rosen Bridge and passed to the command ship of the real world. Dot. Next, a group of researchers had a heated discussion about the giant tentacle monster in the video, and several of them were shaking with excitement, yelling that they must get some samples of the tentacle because of this. It will be the first time alien life has been discovered in human history. No, it should be foreign world life. Immediately, orders came out one by one, and again passed through the optical cable into the world on the opposite side of the spot, and then passed to everyone's war kayator key. Damn it. Seeing all kinds of outrageous commands on the war kayator key screen, he almost had the urge to drop the war kayator key. The group of inhumane researchers not only asked for the flesh and blood sample of the tentacle monster, but also said that it is best to catch one alive tentacle, see what kind of monster is behind the tentacle. This group of people, don't you know that your team just lost two soldiers? At this time, about three hours have passed, and the sky is getting dark. A shining round moon rises from the east illuminating the entire earth. In this foreign world without any trace of human beings, 
the color is unexpectedly moving, giving people a poetic and pictorial image of the moon is born on the sea, and the horizon is at this time. Of course, it would be better if it didn't have that deep pit and those strange tentacles. Just when everyone was worried, there was a rustle from the intercom, and a voice came from it, the Columbus team has arrived at the coordinate position and is currently located directly behind you. The voice was not finished yet, another voice followed, Zheng He team has arrived at the target location and is currently at the 3 o'clock position of Dong Wu team. Everyone was overjoyed and quickly looked behind them. As expected, two light spots were slowly approaching at 3 o'clock in the night and directly behind, until the three teams were close enough. The two sides met the secret signals before they were fully assembled. So far, North America, Northern Sea Continent, and Central Continent have been assembled in one place. Only the European team has not yet arrived. But this is also inevitable. At that time, the Northern Sea Continent area chose to explore in the north, and the European area was in the south. The two teams were the furthest apart, so naturally they would be the last to arrive. How about, have you collected the tentacle samples that the research department wants? Captain in North America asked immediately, I got it. The officer took out a transparent glass box with a few pieces of blood in it, but we can't do the tentacles requested by the other party. Maybe you two teams can try it. Are you injured? Captain Li Qianjing his team in the Zongzhu district suddenly saw the wound on the officer's arm. Since you have been exposed in the foreign world. You should return to the camp immediately and go to the actual isolation treatment according to the regulations. P. Let the isolation treatment go to hell. The officer in the Northern Sea Continent District couldn't help but angrily said, My body is very clear to me. There is no problem. Speaking, he took out a highly concentrated glucose injection and injected it into his within the body. I hope so. Seeing the other party's resistance to isolation treatment. Li Qiang was shrugged and did not continue to persuade him. Then the three waited for a while again, until the European team arrived, and the four teams arrived at one place before they officially began to discuss countermeasures. What they have to do is actually very simple, is to collect as much information as possible about these tentacles and this cave, and then pass it to the rear, so that Foundation can grasp as much information as possible about this foreign world. Not only that, as the first batch of pioneers, as long as they can be sure that they and the others can survive in the foreign world without being harmed by force majeure, there will naturally be more task force members in the future. In the coming days, there will even be troops from four continents. Moreover, there was news from the rear before that the helicopters, armored vehicles and even the engineering team were already on their way when they came and they will basically arrive tomorrow. When the time comes, everyone has more guarantees for survival. After some discussions, the other three teams also launched their own drones one by one, and learned the lessons of the Dongwu team, knowing which tentacles seem to be able to sense the vibration of the air, so three drones they all flew extremely high, completely suspended in the sky above several dozen meters high caves and finally saw the inside of the pit clearly. The diameter of this pit is more than 300 meters, and the inside looks very deep and dark. Even night vision equipment can't see the bottom, and I don't know it. On the drone lens, only the edges of the potholes can be seen, and they are all densely packed tentacles. These tentacles from the depths of the mud on the edge of the hole are like hairs made of flesh and blood growing from the side of the hole. The only thing different from animal hair is that these hairs are all living creatures, like maggots. Wriggling, any disturbance is enough to trigger the opponent's attack. From the night vision, the potholes in the black and white images are like entrances to hell. Densely packed is uncomfortable. It seems disgusting and disgusting. Then, everyone tried to detect these tentacles in other ways. They used flares and incendiary bombs, and then found that these tentacles did not respond to light at all. But a few incendiary bombs exploding on the tentacles could cause the tentacles. Vigilance. As soon as I found myself burnt, those tentacles instinctively retracted to the side wall of the pothole, 
causing the incendiary bomb to fail to do work. After collecting certain information, the four teams did not have the idea of continuing to explore, and because the night was getting deeper, everyone was wrapped in protective clothing and could not excrete and rest. So after some discussion, the four teams the team returned the same way again. After an hour of rushing, the four Foundation task forces returned to the entrance. At this time, a group of XTN engineering robots had built a large disinfection room and living area. These all are in a special airtight, made of materials. Once built, it is extremely strong and at the same time it can completely isolate the outside from the inside. Then, the people took off their protective clothing for a day in the disinfection room at the door and then checked for unknown infections through a blood test. After confirmation, they entered the living area and performed repairs inside. He didn't take off his protective suit weekly until Captain from the Northern Sea Continent area entered, and suddenly revealed a pale, sweaty face. The officer touched the sealed wound on his shoulder, then stood in front of the disinfection spout, and silently sprayed several kinds of disinfectant over his body and then walked to the blood collection device, a little nervously letting the opponent pierce him. Click your finger. A few seconds later, the green light flashed on the screen of the blood sampling device, and at the same time a mechanical voice resumed it. Number 04564, no signs of microbial infection were found. Allow passage. Ha! Huh. Seeing this, the officer was completely relieved. He silently sighed in relief, some fortunately, put on the clothes provided in the disinfection room, and then walked into the living area like a pardon. It's just that when he turned around, he could see a densely packed red rash on the shoulder blades on his back. At the same time, there was a trace of blood that slowly permeated through the clothes. 